Hello my lovelies and welcome to another video and today we have something very exciting. We're going to be doing a 30 day challenge and I'm going to be designing this island in 30 days without treasure islands and without terraforming and I'm going to take you along with me. Now we have just reset our island so we're going to go through all of that and I'll show you everything that we got done in day one of this 30 day challenge. Enjoy! Good afternoon, we're so excited to have you here. Let us be the first to congratulate you on your wise decision to sign up for this adventure. Welcome to the check-in counter for your deserted island getaway package. There is so much to look forward to, but first let us introduce ourselves. I'm Timmy with Nook Inc. And I'm Tommy. We'll be flying to the island with you to help you get settled. The of us is your partners. We're in it for the long haul. So let's get started, shall we? First step is checking your application. Is this the first time applying for one of our packages? Indeed. Understood. Now then, we'll need to look up your application. Can we have your name and birthday? My name is Honey. My birthday or my birthday? You guys are going to know my birthday now. What? Nobody look. It's illegal. It's illegal. Let's see. Our next step will be to take a picture of you. Don't worry, take as much time as you need to get yourself looking just the way you want. I forgot we get to customize ourselves a little bit. What hair do we want? I mean, we always change this after, you know? I'm gonna go with the wavy hair. Okay, yes, ginger, sleepy eyeballs. My eyeballs are brown. And obviously, superior mouth. If you don't have this mouth, I don't know what you're doing. Also, our outfit, kind of a sleigh, you know? The pineapple. We'll go with little peach cheeks. Actually, no. I want the pink ones. Okay, we're all set. Just go ahead and add that picture to your records. Okay, thank you. Love that. Let's get started talking about your new home. So exciting. You see, we're quite proud of the work we've done to help you feel comfortable in your new life. See, we're quite proud of the work we've done to help you feel comfortable in your new life. Yes, in fact, if you want, you can even experience the seasons the same way you're used to them. What I mean is, we have islands in both the northern hemisphere and the southern hemisphere. Okay, I love that. We already know this, though. Uh, we are currently choosing choose an island that has the same seasonal pattern as your current home. Where do we live? Europe. We'll go to the northern hemisphere because we're going to be doing an autumnal island. We're going to be doing autumn girl core. Very good, we have a number of lovely uninhabited islands. Let me see them, please. I actually don't know what I want from a map. I'm not going to lie. What do I want out of my map? This one looks really interesting. Do I like any of these? Go with your gut. I like this one because resin services is like a little further away from the airport. I kind of like the layout of this one though. So that's got like an awkward rivery bit. But we are going to be terraforming. What if I do a no terraform challenge? Imagine. Okay, I think this one. The goals are orange trees or apple trees. Maybe apple trees because that's more autumnal. Apple trees and an orange airport. So we're going to go with this one. Amazing. One final question. If I could bring one thing, what would it be? Some food, obviously. I, I'd be snacking all the time. Let's get going. We're boarding the flight. We're gonna run across the airport. How come the receptionists are getting on the plane with us? Who's gonna do the reception now? Hello everyone. Thank you for taking this chartered flight as part of Nook Inc's deserted island getaway package. Sit back, relax, and enjoy a complimentary video presentation about deserted, deserted, deserted life. No, deserted island life. The classic starting video. Love it. Absolutely filmed on my eyeballs. This is. That's the vibe. Autumnal. This is so cute. I always forget this little video. I always forget. We got oranges. Okay. We've got a yellow airport, and we got Deirdre. Is that the? biker pig it is okay wait oranges is not what i wanted was it it was apples because we're doing an autumnal island what if we did a restart to get apples and maybe better starter villages and maybe an orange airport okay we're gonna restart right let's skip through all this okay we've just been through this spiel do i not look similar i actually love this outfit i'm not gonna lie look how far away this resident services is I don't think I've ever seen that in my life. Whoa. I like that one. It's got a heart pond. Oh my goodness. Apples! We got apples. We got Dom. And I forget her name. Agnes? Apples, Dom. Agnes and a heart pond. Hello, you little cuties. Thank you for being on this island. And yes, except Green Airport. This is true. The Green Airport is not what I wanted. The same as my last one. But I'm, I'm willing to give that up for the apples and the good starters. I hate roses. And we just restarted and I got roses, but we got apples and we got Dom and Agnes and the map's really cool. So you never get roses. You're so jealous. I don't like roses. I don't, I've had them on every single island. Let's get started. Is that everyone? Let's see. Agnes and Dom. 
and Honey. Amazing. We're all here. I'll turn it over to you, Mr. Nook. Our three adventurers are ready to get started. Yes, very good. Let's see, how shall I begin? I'm not gonna read through all this. Okay, let's find a place for our tent. Where should we have our house? Agnes is pretty autumnal in my opinion, and Dom is just a little cutie, you know? So, I might put my little tent here. I think this is a really cute place. Actually, no, I want that. Tr I want the trees to stay there. Will this get rid of the trees? Didn't even know airports change color. They do, there's different like colors for them. I think here is adorable. Wow, this is actually miles away from the airport. This is like so far. I don't think I've ever had a resident services this far away. I reckon we can put some houses like here. Mm, yeah, I think so. I'll find you a spot. I will, Dom. You little cutie. My tent is in your hands. Where should we put it though? Right, I think here. Actually, no, I'm not gonna put it there because I want to like, I think I want to do like a full on town square here. You know, like classic norm core with autumnal, autumnal vibes. I think that would be really cute. So I might put tent here. Yeah, I think that is really cute. Right, let's find a spot for Agnes. I think we could do a little neighborhood snaking up to my house. So like, house like here, and then my house. I feel like that makes sense. A trick-or-treating neighborhood, yes. That sounds amazing. Oh my goodness. Trick-or-treating neighborhood, that is perfect for an autumnal island. We have, yeah. What do I need to do? Hi, okay. What did I need to do? Wait, what? Would you mind talking to me first? Oh, right, let's pick up some apples and stuff. I wanna get us in like a good place for our first day of the 30 day challenge. I don't know how many apples and things we need or whatever, but it's fine. And we just start playing, playing for a week now and you're obsessed. I'm so glad you're obsessed. It is such a good game. It's such a good time. Do sheep even have horns? I thought it was goats. He's probably a little ram, a little ram. Yeah, some sheep have horns. I'm just gonna clean up the island a little bit while we're at it. Doink. I don't even know what we needed to pick up. I ignored him, I'm not gonna lie. So I know I need to get apples. I'm guessing twigs for the campfire. All of these twigs. Do I have enough stuff? 15 twigs, it's gotta be enough, right? The can't have asked us to get more than 10. Oh, I've done it, okay. I did find more. I'm just that good, you know? I love our little outfit, it's so cute. This is so much better than the pineapple t-shirt. Okay, I've got apples, don't you worry. Yeah, I'm just so ahead of the curve, you know, the best island getaway person ever. Now is that everything? Yes, I believe it is. Let's get started with the festivities. He's just a wild guy, you know? Dun dun dun! Amazing. I'm so hyped. It's not deserted. Oh, poo. Honey Cove, we're called Honey. So I feel like the island name being Honey might not work. Mush Town, Mushroom Grove, Autumn Alley. That's really good. Honeydew Island, we just did Dewdrop, Mushy Cove, Autumnally, Applesauce, I kind of love Applesauce, Gold Leaf, you guys have me in a chokehold right now, Applesauce is so cute, Applesauce or Gold Leaf, I really like Gold Leaf as well, should we ever vote between Applesauce and Gold Leaf, Apple Crumble, you know what, I think I love Apple Crumble, because I'm going to be making an Apple Crumble tonight, Cider City, it's not going to be very city vibes though, it's going to be very small, Autumnal town, you know, like Gilmore Girls sort of vibe. <laughs> Apple sauce. I might scream and cry. Okay, no space, no space, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah. Feels so cool that mine got chosen, consider this my acceptance speech. <laughs> Amazing, proud of you. Why do ghosts take naps? Because they need their booty sleep. Apple sauce, guitar burrow, buff bug, nuggets. Oh my god. Buffberg. I forgot Dom's a jock. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, we've settled on a name. We are slaying. Okay, hi Tom. Oh, it feels weird calling him Tom. <laughs> Sounds good to me, but I want this. Is it a bed? It is a bed. What's in here? The radio. Oh, that lamp's nice. I like the little, the little brown. Let's go to bed. <gasps> I forgot about the, the, the KK song. Think of from a cat who's been on the... You're not a cat, are you? You're not a cat. Thank you, KK. I love a good rap. We are the truest KK fan. I get that. I am in there. Okay. You woke me from my KK slider dream, which is actually really upsetting, but I slept great. I slept that long. That is wild. Oh, we got a phone. We got our Nook phone. I'm well versed in the smartphone area. Don't you worry. 
I got the smartest of the phones. Oh, is that our contract? Oh, it's our bill. Finally. Okay, we're gonna work on basically getting as many Nook Miles as we can at the minute and sorting that out, I suppose. I think that's a good idea. We have a little mail. Hello, Nintendo. Thank you. Paradise planning photo. Thank you. And oh, we've got all this new stuff. Do I have to go through all of them like this? This is really annoying. Applesauce Miles. I'm just gonna work on... Wait, do we have all these unlocked yet? I don't know. Animal Cross Applesauce. Exactly. I don't think we have things unlocked yet. Hi! Let's have a look in residence services then. And see what we need to do. And get on with it, I suppose. Hi! Oh, hi ah, honey. Welcome. As you can see, it's quite cosy in here. Funny how cosy doesn't always mean comfortable. Hiya. I'll take a look. Can we sell anything to him? Probably not. Okay, yeah, we can. Right. I guess I'll sell some stuff. What's in here? Thank you for telling me. Let's grab some stuff out of here. A cardboard box. I can sell you that. It's okay. Let me sell all of those. I mean, that, that's something. That is something, I suppose. Hi! What should I do? DIY workshops. Let's do that then. About that workshop. Hey, yes, please. Let's get these started. I always forget how the beginning of the game goes because I've only played it like twice. This is the third time. Do I have? I've got tree branches, workbench, craftable. Oh, I didn't mean to press no. Let's craft. Actually, no. No thanks. I made a flimsy fishing rod. I'm just so good. I did make a flimsy fishing rod. What did we get? Simple DIY workbench. And what else did we get? These. We can build a campfire and net. Okay. Let's go get some more wood, I suppose. Collect these nook miles and keep going. It's gonna be a great time. Blink. Oh, amazing. So we can go through and do all of these. Oh, we got another one. Selling what is stuff. Yep. The main thing right now, collecting everything that we can. Imagine having like onesies of the different villages. That probably exists, to be honest. Here we are. We found the tree. I forget how much I love the beginning of the game. You're just collecting everything, learning your way through deserted island life. What a great time. You get these. Doink, doink, doink. Do I need five sticks? Oh, I've got five. I guess we'll go build. Maybe I should get like a little workbench as well. Probably need sticks for that. Or I wonder if I need wood for that. That might actually make more sense. And um, after this, I'll catch some bugs, catch some fish, all the good stuff. Look at us go. We're so efficient. Right, I'm gonna run and make ourselves a net because there's so many little bugs around. I want to craft flimsy net. Oh, I don't have the tool ring. I just remembered. That is so sad. Yikes. Whee! I'm just gonna catch all the bugs that I see. I'm gonna save them all for blathers because I'm smart. Hi, Agnes. I don't think I've spoke to you yet. Oh, a leaf umbrella. Is the leaf umbrella like the first recipe you get other than the tools? I feel like I've gotten that every single time. And I'm gonna grab you. What you want, We're here for the grind and we stay for the sleighs. Oh, wait, what? How did I mess that one up? I think that's a scam, if you ask me. Absolutely scam. I can get that thing, whatever it is. I don't know what you're doing. You're mine now. A bell cricket. I'm obsessed with the cozy vibes right now. It is the best time. I see a balloon that I can't get, which is really upsetting. I'm gonna save the weeds. So we can sell them to Leaf. Hello, fishy. A tilapia. I know that one. Right. Oh my god. We've already got scorpions going on. I'm gonna put all this together. Place. Whoa. That looks so cool. Did he despawn? Maybe. Excuse me. Thank you. I can sell this one. The scorpion despawned, which is very sad. Okay. And the weeds, I'm gonna save the Leaf. So they're getting dropped here. Oh, I forgot about these. The easy buckaroonies. Hi, Agnes. I want to sail. Oh, there's a lot. Okay. Yes. Oh, I did have another thing, but that's fine. Sold. Thank you. I can eat the fruit and I can break things down. Oh, a moth. Right. What did we get? Pick up the bunch. We've sold fruit. Let me grab these. Any more fishies? We might have to time travel. Okay. There we go. Oh, little fishy. Horse mackerel. Let me grab... I see a bunch of bugs. It jumped into my net. Amazing. I've got the bug. And then I think I have... I should have another one. Trash tools. Amazing. We're getting there already. We're almost halfway there for the Nook Miles. Learn this. Taking up space in my inventory. Thank you for the leaf umbrella. Okay. Let's go sell some stuff. We need to make another net as well. I want to sell 
What exactly are you offering? I am offering so many good things. 810 bells. That sounds good to me. I want to craft a flimsy net. Um, okay. I'm all done. What do I do? Hello. Catch all kinds of creatures. Oh, I need to bring creatures to him. Next one I catch will be yours, Tom Nook. Don't you worry. Oh, that was very convenient. I need to bring him a few, don't I? So that he can give it to Blathers. There's nothing else here, so I'm just going to use the stuff that I've caught. Hello. I really, really crave brownies right now. I got bugs. Fudgy or cakey? Fudgy. Definitely fudgy brownie. They are the best. I do believe this is a moth. Wow. Critopedia. Send you the Critopedia app. It's a terrific source for an aspiring island researcher such as yourself. Thank you, Mr. Nook. I've got some stuff for you. I've been taking advantage of my DIY workbench. I have. More DIY recipes. Amazing. An axe. Let me give you more. A moth. Oh. Anything new. That's really annoying. I found a creature. This thing. I hope this is a new one. There we go. A proper reward. What is my proper reward? <gasps> These flowers. Red cosmos. Why the red? I guess I'm gonna... I guess thank you. What did we get again? An axe. Oh, we got quite a few new things actually. I need more materials for everything. Mini, I really can't see the screen with you there. I'm not gonna lie. Have a nice DIY. Then that's it. All of these bad boys. Let's go give them to Miss Anuk. Wahoo! Do I have... I have room. I'm gonna shake some trees for these bad boys. How many stone do I need? I hope not many. I only need one. That's good. I need a couple more of these. Slaying the day away, if you ask me. Craft this bad boy. Thank you. I made a flimsy axe. I really want the museum. That would be absolutely lovely. I know I haven't showed you that. Found a creature. I got this one for you, my man. How many do I need to give him? How many was it? Oh, okay, that many. <laughs> Five specimens so far. Thank you. Yes. Now, we can put the leathers tent somewhere. Where do we want Blathers tent? I have no idea. I would love to do it across the water, but I can't do that yet. I, can I get the vaulting pole before I put the tent down, or is that impossible? Because then I could keep the tent. Have Blathers tent, and it would be really cute. We could do it down at the front anyway. Got these. Keep tent. Much cuter. Can you get the pole, the vaulting pole, before I put the tent down? Or is that just, like, not a thing? Wait, let me check my recipes. No. I have a feeling no, unfortunately. I think it's later. I think this corner would be super cute. And then we could have, like, little dig areas on the sand as well. I reckon. Right here. Oh my god, that's huge. I forgot how big it was. Wait, actually, I want to give it a bit more room. I want it to have room to breathe as well. Let me imagine. Yes. And then we can put more of those fences around and make like a little archaeological dig site area. I think that could be really cute. So I can't give Blathers basically anything and that's okay. Oh my god. Wait, I can't get him fast enough. He's gone. It was so sad. I was way too slow. Amazing. That was a big one. The sea bass haunt me, I swear. I could plant the little flowers. I mean, plant. That is really annoying. That is five and not six. But okay, I guess. Doink, 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 doink. Amazing. Tomorrow's arts and crafts. Amazing. You're part of my cozy morning routine. And it's a good time. I had like a candle, some cucumber water, Haley on stream, sitting in my Udi on my new sofa. <laughs> the best time. I'm gonna sell a few things. And then I might make another axe. I don't even think we've got a shovel. Can you whack a stone with an axe? Afragor. You can? Amazing. I will do lots of that then. I wanna sell. I'm offering so much. So much is up for sellage. Wait, I think I, I can sell everything. I forgot. Okay, so after stream, I decided I wanted to do a little bit more for this challenge to get it underway. Of course, I encountered some wasps straight away. But the whole idea of this challenge, as I explained at the beginning, is we're going to be doing an island in 30 days. This is inspired by Froggy Crossing's um, 30 days series. And I'm hoping to do this island without Treasure Islands. And from getting all the like items from Nook's Cranny and the balloons and things. And the idea is autumnal call. We're doing it in September. It's, it's becoming autumn. I think it's a perfect time do a little autumnal island and I want to take you guys along with me and try and build this island in just 30 in real life days. Now I'm allowed to time travel 
I thought that would make the challenge a little bit easier on me. Um, I've never really done a hard challenge before, so I wanted to make it like so I'd enjoy it. And I think that's the best way to do it. I haven't designed an island without a treasure island before. My first one, I have a video on it literally failing because I didn't know about treasure islands or anything and then I restarted. But I'm ready for this, I'm ready for the challenge. So off stream I went about catching some more fish, um, also getting bit by mosquitoes and catching more fish and just doing lots of little tasks to get us more money, more nook miles and work towards getting blathers on the island. I wanted to get us in a place where we could just pick up and keep going um, instead of like leaving it like half finished, like halfway to blathers or anything. Um, and Molly set this little bottle on the beach and I thought it was so cute. I love Molly. Now I time travel to the next day. Obviously we got this little broadcast from Tom Nook and I skipped through it all because I can never be bothered to read dialogue anymore. And then checked my mail. We got a little mail from mum. We got a lovely little present of some peaches and I will be using them very soon. I want to do a little orchard and have, because I feel like that's just so autumnal. And I'm having like a row of peaches and some apples apples are perfect for the theme so I began chopping some trees breaking some rocks well not breaking like s slapping them I suppose with my axe because I didn't have a shovel yet and working towards all of these little goals we did end up getting blathers after giving so many fish to Tom Nook like so many fish and bugs and it was ridiculous and I don't think we're going to be giving Blathers any of our finds because I really want to have Blathers tent on the island and I put it in a little place where I thought would be perfect for Blathers little area. I don't know, I think it's so cute. And I bought some things, I made a vaulting pole and shovel, I got my 50 miles from the ABD and I'm going to try and do that every single day so we get more and more and then I managed to get over to another part of the island with my little vaulting pole, catch some more things, picked up a crap ton of weeds and noticed this heart shaped pond was not quite heart shaped as I thought but I might be doing a little challenge where I do no terraforming on this island as well. So we're going with the natural shape of the island, we're going to work with it, we're going to try and make it look cute. Um, and it's going to be tough because I do a lot of terraforming in my builds. I always include terraforming, so it's, it's going to be a good time. I'm going, to, I'm going to be crying by the end of it probably, but I'm hoping to enjoy it as well. I'm hoping to enjoy it. Then these wasps came out and I was like, you know what? I'm going to try my hand at getting these wasps. And I did it. I did it. I got the wasps. Are you proud of me? Because I was very scared. Um, continued getting nook miles, continued slapping trees, and then all of my tools are breaking all the time because we've only got the flimsy ones, more nook miles, and more trees, and this. Now I didn't mean to smack Agnes with my net, but it, it did just end up happening. I found my money tree, my first one of the island, and I put 10,000 bells back in because I'm high risk, high reward, you know what I mean? We're gonna, we're gonna get threefold back and it's gonna be a good time. But yes, I hope you enjoyed watching today's video and I hope you're excited for this 30 day challenge as much as I am. And hopefully I'll be posting quite often about the challenge. Now I'm not sure if I'd do it 30 days in a row, but it's gonna be 30 days of playtime. So you, you know what that means. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you so much. Feel free to like and subscribe if you've enjoyed. And I suppose I will see you in day two. I played a little bit last night and I got, I time traveled so we got Blathers 10. And we're gonna hopefully keep Blathers 10 just as Blathers 10. We're not gonna donate anything to make it any more than that. We upgraded to a house. Look at this bad boy over here. Here is a lovely orchard that I'm starting. We got peaches from mum, so I thought 
We'll grow an orchard. I have to get rid of this rock, which is annoying. But yeah, what have we got? Dream house. We've upgraded it one time, and that is a great time. And I suppose today we're just going to work on leveling up in the world, starting to decorate, starting to get all the good stuff. Obviously got shovel and what's it called? The pole thing? Yes, the vaulting pole. You guys are so right. I can put 10,000 in there, so I might do that. Berry and hole. Right, another fossil. Snacks are great. This is true. Let's go there. Is that two fossils today? I think so. Oh, and we can get all of these and sell them. Thank you, Picasso, for climbing on my laptop. Yeah. My cats are taking over the stream. Let's eat one of these and break this rock. That's a good idea. Oh, we need to build a shop. We've got Happy Home Academy. Yes. Tom Nook is being mean to us. He's been a little bully. Nook Miles ticket. We can get furniture from Nook Miles Island. So we're getting the first shop thing, which is good. Cool beans. We need to find a place to put the shop. Hi, thank you. <gasps> My money rock! We've got money. Amazing. Missing. So I heard you were getting your stuff together for a shop. Yes. Thank you for gathering stuff for me. Oh, a shovel? Oh, that didn't our shovel just break? That's so sweet. Um, sell all these bad boys. And what did I need? That's a lot. That's a lot of money. Okay, nice. And we're gonna see what we need to build this shop. We're gonna see what we need. What do you need? I'd like to know. Okay, we need all the 30 pieces of everything. It was wood, iron, and was it stone? I don't know. Oh, this is a normal shovel? I need actual stone, not iron, but um, thank you anyway. Actually, maybe I do need iron, I'm not sure. It's a no-brain day, I get that. About building a shop. We're asking for donations. What do you need? 30 pieces of each wood and 30 iron nuggets. I see. And what have we got? We're two iron nuggets off. That's really annoying. Okay. You've always wanted to do a no terraforming island, but then you cave in. Yeah. It's going to be a struggle. It really is. The heart, the heart pond is not quite a heart, which is very upsetting because I thought it was, but it, it just is not. It's not. Trees bounty. That is so cute. Flimsy axe. This. And we're going to chop some trees. Hello, Agnes. How are you doing? Will you give me something? Oh, Agnes has got an attitude. Okay. I think the island is big enough for the both of us. I'm just being nice and neighborly. Okay. Thank you. I love autumn and Animal Crossing because the trees actually have different shades. It makes me really happy. You love Agnes? Agnes is like a sassy queen. Um, what do I need? I need to speak to you. Okay, I think it, they took all of my stuff and they gave me a bowl, a garden lantern, and a humidifier. Thanks! Honey can't words today. Can I ever words any day? <laughs> Applesauce Airport. Hi! Okay, I wanna fly. Yes. I wanna get a Nook Miles ticket. And then, will, will, there will be villages on these islands, right? Okay, our first Nook Miles Island. Oh my god, who is gonna be here? If there's gonna be anyone here. There is a campfire. Who is this? Hmm. Hmm. Hello. Hi. Bangle. Bangle was kind of a, a little cutie. Is Bangle autumnal? Question mark. <gasps> Shoot. Okay, I've got like a second. <laughs> that was so close. Okay. That, my heart's racing. I reckon we could get better villagers. I'm gonna leave Bangle. I'm gonna leave Bangle. Oh, break all the rocks as well. Not that one. It's fine. This rock is no match for me. I wanna find the the tree with the item in it, but I don't have ladders, so I don't know. I really hope that the, the tree with the item in it isn't up top. Where's my item? Give me my item. Give it, please. This isn't looking good, loves. <gasps> what did we get? What did we get? Wait, cream and sugar. Oh, I didn't get it. I can't place it on here. Okay. I think we're good. We've got the wasps. I'll save that for the lick. And I'm going to save up to um, get loads of Nook Miles tickets so we can actually go on a hunt. That's going to be a good time. Let's go give all of my iron. Yes, I can give you the materials. Yes. Amazing. I'm excited. Let's find a place for this shop. 
Now, I don't know where it's gonna go, but I have an idea. I have a little idea. I'll show you guys the map. I think in that little nook over there on the left, we could put the shop, maybe. Or we could do it at the back. Actually, I might do it. I might do it at the back. Do I want it there? I might do the neighborhood over here. Do I put it next to the heart pond? Do I put it across the river from the museum? That's the two options I'm thinking. Because over on the left, I think I'm going to have the neighborhood go from the left side to where those tents are. And then there's going to be a bridge in the middle of it. It's going to be an archaeological area where the museum is. And there's going to be a town plaza in front of resident services. That's the idea. Hmm. I don't know what to do with this section of the island. I'm not going to lie. But we could have Nook's Cranny in the little nook over here. I think that could be cute. Oh over here i think i'm gonna have it on the outskirts yeah i'm gonna have it on the outskirts um let me get these off this tree before we destroy it um let's see i think this is too big it's too big let me imagine oh so i thought it was gonna be a little tent thing it's gonna be a whole ass shot i think there's okay to be fair actually if we're not terraforming Maybe I give it a little space behind it so we can put trees behind. Or should I put it right up against? Should I put it right up against? Too close to the cliff. Let me imagine. Because we're not going to be doing any terraforming, so I really need to have room for the paths around it, you know? Let's see. Build here. No, I want to go right up against. You always do right up against? I get that. Just makes it feel a bit more put together. Let me imagine. Do we think that works? I think that works there. Boop, boop. That's fine. That's all good. We've got the shop. That works. Let's go tell them what we did. Hi, Dom. Hi. I got the shop done for you. Yeah. Okay, so it's open tomorrow. I'm going to plant a few of these. Plonk. You know what's really sad? I'm probably not gonna get wheat fields. I feel like they never turn up in my nooks cranny. Plant this. And then we're gonna like make so much money because having coconuts does that. Okay, let's put this there. And then we'll put one here. So, we have grown fruit trees. That's a good time. We have fruit roots. We've done three out of five. Nope, three out of six. <laughs> of the fruit trees. Is it impossible to do all of the fruit trees if you don't have Nintendo online? I'm unsure. Yeah, I'm gonna keep the wasp for flick. I'm gonna have a little beach for my bugs and fish. <gasps> Gulliver's here! Ooh! Announcement time! Hi! Is Rainy? Hello everyone, this is Tom Nook. Amazing. What have we got? We've opened up a shop. It's small. But it's cute. We've added new catalog service in the shopping. We've got the catalog. I will make good use of that as well. And we've got a ceremony that we can do. You have a little ring-a-ding-ding. -ding. Heading to your island every Sunday morning to sell my precious turnips just the way grandma used to. Thank you, Daisy May. I've never used turnip market in my life. Active island resident. Wow, three whole days. Oh, this is Agnes's house. Oop. And this is Dom's house. Okay. Cute enough. Our trees are growing. And there's Nook's Cranny. Oh. Hello. Glad this has moved in. We're able to open the shop. Amazing. So pleased to hear that. Actually, I came here today to check in on you all. See if you needed any assistance with anything. It's our way of celebrating a new shop. We sisters like to help wherever we can. Any island ideas come to mind? Mabel, what if you opened up a shop? What? Thank you. Amazing. Clothing supplier. Please, guys. I know that Mabel wants to move over. It's all good. Thank you for having this business meeting right in front of me. Let me see what I can buy. I could do with I could do a cushion. There's a little board game. That is definitely the game of life. And this I like. Yes. And do we have a ladder? I am curious. We have a slingshot. I'll take that. I will take that. Yeah. We have lots of um, flowers. We've got lilies. I don't really like lilies. But I like cosmos. So I might buy a few cosmos. Do maybe a little flower field somewhere. Let's see. What's your favorite Studio Ghibli movie? It is Howl's Moving Castle. 
Howl's Moving Castle is my absolute fave. I'll buy it. What is everyone's favourite Studio Ghibli film? I would love to know. This is really cute, but it's very summer, you know? Let's see. This is going to be our first balloon. Such a good aim. Ooh, 5,000 bells. Amazing. Let me whack all of my rocks. I actually haven't seen my money tree today. I need to search for that. How do you get the ladder again? Because I still haven't gotten a ladder. I don't know. Where's the other rocks? Here. And then... I'm going to whack these. Nope, not there. Here. The little bug. And it got squished by the clay. Oh, it didn't. We're all good. He's still alive. He's still alive. Don't worry, guys. I kind of want to make a little flower garden. You feel me? This is our orchard thing. Let me put these away in storage. Oh, cutscene. A Tom Nook scene, if you will. Don't worry about a thing. We can set up your getaway package to include a lovely furnished home. Okay, we'll need to set up. This is where we have to set up three island homes, I think. Three interested parties. Amazing. And we don't have any homes. <laughs> we can get the stuff. It's all good. I think we basically have most of the stuff to make the stuff. We've got a lot of wood, stone, iron, but I'm not gonna make any of this until we have done our villager hunt. What can we actually make? Old-fashioned wash tub, that would be cute outside. The hay bed, yes. The campfire, the bonfire thingy, log stakes. Okay, we've got, we've got some good DIYs so far. Right, I want to do a little, a little patch of flowers here, I think. How cute is that? That's my little patch. Are you guys proud? I need to make a workbench for us to have because we actually don't have one. I have to keep going inside resident services. Hardwood and iron nugget. Okay, let's craft this bad boy. Yes, I am ready to help. A bridge? What do I need for that? Log stakes, clay and stone. Wood, stone, clay. And I'm just going to sell these three things. That actually gives me quite a bit of money. Right, let's craft some of these things, I suppose. Let's get some log stakes. We needed three. Thank you. And this one. And one more. And then we should be able to make the bridge. And that'll be a good time. My brain feels so melted right now. Oh, we'll grab this. Amazing. I'm going to put a bridge right behind the orchard. I think that would be cute. Yes, I think so. Let's imagine it. A little hidden bridge. Honey, hello. I did find a place for the bridge. It is all ready. Okay, the bridge will be there tomorrow. And then let's get these homes built up. Three housing kits. Here's our little neighborhood that we're doing. So I want to continue this over here. Let's see. I'm going to put a house here. I forgot I needed that big of a space for each one. What the hell am I meant to do? So I don't want any terraforming. So I don't want one down there. I could put one up here. No, I can't. I don't want to get rid of this because this is this is 10,000 bells right here. But I've just remembered we can move it, can't we? We can move our little money tree. So we're all good. I suppose that works. Let's see. Maybe we could do one like here. No, I need to go one over, I think. Here. Let's see. Let me imagine this. That's good enough for me. Okay. Amazing. And we, we definitely don't have enough room in this area for another one. So let me go back over and see if there's room over here. Because I want it to be like a little trick-or-treat neighborhood. I want it to be really cute. I put one down. Oh, that's way too close to the airport. I did not think this through with this house. I do like uh, one here. No room. I think that's enough room. And if I don't like it, we can move it later on. It does cost a lot, but that's okay. I'm going to pick up this tree as well. And I'm going to make a little area for our money trees. Doink. Let's wait a sec. Silly. Okay. What have we got? A life ring. I suppose I could put that on the beach for now. Look miles for miles. Okay. Oh, we can make a ladder? Sea looks so pretty. Oh, why am I like this, guys? Send help. Look at the little baby. It jumped into my net. Hee <laughs> hee. Amazing. I'm just too good. Hi. I don't know if I can be bothered with him. Tulip crown. I don't know if I've done this rock, actually, so I'm going to do that as well. Okay. Yeah, this is my money rock. Amazing. 
This is what I needed in my life. That is so much money. Oh, okay, fish, you better turn back around. So I don't want to move from here. Please. Amazing. Is he going to see my rod, though? Are you going to see my absolute rod? Nope. That is really rude. He turned around. But when he turns back around... No, nope, it's going to go back at... Okay. There we go. I think he's spotted. He's just shy. How is that a tire? That was literally a fish. Oh. Hello. <gasps> Leaf's here. Hello, everyone. This is Tom Nook. Not much news today. And there's a mild redemption service. There's a wetsuit. Ooh, yes. We can get money from diving. Let me back in. Oh, I'm getting cold. Hi. Are you telling me I'm rich now? This is Tommy from Nook's Cranny. Every tunny, right? We sent payment of 14,000 bells. Hello, Leaf. We have lots of weeds, yes. I don't know about reactions. Okay, thanks. Hi. It is a lovely day to shop for flowers. Double, that's 20 bells per clump of weeds. Is a clump of weed one weed? 15,000 bells. Okay. I'm good with that. Thank you, Candy. Let's buy some stuff. Right. We are doing autumnal. And that means farm core. And that means all of the farm stuff. So we're going to take a load of tomatoes. I'm going to get like 10. And then we'll see what flowers he's got as well. Maybe some bushes. We made bells by selling items. Sell clumps of weeds. That one was an easy one, I suppose. Greedy weeder. Oh my goodness. And then reaction ruler. Amazing. We got quite a few little nook mile thingies going off there. Rocks. I love the little face. Ooh, we have a balloon incoming. Let me get my slingshot. Whacking rocks. It's raining treasure. What did we get, actually? Plasma ball. Oh, okay. Okay then. Right, let me plant these. We'll do it in set of nine. Look at all those tomatoes. Oh, got so many. Right out loud. Let me grab oh, a gold nugget. So after streaming for a little bit, I decided I wanted to play a bit more in the afternoon. And that meant I was going to do, well, I did do all of the making of the items for these plots. So I did all the exterior items I could and all the interior items I could. I think I might be missing a few things, but nothing too bad. Um, and I just plopped everything next to it. I didn't want to like fully complete these because... I don't want to autofill them. I want to go on a little miniature, miniature, a little villager hunt um, for the people who go into these pots. So I made everything. It's all looking good, and I need to save up some nook miles so we can get on a little hunt and find some dreamies for this island. Any autumnal cottage core, farm core, villagers. I just I don't know. Who would you like to see on the island who you think would fit? I haven't chosen any yet, but I think Bo is definitely in the running. I do love Bo, and I think Bo deserves a place. But I haven't thought of anyone else. Maybe Stitches. He kind of goes with the Halloween-y autumnal kind of vibe as well. I think that could be a good idea. Um, other than making all of these lovely items for these plots, I did some little dailies, you know, shooting down balloons, finding my money rock, and it was a really nice evening. It was even shooting stars. First ever shooting stars on this island on applesauce. And so I had to obviously make a wish on a couple stars and we'll see what that gives us tomorrow. I think I literally only wished on one because after this clip, <laughs> there were no others, but that's okay because we got Nook Miles from it. And then, found my money rock, which was a great time, getting rich, all the good stuff. And then I went to Nook's Cranny and spent all of my bells, not all of them, but um, Nook Cranny had like some really good things in this time, like the little wheelbarrow kind of thing, a little mug of tea, a little smoothie, and then like a towel rack, all things that are like so usable. Yeah. So I didn't go live today because I had a market and for those who don't watch my other content on YouTube, I am actually a full-time illustrator um, as well as a content creator and I sell my things at market sometimes and so all of this has been filmed after the market because it was a long day. It was like half nine 
a.m. until like 4 p.m. And obviously we had to get there and get back and it was an outdoor market and it was really fun and it was sunny and it was just nice to work outdoors for once. Like I'm always working indoors and it was nice to be in the sun. It was nice to meet some people's faces. It was lovely to meet some of you guys. Um, well, not necessarily you guys. It was from people who follow my Instagram. I had quite a few people come up and be like, oh, I follow my on Instagram. And it was really interesting. It was really fun. Um, but the market went really well. And I'm very happy with everything that sold and the whole day. And got home and went straight on Animal Crossing after a little, a little relax. Um, and it was just a nice time. So what I did in Animal Crossing today, we did a lot of things so many things and most of it was just getting nook miles and making money and here Timmy and Tommy are telling me about turnips and how that works but I've never been in the turnip market I have no idea how it works i am always let them rot by accident you know so we'll see if that actually happens if I actually get into turnips or not but I started selling some things getting some money and it's a good time and I did time travel a little bit today uh, maybe quite a lot actually. I time travelled like a few days um, to keep buying things from Nook's Cranny to decorate my house in the island as well as doing my dailies every single time I time travel like collecting my money tree, shaking my money trees, finding my fossils. Well, I don't do the fossils every single day because I don't get them like assessed by blathers so I feel like it's not that much money. Checking the ABD. I keep forgetting about checking so I keep getting reset to day one and then I bought some stuff in the ABD I thought it was well not the ABD it's nook shopping or something and I saw this little grape basket and it's so cute and I thought it's autumnal vibes it's everything we need and more and then I had a little look what else was on sale I got some garden lanterns and I'm gonna try and buy some items quite a lot every time we check um, but Maybe I'll wait until I get some more options to choose from because I really don't have many options in there. I decided to move my flowers because they were annoying me next to my house. Um, so we're going to have a little flower patch over there and see how it goes. Um, of course, shaking my trees, all the good stuff. I'm really wanting this island to start shaping up and so I want to start preparing to do some builds. now. Without having Nintendo Online, I mean I have it, but without using Nintendo Online. It was going to be just not using Treasure Islands, but I thought I may as well give a go at making my own codes, you know? But I'm going to have to make my own codes, because the challenge is a challenge. And I haven't started that today, but I will be soon. But I'm very nervous. I am so bad at doing Animal Crossing codes, and I want a really nice path. I want some really cute things. I could definitely do some pumpkins and some fall leaves. I feel like that would be like the easy things for me. Um, I've done pixel art before for those kinds of things, but actually making it things look like an actual path or stuff like that, I have no idea how I'm going to do it. But I'll take you along for the journey and that's okay. Here I decided I wanted to move my little orchard around and um, but like, so we have a path, I want to have a path going down the middle of this like tree orchard area. So I needed to move the trees over a couple to like make sure we had room to put a path down. And I think it just looks a lot neater and you know, well put together. It's kind of what I was doing the whole time. It's just like reorganizing the island and selling things. And then I, I noticed that Sahara was here. And I don't know if I filmed any of it, but I did get some rugs from Sahara um, to decorate my house with. I got every single rug, I got the mystery wallpaper and the mystery flooring. Um, yeah. And of course I started selling all this stuff and then time travelled. And I thought this was so cute because there's a little rainbow and it's like a little spitting with rain. I thought it was so cute. Um, and Mabel, Mabel Abel, I always forget her name, but she was here, Sonic. You know, she was here and I thought, you know what, we're going to try and get the Able sisters to come to the island. So I checked my mail, all the good stuff that I ordered from Nook Shopping arrived and this means I can like decorate my island a little bit 
have a little bit of a new outfit. I mean, hopefully get a new outfit with Able Label Mabel and see how that goes. And so I'm just plopping some things down. Obviously, we don't have resident services yet, um, but I did prepare to do those plots yesterday, which will help us get towards that. Um, but I do... I do want to wait until we have tickets. That's the goal of this. I want to get tickets before we complete those plots because I've done it before where um, I do a search before the plots are actually ready. And then you can have all three without your plots even being ready, I'm pretty sure. If you can't, then I'm gonna mess things up. But that's okay, we can, we can see it together. We can see what happens <laughs> because I really hope it does work out. Oh, this lantern is actually so cute and I need it. I need it. Oh my goodness. I think it'll go really well with the autumnal vibes and then that hose as well. I think the hose would go really well just in the gardens because we're going to have some natural gardens on this island. We're going to have to do some villager yards. We're going to have to do my yard. This will fit in perfectly. I think it'll be so cute. Yes. Thank you, Tommy. You know, every single time I see these rocks and I do and I break them, and I just I look at the face of the villager and like why do we look so shocked that something comes out every single time we hit the rock? I just I don't get it. <laughs> oh, my coconuts are all grown in and you know what that means. It means we're gonna sell them. It means we're gonna get some money from these coconuts because I feel like I don't know if they sell for a lot on every island, but I feel like they sell for like a decent chunk. I feel like we could make a little bit of money from this. And I'm grabbing all the shells as well because, you know, they make money as well. I, I, gotta, I gotta make money somehow. I have a full inventory and I wanna see how much we're gonna get for it. Oh, I don't wanna sell the clay, no thanks. Uh, I think that's everything. Yes, what are we gonna get? Oh, 5,900, don't mind if I diddly do. Sonic is here. Oh, well, actually, <laughs> Mabel is here. I feel really bad now. Mabel is here, and obviously that means we're going to have to have a look if we can get any new things for a little outfit. And these little shorts and that skirt and those sunglasses, actually, those are really cute. So I might buy those. Yeah, I think we could make, like, something out of those. I might not wear the skirt, but, like, it's nice enough to just buy and have because we, we want to get the able sisters on the island so i may as well buy the things that i like definitely gonna wear these shorts super cute and those sunglasses i think they're so cute like if it's the color scheme i don't know i think they're gonna be perfect i think mabel's so cute oh, she's just so passionate about a little fashion shop so cute let's see how these goodies look okay we're gonna try on the shorts i mean they're kind of cute actually and then the sunglasses, I mean, they go together. They're a cute fit. I'm not sure about the skirt. Some of the money trees have been growing in, so it's been nice to finally be able to actually shake them and get my return back. I've just noticed that we have enough money to pay off our loan, our first loan. So I think we're gonna do it. I think we're gonna pay the first loan fully off, finally move up in the world, only to be in debt again, but that's okay. <laughs> Look at us go. Look at us go. It took so long to grind for those bells, but it was worth it, and I'm very proud of us. And we get a little bonus. A little, a little Nook Miles bonus for paying off our little loan. Why, thank you, Tom Nook, for the congratulations. A look at this milestone. Of course, it is cause for a celebration. And... Oh, it, I mean, it could be bigger. Yeah, I, I suppose... I suppose we could have more storage and and more room. Yeah, okay. So, about that upgrade. Um, yeah, great. Let's go. Okay, let's choose a new roof colour. I mean, I want an orange roof, but I don't think there is an option. Is there? Let's check. No. Okay, well that's fine. I thought an orange roof could be really cute, but I suppose I'll just go with red. That fits for now, I suppose. Okay, so I time travelled to the next day. Mabel is here again. I didn't know you could get them in a row so many times. That's fine. Okay. Nothing to report from Tom Nook. Love that for you. Thank you, thank you. Our tomatoes have 
finally grown in. Look at those juicy bad boys. And we get two on each because it's been raining, so they got watered. I didn't water them myself. Myself? Myself. Not even once, but that's okay. And we get some nook miles for it. Look at us go. We're absolutely slaying today. Okay, Mabel has some really cute things. So we just got some like flowy trousers and obviously we're gonna get the horns. Look at those horns. I mean, like it's so perfect for spooky season. Like, let's, we're gonna have to try them on. Okay, look how cute we look. I also got a little jumper for Dom and he's gonna look so cute in it. Just, just you wait. It's a little sweater, it's like blue and pink. And I thought it would be a little bit cuter than his rainbow shirt. I mean, <laughs> look at him. I thought it was about time we actually like sort out our house and kind of actually decorate a little bit. So we've got this um, wallpaper going on. That's the only option that I had from Sahara. We've got these rugs, obviously. Um, let me just put some things around. I mean, that kind of works, the little, little rug on top, okay. I need to get back on top of things. So let's shake my trees. Let's get my money tree and let's sell some things. I need to make some bells, okay? Hello, Timmy and Tommy. I have a full inventory for you. Oh, let's sell our tomatoes, sell these good things. Right, I don't know how much this is gonna be. I don't know how much produce like sells for. And I thought I'd pick my flowers and see how much that sells for too. Oh, okay. Okay, this is cute. I like the tapestry. That could work for some decoration. And then I could also get that chair. We've already got a study chair, but that means we can have matching chairs that we can put outdoors somewhere. We, we need everything we can get. Do we have a cute parasol? Not autumnal. We have spent so many bells. Oh my God. Oh, hello, Agnes. What do you want? Reactions. Okay. Amazing. We got more reactions. That would be... That's our second time they gave us the reactions. Kind of cute. Oh, I thought I would open up my mystery bottle on the beach thing up here because I kind of forgot. Oh, right. Okay, so I want to start clearing up the top of the cliffs and I hate the roses. So we're going to get rid of all the roses I can and it's gonna be it's gonna be a lot we're gonna be a lot better for it you know it's, it's gonna make the island a lot cuter it's not an autumnal flower it's it's not a cute flower in my opinion um and if i'm on my rock by the way <laughs> here is my money tree i don't think we oh thank thank you for that we don't have room up here so i'm gonna clear it out so we can put another money tree here and it's gonna look cute there we go this is our money tree area so I time traveled again and Mabel is here ag again? Three times in a row is that? Or is that like four times in a row? I don't know. Um, okay. Okay, so I thought we would shake some of our fruit trees so we can sell some fruit, get some more money, work towards our next loan, always in the grind. Hello, Mabel. Uh, what is up? Okay, you can bend my ear if you want to. A location for the store, you say? That sounds good to me. Okay, we've, we've, dris we've driven business to her. We have got her to want to move here because it's a good financial decision. Okay, let's find the location. We'll find a little a little area for you. Oh my goodness, amazing. I'm, I'm so excited, I'm so excited. Thank you, Mabel. Okay, I think I know where I want it because I want the shopping area to be like similar places. I want it to be like next to each other and this tree is definitely in the way. Yeah, I want it right up against the cliff. So I'm gonna have to remove this tree first and then put it exactly there. <laughs> of course it's in the way, of course it is. All right, we've got that nice and done. Mabel, the spot has been found and I believe it is quite perfect next to the wonky heart pond <laughs> right do we have anything cute for sale as well let us see what have you got i don't think i want anything from here today but that's all good thank you mabel as always we need to check tom nook's nope nook's cranny and see what they have for sale also sell my full inventory of stuff 
um, including some of the trees. Definitely getting these books because they're going to look so cute on this autumnal themed island, of course. You know, cozy reading is exactly what we need, so I'm going to get a few of those. It's so fun being able to get Nook Miles when not even trying. Like, I didn't even look at what I needed to do and got so many. Time for our daily whack of the rocks. Oh, and it's our money rock. Oh my goodness, look at us go. That was, I think that's the first rock we've whacked today. Okay. I've been plonking all of my things in this little corner next to my house. You know, like, the start of the game, you're gonna have to have, like, a doom area full of all the items because I want to get to three stars really quickly. Um, I'm hoping to get this island to five stars, but I don't know. Hello, Tom. My home is much roomier, thank you very much. Okay. How much do I owe you then? Ooh, that is a lot of bells. I guess we've got to start saving up. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna pay some stuff into my savings so we can start making interest on our bells. I think that is a good thing to do. Yes, we are smart and savvy. Okay. Please. Okay. I'm so bad at catching these bugs. It actually hurts. But I thought we would catch some bugs to I don't even know what I was trying to hit there. That's that was a bit embarrassing. But I want to I want to start selling some more bugs. So, mm, yep. Yeah, mm. This this is embarrassing. I'm I'm sorry. Okay. At least we get nook miles for that. Let's collect some more. Let me catch some more bugs. We've got we've got a little bit more room in our inventory, so you know it's it can't be that hard, can it? Mm -mm. Okay. Let me sell these bad boys, and that's not a lot of money. But we get nook miles for trashing our tools, so that's okay. Little fishy, and more nook miles. Okay, so I time traveled again because it felt like that's all I could do. Oh, I see my money tree is growing in already. But yeah, I felt like that was all we could do, so here we are with um, no news from Tom Nook again. Right, what do we have here? Document stack? I, I suppose I could use that somehow. I don't know how, but we're getting it. I'm gonna chop- oh. Oh god. Please, please. I, I've seen that we can do this, we can do this. Let's go. Oh, let's try it. Please. How- I- mm. That is a little bit embarrassing. I'm not gonna lie. We did it so well before, but of course this time we got stuck. <laughs> uh. Okay, I'm gonna chop some trees down. We've got a new look. We've got a swollen eye, but that's okay. And I don't know if I ever showed you this um, Able Sisters area, like when I actually put it down, but it's here. It's getting built. And I think it's in a cute spot. It's right next to Nooks, like on the opposite side of the pond. I think, I don't know. I think it'll look really cute here. We could do a little path between them. Okay. I thought what we were missing was another tomato field. <laughs> another tomato area. So, we're gonna make another identical patch of tomatoes with everything that we've just picked from that tomato field. And then we're gonna have like double the harvest and then we're gonna have stonks, you know, we're gonna we're gonna make so much money from these tomatoes that we're growing and then selling. And it's gonna be the best time. Okay. I have a full inventory of fish, please. What what have we got? What have we got? Please tell me. Twelve thousand, I'll take that. I'm gonna buy another study chair. That'll match the last one. It's all good. Okay. We have saved up so many miles. I had 20,000 before I started recording this little clip and I thought we should get some Nook Miles tickets. Like, what am I missing except the little villager hunt that we want to go on? So I got, I'm getting five tickets and then I might spend the spare bells on things like the tool ring. Yeah. So I think I'm going to get the tool ring and then there was also, I want to upgrade my pocket size. So we're going to get the pocket organization guide as well, which is very expensive, but that's okay. And yeah, I want the pretty good tools as well. That's fine. We're spending all of our nook miles 
but look at us go. We can get stronger tools now. We're gonna have a bigger inventory. And yeah, it's 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 gonna it's gonna help. It's gonna help, trust me. I want the tool ring as well. Give me that tool ring. Okay, it's time. It's time that I caved and bought a wetsuit so we can go out swimming, getting all those sea creatures. Because I've done this before on other islands, got lots of sea creatures, and then sold the full inventory of sea creatures. And it just, it gives you so much money sometimes. Sometimes it's like average, sometimes it's so much. Right, let's drop everything. I wanna try and get a full inventory of these sea creatures from diving. Let's go. Let's go. I'm gonna jump in. Oh my goodness. So cute. Right. I am gonna catch so many. And I'm gonna show you them all. And it's gonna be a great time. Oh, a little break for Nook Miles. Look at us go. I think we got two. Oh my goodness. Okay, I got a scallop, and you know what that means? You get Pascal, the little cutie. Look at us go. Hey man, about that scallop of yours, can I have it? Of course you're gonna be able to have it. Thank you for the generosity, man. I love you, Pascal, you're a little cutie. Since you're cool about the scallop, I left you a cool recipe. The pearls that you need for the recipe are rare, and they're gonna keep, he's gonna keep his eyes open for us. That is so cute. Forget give and take, this is called give and give. Uh, okay, lay that truth on me. Feel this. If your philosophy can't be summed up in three words on a t-shirt, man, it's too much work. Stick that in your skillet and let it simmer. <laughs> I mean, I, I'll i take that into mind, Pascal. You know, look at us go. Okay, so here is our full inventory. I mean, I know I'm missing two, but that's okay. Our full inventory. Of sea creatures. Let's not sell them a mid wall. And I want to see how much these will sell for. Actually, I kind of want to see what the jellyfish looks like if it's got a cool tank or not. So I'm going to leave that out. 27,900 bells. Hello, everyone. This is Tom Nook. Happy Tuesday. Now, for today's news Able Sisters is open. Amazing. And we can do a ceremony, which I haven't done one yet. Amazing. We have Able Sisters. We did sell some stuff at the drop off box yesterday. So, okay, we got like 6,000 bells. That's a good time. We have a lot of bells. Wow. Oh, hello, Dom. How you doing? We got a new reaction. Amazing. Thank you, Dom. You're perfect. I gave Dom a jumper yesterday and he's took it off. It's actually really upsetting. I think yesterday as well, I got a new outfit. Look at how cool I look. Let's see. I did move my flowers over here and I start I made like um my orchard a bit better around this area So we have a walkway this way and I wanted to do some custom designs today Maybe shall we go see the able sisters? I suppose I'll show you where I put the able sisters over this way Let's see right next to the heart pond on the other side. Very cute. I'm excited about it all Hello there. Welcome to the able sisters where we sell fashions made lovingly by Chloe. They have claws I did not know that <laughs> We've got the recommended items and I want to have, I want to keep an eye out for cute clothes, you know? Custom designs, amazing. We don't, we're not going to use the portal because I'm doing this without Nintendo Online. I was going to do it just without terraforming, but I want to challenge myself to do the designs myself. Um, okay, I'm going to see if there's anything cute in here. Is there anything cute? Oh, the pockets. Oh, it's a little ducky one. There's a frog one. Why are these so cute? Oh my god. And these sweaters. Wait a sec. Ooh, I kind of love. Oh my god, you can tell it's autumn. Wow. What is this? <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, and we've got this cute hair. I don't want that though because I've got my horns. Um, love that. Eye patch. Ooh, they're kind of cool. I kind of like those. Wait, the socks are everything. No, why are these so cute though? The sweaters are perfect for your theme. They really are. Oh, and we've got some cute shoes. Which ones do I like? I like these brown ones. Let's make an outfit. I'm kind of obsessed. I think this might be the outfit. I like the dark ones. Okay. And I got the grape basket yesterday. Obsessed. I'm excited. 
excited. This is so cute. Thank you. A nice fall outfit, exactly. I don't know. I think someone told me to talk to Sable a lot, and I don't know why, but that's okay, because I'll do it. I'll do it as often as I can. I suppose we'll get into... Oh, Sahara's here. We'll do some daily stuff, and then see what Sahara has, I suppose. And of course, we're gonna whack these rocks. And today, we're gonna be doing a villager hunt, so after we've done a little bit of daily things, you know. Sahara, I will speak to you later. I will speak to you later. I have the three plots. I did work on getting all of the items for those. So I think I've got everything for those. Ooh, my money rock. I've got all of the plot stuff ready. And I'm not putting it in until we find three villages. I'm pretty sure that we can villager hunt without completing the plot. I think I've done that before by accident. <laughs> oh, please. I'm gonna get my rocks. I don't really actually need to do all of my rocks now that we've got the money rock. And I have so much materials, so many materials in my storage. I don't know where my money tree is, but I kind of just want to get into the villager hunt. So I think we might do that. I've got five tickets out and I think that hopefully will be enough. Oh, this is my gaff. Isn't it great? Let me learn this. Thank you. And I'm gonna put loads of stuff in storage. And I guess I'll put all of these bells in the ABD because it's a bit annoying to have them out like this. Can I stack them up with this? No, okay. I can probably stack these up though, yeah. Oh, that's so annoying. That hurts, okay. Right, let me go put these in the ABD. Oh wait, I'm gonna go back inside my house and get the tickets. So annoying. I really want a storage shed. That would that would make my heart happy. There they are. Look at those bad boys. Five whole Nook Mile tickets. I got the tool ring. I upgraded my inventory. And what else did I get? Oh, I got the, the, the better tools recipes. So I spent quite a lot of miles yesterday. We're going on a villager hunt besties. And the two main people that I want to find are bow and stitches but because it is like an autumnal fall island i do want to look out for coco because she's my fave anyway lucky as well kiki i definitely want kiki and then maybe some more autumnal ones i do have a knock miles ticket on me let's go to our first island time to take off amazing thank you very kindly uh, okay, we are down and docked. Indeed we are. Let us see who is here. Right, where are we gonna be? It's one of these islands. Let's climb up to the top then. Let's climb up. I'm really nervous. Okay, why don't I see anyone? Oh, wait. Okay, right. Rhonda, I think is a cutie but i don't want ronda on applesauce she does not fit the theme i'm gonna grab this i'm gonna see if there's a message in a bottle and i'm gonna shake the trees for our item that is a cute butterfly wait hello come back what are you <gasps> this is so pretty oh my god that is such a ronda butterfly oh thank you anything good not on this side oh i found the item floating biotope planter hi I want to go the second island in the hunt. Let's see. Who is this? I don't want a sporty elephant, I'm not gonna lie. Who are you? I don't think I've ever met you before. Big Top? Why is Big Top kind of a cutie? If he wasn't in that outfit, like, he's kind of a cutie. Let me grab these. And oh my god. Okay, we've got this. Oh, oh my god. Well, yeah, that, mm, that's unfortunate. There's a strategy to catch them right away if you don't know already. How do that? I don't know this. I need the knowledge. I did not know that there was a strategy. Why can't I get the item? Hello? You better have the item. You do indeed. A lawn chair. It's definitely not worth it, I'm not gonna lie. But I need all the items I can get. Come on, Wilbur. This better be a good island. Let's go. Who is it gonna be? Where are we? Over this way. Right, let me get my stick out and let's go over. Who is it gonna be? Oh, oh no. It's you. I have a vendetta against the bulls, I'm not gonna lie. Stu is cursed. <laughs> Stu is definitely cursed. A cursed king. Right, should we try out, what's the word, method? We only have a couple left, come on. Oh my god. <gasps> it worked! Oh my god, the method worked! There's a method to the madness. And here's my item. An absolute victory if you ask me. Is this number four? I think this is number four. Okay, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Right, what island have we got? Okay, we need our stick. Let's have a look. Oh my god. Wait, I want that off. Thank you. Oh my god, he's got his booty cheeks out. Jesus Christ. 
Not the booty cheeks. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Again? Oh, what a sleigh. Okay, we can we can escape quickly, it's okay. Oh my god, he's so scary. Please don't look at me. Okay. Norma! Oh, Norma's kind of a cutie though. She doesn't really fit autumnal. But do we invite her? Because I don't think we're gonna get perfect villagers. You know, like all of them. But what I want. I really do not have a lot of Nook Miles. Yeah, I can get one more ticket. <laughs> we need three villagers. <laughs> Just notice the pigtails, you don't like them. It's a, it's a choice. I'm gonna invite Norma. I think Norma's a good idea. Okay, Norma, do you wanna move to Applesauce? Oh, okay, I've got this. That's so good. I'm never gonna not catch a wasp now. Oh, and here's my item. I suppose I'm gonna sell loads of these. I'm gonna keep all the wasps for Flick. That's so many wasps. Let me sell all these coconuts and all of the wasps' nests. 14,000. Let me get the pet bull. I think that works. And then I'm gonna buy this. Sounds like a great time. I do not have a watering can, but I suppose we can try and make one. What do I need for it? Softwood. I think I have softwood in the house. A watering can. What are my produce? What are my flowers? Do I have a... Yeah, I do. I have one here. Right, let me craft this. All done. Right, is my watering can in my ring? It is. Oh, it's one of these rubbish ones that doesn't water loads. I wish I just bought one now. This is upsetting. We did one of these. Nook Miles. Get two of these bad boys. Who's it gonna be? I don't know. Oh! I don't know his name, but I don't really want him. I'm not gonna lie. Not wasps again. Okay. Wait! No, 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 no. It didn't turn me. Oh! Okay. That's embarrassing. <gasps> we got Nook Miles for it though. <laughs> That's okay. Yikes. Oh my goodness. Come on, Wilbur. You're gonna give us someone good. Oh, okay, wait. Sherb is a little cutie. Hi, Sherb. Sherb is adorable. I'm gonna invite Sherb because I want to have villagers that I'm happy with. <gasps> My item. Thank you. These are the inside stuff. So let's put it all on the inside. Doink. Interior. Crocodile. Alligator. This away. Amazing. Doink. Interior. This and this. Wait, is that not for there? What do I need now? Check exterior. A pot? Why did I put a rose wreath here? Was the rose wreath for this one? Interior. Submit. It was. Rose wreath and these. And now I need to make a pot. Look at us go. Let me go put this in the plot. Amazing. Oh my goodness. We've done it. Look at us go. We've got this. It's a great time. Let's see. I'm gonna ask Tom Nook what we need to do. Actually, no. We're gonna go see Sahara first, then we're gonna ask Tom Nook. So you got attacked by wasps? How could you tell? We love you, Sahara. Place on wall. That's nice. And we got Nook Miles. What are these? Good things in store. Hello. Ah, oh, honey. Hello. How have things been going since we last spoke? You're close to finishing the plots and furniture. Everything's good. Everything's all done. The rest is up to me. I'll get started on home construction right away. I forgot how cute the little fencing is. Make them look like a little farm. That is perfect. Making this adorable and cute and the best. We can get another ticket. Wait, let's do another ticket. Right, give me. I've got 40 miles left. This is so sad. Well, let's go to another island. I'm gonna get out my vaulting pole straight away. I'm praying it is someone cute. Wait a sec. Have I just wasted a Nook Miles ticket? I wasted a Nook Miles ticket. But I have one house left. Why is it like that? How does that work? Why? I've got a spare plot. So why? I'm confused. That's so sad. <laughs> Alexa play KK Blue Sky. Okay, 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 wait. I am so good. What did I caught a bug? Oh, I did. I caught a wasp. Oh, Norma. Oh my god. Sherb. Okay. I can't believe we autofilled. Right. Push your fingers, everyone. Exactly. Peanut. Who's Peanut? Peppy Squirrel. Peanut is so adorable, right? Peanut is so cute. But she really does not fit an autumnal island, but definitely a cutie. So it's like not the worst. We could have definitely gotten some awful people like like Chops or Boris or Rocket, you know? But she does not fit autumnal. I think I want to work on making a custom designed path. So we need like an autumnal path. Could use that. How do people do their natural paths? Okay, I can do this. We go down like that. I don't need to do it exactly the same. Like, I'm not super caught up on doing it, like, super the same. But just, like, in general, I just want to make it look nice. Right, I think that works. 
I was also thinking within the autumn core kind of thing that we're doing, we could mix in metal core because I've always wanted to do a metal core island because like that's so cute. And I've seen a lot of like spring core metal islands. I don't know if I've seen an autumn one personally. So I think it'd be really fun to do. I do like a little a little thing like this and like a dot there. Right. I can only display on ground like so. Obviously, this is not going to be the final piece. I do want... Oh wait, really? Why would I choose that space last? I do want to shade it, do it more autumnal colours. Come on, what are you doing? Don't disconnect on me. Why can't I... Okay, this is not a vibe. Let me out of this jail. I can't go left at all. It won't let me go left. That was very sudden. Do they move in all at once or one at a time? I can't remember. Hello, Tom. We get a new neighbor today, Shub. And another announcement. DIY veterans can now take part in the special customization workshop. <gasps> okay. First decoration. I've already put decorations out. A tourist telescope. That's a good one, actually. Hello. You're a cutie. Enjoy moving in. Hi. <gasps> Sewing machine. That is not bad. I will take that. Then I'll take you. Hello. As you might have heard on today's broadcast, I'm now offering a new workshop. Thank you. Let me collect my miles. 150. I might just time travel to get all of the villagers moved in. If I time travel two days, will both of them be moved in? I used to have a DS Lite, but my dog ate it when I was a child. So I have a DSi XL, but I don't know where that is. Tom Nook. Applesauce gained a new neighbor. Peanut. I don't think both of them have moved in. And resident services again upgrade finally. Luna. <gasps> we have Luna's bed now. Amazing. Okay. Peanut's house is kind of a vibe. Okay. Norma's house is also adorable. Little theme going on with like the pink. So we have those moved in. Tomorrow, Nook County gets an upgrade. It's going to be a good time. Oh my god, I thought my money disappeared. <gasps> Harvey! Hi! This episode is gonna be wild. Hi, Harvey! Glad to meet you. You can call me Harv if you want. Amazing. Okay, we're gonna go to this island. And it's gonna be a good time. What's the deal? I heard this place was, like, deserted. Not anymore. Not anymore. Cute sofa? What have we got? We have... Oh, tomatoes again. Hyacinths. <gasps> and tulips! Amazing. I want five. We have red tulips, white tulips, yellow tulips, white hyacinth. I don't know where to do the cornfield, but I'm gonna I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it for another time. We're gonna put it in my storage. I think that would be a good idea. Um, I'm gonna put all these flowers away actually. Alright. Let me put in storage. All of these bad boys. I'm gonna sell these. Make some monies. Make some buckaroonies. I feel like we've done good. We got three new villagers. We are gonna have an upgraded resident services tomorrow. We're gonna be going up in the world and it's gonna be a great time. Hello my lovelies and welcome back to Design an Island in 30 Days without Nintendo Online or Terraforming. And we didn't live stream today, but I did get a lot of playtime in anyway. So I suppose we'll just get straight into it. Okay, so I'm doing a little voiceover after the fact because we've had some family visiting and I was able to get on my Switch and stuff but not really able to record, but that's okay. Um, obviously here I am just picking all of my little tomatoes because these are a big money maker. They're doing so well for us and I'm kind of obsessed with how the little farm is looking. Like, isn't this just so cute? And picking these tomatoes got us some bells, which is, nope, not bells, <laughs> Nook Miles, amazing. And we also got the upgrade for the resident services. And I did this yesterday, so today we're waiting for it to open up, so we will be time traveling, so this bad boy will be the full building. And I found a money tree, I went to Nook's, did my little dailies, uh, picked up some really cute items and this is going to be really cute for decorating the island and of course hit some rocks i don't have a family money rock though i decided to time travel to tomorrow because i wanted resident services to be opened up i wanted us to get isabel i wanted to work towards getting our star rating and being able to check our island evals and just you know move on with the challenge so we did 
time travel. Hello, Isabel. And I got some mail, and I didn't realise, but like, I got sent a Nook Miles ticket, what? And then I saw this gorgeous butterfly. Of course I had to catch it, even though we're not giving these to Falathers. I'm gonna sell it straight away, but that's okay. Every time I time travel, we obviously have to go into Nook's cranny and see if there's any cute things to buy, anything to decorate the island with because we're not using treasure islands and we've got 30 days to make this island look somewhat cute, you know, that's the goal. And I've been putting all of my items in this absolute doom pile um, and it's, it's not looking the prettiest right now but we can use the items in another way later on because this is going to get us to three stars, <laughs> I hope. And then I walked in and of course Tom Nook had to speak to us um, because Resident Services has been upgraded and he wanted to introduce Isabel to us, the little cutie. I'm very excited about this. There was a few things that I need to do. Um, we can now build bridges and inclines and we also need to get KK Slider here which means we need to get a three star island. So for the next few days of the challenge it's probably gonna be a massive grind on trying to get three stars because that is the main priority to keep moving on with the island and I'm hoping we can get to maybe a five star island. It's not in the ultimate goals, the the, the goals of this challenge are really to like, you know, have an island that actually fits the theme and is fully decorated. I did decide to change the island theme tune and the flag and get my daily miles, which were 500 miles today from the Nook Stop, um, to get some more Nook miles because we're going to need them if we're going to go on another villager hunt. And popping into Ables, I wanted to see if Able Mabel's Ables labels had some cute clothes and when looking through like the clothes are okay but there's nothing really here for like what i would want there is a duck bill though so that was kind of interesting but yeah nothing for us today been catching some bugs and working on getting the things together to get that campsite built because we did get given the recipe from tom nook so we're able to craft that now because we have all of the materials we need and I need to figure out where I want to put the campsite. So that's going to be a challenge because the island, we're not terraforming, you know? I wanted to sell some stuff in my inventory because it was really full and we have quite a few good things. So hopefully we'll get like a decent amount of bells from this stuff. Maybe? How much? Yeah, 19,000 bells. That's like, that's so much. And we got some Nook Miles for selling, which is a great time. Okay, I've been looking around for like a perfect place for this campsite. And the only place that I've found that would really work is here. Because of course, you know, we're not terraforming. So I need to have lots of space around the campsite to put things that are like decorations. I want to have trees next to it. I want to have pumpkins. I want to make sure that it's going to be in like the perfect area so here is where i found and i think it looks super cute there i think it's a good time okay hello you two lovely villagers i have put the campsite down and it's a great time what have you got for us what do we need to do now because we should be getting a campsite villager what like tomorrow because it's like or is it does it get built tomorrow maybe i can't remember but yeah, we've got, to, we've got to move on. We need to do the workshop. So I'm just going to quickly get that done. It's just, I hate doing the workshop, but you know, it's necessary. Let's change this. Okay, I thought we would time travel after that workshop because I couldn't think of anything else to do. We did our dailies, we did everything. And we now have our own campsite. Um, do we get a villager staying in it today or do we get it like later on? Yeah, I don't think we get one today, but that's okay. I will not be doing a celebration ceremony, but thank you, anyway. And, okay, the bug off registration is here. Do you have to register? What? Oh, okay, we have a phone call from Tom Nook, what the hell? Let's go to the airport. Oh my god, it's Lottie. I forgot, we have the DLC. 
but I think we spoke about this in some other episodes. I'm not going to be doing the, uh, no, it's not Happy Home Paradise. No, it is. Yeah. I'm not going to be doing the DLC in this because obviously you get Wardell's catalog and it's not part of it. I wanted to pick up my little tomatoes again. These things grow so quickly and, you know, that's good news for us. More bells. And then I thought I'd shake my peach trees just to add on, like more bells to what we're going to be selling and 17,000 bells is pretty good and then we time traveled again because I wanted to get that campsite villager out of the way I need to know who we're gonna have to have on the island so let's let's see and it's Lopez Lopez is really cute I really like Lopez um, he's not perfect but I think he does fit the autumnal theme I think He's an antelope, right? I think that's really cute. And that, it, there's a car alarm, please. He fits the theme well. <laughs> and there's definitely worse campsite villagers to get. I'm just happy we got someone that like I can settle with, you know? So we've got him to move in. Let's go. Right, I need to find a place for Lopez's house. And I was thinking around about here, because it's within the neighborhood. This is going to be like the trick or treat neighborhood. And so I thought we should put Lopez in with these. Oh, there's going to be so many other houses we're going to have to fit in. And without terraforming, I have no idea how we're going to do it. But had to move this tree. And I think this is probably the best spot for Lopez's house. And we did it. Amazing. Proud of us. Okay, we got Lopez's plot all sorted out. And now we need to think about getting other islands other islands on the island other villages on the island um and of course tom nook is gonna make us pay which is really annoying but we can do it we'll get on with it it's fine thank you tom nook label was visiting and so i thought we'll do her little challenge and we'll do a little outfit for her so we have to do a little vacation outfit i think she gave us a little top so we can just kind of use that with whatever else I have and then tell her like, oh, this is perfect. You know, see, like, she really liked our help. We got a little Taylor's ticket. She gave us some sunglasses. They're kind of cute, but I do prefer my own shades. <laughs> okay. Oh, hi, Shav. Hi there, little cutie. Okay, let's see. What do you want? Welcome to the island gift. That's really cute, but you do know that you moved to the island? We were already here, you little cutie. Okay, thank you. And then we time traveled again. And it is Norma's birthday, so we're gonna have to go celebrate the birthday with her. And Lopez has moved in. It's a big day, we've got stuff to do. Label sent us that little Taylor's ticket and our tomatoes had grown in yet again. And I found my money tree, doing all my little dailies, getting them sorted. And I thought we should go say hello to Lopez. Welcome in, welcome him in to the island, you know, all of the good stuff. He's he's been here like a little a little less than a day, so I wanted to say hello. And I kind of want to see what his house looks like. It's a lot of wood, but it's kind of cute, you know. I like the style; it fits. Hello Norma, it is Norma's birthday, I came for the cake, I mean, um, to say hello to Norma and happy birthday of course, and we did bring her a present. <laughs> it wouldn't be a present that I would want, but I'm sure Norma, Norma will want this, it's, it's a little humidifier, of, and it's pink, like is that not perfect? Okay, here's your humidifier, Norma. See, I, I knew it would be perfect for her, I knew it. Right, let's let's dig into this cake. Why don't we? Oh, hi Peanut. Hello. Are you gonna give me some cake? No. Oh, I <laughs> blew out the candles. I just want a slice of cake, please. Just oh my goodness. Okay, bye. Bye. I did get some Nook Miles for going to that birthday though, which is a great time. Okay. Flick is on the island, and we know what that means. It means money. So I'm gonna go and get the wasps that we got, I think yesterday, from doing all that like villager hunting. We caught so many wasps. 
So I think that could get us a lot of bells. I think we could definitely work with this. I'm gonna go down and get them from our little bug beach and take them to flick. That little hack that someone taught me yesterday of like being able to just catch them straight away if you shake the tree like on a diagonal helped so much. We got so many wasps and let's see how much they're gonna sell for. I mean five wasps isn't like a billion but like it's a lot. It's a lot. See a whole swarm. 18,750 bells. Don't mind if I diddly do. Thank you, Flick. I will gladly take those bells off you. Um, okay, I, I suppose we'll go catch some more bugs as well. I found a money tree behind resident services that I completely forgot about. Okay. And I want to sell my stuff in my inventory so we can try and get a full inventory of bugs for Flick. And see how that goes. I also want to buy a couple things here because... Um, there are a few things that I can see myself using, like the iron insect can be used inside my house. I think that would work really well in like the bathroom or the kitchen or the bedroom or something. Just something to bulk up the items that we have. And then these candles are so perfect for the autumnal like aesthetic that we're going to have going on. So I actually grabbed a couple of those as well. Okay, time to catch or attempt to catch bugs. As you can see, it was not going very well for me. I'm, I'm not good at this. I caught a few though. I caught a few. I forgot that villagers actually craft things in their house. So I saw Dom was in and I thought, you know what? I should probably see if he's crafting something because I really need to get more, what are they called? Like recipes for like items. Even though we don't have tulips on the island, it's still good to get, like, bulk up the recipes, I suppose. Um, thank you, Dom. Okay, more bug catching. As you can see, I'm really good at this. It's working so well for me. I, like, what? Okay, we caught one. Right, I've given up on bug catching. Flick, just tell me what I'm gonna get for these four measly bugs that I caught. I just, I need to know. I need to know. 2,000 bells. Okay, hello. We have inquiries about the campsite. Amazing. And we, I'm guessing he's going to ask us about selling more land. And obviously we need to get three stars. I think we might be able to do the island eval now as well. Let's have a little look. I'd like to know how many stars we have on this island. Okay, Tom Nook, I will come over and ask you what I should do. Hello. I have no idea. Okay, just Project K. Is this, is it going to send us straight over to Isabel? Probably. Okay, great. So we didn't need to sit down in front of you, Tom. Right. Okay. I'm guessing that we need to sell some land and we need to work on the three stars, like I've mentioned earlier on. And so, I'm gonna see how many stars we have. Let's see. Lay it on me, Isabel. I can take it. I can take it. Can you get zero stars? Is that a thing? I don't know. I'm like on the edge of my seat right now. What have we got, Isabel? Please. One star. A one star rating. I mean, it makes sense. We have like no one on the island. We have all of the starter villages and like the starter three that we traveled for, the two that we got, and then the one campsite villager. So it kind of makes sense. We need more people on the island to get more stars. Um, I can do that. We can, we can get some plots. Let's get one. I'm going to get one plot and I don't know if I'll put it down today, but we could have it for tomorrow. We could have it ready because I want to do a villager hunt. We're going to have to get a lot more Nook Miles though. Okay, I've been running around, catching bugs, catching fish, doing all the good stuff. I just really need to try and get more Nook Miles because we're getting to the point where we're going to have to be do, doing quite a few villager hunts for these plots unless we want to order fill, which I, I really don't want to order fill. I want to get some dreamies. I want to get stitches. I want to get cocoa. 
maybe bow, but we have like an antelope now, so I'm not sure. Look at this salmon. Wow. I'm so talented. Um, I'm not sure who else we want. Maple, maybe. Just some like cottage core but autumnal cuties, I suppose. And I'm looking for my bottle on the beach because I haven't gotten that today as well. Here it is. There we go. Let's hope that this is something useful. Fingers crossed. A cabin wall. I don't really want the wallpapers and stuff, not gonna lie. Okay, so today I didn't stream as well. Well, again. And I played a lot. Well, not, not even a lot, actually. I didn't play too much today because I wasn't feeling too well. Um... Because I'd been out all day with um, family and my boyfriend and we had a lovely day out and it was just, I got home and I was just so tired. Like, as someone who is disabled and chronically ill, being out all day really kills me off. Um, and so I was just too tired to play too much. But I did get some things done. Sold a lot of things to Nook's Cranny, bought a few items, we did time travel a bit, did some of my dailies, all the good stuff. Um, and I'm very happy in the place this left us off in, as you will see. But yes, I've been buying some really cute things from Nook's Cranny uh, to decorate the um, island with. And I've been collecting my miles. I bought a fence here. The country fence is like one of my favourites to do on like a natural island and I think it'll fit so well with the autumnal theme we've got going on. And then I thought we have a lot of bells so I may as well put a lot of stuff into my savings and also pay off my loan. Because look, look at all that look at all them bells. We're, we're billionaires. I mean not quite but I think it's a good idea to get the next loan paid off, have a bit more storage, a bigger house, move on to bigger things, and it's going to be a good time. So we did that. Look at us go. We've actually, we've done it so quickly. I'm so proud of us for getting this far. And of course, Tom Nook was like, yeah, but you could do better. You could have a bigger house. Um, so... I went into debt again because he convinced me and we have upgraded our house again. We haven't finished paying off that loan, obviously. Um, and then I also thought it would be a good idea to think about bridges and inclines. I haven't properly thought about the layout of the island, but it would be good to start having some bridges and inclines in places because we know where like we're not terraforming so we know where the bridges need to go i suppose sahara was on the island today and of course i bought all of the rugs and both of the mystery items from sahara and you know you, you've just got to do it you've got to do it and i'm excited about those we also got some nook miles for doing this which is great because we need to save those up i decided we should Decorate the house a little bit. Like, we got some new rugs. We got some new furniture. Like, we've got so many items. And, like, I had it so ugly before, you know, with all the starter things. So I thought, mm, it's about time that I do something with all the items that I have. And it's definitely nowhere near perfect. But I can work with it. I can work with this. <laughs> And doing that got us some bells. Nope, Nook Miles as well. Okay, I want to find my money rocks. So we're going to whack some rocks and get all the stuff out of it. And hopefully we find the money rock. But also getting all of these materials will really help with the DIYs. And obviously Nook Miles saving up. Amazing. Okay, more materials. We didn't find the money rock, but... I got a gold nugget, so I'm very happy with that. That'll help me buy another shovel, I suppose. Um, because they keep breaking. I really need to just, like, actually upgrade my tools and do something about that. Like, I've got the better tools recipes, but I just forget that I can make the better tools. <laughs> um, I'm gonna run around and I'm gonna pick up all of these coconuts. And... Maybe some of the shells and things, because we need to get more money. We need to find a way 
to get more money so we can pay off the loan we can pay off the bridge that I'm gonna build so yeah we're gonna sell all this fruit I also know that selling fruit has like it's little nook miles like achievements I probably have to sell like thousands but I may as well work towards that and hopefully get a few more nook miles out of it so yeah let's shake some trees get some apples even though they don't sell for loads but it's worth it in the long run I suppose I hope everyone's had a lovely week so far I definitely have with having family over it's been really nice we've been getting out in the sun there's a bit of a heat wave going on right now um, in the UK so it's been like almost 30 degrees C um, super sunny always needing sun cream on but I live right next to the beach so it's been absolutely wonderful to have that um, okay I need to sell this full inventory of stuff and 14,000 bells is great thank you I also thought we should say hello to Lopez because he's moved in and I feel like we've talked to him once um, and I caught fish I've just been going around the island trying to catch fish um, picking up things to sell find my messages in a bottle you know all that good stuff because you know we're working towards a common goal I went to this little town yesterday along the coast for a little day trip and it was so cute the little streets and everything oh my goodness it was amazing and yesterday I had like the best pizza ever it was so good like in this little town and it was just it was like sourdough base pizza and it had like this is a weird one but i love tuna pizza i don't know if like it is actually weird and other people like it but i really like tuna pizza and it's an option on the menu so you know um they didn't have any pineapple pineapple on pizza is my favorite just just pineapple and cheese so good but i had a little tuna pizza and it was amazing and it was really nice to walk around a little town okay now Let's choose a bridge. I don't know which one to go with, to be honest. The stone bridge is a classic, and uh, custom paths fit underneath it, which is really cool. I love the brick bridge, and it would go, but I also find it hard to fit in. So I think we'll go with the stone bridge, just because like I'm I'm used to that bridge. It's it's like a comfort bridge. Let's go see where we can put this bridge. I suppose. Okay, I have an idea. I want to connect the neighborhood over here and figure out where I want to put it. Because there's not too much, like, even land, I suppose. Um, yeah, that's, like, not even. So I'm going to have to find a very specific area for this bridge because we're not terraforming. Here is okay, I think. Let's have a look. Like, that looks okay. But I also think we could put it somewhere better. I kind of like it down at the front. I mean, the ideal place is where that like little bit of land juts out a bit. Like it sticks out. I would love it there. But obviously we can't terraform and make it so that would work. Okay, it doesn't fit here. That's a shame. I'm gonna see... Uh, I don't want it behind the house really. So I think next to it is gonna be the best place for this to work. Okay, let's have a little look. Let me imagine. Okay, yeah, that's fine. We've moved up a little bit from the first time I looked at it. I think it looks a bit better there. Look at us go. Look at us go. We're so good at this. We've got our first bridge in the works on applesauce. And hi, Tom. You have to ruin the moment every single time. Why do you have to babysit us like this? Like, please, just let me build this bridge in peace okay stop trying to get money out of me it's it's a bit embarrassing right okay i need to open this message in a bottle as well what did we get oh my god i'm so sick of getting little diy recipes that like we already have but that's okay i'm gonna sell it anyway um but yes Okay, so we've time traveled to the next day because I felt like there wasn't much to do and I also time traveled um, a bit earlier in the day because I wasn't enjoying like playing with the dark. Like sometimes I like it and it's nice and cozy, but I wanted to be in the light hours of Animal Crossing. Um, we did sell some stuff at Nook's Cranny, so we got almost 20,000 bells, which is great. That's a great time. And we have mail. 
we did upgrade our house so i think yeah happy home academy is sent something and sherba sent us a little present that's so cute oh my god okay what have we got let me see what did sherba send us a, a toilet okay and a shower set all right what we'll do is i think we can pick all of these tomatoes of course they're growing so quickly and they're such a good money maker so i'm gonna pick them all and i'm gonna sell these bad boys because we need to work towards paying off that bridge i'm probably not gonna work towards paying off the loan anytime soon because we've upgraded quite a few times now and i don't imagine we're gonna have full in like full storage um that's a lot of miles oh my god okay i'm gonna buy some things in this cranny um, some of these things are really cute, so I thought it was a good idea just to grab them. I like checking Nook's Cranny every single day. And I also like to keep an eye out for the parasols. This one is super autumnal. I think this parasol is going to be perfect to use to decorate. And it's been the only one so far out of the whole six days, I suppose. But we've been time traveling, so it's kind of longer than that um, in game. But yeah, and I need to sell some things because I have those tomatoes that I picked. Okay, let's see how much these tomatoes are going to sell for. Okay, let me know, Tommy. 12,600 for all those tomatoes. That's kind of tempting to like grow more because that's like a good money maker. Like that's so good. Okay, I'm just whacking my rocks again, as always, getting the good stuff, and trying to find my money rock. Here it is. Look at us go. We found it. And I'm glad that I was able to, like, actually make this rock work, because I tried one with the holes earlier, and I completely messed up. It just... I think I w didn't even get, like, the last three hits in right so i didn't even get this the, the stuff from it it was really annoying okay thank you for upgrading my house but i'm not i don't appreciate being in debt to be honest thanks tom nook okay i think we should pay off a little bit of this bridge i don't think i have enough i think it's a hundred and yeah hundred and seventy thousand basically and we've got 185 bells wow okay i'm gonna put in Mm. I'll not do as much as possible. I was tempted. 120,000. We are left with a little bit where we can like check, Snook check Nook's Cranny and like buy things if we want to. Today was a very short one because I wasn't feeling too well, but I hope you enjoyed it regardless. Please leave a like and subscribe if you did. And tomorrow's will be longer. I can promise you that. I shall see you in day six. Nope, that's today. Day seven of the 30 day challenge tomorrow. Isabel, hello there everyone. Amazing. It's the bug off today. How did I not know that? Completely forgot about that actually, but that's a good idea to make more bells and things. We should do the bug off. Why have I got Nook Miles? What did I do? Active for 20 days. I've time traveled that much. I forgot everyone wears these funky outfits for the bug off. Oh my goodness, okay. I need to pay off this bridge. I worked on this yesterday. Should we sign up to the bug off? See, this is a sporty cap. That makes sense. I kind of like that one, but it's not sporty either. Let me get my money tree. We'll do some of the dailies. That is not what I meant to do. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna put back in 10,000 bells. Because we have enough money to do so. And I have a plot in my inventory, which I need to put down somewhere. But I don't want to put it down yet. I want more nook miles so we can go on a villager hunt. The bug off within three minutes. We're gonna we're gonna be amazing. It's gonna be great. Flame, I need you to get off. I can't right now. I'm too warm. It's a bit sensory overload. Right. I suppose we're gonna do a round. Amazing. Wait. I've got it. Let's go. Where are all my bugs? Where are the bugs at? Are they hiding from me? I saw one over here. Oh, I'm really bad at catching bugs. I see bugs everywhere. We're on our second one. I can do this. Where did that... What? I was going to call it a firefly. Dragonfly. It's literally still, please. Thank you. Alright, is there any more over here? Did he say three was what we needed to do? That's all I can do, apparently. 
Right, let's see. We've got two minutes left. I'm sure we can do something in that time. Oh, there's a freaking balloon. Wait, I'm going to sabotage myself and get this balloon because I need the items. We're fine. We're fine. I can do this. I can't find any more bugs. I might have cursed myself by... What the hell? Getting that balloon. But, oh my god. <laughs> Guys, we're okay. We've got four. It's fine. It's fine. I also don't have... Oh, I heard one. Oh, did I scare it off the tree? Okay. That's unfortunate. I'm not gonna long away. Let's see. Where's the rest of the bugs? Please tell me. I don't actually have like an area where they would like all spawn either. I've got one here. Oh, where'd he go? The past couple days, I've been catching bugs. Well trying to catch bugs and they keep jumping in the rivers and stuff it's a struggle we've got six and i see another one behind me hello let's see there's no bugs here there's no bugs we got seven it's fine let me do this get these nook miles i'm trying to get as many nook miles as we can because we need to go villager hunting that's the goal at the minute can i sell things to on the bug off day or not i don't know maybe my net broke <laughs> Thanks. Wow. Maybe I should make a good net. Maybe that's like in the goals for today. I got seven. Thank you. Ooh, there's a hammock. I'll take the hammock. Okay. Thank you very much. Yes, this is very cute. I'm going to take it and I'm going to get a net and then sell the other bugs to them to get the money. Grab this. Thank you. Nope. And then you guys can have the pleasure of buying the bugs. Oh, I have quite a few things to sell actually. Why have I got so much in my inventory? Okay, we're gonna put the rest of the stuff in my storage. 1,200 barrels. That was not a good haul, but that's okay. This is my doom corner. It keeps growing. We ignore that for now. I'm trying to get three stars, so we gotta do what we gotta do. Let me do the bug off. Wait, is 500 bells? We gotta catch a lot. We gotta make some money off this. I saw a couple over here, but have they both like disappeared? I think they have. I see one over here. We've got one. What happens if you don't catch three? Does something happen? Grabby you. Thank you very much. I haven't got three yet. Wait. Where's all the bugs? Hello? Have they all just like ran away from me? I feel like this isn't fair. I mean, where have they gone? I need to get bridges sorted out. That is something that I need to do. We're realizing after there's no bugs on this island. Oh, there's one here. Please. I can't even see him. I got three. Look at this one. Oh, that one's pretty. Why is the timer going down while it's making me show the bug? Please. Okay, come on. Maybe a couple more. We got seven last time. I can hear bugs. I can't see any. Please. Five. I can deal with that. Oh, there's a couple over here. Hold on. You come here. Oh, how am I missing? Six. Banded dragonfly. Where's the other one gone? I saw one over here. There. No! Wait, can I get this one? I caught it! It didn't count. That's really mean if you ask me. That's really mean. More Nook Miles. It's a great time. At least I can sell these on. I'm doing so well, Flick. Six. So we get a bonus. Eight points. Oh, we can get bug relics. That would, that's what they're for then. But maybe I want to do that. There we go. 13,000. I'll take that. Okay. Well, I want to play another round. We're going to keep going. We learned a lot more than 500 bells there, so I may as well. You stay over here, please. Thank you. Number one. Starting off strong. Two. Amazing. Oh, there's one here as well. Please. Oh, God. Three. Any bugs here? There is. You. Where's he gone? Amazing. Number five. What else have we got? I don't see any others. Oh, the villagers actually go and try and catch the bugs. I'm sorry I stole that, Dom. I didn't mean to, but like, I also did, so. Oh my God. Why am I so bad at this? Where'd he go? Don't jump into the sea. Oh, it jumped into the sea, guys. I actually don't see any others. Got one. The bug was never seen again. Got a different one though. Keep thinking that apples are bugs. Apples are not, in fact, bugs. Here we've got seven. Seven measly bugs. Where are the rest of them? We've got a whole last minute left. Oh. It would also help if I was good at catching them as well. We've got eight. I see one. I see you. Nine. Can we get ten? That is the question. Probably not, but that's okay. I'm gonna try my best anyway. I see one. That's ten. That is ten. Oh, there's a balloon over there. Oh, I thought I was gonna get eleven there. I was so excited. <laughs> Where's this balloon? Can I get you here? No. Why do I keep missing? Please. Okay, just wait. 
Thank you. I earn bells by selling items. You can buy my bugs. We got 12 points. And we'll see what relics we can get. Because we could decorate with the relics. 3,000 for 10 bugs. We literally got 13,000 for 5 last time. That's so annoying. Oh, we can sell in bugs. Oh my god. 10 points for a bug relic. Behold, a butterfly backpack. Yes. What is this? A toy centipede. And then... Wear the butterfly pack. Wait. So cute. How many bells do I need for you? Okay. I think we have enough. Yeah. Okay. I'll donate the rest. That sounds great to me. Okay. Bridge done. That is a sleigh if you ask me. Let us get into some other stuff, I suppose. Oh my goodness. Oh, why would you do that? Oh, well, I, I got a money. Thank you. I'm gonna put all these in storage. Put in storage... And I need to work on Nook Miles. All we could do, we could do a mini hunt right now. We'd have to have the plot though. We'd have to put the plot down. And am I willing to do that with how many miles have I got? 7,000. Right, let's hit some rocks. So 8,000 would be how many tickets? Four? You reckon we can find someone in four tickets? We have whacked rocks. Thank you. And one more till 8,000. Maybe we'll go on a mini one. Doink. Doink. Plant a tree or shrub. Okay. If they brought out a new Animal Crossing, I would scream and cry. That would be insane. I would be so happy. Okay, I know there's a tree in here that we can plant. Yes. Can I plant one here? Struggling to not have burnout with it. That's why I'm doing the challenge. So I'm not burnt out because it's something like new. This is my trick-or-treat neighborhood. I think I need to have another house like here, I would say. How close is that to the other one though? That's pretty close, isn't it? Move it up a little bit. No, because that's so close to the uh, one above it. Wait. I'm wanting like winding paths and things. Right, that's good enough for me, I think. That's a good enough spot. Right, we're gonna get four tickets. We're gonna get four tickets. And we're gonna do a little uh, villager hunt. Redeem Nook Miles. Do we do two tickets at a time, maybe? I think so. I don't want to use all my Nook Miles straight away. We're looking for... My main two are bow and stitches. But anyone autumnal or cottage core or stuff like that is good by me. I think the, the theme in the end that I've decided with is like autumnal kind of meadow core. Because I think that would be really interesting instead of having like a spring meadow core island, have an autumnal meadow core island. I think that could be really cool. It is me. Oh, we're not going to work. Sorry. I do have a Nook Miles ticket. We've got this. We've got this. You're going to take us somewhere great and it's going to be a great time. Who is it going to be? <gasps> Cosmos. <gasps> Wait, Bianca. Is this Bianca? Am I right? Bianca is kind of a cutie, but Bianca isn't autumnal at all. Imagine a winter island with Bianca. That would be really cute. Okay, you're a cutie, but also no. Let me find my item. Oh, no. Stop whacking the trees. Thank you. Whoa, there's so many fish in that little pond. Oh my god. Okay, I did it. Amazing. I did the method and the method doesn't fail. Let me dig up some of these. Let me grab these. There we go. I am using an aquas ticket. Let's go. Who have we got? Who did you bring us to? We're gonna have to get our pole out. I'm actually really upset about that. I'm not even gonna get my pole out. I'm even gonna no, I actually have to go. I have to go shake the trees actually. This is one of the better birds, you know? Like I don't mind Amelia, but I don't want Amelia. Although her jumper is really cute and does it does fit the autumnal vibe, you know? Okay. My item straight away. A fortune telling set. I already have one of those. That's unfortunate. Aha, you see what I did there? It's a fortune telling set and it's unfortunate. What have I done? Let's see. I have shook down 10 trees for items. That was a thousand nook miles. And nowhere near the land. I thought that was a frog. I'm not gonna lie. Why not Animal Crossing? Why doesn't it have frogs just jumping around? I feel like that's something that we should have. Thank you for the nook miles ticket. You'll better have all your fingers and your toes crossed for this nook miles island. Let's go to the nook miles island. I just want all autumnal vibes come on old girl you've got this okay wilbur who have you brought me to why is rodeo haunting me island to island now what the hell for those of you who don't remember i had rodeo i think it was like literally seven tickets in a row one time something like that it was like a ridiculous amount i'm very upset right now give him my item i need to leave as soon as i can i hate rodeo rodeo is why i've got like a vendetta against bulls in this game I got beef with Rodeo. I want to fly to a Nook Miles Island, pretty please. And it better be a good one. Everyone can uncross their toes. Maybe that's why we didn't, maybe that's why we didn't get a good island. Just cross your fingers this time. 
yeah. I'm excited. I'm also nervous. And I'm just hoping for a good villager, please. Yeah, thank you, Wilbur. All right, let me get my stick out. Oh my goodness, who is this? Do I like Chow? What's our opinions on Chow? I don't think he's awful. He's kind of cute. How many Nook Miles do I have? This is so not nice. Okay, my goodness. Am I gonna take Chow? Or should I risk it to the autofill gods? GameCube Chow is so scary. I never played on GameCube. It's a color scheme. I'm just not a big fan of the color scheme. We can grind out some Nook Miles hopefully and maybe get one more ticket but after that we might have to risk it to the order fill gods which is not exactly what i want to do but like i don't know i should have took bianca i want my item please thanks it was listening i've got you bestie okay 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 see i absolutely smashing it with these wasps i'm gonna sell some stuff maybe we'll do another bug off and then we'll grind out some nook miles let me put this away we have two wasps to sell which is really nice all right, what have I got to sell? These bad boys and this shell here. Oh, and there's one up here as well. Oh, and these coconuts. We're gonna get like 9,000 bells tomorrow, which is nice. Let me sell my bugs to Flick. Hi. Something else. And I wanna sell some stuff, please. Pretty please. I have two wasps and a butterfly. 7,700, I'll take it. Indeedly do. Bye, Flick. I have so many items, this, this hurts. What have I got? A flamingo, fortune telling set. What else have we got? Anatomical model. Ooh, slay, I suppose. Then, I don't know what this is either. Oh, it's a flag. I'm sure I can use that at some point. We haven't got the worst items ever. Right, Nook Miles. Let's see. Say hello to the villagers and talk to neighbors. Fortune telling set is really cute and spooky. Yes, I have two now, but that's okay because we could do like little picnics, but with like fortune telling sets. I think it could be really cute. Right, there's three villagers here. I can speak to you guys. Hi. Hello, Peanut. You're actually so cute. Oh, we also got Lopez as a campsite villager. And that was the day before yesterday, I think. Um, yeah, pretty good campsite villager if you ask me. Catch fish. Let's catch some fish. I don't have a fishing rod. Let me go buy a fishing rod and then we'll catch some fish. I also want to put this um, out so I don't sell it by accident because I want to sell it to CJ. Let's see. Okay. Give me a fishing rod. 400 bells. Sounds great to me. Bye. You know what I really fancy? A biscuit. You know what I've got in? I've got in biscuits. Amazing. We're actually going to upgrade it. I have enough iron. So we're going to... We're gonna upgrade our fishing rod to a, a little bit better one. Where is it? Here it is. See? Amazing. Works in our favor, I suppose. Don't have to craft the first one. Right, let me, let's go fishing. I think that's gonna be a good time. I think I have to catch a sea bass for one of the Nook Miles as well, as well as just catching fish in general. Let's see how well I'll do it because I'm not very good at catching fish, so. I'm so good actually. Maybe I lied. A salmon. Any others here? Let's grab that. Do I have to go round? That's so annoying. A fish! That is definitely not in front of that fish. There's a Nook Miles achievement for catching 50 fish in a row without, like, missing them. I did 10 in a row. That's how I know, because I got Nook Miles for that one. 50 in a row seal seems, like, absolutely wild. I've got this. Amazing. See? Lovely. Oh, no fish in the... This is my heart pond, by the way. <laughs> On this no terraforming island. That's a bit sad, but that's okay. Why am I so bad at fishing? <laughs> I've got this. I'm actually so good at fishing. See, I absolutely manifested it. Look at that one. A little butterfly fish. That's so cute. What do I need? Let's see. A sea bass. I suppose we're in the right place. There we go. Wow. What are you? A black bass. Not quite what I wanted. Chop wood. I can do that. Nice and easy. Wait, how many nook miles do I have? We still need quite a bit more actually, so gonna continue fishing you know i need to chop down a tree fully as well for one of them as well so i might upgrade my axe let's chop wood and chop a tree down and then we can get another ticket i think should be should be i hope i'm upgrading my axe do i even have an axe no but i can probably make one why can't i make you i need more tree branch well i'm just gonna go buy one then i thought they didn't sell them for a second there i got a bit worried but it's all good we're fine Wait, what? I need wood? Actually really mean. I'm gonna chop down a tree. I don't know which one though. I'm just gonna chop down any. 
Wow. I love the tree falling down animation. I don't know. There's just something about it. It's just so satisfying. Oop. What did we get? Both of those. What? Okay, I need to chop more wood. Let me sell you my weeds and get lots of bells. And it'll be a good time. Hello. I'm gonna sell those. And then I can actually sell the bugs to Flick because he's still on the island. 320. Yeah. Okay. Give me those miles. I've just realized we can get another ticket. So, you know what time it is? Time to go to a Nook Miles Island. All right, I'm gonna sell these little bugs to Flick. We're broken Nook Miles, but that's okay. Treasure Island. Nope. Yeah. We're not using Treasure Islands. Nook Miles Island. <gasps> Money Rock Island. Mon Money Rock. Money Rock Island. Who is on this island? Hello? Oh. I'm just gonna take your coconuts. Bye. Put his campfire out. That is a good idea. Right, we've got a lot to do on this island. That had money in it. Oh my god. I should have... Damn. That's annoying. Okay. Let me collect all these. Wait, this is a tiny Money Rock Island. Look how small. How small and baby. Money rocks, money rocks, money rocks, money rocks, money rocks. This makes me happy. I already have that one. Also, yeah. Do I get an item on this island? It doesn't look like it. Yeah, no item, no wasps. Okay. Right, I suppose we can put some bells away. I'm gonna sell this silly pot. I dare it even be in my inventory. Silly recipe. Right, let me put these bells away. Hi, Flick. Hello, Flick. Okay, we're trying to save up some Nook Miles because we're like villager hunting, but not very successfully. We've had some not very good villagers so far, you know? Let me put away like a hundred thousand. There we go. But I'm gonna have to like make like two thousand more bells or we could all fill. I don't know. What do I need to do? Chop wood. I can do that. Should we chop all my trees down? I only have this axe. I'll do two times. This will refresh tomorrow, right? And if I chop it again, it'll be fine. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna grab all these. We gotta catch a tilapia, plant trees or shrubs, water produce. And I can't assess fossils, so, you know. I need a watering can. Can you buy a watering can? Yes, I see. I scrolled past it. I was like, where? It's right here. I'm just a silly sausage. It's gonna be a grind, but that's okay. We can do this. Right. What do I need to do? Water my flowers? Can I upgrade my watering can? Let's have a look. You can upgrade can. <gasps> Amazing. Look at us go. Look at the butterfly. I want you. Where's my net? My upgraded net. Are you kidding me? Right, wait. I'm I'm, I'm stuck. Oh, God. Okay. Where the frickity whack? Did that butterfly go? I don't even know. I guess I'm not catching that. Let me tend to my flowers. We need to do some fishing. Oh, this is going to take a while. Die for sea creatures. We could do that. Let's die for some sea creatures. Wait, I don't have... I don't have my suit in my inventory. We can also fish as well. We scared off the fishy. Wow. Look at us go. What did we get? <gasps> I was so fed up with growing jellyfish. This. 150. This is going to take a while. 10 flowers. I can do that as well. Where's this fish? Is it behind my head? It is. It is. No. We're saving up Nook Miles. Okay. Fishy. Uh, bite. Amazing. <gasps> a soft shell turtle? What? Look at that. It's in a little bucket. Whoa. A ray? Another stingray. What? How come I've never caught one before and I've caught two in one day? It's a tilapia. No, it's not. <laughs> Why did I think it was a tilapia? Oh god, I was so excited. That is very embarrassing. <laughs> um, Nemo! We got a stone? Whoa, big tank. I should make some bait and then get a tilapia that way. Exactly. Unless you're a tilapia. Oh, it is. I was like, wait, is the tilapia? Why couldn't I have reacted properly to that? I was like, oh. <laughs> oh my god. Spent the whole day making bait. It takes so much time. Oh, it does, doesn't it? I don't need it though. It had bait and it was like, nah. It was like, nah. Okay, we just need a few more of these. Grow fruit trees. All right, let's tend to flowers. Maybe. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. We got this one. Okay. So many to water. So many flowers here. Where do I begin? I might be going crazy, but that's okay. I need 100 miles. Wait, we got another one? Look, miles for miles? I'll take it. Let's get another ticket. Manifesting a cutie. I'll take anyone at this point that's cute. 
you know? We have got the full outfit on. Come on. Someone cute, I'll be happy. Hello? Nook Miles ticket, please, Orville. Let's go. I'm ready, just take me there. He's literally got underwear on his head. That's so rude. Did I shake all these? Anything over this way? Oh, there is. Here's my wasps. Ha ha ha. Yoink. And some Nook Miles, don't mind if I diddly do. What did we get? Netting better? The rest when you catch five wasps in a row. Look at us go. Five freaking wasps in a row. What's this one? Oh, we already did this. Okay. There's a bunch that we could do. Wait, what's this? First time you write something on the bulletin board. I could do that. Take me home right now. Oops, sorry. Oopsie. Let me whacking everyone with the nets. Poor Wilbur. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. I didn't mean to. Let's do the thingy. Open and close your phone a phone hundred times. Really? Does that do, do anything in a row? I'm going to do the, the bulletin board. This is a little bit terrifying. I'm not going to lie. I've got this. It's fine. It's fine. Do you guys know what I'm drawing? It's a nook mile thing. <gasps> I'm going to do that. I literally have a degree in illustration, guys. A bear? It's going to be a frog. I literally have a degree in this. Can you tell? Froggy. I'm going to give him a little nubby leg. And he's got little arms. This is perfect. Wow. Look at us go. How many? 300. That's actually a little bit sad. Edit credit. <gasps> passport. Passport, passport, passport. Okay, edit. I want to edit this. What can we even do? Flapping. Flapping mama. Take that as you will. What did we get? And we can get a Nook Miles ticket. Look at us go. I'll do the fun one next time. Manifesting cuties. As always. I really hope we get someone because I'm getting tired. Hi. I saw someone on TikTok last night make peach crumble. I, I had an epiphany and I realized you can make crumble out of any fruit, basically. You put crumble on top of it and then it's that kind of fruit crumble. And I don't know why I never realized that before. Miles Island. It's quite the challenge. Sounds difficult, but fun. It's it's difficult, but it's breathing life into the game. You know what I mean? I feel like I was getting a bit burnt out, but this is bringing new life to it for me. Um. <gasps> oh my. Wait, is this Olive? Olive is so cute. Oh my god. Olive is autumn coded. Okay. Oh my goodness. She's so cute. You know what we can do now? We can actually time travel. We haven't time traveled this whole time, but tomorrow we'll literally have Olive moving in and the bridge built. So we're going to time travel. I'm going to sell this to Flick first. I'm going to sell this to Flick. Hi. Just this bad boy. How much are wasps? 3,750. I'll take that. That's good enough for me. Today's announcement. Olive is arriving. Amazing. We sold stuff, I think? Yes. What did we get? Play on me. 11,000. That's not bad. Can't really remember what we sold, but that's not bad. Happy Home Academy. Rank B. Oh yeah, we've got literally an empty room. Let me grab all these and we'll go introduce ourselves to Olive again since she's moved here. So excited about that. She's so cute. She's like perfect for the autumn theme. I'm glad we waited. In the end, it was only like, what, six or seven tickets? Um, which is a lot at the beginning of game, but that's okay. I'm glad I waited. Tomatoes, thank you. And then Olive is literally, what a cute little house as well. This is adorable and I'm very happy. Hello. Hey, what's up? Hello. Love our house. Isn't it so cute? So cute. She's a little cutie. Imagine her and Maple being like little neighbors. That would be actually adorable. I think I'd cry. Okay, I think the bridge is built as well, which is literally, literally right here. Oh my God, look at that. All the neighborhoods connect, which is a great time. And then maybe we could have like some up there, some houses up there. If we do like an incline somewhere, maybe in between the houses or something for our little trick or treat neighborhood. I'm gonna buy both of these as well. Kitty litter box. Thank you very much. And we have quite a few of these, but I kind of want to, do them throughout the neighborhood. Thank you. Thanks. Bye. That was a good haul. Right. I'm going to put them all away in my... Oh, hi, Norma. You little cutie. To thank me? Okay. What have you got for us, Norma? A garbage bin. That'll actually be useful, to be fair. Thank you. I'll put that in someone's, like, garden, like, area. That would fit so well. That's not what I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be one of those, like, metal ones. Wow. Placing all these in storage. What have we got, Isabel? I am very curious. <gasps> Two stars? I'm okay with that. What do I need to do? Do I need more people here? Let's see. 
We need more residents to get some more word of mouth. More residents. Okay. Better than one. Exactly. Infrastructure. I'm going to sell some land. But I'm not going to put this down until we have Nook Miles for a little hunt. Thank you. Okay. Nuh-uh. Thank you very much. And nothing in there. I'm going to get my miles on here. Look at us go. Thank you. Hello, everyone. Now for today's announcements. We have a visitor to the campsite. We'll see who's there. I don't have my ladders. Are my ladders in here? We'll have to find out. Oh my god. Have I actually, like, lost my ladders? Where can I put my ladders? Right. We're gonna have to have a little search. Where would I put my ladders? I'm confused. Let's think into me from yesterday. And remember where I put it, please. Olive's here. Oh, okay. Hi, Dom. Hey. Oh, reactions. Amazing. Distress. Nice. I feel like I've been basically getting all of my reactions from Dom. Where's my stuff? I ordered before the coffee gets cold on Vinted. And it's my first order on Vinted, so I'm, I'm nervous. But it was like £3 altogether, including shipping, which is like so good. Big charity shop prices, so I'm having my fingers crossed. Hopefully it is a good time. I actually don't know where this could be. So I might actually have to go buy one. I'm just gonna have to make one, which is really annoying, but that's fine. I am excited to read it. It's been on my reading to be read for so long. So I'm hoping I enjoy it. Let me put these away and we have a campsite villager. So it's a good time. It's a good day. Campsite is up here. I need an incline. I really need an incline. I don't know where I would put it yet though. Hi. I need to get rid of all these roses. Who is it? I've never seen this villager before, ever. Robin. Is Robin autumnal? Robin's kind of cute. Are you basing autumnal on the houses or the way they look? On the way they look, I would say. Talk to neighbours, sell clumps of weed, sell fruit, water produce, catch bugs. We've got like quite a good mix up of Nook Miles things there. This works. Look at us go. That is 200 miles. Wait, is it 200 times two? So did I just get 400 there? I, I don't know. I really don't know. Look at her reading a book next to these fishies. You are so cute. Right, what else did I need to do? Olive is a cutie. Sell clumps of weed, sell fruit. I can do that. Let me sell fruit. The five fruit or something, maybe. Let's grab these bad boys. I'm destroying my orchard, but like it's gonna give us money, so I don't mind. That's okay. And Nook Miles, which is a great time. And then I need to get the weeds from up top, so let's do that. I've had quite a few of these Nook Miles things to collect weeds and sell them. Orchards usually have apples on the ground anyways. This is true. If we're doing it realistically. Where's my weeds? Over here. That's where they all are. I don't know how many clumps we have to sell, but probably not that many. Probably like five or something, which is great. Let me grab these. Amazing. Butterflies are so cute. Right, we need to go into Nooks and deal with this. Let's sell some stuff. Also, we'll see what's on sale. I don't know what they're selling yet, so that would be a good time. Ooh, some good things, actually. I like the tree. We're gonna get that tree. Apples, weeds, and apples. How much are you gonna give us? 1,300. Okay, fair enough. Wait, let me get this before, just in case we have to, like, spend bells. We didn't sell enough weeds. Oh, that's fine. I need to find some more weeds. Thank you for this. Yep. I'm gonna grab this for like the spooky area. I don't know if you can close it or not, but maybe. I wanna see the parasol here. Yeah, not autumnal, but that's okay. Think you should be able to close it, yeah? Okay, amazing. That's gonna be perfect for the spooky area. For the trick-or-treat neighborhood, I think it's gonna be really cute. It's gonna be super cute. Um. Okay, I wanted weeds. That's, oh wait, I have my ladder out. Let's go up here. We need to sell like five more or something. My money tree's up here. Well, the items do stuff when you press, so maybe this one will too. Amazing. I hope it does. Let me grab all these. And then I'm gonna also get this. No, I'm not. I don't have a shovel, so I can't. <laughs> Fair enough, thank you. You can make a play spooky music. Yes, that is such a good idea. I don't know what spooky songs KK Slider has, but I'll keep an eye out. Hi, you will buy my weeds, please. 15. I'm just so good like that, you know? 150 bells. It's not awful for like 15 weeds, you know? Please let me get the Nook Miles. Right, we're saving up for Nook Miles because we need to go on another villager hunt. We need more people here to get more, um stars so we have stuff to do catch bugs right let me put these away i'm gonna grab all these right bugs i don't know how many it was but we can just catch bugs and see how it goes 
We will be time traveling quite a bit before we settle down, I suppose, and put the plot down to time travel to what's the word? Villager hunt. I was so confused there. Yeah, I'm gonna time travel a lot first. Where's all these bugs at? I swear. <gasps> There's one here. Oh, See, I'm just so good. I'm just so good at catching these bugs. Oh, and there's another one here. Amazing. Was that everything? No? Oh, I have to sell- I have to catch two more, I think. I don't get off that easily. Okay. I don't see any bugs. We're also gonna make so many bells by selling these coconuts, which is gonna be a great time. The bugs can smell your fear? Oh no. They're all running away because they can smell my fear of the bugs. Here's another one. Oh, they're very good at evading, I'm not gonna lie. There we go. See, smashing through these. What is this? Catch a yellow butterfly. I thought I already did that. Woohoo! Right, what does Leaf have for us? Because I need more produce that's not tomatoes. If you keep air pressed, you can sneak up on the bugs. I did not know this. Okay. No, wait, I did know this. I'm just not using it. I'm silly. <laughs> wait. Okay, I'm gonna grab 10. I might go for some white tulips as well. Thank you. And I'm just gonna let them spread. I'm just gonna let them do their thing. Okay, bye. Thank you for all these flowers. I can't grab my bells here because there's flowers in the way, but I'll leave that for now. I need to find a yellow butterfly. Where is the yellow butterfly? Or what else can I do actually for these miles? Speak to people. I could speak to people, maybe. And I wonder if someone is crafting. Hi, Olive. Oh, she calls us sweet pea. That is the cutest thing ever. Uh, we've already spoke to Dom and okay Lopez is in. You're crafting? Wait is Holmes kind of cute? What you're crafting? A rose bed? Okay thank you. I don't think I've seen a rose bed before. Look at this house. This is so snazzy. What? I really wish we could have like this kind of point of view moving the camera on our own in the game outside. That would make me happy. We've talked to villagers which is a great time. And then we're smashing through these nook miles. Ten flowers, sell shells. I can do that. Let me water my flowers and then sell the shells that we got. But I haven't seen the yellow butterfly. Does this make them grow quicker or something? I don't know. You're doing your daily exercise in front of the town centre thing? Oh, um, um, am I? No. Because you get miles for that? Maybe we should do that today then. We'll do that today. Plant produce. And okay, let's sell some shells. I will do that. It doesn't just gives you more chance of them creating another flower. That makes sense. Oh, we've got a lot of stuff. Sell all these. 8,000 bells. Also, you get items from it if you do it every day. What? Wait, that didn't count as selling my shells? Oh, it did. I just didn't sell enough. Oopsie. Okay, let's do our group stretch. I think I've done this like once. So, okay. I am using a Joy-Con. Close. Actually, I might, I'll do the buttons. This will help. Everyone getting ready for a stretch? Oh, would you work, please? Amazing. Look at us go. I'm in time. I'm really not in time, but that's okay. I was in time there. Are you guys stretching as well? You're sitting? How dare you? Are you gonna let me circle? No, okay. Oh, did we get- No, did we- We did. It just didn't tell us. How dare- Wait, what? I'm confused. It said we did, but we didn't. I didn't get any miles for it. But that was the first time I ever stretched ever. That's really sad. It created the thing, but it's 10 minimum, I think. Ah, okay. We'll do that every day then. There should be miles! <laughs> and we got our bottle on the beach. Item in a bottle. I'm grabbing all these set shells. Three minimum, then ten. Amazing, thank you. Then twenty. Cool beans. We could do the three. That's fine. Right, let me sell some stuff again. It feels so weird not needing to do, like, the fossils because we're keeping the tent. It's wild. It feels wrong. It feels wrong. Right, let me sell some stuff to you. I actually meant to do it in the drop-off box, but we're here now, so... <laughs> let me sell these. Perfect. 5,000 bells. Don't mind if I diddly do. Thank you. I'm wanting probably about six tickets, six to ten, but obviously you need a lot of nook miles for that, so I'm gonna keep trying my best. Lots of stuff. <gasps> That's so good. That was a thousand miles. Right, let me do this. Pansy crown, kind of cute, but I don't have pansies. And we have our horns. We have our horns for spooky season. A rose bed. Thank you. And let me put some stuff away. I've decided I don't want the campsite villager. Who did we get again? Robin. Hello, Abel. Right, what have we got? What have we got? Label, label, Mabel. Earbuds combo. 
Okay. Red worn sweater. No thanks. Now that is cute. And we have these. These are really cute. We got little Mary Janes. I'm gonna buy this outfit. It's great. Good things in store. 2000. I'm happy about that. Okay. Right. Catch a sea bass. Plant produce. Plant trio shrubs. Customize item. Those suck. <laughs> we still have weeds everywhere. First thing I do when I restart my island is pick up all of the weeds. Every single last one. You get good, good enough miles for that as well. For selling them. But you save them for leaf and sell them and get more. It's a great time. Imagine if we did community hard mode so we could all do the Sunday markets together. That would be so cute. I'd love that. That would be amazing. What if I did like a community challenge that was like a little different so it wasn't like too hard? Hard mode. It's <laughs> hard mode is difficult. <laughs> right, I think we're gonna time travel. Hello, Isabel. Abel, Label, Mabel, visiting. Amazing. This is Timmy. 8,000 bells. Thank you very much. Um, okay, what do we have for the Nook Miles today? Sell an item for a hot- uh, it's hot- bip, bip. Oh, It's starting. Sell hot item for a fortune. Sell fruit, catch bugs, chop wood, catch fish. I can sell fruit and catch bugs. Doink. That one's pretty. Come here, please. I'm so good. Would you believe me that I actually charged these Joy-Cons before stream? And they're still almost dying? So sad. Should we see what the hot item is as well? So we can, um, sell that. Hello. Oh my god. <laughs> I am currently a cat. Right, I'm gonna grab this. I think this would be super cute. I wonder if we can customize the color. I really do like the pink, but it's not autumnal, you know? Okay, and then let me see what the hot item is. Simple DIY workbench. Amazing. We're gonna catch bugs and fish right now. Oh, here's one. I can catch that one. That one's nice and slow. And there's one here. Oh my God, an absolute slay if you ask me. Oh yeah, not happening. Oh my god. Look at us go. That was a good net as well. That's so annoying. Oh my god. Let me get another net. Did I already get the nook miles for it? No. I need a couple more and then we can catch fish. It's a great time. There we go. Amazing. Let me grab these. I'm gonna catch some fish. Amazing. We're gonna do so good. See? I'm great. Wow. Give me those. Thanks. Look at me. I'm rich. I'm rich. Let's see. I'm gonna grab this and catch some more fishies look it's a little baby grab this playberry is ten thousand to ninety nine thousand bells there's a 70 percent chance of three times ten thousand bells and 30 percent chance of three times the amount of the berry so basically 10k is the only guaranteed profit can you hold please twenty thousand should we bury thirty thousand and then there's a 30 percent chance that we'll get more than thirty thousand I'm gonna plant 30,000 bells. Fishy, hello. Doink, a seahorse? What the hell? That's so cute. Okay, 8,000 bells. We're doing so good. I'm so good at this now, absolute pro. This takes so long, I hope the miles are worth it. I hope it's at least a thousand. We got miles. Oh yeah, I'm so silly. Applesauce, kick is here with shoes and socks and stuffs. Amazing. Are you checking ABD every day? No, I've been forgetting, oh my God. You guys gotta keep me right, you know? Agnes wants to move out, we've got a moving bubble. We have a moving bubble. Go to the next day, we will, we will. We'll have that little thing passed around. What's in here? Formal paper? Look at Dom being a little cutie. I have such a full inventory right now. It hurts my feelings. I need to sell these. What have we got to do today for miles? Talk to neighbors. Hi. Oh, that wasn't a moving bubble. It's gone already because we went inside a house, inside a building. Right, who's in the house? Who's crafting? Sherb crafting? It is. Sherb's house is adorable. Oh my goodness. It's okay. It's not messy at all. What have we got? Bone door plate. That sounds kind of scary. I love it. Amazing. Oh my god. Look at all those miles. Right. We need to chop wood. Hit rocks. Catch a sea bass. I hate catching fish. How much inventory space do I have? Enough. I have enough. A fish? That is not a sea bass. Definitely not a sea bass. This one could be though. Let me grab my fishing rod and here we are. Doink. It's not gonna see it, is it? Oh, it is. Why did I press the button? That is actually so annoying. See, I can catch them when I'm concentrating. Okay, deposit, like a hundred thousand. Look at us go, we're actually getting so rich. Hi. Anything in here? No. Slay. What is the Nook Miles things that I need to do? I'm gonna check kick first. What have we got? Spiderweb tights. That's kind of cute. What else have we got then? Wings. We're gonna have wings. It's a great time. Bye, kick. Excuse me. I need to try these on like straight away. Oh my god. We have wings now. Our outfit's coming together. Right, what do we need to do? Chop wood and hit rocks. 
Do I have a shovel? Doink. We have 10,000 Nook Miles. Is that five tickets? That's not that bad. I think we can go on a little villager hunt. Let me put all these away. And let me put some stuff in my inventory. And we're gonna get the Nook Miles out and go on a villager hunt. Build here. I think that is gonna be really cute, actually. All right, let's go get some Nook Miles. Right, we're getting some Nook Miles to keep. You're gonna take me to a very autumnal island because that's where I want to go. Hello, Wilbur. Are you taking me to a good island? Oh, I saw purple hair. Hello. Gloria. Gloria's a cutie. I think Gloria is really cute. Is Gloria coming on the island? No. A pine cone. I'll take that. It never fails. Bee bee. My item straight away. Retro gas pump. That means we have two. We have a little matching set. Oh no, I can already see. I can already see it's someone who I don't want. We've already had her on a, a hunt yesterday, I think. She's not the worst of the mice, but like, I don't want you. Candy's not the worst. She's not the worst, but I just really don't like the mice, personally. Who have we got? Orville. Oh, Wilbur, sorry. Not gonna lie, I'm not very happy about that one. Let's not slay. Right, I'm just gonna get my stuff and leave. Who is here? I thought it was a frog for a sec. But it's one of these Care Bears. One of these stinking Care Bears. I'm not having much luck with the hunting today, I'm not gonna lie. We're so good at this. Okay, yeah, you are not autumnal, I'm not gonna lie. Let's see, I'm gonna take all these oranges. I'm gonna take them all. Oh my god, who is that? Mm, why? T-Bone. Right, we're gonna have to do a load of Nook Miles. How much room do I have? Oh, loads of room. Loads of room, we're gonna make so much money. We're gonna have oranges finally, and they're like... Fit the autumn colors. Oranges remind me of summer, but they fit the autumn colors. Right, let's go sell some stuff and also plant some trees. I can plant some trees in this orchard area. Let me see. I'm gonna grab these to eat. I can't grab these to eat. Hold on. What do I need to do for miles? Sell things? No. Sell a hot item. It's annoying. Okay. I will sell some things though. Oh, the candle's back. I might buy a few more candles. I wanna sell. Oh my God, we actually have a lot. Oh, we did a big one. Does this get us a thousand bells? And planting them's gonna get us some bells. I don't know how much, but some. Right, let me take these and eat them. All of these, these flowers are gonna be a problem in the future, but that's like a problem for future me. You know what I mean? Let's grab this and this. That works. I want to plant an orange here and then I want to plant an orange there. So I'm also going to pick up these flowers around here so I can actually get my money from the money tree. Otherwise I'll be sad. And then we can move that tree as well. Shake the tree. Oh, I didn't mean to pick the flower. That was sad. What did we get? They might have enough for another ticket. 500. So close. So close. And we can't even get the other fruit because it's impossible. Right, the wasps are going on the beach. We're gonna have the wasp beach again. Plus item. Plus item. Catch bugs. Catch a sea bass. Complete DIY projects. Well, I can catch bugs and sea bass. Let me do that one. Let me claim this. Right, sea bass. We can do that one. I think we can at least. Well, we can't if there's no actual fish. That would be a problem. It's a salmon. That's okay, I suppose. That's an eel, that's not a fish. Told you. Look at this fancy boy. Bird house. And these. I'm gonna sell these trees and the oranges that we have left. And I'm gonna keep the other things for like CJ. Those like fishies. Yes. We have one ticket. One measly little ticket. But we're gonna take off the horns like Brent suggested. Maybe we're scaring people away. And we're gonna see if we can find someone cute. I hope. Horns go bye bye. How do you do that again? This way. I keep forgetting how far my airport is from residence services. It makes me happy. Right, you've gotta take me somewhere cute, Orville. You gotta promise me that you're gonna try. I'm gonna have a stern talking to you if this isn't a good island. We've gotta go over here. Oh! Why? You're literally the second kangaroo in a row. Walt. Walt isn't the worst. Walt is kind of nice, you know? But he's just not, he's not autumnal. But I wouldn't call him cute. I wouldn't call him cursed either. We got our item. What do I have to do? Buy items, catch sea bass, catch fish. Excuse me? Thank you. What did I need to do? Catch fish? Did my, f oh. All of my tools are breaking, please. Okay. 
What are you? A king salmon? Okay. Amazing. Look at me go. Oh, we haven't caught one of these yet. An olive flounder. I'm getting better at fishing, I think. This is what I called the tilapia yesterday. And then was very embarrassed after. I knew your Joy-Cons are gonna die. Shh. You didn't see that. Guys, I'm actually gonna struggle doing the rest of these. Like I have to customize items. Grow a fruit tree, I can do that. I can do that really easily. Do I have fruit in? I do. Right, let's grow a coconut tree. A hundred. We have some customizable kits in the storage. So I suppose we'll try and do that and customize a couple things. I don't know what I can customize, but I can have a look. Storage. I have a gold nugget. Why haven't I sold that? I guess I'm keeping it for a rainy day or something. What can I customize? I don't actually know. Let's have a look. Oh, I didn't mean to craft anything. We can only customize the locker. With a little sticker on it? Come on, it's gotta be a lot. We need a hundred more. I can plant a tree or shrub. You do this because you're trying to get rich. I get you. Let me plant this. Oh my god, we got so many flowers. I don't need to plant them right now. Though. We finally have 2,000 miles. Right, let's see who is here. I'm nervous, so nervous. Oh god, I saw. Who are you? Ed. Ed. The wannabe Julian? I'm very upset right now. Wow. This is tragic. There's my item. Nook Miles. Don't mind if I diddly do. Thank you very much. <gasps> we have enough for another ticket. Um, okay. That was kind of good luck, but I'm, I'm not going to complain. That's amazing. Let us see who this is. I'm actually really nervous. Right, let me get my pole out. Hello. Wait, is it Scoot? I might take Scoot because even though Scoot isn't autumnal, Scoot is a cutie. We're gonna take Scoot because I'm so sad about not getting many villagers. Come on, we we're gonna do it. Scoot is really cute though. You're gonna come come to my island, you little cutie, you little baby. Hello there, everyone. Right now in Applesauce, it is October 2nd. We have time traveled quite a bit. A label is visiting us. Able label Mabels. Okay, amazing. While I was time traveling this morning and getting Nook Miles, I did um, see Sahara. Got a lot of rugs and stuff. It's a good time. Oh, what have we got? Leaf. Oh, this is so cute. Wait, what did Leaf send us? What? You need rain? Oh my god, it rained for like all of August for me. When did I get the hedge recipe? I have no idea. Oh my goodness. I didn't like open any of my recipes and learn them. Thank you so much for the clothesline poll. You're the best. Thank you, Dom. Dom's been giving us so much. What a cutie. Oh, also, we planted um, a money tree. We planted like 30,000 bells to like experiment. I'll sell the peaches and let's see what we've got in Nook's cranny. I think I did uh, time travel so we'd be on like a new day. Okay, I want those too. That's all I want. I don't have anything to sell. No. We need to see. We need to see what we can do to get more Nook Miles. What are my produce? I could do that. Is a group of crocs considered a flock? A flock of crocs. Maybe. That would be very, that would be very good. I would like that. Nook Miles grind never stops. Oh my god. It's such a struggle. It's such a struggle. They're not my crops. They're not my crops. They're my flowers. <laughs> oh, I also bought a lot of uh, pumpkins. We'll see what colours we get. Hopefully all of them. But this is going to be so good for the spooky island. The spooky autumnal island. It's going to be a great time. Okay. Look at us go. Already smashing it. Straight out of the bag. I can take a picture. Chop some wood, sell more fruit. This is gonna be a great day. Oh, I didn't mean to click on that. I need the camera. Thank you. There we go. I keep clicking on the wrong things. Okay, thanks. And bells by selling items and chopping wood. Well, we can sell fruit because our fruit, our orange is grown in as well. We've got these apples. Oh, all those oranges will like disappear because of those flowers. I really need to move the flowers at some point. Maybe to the beaches because we have quite a few now. Just maybe. I want to, I want to see, we planted a tree and we put 30,000 bells in like the money tree hole. So I want to see if we've got a big hole, you know? Okay, I'm going to do this. Elegant hat. What is that? Oh, oh. I'm just gonna keep my horns, I think. Here is the said tree that I planted 30,000 bells into. 
So let's see. 30,000. 30,000. 30,000. I think we've won at life. Oh my god. We got the 30% chance. We just gained 60,000 bells off that tree. 90,000 if you include the 30,000 that we planted. That got given back to us. Today the goal is going on a little villager hunt. Um, find someone autumnal. Because we're, we're working on getting to three stars, you know? Let's see. We got this one. And let's go get some Nook Miles tickets. I don't actually have a plot down, so we need to do that as well. But that's fine. Okay, I don't know how many tickets we have. Maybe like five, I think, because we had one before we started redeeming. So we'll see. Thank you for the tickets. Appreciate it. And winning at life here. Infrastructure. And I'm rich, so like I could do as many as I want. I don't know where to put my next one. We're not allowed to terraform. What's up here? No room for a house. No room for a house. There's room for a house in this little corner though. How cute would that be? A little spooky house in the woods, maybe? Oh, I don't think we have enough room. Okay, that's fine. Right, let's see. We could have one over here by this lake. We put it like here. And then we can have trees around it as well. Let me imagine. I think that's good there. Yeah. Do -do 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 -do. Amazing, look at us go. And now we're gonna go hunting. We're gonna go hunting for a little cutie. It's gonna be a great time. Agnes is fishing. We're a little cutie. Hi, I literally just jumped through her, but um, okay. I also need to put more inclines in, more bridges in, all of that good stuff. Wilbur and Orville, you're gonna band together. Bring me to a cutie. Hi, I want to go to a Nook Miles Island, bestie. Let's go. Manifesting curse. That is so rude. <laughs> Where's the campfire? Over here. Let me go over here. <gasps> it's another little bear. Cherry. I'm going to take Cherry. Yeah, I'm going to take Cherry. That's so cute. What the hell? That was easy. That was the quickest villager hunt ever. But we will be doing more, I think. I don't think we've got all of the villagers yet. Do we? Oh, play. Look at us go. I'm undefeated. Look at us go. That was so good. Terry is so cute. We have two bear cubs on our island. And I did want maple, but I feel like having more than two bear cubs might be a bit too much, you know? But we'll see. Oh, we can we have one more? Because um, we've got Cherry there. Do we get one more? We have a new friend, Cherry, the little cutie. Right, let's go buy another plot, I suppose. Infrastructure, sell some land. 10,000 bells. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We're villager hunting for our last villager? No way. Okay, this is good because that means we can work on getting the island better. I think. Do I want a house there? I might put a house like here. Excuse me. Doink. No, that won't work. What if I put one like here? Let me have a look. I think that could be really cute. I forget that it doesn't show you like an actual house, which is kind of annoying, but you know. That's fine. Doop, 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 doop. I want you to work together to take me to a cute island. Amazing. Use Nook Miles ticket. I'm ready. Time for takeoff. Who have we got up here? Let's see. I'm actually a bit nervous. Oh. Who is this? Okay. Hi. Snooty. Snooty isn't the worst. Snooty isn't the worst. And he's kind of autumnal. But I'm not a big fan of the anteaters. You know? I would still say he's kind of cute though. Oh, did I miss this tree altogether? That is so strange. I wanna go. We got oranges. That means we're gonna be rich. Hopefully it's lucky. Oh my goodness, it's this bird. This bird is absolutely terrifying. Sparrow's autumnal, but I find Sparrow absolutely terrifying. He needs some sleep, you know? I'm gonna grab all of the oranges. I'm gonna sell them all. And maybe find the bottle on the beach. I don't know if we'll have one. We've got two more tickets. Take us to someone cute, please. Lucky Bamboo Island. Let us get some bamboo. Who is it? Who are you? Piper. Piper's cute, but we don't want Piper. Let me chop these down. Let's get the bamboo trees. Bamboo trees will make island look very pretty. Right, we are selling some stuffs. All of these. Forget how much these are worth. It is so good. That's 23,000 bells. That makes me so happy. Here's all my wasps. They're just chilling, you know. And then I have some bamboo trees, which I don't know what to do with. Let me plant these here for now. I don't know what we'll use them for on an autumn island, but do they change color in autumn? 
I don't know. Okay, let's go to our last island. Hopefully it's someone good. Who is this? It's gotta be Tony. Oh, he's called Leonardo. I think Leonardo's kind of cute. A cheetah? Oh yeah, not a tiger. What am I thinking? <laughs> I think he's cute. Let's see. Do we want Leonardo on the island or should I farm for some more Nook Miles? Hmm. Let me grab all these. I'm gonna be so rich from selling all this fruit. It's gonna be a great time. We're so good at this. We're so good. That is wild. Okay, guys. We're gonna have to farm for some Nook Miles then. That's okay though. Why are we collecting so many wasps for money? You sell the wasps to Flick, you get rich quick. Plant trees, chop wood. Okay, I can chop wood. And I actually want to put my wasp here. So many wasps, look at us go. A place. I also got so many items from those islands. It's a great time. All of the wood. Plant trees are shrubs. I don't have a tree to plant. I'll go buy one. I'm guessing it wouldn't count a fruit tree, so... Unless it will. That didn't count! Oh, that sucks, doesn't it? Wow. Okay. Let me grab a few things. This pink umbrella is kind of cute. They've got mums. They have mum. Wait. They have, they have white mums. It's okay. I found them. I found them. I'm taking them. Thank you. And then I'll just grab one of these. Thanks. Bye! I can sell a few things as well, so I might do that just in the drop-off box. Oh, okay. Well, I did have a hole for it, but I decided not to go in the hole. Dive for sea creatures DIY projects. You love that you can sell whole trees? Oh, it's so good. It makes me so happy. Oh, rip. A large rug, please. Thank you. Look, Miles ticket. Let's go. Orville and Wilbur, you gotta band together and take us to a cutie. A little cutie. And I'll be very grateful. Let's see who this is. Who is that? Who are you? Kid! Oh, Kid is kind of cute. But Kid is not autumnal core. I think this is cute. Kid is cute. But also, I don't want Kid for the island. Let's get some more Nook Miles friends. Besties. Buddy is Zo pals? Buddy o pals. That's what I'm trying to say. What do I need to do? We haven't been to Harv's Island. Do you get Nook Miles for going to Harv's Island? Dive for sea creatures. Let's do that one. I can put my wasp here. Yes. And then put some stuff in my uh, storage. And then maybe sell some stuff. Put that away. Oh, we only got one item because we only went to one little island. A bit of a silly sausage. Toilet cleaning set. Perfect. All right, let's go. How far out we going? Not too far. Imagine an open world Animal Crossing where you could like make a little base and stuff. Oh my goodness. Oh, a crab. I never do have a crab before. That was the first one. Whoa, we haven't had one of these either, sea slug. Imagine if you could swim to other people's islands, that would be absolutely crazy. MMO Animal Crossing? Maybe that's why they've not said anything, because they've actually been working on an MMO <laughs> Animal Crossing. Let's swim back. 300? That would be so cool. I think that would be so cool, yeah. Okay. I need to sell some items, so I'll just sell these bad boys. Hello. I'm gonna sell all of these. I'll actually sell these as well. Feel like that would make sense. 17,000 bells? I'll take it. Okay. That is a lot of bells. We're getting rich, loves. I think we're gonna go to Harv's Island as well. I think that's a good idea. We need 300 more. We do three DIY projects. Maybe we do that instead of going to Harv's. Let me grab some twigs. I'll just make some tools and then have them ready for when my tools break. I feel like that could be a good idea. What do I need? Do I not have any sticks? Oh, I do have sticks. But how many do I have? I can't see. It's fine, I suppose. We can make hedge. I like hedge. Also, I got the, the spooky arch, which is going to be so perfect. I'm just going to craft stuff that breaks all the time. These look so funny when they're placed. Place. What else can I craft? That's like easy. Oh, we could get one Manila clam and then craft a bait. That would be nice and easy. Oh, hi. A cold chill. Oh, that is not how you dig up clams. Wow. It's a little bit embarrassing. Is that my first? Oh no, it's a five. Okay. We don't need to craft right now, but I'll do it anyway. Because it's easy enough to. Craftable. Oh, please let me craft it. Thank you. And then we have this nook mile. 
300. Amazing. We're gonna go to Nookmouth Island. You know why I can't scroll? Because my cat's asleep on my keyboard. Get off my keyboard. Lame. Oh my god. That makes so much sense. Right, who is this gonna be? Let me get my pole out. I'm very scared. These islands always scare me. I don't see anyone. Hello? Oh. Pee wee. Pee wee. Not the booty cheeks. Why is it called pee wee? I've been so disappointed in my life. Thank you very much. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait. The method failed me. I didn't do it on a diagonal. This is so sad. <laughs> Cursed villager, then the wasp attack. Pain. It's not a great time. Grow fruit trees. Okay. Talk to neighbors. Nice. I can talk to people. And I'm going to get my net out so I remember that we need to catch bugs. Oh, can I please? Thank you. Thank you, thank you. We need 500 more. Catch bugs. We can do that. We're so good at catching bugs today. I don't know what happened. I'm usually really bad. These bad boys. 150. Wow. Catch a dace. I suppose we can wait. What did I do? Water them a bunch of times. Wow. Hello, seahorse. I have one bait. A fish. Fishy time. Oh my god, why am I like this? Oh. This is a river fish. I'll get it into a river then. Black brass. Amazing. I've got to be patient. Keep my hand off the button. There we go. Are you a dace? No, you're a cod. No, oh, a carp, not a cod. Wait, how do I visit Harv? We're gonna go to Harv's Island for the first time ever. So I need Nook Miles. And I'm struggling. We just gotta find one more villager, you know? Let's go inside. Let us go inside and see his little studio. Do I get Nook Miles for this? I thought I did, but I'm unsure now. Okay. Yeah. Okay, thank you, Harv. Amazing. Thank you. 500 miles. Do I not get Nook Miles for being at Harv's? Do I have to just ask him about everything? Let's go home. It was worth a try. It was. Push down. Grow fruit trees. And die for sea creatures. Plant. Open this up. Decayed tree? <gasps> We're getting the spooky DIYs now. Oh, I did this, didn't I? Let's go deep sea diving. What are you thinking about? A delivery jacket. Thank you. Let's grab this. And deep sea dive. Here we go. Wow. Barnacles. Oh, is that the first low battery we've had? It's been two hours and it was fully charged. One more. Is there one here? Oh, there's one here. Why is he swimming so fast? Oh my god, that is so fast. What is this? An umbrella octopus? That's the cutest little dude ever. What the hell? Let's do another Nook Miles Island. Give me a Nook Mile ticket. Thank you very much. And let's go search for another cutie. Let's go, Nook Miles Island. Hi. What would dodos do? No idea. Who's it gonna be? It's a blurst. No one wins. It's blurst. Hi, Ruby. Ruby's coming to the island. Like, she is so perfect for the trick or treat neighborhood. 100% cursed in your opinion. I love Ruby. Ruby reminds me of my old rabbit called Angel. White with red eyes. Adorable. She's wearing a t-shirt of her own face. That's the best. I don't have a net. So we're gonna have to risk it for a biscuit. Because I still want my item. Oh, I don't want that one. That's all of our villagers. All 10 of them. Amazing. I'm gonna see how many stars our island is. Because then once we get to time traveling, we could maybe have KK Slider come. But I don't know how many stars we have so we've I've got loads of flowers and items on the island so like we should have a good time good afternoon isabel let's talk island evals we have three stars we have three stars on day nine that is a sleigh oh yes it is five stars mr nook we're, we're having kk slider coming to the island because then we can get terraforming and even though we can't terraform on this island i want to use the custom designs that i have made we are striking when the iron's hot. How come Tom Nook had KK Slider's phone number this whole time and he didn't think to invite him before? Really a bit sus, if you ask me. Email you the details, that's really funny. Email. It's funny to think that like in Animal Crossing they have email. <laughs> I don't know, something about it. Let's 
Time travel, I suppose. Hi, Isabel. October 4th. I have a new friend of our island, Ruby. A very special announcement. And Kicker Slider is here visiting. Amazing. Hey, Applesauce. It's real groovy being here today. Feels like this dream I once had when I was just a scruffy pup with a shoebox guitar. I was dreaming of hitting out on my own, wondering wherever my road would take me. Dreaming of finding a magical place where cool cats like you would come together and see a stray like me. Sorry about that, I do run on. Time to get your fingers snapping! Right on! This one goes out to all you cool cats on Applesauce. I call it Welcome Horizons. Wow. Exciting. Look at us. Joy-Con, you're ruining the moment. Stop. Turn that shit up. Am I right? We've made it. We beat Animal Crossing. Absolutely clocked Animal Crossing. Wow. This is so sweet. It's absolutely spitting facts right now. Three stars. Look at us go. Can I clap? No. Look at all my villagers. They're so cute. Peanut needs to go though. What a sleigh this is. I feel so proud of us. Now I'm gonna finish the island in 21 days. Thank you so much. Maybe I'll catch you next time. Look at Blathers, little cutie. Oh, hi. Hello, honey. Did you enjoy KK's concert? It was wonderful, wasn't it? I'm overjoyed that we could get him to play here. And we got the song. It's ours. Big news? Oh, yes. Every Saturday evening, we get KK Slider here. Oop, and now we got the app. You know what? We should have a music app on this phone that we can choose which music is on instead of having to go with whatever time it is in the game. Now I can decorate properly with all the paths. I I'm excited. We're going to be able to do some builds. It's going to be a great time. Wow. Look at us go. We're getting cold because we did make like 30,000 bells or something in the little drop off box. 30,000 bells. We're rich Aroni. Right. We have lots of stuff going on. Let me claim everything. Is it going to work? Hello? There we go. I was clicking the wrong button. Would you even imagine? Um, Nook Inc. Thousand miles into your account. Hope you spend them on something happy. Something that makes you happy, not something happy. That's nice of them. I suppose it is time to get started with our little paths and things. Getting decorated, all the good stuff. Let me eat a couple of these. Right, I want to edit this. Do I need like custom design pro thing to make this have a different color. Let me see. Yes. I'm going to try and buy the custom design thingy. Redeem Nook Miles. Is it this one? I think so, maybe. Thank you for updating the app. Wow. I want to do some leaves as well on the custom signs. I think that could be cute as hell. Okay. Yes, we can edit the palette colors. Amazing. That's all I needed. Right. Let's see. How do I edit it? How do I edit the colors then? Oh, change color. <gasps> it's going to be tough because obviously the grass is going to be a different color when we actually have the dream address. I mean, oh, I want this to be a bit more, maybe like the path, maybe like, like that. I don't know. I didn't save it. Oh my God. I'm such a dingus. There's like loads of little flecks and like stuff in paths that people make. And I want to kind of do that, you know? So let's try that. Maybe like this. I don't know how to make paths cute. Right. Let's see. Does this look okay? I don't know. Should we view it on the floor? I feel like that's probably a good idea. It literally looks like a pancake. I think it needs to be darker. Let's see. Let's do that and then change the color of this one as well. So how do people do this? I don't know. Maybe like that? Is anyone here a professional path designer? I'd love some help, but I'm trying my best. Let's try this. What do we think of that? Is that cute or is that weird? Definitely better than a pancake. Is there too much going on? with the shading in the middle. Some people do them so well with all the different colors. You like the crust? <laughs> you like the crust? So I don't know how to do it except for like just adding dots everywhere. So I suppose maybe we could do lighter dots in places. There's obviously a lot more of the darker dots out at the side, which I think I might add in just because I think it will make it fit better. I think that looks like a path. This is so difficult. This is looking okay-ish. I think we could do like a little one here. My eyeballs are going to be pixels after this. Most definitely. Who said the middle one was going to be easy? I feel like with the crust I have something to reference, you know? With this it's like the wild west. I'm going to deal with the middle. I'm going to deal with it. It can be like that. 
Here we are. Amazing. Okay, I did log in because I needed, um, why have I got my axe open? I needed to get some footage for, um, the intro and outro of the day nine. So I have logged in. We were told by Isabel, unfortunately it was a big announcement day. We got told by Isabel that Tom, uh, no, Nook's Cranny is updating. So it will be closed tomorrow. We got told that island tours from Catton are available. Oh, there was some other things. I can't remember what. Right, we can sell these. I want to sell some things. So I'm going to do that now. Actually, I want to go inside because we haven't checked what's in Nook's Cranny. So let's have a little look. Let's have a little look. Hello. Big news. Nook's Cranny has been blessed with a lot of business. Okay. Expanding the shop. Thank you very much. Okay. We can deal with that. That's going to be a good time. Let me sell some things. I'm going to sell these peaches. I have a money tree in my inventory. I don't know why. Let me sell. Oh my god, I love the umbrella octopus. I kind of want to see what it looks like outside before I sell. If you get fossils assessed and don't donate, will that upgrade the tent? I actually don't know. I was told in a YouTube comment actually today that I could get them assessed as long as I don't donate them. But I thought you had to donate them at first. So maybe we could try one fossil. Look at all these beautiful pumpkins. I'm so happy. I think you can just keep them. We'll give it a go today. I also need some Nook Miles so we can upgrade our terraforming thing to have like paths so we can actually do paths. Oh, I want to see what the Umbrella Octopus looks like. Oh, look at him. Look at him. He's so cute, but I don't want him. I'm going to sell. Let me sell all of these. I suppose we'll find a fossil. Oh, we've got a couple here. Let me do this then. Let's have a little look. It, it's it doing one won't be any harm i don't think i've ever spoke to him or maybe we spoke once oh it says make a donation it doesn't say assess it says make donation so i don't think we can get them assessed i don't think it's an option loves unfortunately i thought we could assess them and, and not donate but it says make donation so maybe not right i need to see how much the paths thing is in here holding chair I'll take that. 200 bonus miles. Thank you. Demonic miles. I think the first one doesn't let you, but once you give him one, it gives you an option. We'll give that a go. Because you need to give 15, so. But if you test it just once, you don't lose them all. Yes, we will do that. That's a good idea. You guys are just smarter than me. <laughs> Custom design. No. What do we need? Custom design path permit. 2,300. We need 2,300. That's not too bad. That's, that's not, that's not too bad. Bye! Let's go donate one fossil and see how it goes. We'll see if this works for us. My watch keeps buzzing at me. I haven't wore it in like a couple weeks because I, I don't know if anyone else, else has this, but if my watch needs charging, I'll take it off to charge and then I'll forget about its existence for like a week or two and then I'll see it and I'll be like, whoa, I have a watch and then I'll have it on for like a day and then it'll need charging again and then the cycle continues, you know? It just happens. Did I pick up the fossil? I picked up one. Here's a fossil blathers. Wow. Thank you. A T-Rex skull? That would have sold for a lot of money. I'll take it home. Let's go collect all my fossils and make mega bells. This sounds like a great time to me. We have a T-Rex skull. We already have a lot of bells here. Right. Oh, we have mail? Why didn't I check my mail? Okay. Harvey wants us to go over there. Okay, I'm very excited about this now. Being able to assess the fossils. I can use the pumpkins to make the spooky arch, I think. We have the recipe for that. Right, fossil time. Let's go. And I haven't discovered gyroids yet, so there won't be gyroids all over the island. Amazing. Oh my goodness. I've been waiting for this. And there's two here. Hello. Assess fossils. Tee -hee. We have quite a few, actually. All of these. Amazing. Okay. Terribly jealous. Thank you for returning them to me because you're never going to have them, Blathers. I feel bad because I like Blathers, but like, at least I'm showing them to him. He can enjoy looking at them. And I'm going to be putting them outside his tent, so it's like he has them. So I want to do a little, a little archaeological dig site area. That's a whole ass wing, guys. I want to see what these all look like. Whoa, look at this. That one's really cool. Oh, I like that one as well. Look at this one. What's Agnes thinking about? Agnes, what are you thinking about? Agnes wants to move. What do we think about Agnes moving? Already? I know. Maybe I should have left her and then had the moving bubble go to someone else. But last time she had a bubble literally the other day and it wasn't moving related. Because I don't think she doesn't fit in. Agnes is a spooky girl through and through. 
She's a full baddie. I think we're gonna have to keep her, I think. And hopefully the moving bubble will just transfer. I'll just tell her no. There we go. And we'll just hope it transfers. And... Because Agnes is kind of cute. Agnes is like... I think she fits in well. You love Agnes. She was one of our starters and like it's a great time. Animal Crossing Wiki says there's a five day cooldown if you say no. Well that's great because we time travel so we could time travel. Okay none of those fossils I actually want to keep so I'm gonna let those go through the box. Oh my goodness that makes me so happy. That's so much money. Amazing. Right what I wanted to do is because I want to put down paths so let's just do some of these let's hit some rocks and catch some bugs i'm gonna that's not a rock i sell in box because it's easier than going in and selling and then when i time travel i just get the money later do people not sell in box is that weird i've always done that because i'm lazy it's a lot less money you get less money you get less money and if you sell in the box why didn't I know this? Whoa, why are you why are you so upset, bestie? You only get 80% of the value in the box. How did I not know this? What? I've been using the box this whole time, just thinking it was easier. And I get 80%. <laughs> I feel like I learn something new on Animal Crossing every single day. I wish I knew better. I can't believe that. Right, I need this. Thank you. Right, let's go catch some bugs. Excuse me. Thank you. And ooh, I see one. Right. Where's all these bugs? Oh. I keep scaring the bugs away. I can't search for bugs. I'm just notoriously bad at getting them. Zooming around. Mew. Where are you going? Amazing. I still need so much more. What a produce. I can do that one. Oh my god. There was this like spider yesterday. It was like almost it was like a, almost like a white spider or something and it was like crawling on the floor and i was like i'll leave it alone because like bestie is on the floor and not bothering me and then like i'm just lying down on my pillow and sam looks over while we're talking and he yanks me up and he's like move and i'm like what and the, the, the spider was there on my pillow right next to me and it, make, it, it was terrifying but sam hoovered it up so i got my revenge in the end okay we've got enough bells let's go let's go get this so we can put our path down i also want to do um some more custom designing coding today because um our path isn't finished yet we have a couple little bits to it that looks good but the rest of it looks uh, not good so you know okay here it is look at us go custom design paths custom design path i should have two middle ones shouldn't i one without the hole because every single one's gonna have a weird hole maybe we'll duplicate that and sort that out varieties yeah i think it would be a good idea how do i duplicate copy wow look at us go and then have a little bit of this stuff maybe i want to make it just a little bit different so i'm gonna like put some stuff around that's like not the same look beautiful now we can use this doink right that makes me happy a lot better i don't know where i want this path to go but that's okay i also i might do a variation please don't do that of this path with like leaves on the outside as well i've seen that happen and like it'll be easier just to like copy and paste the path and use it that way you know right i want to do this one here as well and let's do our top bit wow Look at that. Wait, would it be better to have it here? I feel like yes. I also want to do paths between all of the houses. So I'm going to do that as well. Let me put the top bits here. And I don't know how I want to do it properly, but that's okay. Let's do little bits and bobs, you know? And now we have pumpkins. So we can actually like decorate nicely as well oh i didn't mean to go in i'm glad you're not in right now i need that i need to move that tree hello agnes are you good all right let me put it there and one here is that a weird corner and then we can ignore that the rest of them are not fully done it's okay We have a lot of things. We don't actually need all these out because we hit three stars, which is great. So now we can actually catalog everything and see what we have to decorate with. Open and open. Trees bounty lamp. 
That's kind of cute. I don't have a storage shed yet, so we're just going to struggle through this. It's just a thing that needs to happen, you know? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. 3,000? Okay, pop off, I guess, like this. It's going to be nice and dotty. Like this. This is going to be cute, hopefully. I hope. I'm excited that we've got a little custom designs now. It's going to be a great time. It's going to look so good. I hope, at least. Ooh, it looks nice. Wait, no, I don't want to wear it. That works. I think that works. Nice. I'm excited for them all. It's going to be a great time. Okay. We're going to keep going. Or I could make some leaves. Maybe we make some leaves. I don't know how, but I'm going to try. That doesn't look like a leaf. Not yet, at least. That works, I think. <laughs> this is so difficult. Maybe like this. Amazing. Cute little leaves for the island. The leaves. Right, I want to put lots of little dots around. Like so. Can't really do it super random here, but that's okay. I'm trying my best. I think that works. I think so. See, like, it just looks so much better. Try some of the leaves as well. <gasps> the leaves. It looks so good once the grass is, like, more orangey. I do need to buy the dark um, soil custom path thing. So I'm going to do that. I don't know how much it is, but that's fine. Uh, redeem Nook Miles. I want that path. This one. It's 2,000. That's really sad. I don't know where I want farm area. I'm unsure. But there is an area where, like, there's loads of space for it. So we could do it over that way. Over there. Or we could do it, like, this whole space here is just kind of empty at the minute. But I kind of want to figure out the builds down here first. And get the neighborhood up and running properly as well. Right, let's see. We don't have too many to do. We don't have too many to do. So let's keep going with this. Oh, the middle clashes. What do I do about that? I'm gonna have to make middle paths with like little bits on, on the side. I don't know. I don't want to worry about that right now. We can put the path down. So I'm gonna do that. But I do want to find where this balloon is. I think I can hear one. Oh, I can. I also think I might make this too wide instead because the, the three wide is just it's the four wide's like throwing me off it's too much let me put the side ones down once we get further into autumn the path will look cuter as well when it fits in with the orange grass yeah it doesn't need to be like fully straight so i might do a little bit of a windy oh you see what i mean that corner bit looks really weird i'll figure it out right let's make this oh that is definitely the wrong one <laughs> Wait, what if I did this? It can go that thin? Wow. Oh, I think that would look better if I did it like this. Wow. Does that look weird? I feel like it kind of does. But what if I made it like wider? I also have these leaves, which I think are kind of cute. I want to put, not there please, that there. Let me put this path here. Oh, this is looking good. It kind of looks like spilt chocolate milk at the minute though. That's one problem I'm finding with it. It's so square. You know what I need? I need little accent pieces where like it'll scoop a bit. A little scoop here instead of it being like a right angle. That's what I need. I can do that though. That's fine. It's here. You see what I mean? Like that's such a right angle. Wait, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it. Okay, copy to this and then change. Do I have an eraser? Wait, no, it's just a big pen in it. Oh, so if it went like inwards like that you know what i mean a scoop i think this will be better and then maybe a little bit of this kind of stuff there we go i think this works that's cute see i can do it it's fine it's gonna look good so if i use this like a scooper oh my god amazing i think i need a scoop it for this one as well but i can figure that out it's fine oh my god it's gonna make everything look so much better because then like I could make one way you could have like a hole in the middle. Look at that bad boy. It literally looks like someone's took a bite out of the path. I do think I need one for the other side. Are you able to flip a design? Is that possible or is that not possible? Can I flip an Animal Crossing custom design? No. You have to remake it. That is poop. Right, I'm going to copy this one to here and then change. What a great time. Oh, that is just the tiniest little path in the world. Um, yeah, that's not gonna fly. Oh, none of it lines up. It's not lining up, besties. We'll figure this out, though. 
Let me put this here. Why can't I do custom paths? I'm struggling so much. Let's put this here. I'm definitely gonna have to change a middle one, I think. I can see where I'm going with this now. Just need to keep going. I do need to change the middle pieces because they do mess up a little bit around these corners and things. But that's okay for now. That is so wrong. Oh, I could do some sort of circly bit. Maybe it's right. How would this look? There's so many balloons that go by. Oh, I can hear it more over here. Nope. Here it is. Wow. So good doing paths. And then you get loads of balloons. We need the middle. How do we feel about that in the middle? I think a maybe. This is looking okay. No, not there. Let's see. Right, I need to start decorating this because, wow, this has been a lot. Right, we have some things. We have book, moss ball, picnic basket, mini chalkboard. We don't really have things to decorate with. Um, right, let's see what we can craft actually, which can be used in the spooky area. <gasps> Decayed tree. We need some hardwood and scarecrow, tree branch and clumps of weeds. These, which is wood. Hedges. I do want lots of hedges. I think that could be cute. And then this as well. Okay. Let me grab some stuff. We have wheat starts and pumpkin starts as well. I can use another bin? Whoa. Because we're doing like kind of farmy core kind of things, I'm just gonna plant. I'm just gonna plant some things around and it's gonna be a great time. Right. I want a pumpkin here. Yep. Put one here as well. This is cute. Wait. Oh my goodness. What did we get? A thousand nook miles. Today's a good day, guys. Right, let's go craft some things to add to our little neighborhood. It doesn't help that we've got the fishies here, but that's okay. We want to craft. Of course we do. Right. Ah, <gasps> the spooky arch is craftable. I need weeds for that. Did I not get... Oh, I need tree branches. I could do that. Let me put log stakes here. How cute this is going to be. Wait. Is that mean, putting chopped tree next to grown tree? Maybe. Let's see. These fishies are definitely in the way. What I'm thinking, this is going to be a trick-or-treat neighborhood. But what if we did the farms around the paths? What if we did like, what's the word? What's a trick-or-treat neighborhood? Well, I'm just going to decorate it like as if it was Halloween. Yeah, that I suppose that's it. <laughs> Halloween is a state of mind. Yeah, my pumpkins are over here. So we can pull these around and then I maybe should do more wheat, but I don't know. I don't have a lot of stuff. I love spooky season. I love autumn. Autumn's a good time. I'm going to remove all these. I'm going to make this a thing. We could definitely make this a bit nighter. Nighter? Nicer. Right, these are tomatoes. Are tomatoes, they're not really autumnal, are they? Do you reckon I should sell the tomatoes? Because we could have wheat and pumpkins. I think that's way more autumnal. I think I'm going to sell the tomatoes. I'm going to sell this. I don't want that. And this. 3,000. Thank you. Let me go pick up some more stuff. I can't find Agnes. I don't know where she is. Oh, she's in the house. All of us fleas again. She still has fleas. Oh, you don't want to talk to me? <laughs> okay, Agnes. <laughs> that's Agnes. I don't have anything of all the other stuff, but that's okay. It's been raining and thundering all day, but that's one of my favorite weathers. I love a good thunderstorm when it's not harming anyone or anything. A good thunderstorm is so cozy. You get to curl up and read a book, light some candles. Right, let's see. A little planter, that could fit in somewhere. I've been doing recently actually to like help practice mindfulness. Like I really find waking up on the morning quite difficult. Just in general, like I'm so tired when I wake up because of everything that I have wrong with my body. But I've been doing cozy mornings. And to do cozy mornings, I've been waking up around, it's between half eight and ten-ish. I try and get up at half eight, but sometimes I sleep in and that's okay. If I need to sleep in, that's okay. But I get up and I go on a little morning walk because when you get outside and as close to sunrise as possible, it's really good for your circadian rhythm, which is like your body clock. It helps with that stuff. And then I've been coming home after the walk, lighting a candle and treating it as if it's a cozy evening, but it's on the morning. And that's made me look forward to my mornings now 
because like I always think of cozy things as an evening thing but you can do it any time of the day this place is looking cute it's looking more like an island that I'm putting together I think we need to have a path go this way as well towards this bridge I don't like that there at all and I don't like water pump either let's see I think that looks okay I think so can I do this I can indeedly do do I want this to be like a little spooky forest? I don't know. Look at my pretty village. Isn't it cute? Hello there, everyone. Right now on Applesauce, it's October 6th. Nick's cranny is closed. That is great. Exactly what I need. Okay. Thank you. We got some money. Nook's cranny is closed, which is annoying. <gasps> I forgot we have cherry now. Cutie. Let's see what this has. Okay, let's have a look. I might get some loafers as little decoration stuff. Like, put these on the floor. Right, I need to... Oh my god, my inventory's full. <gasps> I have a flea. It's so gross. Oh, okay. A fossil. We have one. I'm a big fantasy lover, and that's kind of like... My money disappeared into there. That's so sad. Let me put all of these away. We've got some cute fencing. Oh, I can sell those actually. I don't know what that is. I, I don't know. All of these away. I'm gonna do a circle here. A little circle. Nope, not that one. This corner one is very much more flecked than all the rest of them. I might need to change that in the future. Okay, I need my item in a bottle, so let's have a look around. Oh, we have the Captain Islands, actually, so we'll go to one of those as well. Have I got... Yeah, I've got room in my inventory. I know pot already! Right, let's go on a little tour, island. A thousand miles. Let's go. We're off on a tour with Captain. This is our first one, so I'll let, the, I'll let the music play. We'll not skip it, and it'll be the best time. I love Captain so much. It's a great time. I love it. It's the best. Okay, let's see. <gasps> Mums! Oh my goodness! Have a little look see look then. I'm grabbing all these. We have so much to grab. Do we get items from these trees or not? The Captain Island tours. I don't know. I'm gonna collect all of my coconuts and it's gonna be the best time because we're gonna get rich. I'm gonna shake these trees as well. Not even a message on the beach in the bowl. Actually so rude. I'm gonna grab these. I want this white mum. We can put these in the village. Captain be like a barber. He tells you woes to. Good listener like that. Everyone goes to. Captain's the best. I need to do the path around here, but I can't be bothered with paths today, I'm not gonna lie. But we do need to make a move on with this island. Cause I just we haven't done enough. We don't have long left. Right. Let me plant a few things. I know a log bed now. Tee hee. Maybe I do one here. Oh, I can't sell anything because Nooks is closed. That's really upsetting. <gasps> Look at these dudes. Look at them just having a barbecue. You guys good? Can I have some? What can we get on here? Do I want any of this stuff? Ooh, this could work. Oh, but these are with bells though. Not bells, miles. Let's see. Do I want anything from any of this stuff? Let's see. I don't think I do. I haven't got a lot of stuff catalogued yet. We have simple panels catalogued, so we could use that at some point. Although I don't know what for. Nothing really. We could get a Nintendo Switch. Right, what I do want to do today is transfer all of these pumpkins over to the village. Because what I'm doing is I've decided the autumnal call. We're, we're going to do a lot of farm call because that makes it easier to decorate, you know? We've got a lot of farmy items. We've got a scarecrow that we can make. We've got all the plants that kind of stuff and so I'm gonna make the village kind of like farm core with like fields around it pumpkin patch very autumnal indeed but it's gonna be like oh actually do I want the pumpkins in the village because then I was thinking filling this whole bit around the paths but then it's like they won't be able to walk through so I don't know let me have a look I want to have a look at Pinterest and have a look at an animal crossing pumpkin patch is that not the cutest thing you have ever seen in your life what the hell I really like that one. I love that one actually. Right, I do want... What? My cats are going crazy. I want um the barbed wire fence. We have lanterns. Oh, I have pumpkins in my inventory. Let me get the pumpkins out. <laughs> Pumpkin patch here, I think. I feel like that would work well. So let's get this open and start a little build, I suppose. I'm gonna do the dark 
dirt path. Which way do I want this? Well, not like that, because that's where the fence will go. Right, like this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to have that alternate, alternate, alternate dirt, like so. I just succumbed and got dried mango, it's pudding, kind of. I love dried mango. I hope you enjoy one of my favourite dried fruits. It's so delicious. Oh, I need the other one. Don't do that, that's so rude. And then I have, I have bushes. Let me get these out. So there's bushes in between each of the fences. One here. There we are. Oh, when do they bloom till? I don't want them blooming. It's a bit annoying, isn't it? Plant this one, this one, here, and then plant one here. And then I could plant like a weed. A weed? I'm gonna get some pumpkins out of the, in my, my storage so we can put them out. We have green and we have white and then I have, nope, what are those? Hibiscus starts. Okay, and we have these fences for now, so yeah. Right, let me put this out. Wait, I wanna take one. Thank you. And then I have a green one as well. Or you can run through them. I didn't realize that. That's good. Okay. Can you run through them even when they're grown? And then grab one of these. That looks cute. A little green leaf custom path underneath them. That's a brilliant idea. Hold on. We're gonna have to make one. Hold up a second. Let me change this. What greens? Those have got a couple nice greens. I don't know what pumpkin leaves kind of look like, so I'm just gonna guess. Pumpkin leaves are big and round usually. Okay, I think that looks okay enough. I was like, yeah, I'm not doing any custom paths today because like, they were difficult yesterday. I changed my tune real quick. I can't see because the cat's tail, but I'm attempting to do this, you know? That works, but I'm gonna change this color. Leaves, pumpkin leaves, big leaves. Wow, that's a big leaf if I've ever seen one. Let me put a pumpkin down. <gasps> it looks so good. This was the best. Let's play on ground. Good to have a variety as well. Let me put this here. Let me put this here. I wish you could like put, I've got like these lanterns. You know how you can put lanterns on like fence in Minecraft? That's what I want to do. But no, Nintendo hates us. Oh, poop. I heard a balloon. There it is. We need to grab as many balloons as possible because obviously I need items to decorate and we're not going to treasure islands. Let me grab these. Wow, that's a great time. I want to move the tree that's right in front of this as well. Give sticks, please, or I'll beat you up. This tree doesn't want to give any sticks. Oh, I think it heard my threat. It understood. Wow, look at all this good stuff. The acorns I will use as decor. Thank you for the money. Let's craft. I want to craft this bad boy. It's going to look so good. Wow. And you know what I really want? I want a bucket. I need a bucket for the decor. All right, we'll see who's in so we can get um, a recipe. Look at my little ste scarecrow. Isn't he a cutie? I'm in love. Is Dom crafting? That is the main question. Hi, Dom. You're not crafting, which is not very nice, but I, I will say hello. Disappointing, I'm not gonna lie. You're not crafting either? Shub, you've just betrayed me. Bye. I'm in love with the pumpkin thingy so far though. I think it's gonna look really cute. I want the three stack of pumpkins. I think that would be a cute idea. And then I also, we got the decayed tree. I don't know how to make that. Let's see. Hardwood. Okay. I'm going to get some hardwood out. A decayed tree. Oh my God. Look at this. I like it like that. Can I push it in further closer to the thingy? No. I want to get rid of this tree in front of it because I think it will be cuter without. Bye. What I might do is literally move it along by one. I literally just put it here. Where did the tree go? Here. Yeah, that's like so much better. Very much better. It's October 7th and Nook's Cranny is open. Finally. We also have ordinances now. I just remembered. Look how spooky Nook's Cranny is now. How cute. Oh my goodness. Oh, I do need this. Hi, hello. Thank you very much. I need it. I think this is a good autumnal item, you know? And maybe the dead body as well. <gasps> this umbrella is very cute. Right, what did I get? The spooky lantern set. I think this needs to go here, you know? You know what? I might actually get rid of that. Push that this way. This is our little pumpkin patch. I'm very excited about it. The pumpkins grew in, in a day, when they're all orange, but that's okay. I'm gonna put 
green pumpkin here. Yes, I love it. And this was so perfect when it was in Nook's Cranny. What the hell? I might do some custom pathing. Maybe like a little patch or something. Why do I find decorating with custom paths so difficult? It's a time. I actually think I want like that. Yeah. Let me put this here. And then all, all the middle. We got one of these. Display on ground. My little autumnal leaves. Very cute. And then, do I have a spare? I do. My beautiful pumpkin. Let me grab this. And what do we have? Cabin. We know cabin wall already. What the hell? Why do we keep getting duplicates all of the time? What do we got? I'm going to sell these and this and this. Yeah. Right. This is cute. I'm going to save it. I really like that one. We have things like the little hand cart thing. Look at this little outdoor cafe, little kind of seating. That's so cute. So maybe we could move my trees and put like the little path down. Right, I don't actually have that many nook miles, so we'll have to see what we can do. But I do like that. It, it makes it like, I don't know, like unique. Hello. Three, seven plus days in a row? That's so good. Redeem nook miles. Right, let's have a look at what items we have. We could get the topiaries. Definitely don't have enough miles for this, but that's okay. Obviously, the party lights arch we'll need at some point. The windmill, we can definitely use that. That's my pergola. It's not fully autumn, but it's not the worst. Yeah. Right, how much is the pergola? The pergola is 4,000. You can customize them too. That is good to know. This breaks my heart. We need to actually go see half. Oh, excuse me. Because um, he's invited us to the island. And I'm guessing it's to start being able to pay for those people. All of the people on the island. Right, I suppose what we can do is the dirt paths. But let's see. Let me grab this. I'm gonna make this area. I might make this straight path because it looks very odd winding like this. You know? It's just not the vision that I had. And that's okay. Oops. That's very sad. Right, let me make this straight. That's better. Then, do I have room in my inventory? I do. Oh, it would help if I ate the apples. Oh my goodness. Let me eat these bad boys. Oh, please. There we are. Doink. I'll take this and this one. Right, that's where that tree is. That's where that tree is. And that's where that one is. And if we do, like, all the way around. Oh, why would I do that, please? Oh, thanks. Bye, Dom. Thank you. You're just, you're in the way right now. I keep doing the wrong thing. Right, I want to plant that there. And then this here. Tee hee. And then this here. I think I like that path like that. This is going to look cute, hopefully. Maybe I could do like a little fence around it. I think. Let's see. Wait, where'd it go? Let me get rid of this. And this. Okay, yeah. I think this is what I want it to be. Oopsies. Right, I need to get rid of a lot of these flowers. So we're gonna go put them on a flower beach, I suppose. I only have these because I want orange flowers. No! Let me plant these. Okay, we can get six flowers at a time. Right, let me get the rest of these red ones. I like so. Let me get three white ones. I'm glad we're getting these builds out. It's gonna be a great time. They're gonna look cute and I'm excited. Let me plant these ones. We can have little areas for each plant. This is gonna be so cute. I was gonna have soup today. I was like, oh, I'd like some soup. But then I was like, actually, with this humidity, I'd probably hate soup. Chicken noodle soup slaps. One, two, three, four, five. No, I got one too many. What's everyone's favorite soup? I'd love to know. Soupy soup. Grab this. And then I need to eat these so I can grab another one. I don't know how I'm going to design this fully, but it's fine. Let me eat one of these. No. Right, I'm going to build this fence at the back. I feel like that'll work. Let me put this down. <gasps> I have no more fence. Oh, look at how good that looks, though. Grab apple. Let me put this down. I love these leaves. They're so cute. I'm so happy with them. That is the orchard. I really want to make more fence. How do I make fence? Let me see. Fence? Question mark? Why can't I see it anywhere? 
I'm confused. Right, wait. Fence. I see hedge. How did I make this one then? Oh, it's here. Let's craft. Craftable. Look at us go. Amazing. We can make 20 more, I think. So that is the best time. Let's keep crafting and craft this one. Wow. Gotta get some serious work done on this island. Um, country fencing. Now let's finish doing behind this area. I feel like that would be a good idea. Oh, I need to do the one in the middle there. There we go. And then like this. Do I want to bring the fence all the way down? Like maybe? Why would it let me fence? Oh, what? There we go. It was just being nasty. I can put custom design under. Oh wait, I've got one right there. So maybe I should. If I put one here. Big leaves underneath the fence. There we are. This is going to look so cute. Oops. Doink. So we've got two smallish builds going on right now. We've got our little pumpkin patch. Agnes, that's exactly where I need to be, please. Thanks. What villages do you currently have? I have... I have Lopez, Olive, Dom, Agnes, Scoot, Cherry, Shab, Norma, Ruby, and Peanut. I think the only one I really want to get rid of is Peanut. She doesn't fit, but the rest of them, I don't mind, you know? I think they're cute. I think Peanut is adorable, but she just doesn't fit the theme. I have stuff in my inventory. I thought I had a cart. Where's my cart? Oh, I have two. We have this, and I bet the hose pipe, the, the, the water pump thing would look cute there, actually. Yes. Okay. I want the apple on top of this custom design area. Hand cart. Look at that bad boy go. Yes. Work it. Then, not the lantern. Where's my other hand cart? This one? No. Did I not get it out? Okay, well, that's fine. Spinning wheel. I don't know what I'd use that for. Maybe. Oh my god, look at this. This is a functioning build that I've done. Assess my fossils, please. Thank you. But I'm not going to give you them. I'm sorry. I just want the money from them. Bye. I wonder if there's anything that we can have where it will be like good for the archaeological dig site in this area. My vest give me secondhand embarrassment. Is it just me? No, I completely get that. Perfume adverts. The secondhand embarrassment I get from those. I don't know. There's just something about them. Lather's bestie has a whole desk in his tent. He's just got to have his work with him, you know? Okay, I want fossils here. That's rude. What do you look like? Oh, too big. Too big. I just need those like little plaques, you know? What do I want to do? Sell. Oh, hi. I want to sell and I am offering. And this bug. I don't want olives, fleas. Do we just put like all the bugs and stuff just in our pocket? You know? I'm so happy with these two builds so far. I think we're doing great. So great time. Oh, excuse me. Thank you. I forgot we didn't time travel. I want to time travel. That's what I was going to do. There's no news. And Isabel was having fun with her crossword. A, a great time. Oh, excuse me. I want to put this this way. Here we are. Um, okay, we just need like three more of those. But I think it works. But we are going to have to get some Nook Miles for it. What's in Nook's cranny? What is that? I need it. It's a, it's a trick lamp? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Nook Miles was like, I hear you. You need more. Ooh. I should be buying candy. I've forgotten. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. We need 4,000, well, 8,000 miles actually, because we need two more pergolas. Okay. We need to find our fossils. I want to check Abel's sisters as well. Right. Where's Abel's? Here we are. I also need to do some paths up this way. To, like make it cute i suppose <laughs> so we'll do that hello able mabel sable you know what i kind of like this hat oh no that's the whole outfit isn't it oh no you can get the hat i can do that oh i'm meant to be talking to which one's this one sable i need to talk to sable i was told to do it every day and i forgot what do we want is there anything here <gasps> this little barista uniform is actually adorable i kind of love that the jumpsuit looks quite funny ah ooh. What if I put a little jumpsuit next to the dig site? And a hard hat. There's no white ones. There's like a blue one. Okay. I want this hat as well. Because these can be used for decoration. <gasps> these loafers. Yes. Okay. I don't want to wear it though. Thank you though. 
We got some cute things. Very cute. We're gonna use them as decor. Right, we have a little pumpkin patch here. Amazing. Look at it. What do we have? Spooky trick lamp. Where could I put that? Maybe like next to this tree? That is so cool. I feel like we need like a table to put that on. Will it fit on here? It does. That's so cute. Nice. Garden lantern. Where do I want the little lantern? Maybe at the back here. There we are. Can I turn it on? Or is it only going at night? I don't like that. It looks weird. Oh, but I don't want to pick, pick a pumpkin. I'm going to have to. It's so annoying. Let me put a weed back. There we are. You know what I could do? I could make a little picnic blanket design. I haven't made one yet, so I feel like that's a good idea. I don't know what kind of picnic blanket I want though. Something like this is so pretty. How do people even do that? That's so pretty. These are gorgeous for the orchard. Imagine having that on the little sign. What kind of colours do we want to go for? Maybe some sort of browns and I just like... We can like change the palette here like that and then... Oh, mirroring it doesn't work. That looks so wrong. Hold up a sec. Let me unmirror. I did it wrong. Because it's meant to go like this. A little picnic blanket. This is looking cute. That looks about square size. And then do this. That is not what I meant to do. Nope. Now we have the reference of all the rest of them, which helps. This looks like it could be a picnic blanket, you know? And then, what if I did like... <gasps> That's cute. Like that, but the lines go all the way through. I don't know if this works well. I don't know how this will look. Ah, okay, right, wait. That's what I meant to do. Really liking the way this is going. Hello, Flame. I'm liking this. I feel like if I saw this on the floor, I'd be like, yeah, that is a picnic bl blanket and I would use that as a picnic blanket. What if I did some threads like that? Would that look strange or would it look good? I feel like that looks okay. How do people do this and make it look good? Oh, that's the wrong colour. I don't know where to put the picnic blanket, but I feel like near the orchard would be cute. Or what if we did it near the pumpkin patch? Nah, I think near the orchard. Right, let's see. I can just put them down like this and see how it looks. This looks like a picnic blanket, if you ask me. If I walked up to that and someone was like, what's that? I'd be like, you can't tell, it's a picnic blanket. Right, I want to get out the picnic basket. I feel like that's a good thing to have. Oh my god, and we have like cute little mom's tea cozy, a book. Where's my picnic black basket? I actually don't know. Oh, I see it. Right, let's see. I want to put a book down. I want to put mom's tea cozy. Oh my god, that is so cute. And then I need to get my custom designing on. Yes. Getting permission. Look at us go. I'm going to make this path longer. Do -do. I also want it to be windy, so we're gonna go this way. Through the stumps. We should keep the stumps, I think that's kind of cool. This works. And then what if I did like a little blob that went out? Um, okay. I was like, I'm not doing any custom pathing today. It took too long yesterday and now here I am doing custom paths, but it's a great time, it's fine. The paths aren't perfect. There's a very harsh corner over here, which I do want to fix, but I'll do it at another point. Peanut is singing. To our hearts con- Bestie, please. To our hearts con- Hearts content? I can't speak. Just isn't a peanut. Oh, hi. I swear Dom is the only one to give us reactions, ever. It's just, he's got all of the reactions up his sleeve. Up his rainbow sleeve. Right, let me put this here. This is turning out cute and I'm very excited. I forgot that I have the alternate these things. It gives me so much power. Oh my goodness. I don't know where I put one though. Maybe like here? Let's do that. Is it this one? Wow. Very nice. That kind of looks very weird with the little pointy thing, but that's okay. The paths definitely need improving, but I can do that at a later date. That looks cute. What did we get from the sky? A skirt. I don't really want a skirt right now. Place. That's so perfect. Oh my goodness. I'm loving this so far. I think it's looking cute. We're getting some like little builds out. It's Hello there everyone. Right now on Applesauce, it's up a nine. And an event announcement to share today. Ooh, CJ is here. 
That sounds good to me. Sounds like the best time, actually. I don't think we've had CJ on the island yet. If I need money, I can sell my fruit, but I don't need that right now. What have we got? Oh, a jack-o'-lantern. I can use that. Yeah. Oh, I already have the globe. Could I get the thing next to the globe, please? Right, where do I want this pumpkin to go then? I'm not sure. I'm guessing somewhere around here, but maybe we need like a little table to put it on. That could be good. I'll put it on here for now. Oh my god, my inventory's full place. Oh, so it, it won't it won't go on top of a stump. That's really sad. That there is, is fine for now. Office materials. We got a little straw hat that I thought could be cute somewhere. I'll just put it down here for now. That's kind of cute, right? I think so. I, I think that's too crowded, actually. But I'll leave it there for now. We have lanterns, a spinning wheel. What? Oh, I forgot about that. I forgot about that. Okay. Yes, we have two candies now. Also, I have lemon in my water because I'm bougie today, which is the best time. The goal for today is to get more items because we are very itemless at the minute. And oh, Leaf is here. Hi. Tea olive. What is that? Carrot starts. And those are the tea olive starts. And then the holly bush. And we've got lilies. I don't like lilies, but we have tulips. Let me grab a couple of these. Leaf and CJ. I wonder if... I actually don't know. Isabel said that um, there were sign-ups for the fishing tourney. So maybe I have to sign up inside resident service or something. Maybe CJ isn't here. I don't know how those work. I think you can have multiple NPCs. Oh, Fish and Tony sign up is in the plaza. One plaza and one non-plaza. I don't know where CJ is. CJ is in the plaza, the no Tony. Unless she was saying the Tony isn't today, they will mention it for a future day. I wonder if that's what happened. This is what I get for not reading the announcements or anything properly in when I when I play games. You know, they need to say it out loud or it just doesn't go in. I want to start off with getting the area. Tournament always on Saturdays. It's a Monday, so it must be this week then. They said something about sign-ups, so I don't know why that was said, but that's okay. But yeah, I want to do a little entrance with like some flowers. I really want some hyacinths. I don't know if I've got those in like my storage. Because, you know, like corn, if we have like yellow hyacinths. So I want to change this. Right, what I do want to do is make a quick little custom path. Yes. So how do I copy? Copy. So I want to do a little thin path. Just one little thing. And it's like, it just goes up and down. Because I think it'll look good. So I suppose I'll use that. That looks pretty good for me. Then maybe like drag it over like this. Oh, keep editing. And then here. And I need to be mindful of where the top and bottom starts. Because it's going to link up. Let me get rid of this one. And put this like that. And then we can have little dots around. And then we do this one. That's all that colour. I think this is going to be great. That looks good to me. Let's just call it long. Long. Start construction. Thank you. I've just realised that this is like a too wide area. So I don't know what to do about that. But I'll deal with it when it comes to it, you know? So how would I want to do it? What if I did like a curved bit here? Maybe like that? I'd need a bottom bit here, actually. So I don't know. I'm going to do it too wide. I have resigned to doing it too wide. And I'm going to get rid of this bit of the path. Even though we took ages doing this. Actually, wait, I kind of like that little lump. What if I do this as the little lump at the end? And then like have bits in the little fields. I think so. So like, if I copied this, wait, all right, I'm gonna copy this, maybe like that. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I do like there, maybe? You're welcome, I have to try this on my island as well. Just came up with the idea. It's a great idea. Erase the left side on one and the right side on the other. Yes, right, I'm gonna pen and erase. Okay, done. Is that right? Yes, that's where it was. Then we erase. Let's try this out. I think this is gonna be good. Oh my goodness, look at that. Wow. The only problem with this is that the flowers won't be right next to it, but that's okay. I can deal with that. Wow. This actually looks really cute. Right, I just wanted a small area over here with this path. So let's do this. What do we think? I don't know. I want to get my flowers out. Where's my flowers? Okay. Do I have hyacinths? I do. Hehe. <laughs> Tulips, white hyacinths. Oh, I forgot we have mums as well. Amazing. How do I want this to look? 
That was a big stretch. I need to make this path get together. Oh, oh wait, this won't work, will it? Okay, all right. I don't know how I feel. Do I want... I'm really struggling with this. I think I should do the flowers and things first. Right, these hyacinths need to go in between a lot of the flowers. So we'll see how we do with this. Unless we want the hyacinths just all the flowers? I don't actually know. I don't know. You know what I realized? I could put the nice dirt path underneath. Do I want to do that? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. Plant. I might have other flowers sprinkled in and about. I feel like that could be a good time, but not too many. Not too many. I need to not run out. Oh, that's in the wrong place. That's so rude of it. Wow. Oh, they're tulips. They're, they're all yellow tulips. That's rude. Okay. Let me put a mum here, I think. All right, I'm going to have that. I'm going to move this and then... I also don't want that dirt there because it just doesn't fit. Let's see. Hyacinths. Thank you. I need the white hyacinths as well. And then... Oh, we've got more yellow as well here. Amazing. Let, let me plant this. So once this is actually, like, you know, grown, it'll look a lot nicer. I have no more fence. How do I make fence? Is it this wood? Let's have a look. Let me see. Hi yo. I would love to craft some fence. Hardwood. I suppose... We shall do that. That's not hardwood. That's so rude. Wow. We have one. It's six hardwood for ten fence. I don't need too many fence though. And then this one. Amazing. Wow. Okay, thank you. Silly little axe. We don't even have enough wood. That is so upsetting. I want 20 fence out of this. I chopped enough wood for it. Right. I need my shovel. This is going to make things annoying. I'm going to put these here. Amazing. And then I need these ones. Not that one. That's very upsetting, actually. This is so tedious. Country fencing. Oh my goodness, that fence ties it all together. Look at that. Okay, yeah, that doesn't work. Wait. I need to make this fit, and I don't know how. I'll figure it out. How does this look if I do this? Um, That doesn't work. I don't know how to connect it together or if I should just like have it end there. I don't know. Let me see. I'm struggling with this. I'm not going to lie. Right. Let's see if the bigger path works better for now. What do we think? Did we prefer the small one? Did we prefer the smaller ones? Maybe we could do one of these bad boys. Is this a middle one? No. I chose the wrong one. Loops. That goes in better. But I like the skinny path. Or I could do the in-game pathing. I feel like this works better for what I'm going for. So maybe I do this. I think I need to get rid of the trees. And I might actually move Dom's house. Because it feels just in the way. Like, what if we had, like, a massive flower field? I feel like that would just look so much better. You know? White hyacinths. Yellow hyacinths. Oh! Did I plant loads? Maybe. No. Okay. Apple, please. Thanks. I eat now. Right, trees. Trees. Oh, that's not... What? Nice. Bonk. And then I'm going to move this one as well. So I just want a flower field here. So I do like the way this path is. I love this little wibbly wobbly section. It's kind of ruined the vibes for the flower field. What I'm going to do is I'm going to move Dom. I don't know where to, though. That is a problem. We could put him... No, because that's in front of the orchard and that wouldn't work. Dom, you're just a little bit in the way, my love. You know what? I'm going to move him, move him to the beach. It's awful. Dom homeless? Confirmed. It's just a theory. A Dom theory. Okay. Thank you, Dom. Thanks for understanding. Right. Is this the big one? It's not really big enough, is it? Okay. You can't go there. Maybe I just put him on the beach for now then. That's fine. That's fine. This is so cute. Do I get one? Might get one, but not wear it, because I like my horns. My horns are too cute. And I'm going to get these, because they'll be good as well. Alright, you know what we're going to do? We're going to time travel to the next day. And then Dom will be moved to the beach, and then we can do our little flower field, and it'll be the best time. Hello, Isabel. October 10th. Label is here. I sold things in the drop-off box like a bozo again. Can I not do that, please? It's really upsetting, actually. It was just automatic. Oh my goodness. Okay, nice. This might take a while. Island designer. Yes. Thank you. Right, let's move all this. 
and we'll get the path all the way up to maybe the pumpkin patch. We'll see actually. What have I got in my inventory? I've got space for these and this one here. There we go. And I'm going to get rid of this path here. Right, so I can block this area off because we can get around this way. Wait a sec. Does Lopez want to leave? Oh my goodness. Do you think we should get rid of Lopez and go on a little hunt? I have like no miles. I have like zero miles. Yeah, you can find a dreamy. This is true. That could happen. Plus, I think he's less autumnal than the others on your island. This is true. Okay, it is a moving bubble. Yes. Okay, bye Lopez. See you later. Oh my goodness. Okay. For the dreamy. That's exciting. I suppose we've got to we've got to do a little hunt then. Right, I want to separate this. Oh, I should probably have a little path this way, right? I probably should have cut the flower field off. I don't know, I feel like it's just... There's not enough flowers. Do I get rid of this bit? I reckon if we do something like this. There we are. And then here. I think that works. I just don't think there's enough room here. Unless I move some things around. Right, I think we could move some things around and it might work. Let me see my inventory. It's not too full at the minute. I can move these elsewhere. Onto the beach is elsewhere. Let me put all of these here. I don't want them around at the minute. If I do, a little break here. That might help. Do I have fences left? That's a question. Wait, I have an idea for this bit. I saw people plant trees in between the fences. And I thought that was a really cute idea. And I have nothing to eat. Hold on. What do we think about the tree there? Does that look odd? I can't tell. I think having the path run through would look really pretty. I think I'm gonna go back on this. Even though I do like it, I think being able to connect the paths will be so much better. Let me plop some of these down. I think I'll want these flowers this way anyway, right? I thought Sherb was thinking for a second. I was like, that's impossible. <laughs> I wonder if I could do this here. Let's see how it would look with the thingy. Would it look weird? It doesn't really fit. Or, what about this? And then if I put that here. Nah, I don't think that works. Well, do we think that the fences belong here or not? On the sides? That's what I'm unsure about. I'm gonna make the path too wide because that makes it easier on everybody. I don't know how much inventory space I have though. Plant? Nope, the white mum is literally right there. It's in the wrong place. Rude. Beautiful. I'm gonna put these down this way and then we can have like, actually what if I did this? This works. Like this? I think so. I think that could be cute. And maybe have more pumpkins and stuff here so like the, the pumpkin patch can continue. So like there's a path in between it. I feel like that would work. This tree might have to go but that's okay. Like this and then we can only do two here but that's fine. That's fine. Let's do the other dirt. We are. Do I have any pumpkins in my inventory? I have one. Wait, I want to put a custom design down here. There we are. And drop that. Imagine if I accidentally hit it. Continuation. That looks good to me. And then, do I have any fence? Here. We can have the tree here. I think this works. Do I want to separate it from the flower field? That is the question. I don't know. That's the struggle. What I will do is connect the paths at this bit here. I did want this leaf on the floor. And then I'm going to do the rest of my fences, which I don't think I have. Yeah, I don't have enough. Definitely not. What if it was a broken fence? Kind of like that. I think that's kind of cute. I think that works. Yeah. If I pick up that weed, put a flower there. This entrance is cuter than I thought it was going to be. That is a good time. If I like decorate this area with something cute. Where did the balloon go? Oh, over here. Okay, it's over the river right now. So I'm gonna have to wait until it gets all the way across. Why are you going so slow? Can I have this balloon, please? Thank you. Hopefully it's something useful. Who's here? Who is this? Oh, Scoot. How did he get down from up here? A high chair. That's exactly what I wanted. We need it to look cuter. Give me those. Thank you. I need to plant some pumpkins. Well, I'll drop those actually. Oh, I don't want to drop both of them. Wait, let me grab one and then drop one here and then one here. And then we can plant some weeds as well. I think so. And then maybe some custom paths. 
I think this looks cute, but I actually might change this back because I, I don't like it. I don't think I've made it good enough for it to be used that way. It doesn't fit in. Oh, okay. There we go. A spooky scarecrow. That's useful. We have a normal scarecrow, but not a spooky one. What does that look like? Oh, you need a pumpkin and wood. That's kind of cute. Look at it. That'll fit in so well in the pumpkin field as well. I love it. Okay. This is our pumpkin patch area. I think that's cute. This is our flower field area. I need to put a weed here. A weed. I'm calling the police. I literally made that joke yesterday, but I'm not mad. Did I check nooks today? I feel like I did. I feel like I did, so I'm gonna have a little check, but just in case. Oh, I didn't check it today. Look at that. 10,000 bells is good by me. Look at that bad boy. That's going in the pumpkin patch straight away. We could also use this as decor there as well. I'll buy it. Thank you. And this. I'll buy it. Amazing. Where do I put it like here? Not that. Where is it? Spooky tree. There literally is room. Oh my god, look at that. I love it. I actually love it. It's so cute. What the hell? I think it fits perfectly. Oh my god. I love how we're mixing like spooky with like metalcore. I think it's so cute. Spooky cute. I need to figure out what I want to do down here, but I can do that later. I might actually take that hair bed. That would be useful. Where can I put this? Maybe like here at the back? I think that fits there. And let me put a weed here. Nice. I think this is looking pretty good. How many nook miles do I have? Definitely not a lot. Let's do some... Let's do some of these things, I suppose. Chop some wood. I can do that. I can do that one. Oh, Olive, you're in the way a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. That is very upsetting. Did I not even get the nook miles? That's so annoying. Where did I get up to? I should probably pick it all up, because I will... My future self will definitely complain about my past self if I don't pick all these up. Finally! Oh my goodness. Earn bells by selling items. Customize items. I don't want to. Right, I'm gonna grab these pumpkins. Alright, I'm gonna take this. Put one here. I wonder if I should sell the other pumpkins. I have a lot of pumpkin going on here. Should we have pumpkins next to every house? Would that be cute? We could do some custom pathing here as well. I feel like we've gotten loads done today, which makes me very happy. Let me do this. Let me do this here. Can I do it here? I can! That works. Let me do this. And then this. Can I put a custom design under this bit? No. Let me do that then instead. Custom design paths take so long and it hurts my feelings. I think I'm like a little bit stuck with this path. I want to make it look cute. I need that there. I wish like, you know, actually in Happy Home Paradise, can't you do custom paths like way easier? I wish we had that, but like this, like here. Um, I think that works. This is taking so long. Most of the island designing is literally custom pathing. Wow. I don't think that fits there. I don't like it there. Let me fix it. That's better. Okay, I think that looks okay. The path isn't perfect, but neither are we, so it's fine. That's not a moving bubble. What have you got? Lay it on me, Dom. Portable radio. Wow. It's looking cute. And Dom's house is on the beach. We'll ignore that though. It's fine. This is looking pretty good. Redeem Nook Miles. Get a ticket. Thank you. Bye. We got Nook Miles for that. And then we'll try do some more stuff for Nook Miles. What have we got? Okay. And then we can sell items for bells. Talk to neighbors. I have neighbors right here. Bye. She's kind of cute. Oops. We haven't chat to Peanut. That's really sad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Then we've got this. Is there anything that I want to sell? Maybe we could sell all these. And this will earn us a lot of bells. Let's grab all these. Amazing. And sell them at Nook's Cranny. Let's go. Thank you. Hi. Catch a flea? That is so specific. Right, I'm gonna time travel. So, Lopez is like in boxes. Hello, Isabel. A visitor staying at the campsite? And Lopez is leaving. Right. We're gonna check Nook's Cranny. Oh, look at the little trick-or-treat things. I'll buy. These are so expensive. Why are they so expensive? I might get the piano. Did you say you'll look at the Lord? I did not. Why did I just buy that? What did you do? I just spent all my bells by accident. I was on autopilot. I didn't even look how much it was. I just bought a piano. 
for 53,000 bells. I don't even know where I'd put a piano. We're gonna have to incorporate it into our build somehow. That's so upsetting. I want to have a proper plaza area around here. That's why I've kept like all of this space free. Maybe we could do like a really cute autumnal plaza with like a piano and stuff. It's gonna have to fit in. I've spent all them bells. It can't not, you know? Right, we're gonna see who the campsite villager is. Who is the campsite villager? Let's go in. That was really ominous. So I was, I was like holding my axe before we went in. <gasps> oh my god! It's Freckles! Freckles is a cutie, okay? I love Freckles. Freckles is a cutie. Who's one big there? I didn't think we'd get a cute villager here. Red or black? I'm gonna go with red. Black. That's so rude. A game. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna win. Heart, diamond, spit a club. I'm gonna say diamond. You seem like a diamond girly. Who's she gonna kick out though? Right, okay. Everyone. Fingers crossed. I'm so nervous right now. Okay. I suppose we should do it. I suppose, instead of villager hunting, it would save us a lot of trouble. Okay. Bye, Lopez. Oh, hi. Oh, okay. We getting a little reaction. That's not too bad, then. We have a ticket that's unused, but that's fine. I suppose we'll time travel again. I still want to get more items. I actually should try and make some money. Um, okay. Fossils. Oh, money tree! That's exactly what I'm looking for. I don't know. I don't feel broke anymore. I think we can time travel. Hi, Isabel. Um, okay, October 12th. Kick is here. Thank you. Oh, it's a little pumpkin stool. Okay, that's cute. Let me sell these apples. What is this? Okay, no, I want that. And then I'm gonna buy 200 bells. Okay. I'm gonna buy the pumpkin stool. 5,000 bells. Why the Halloween stuff? Why is it so expensive? I don't get it. Do I want any of this bubble machine? No. I want to finish off some of these builds, but like I don't have the items to do so. Let's have a look at um for our message in a battle. I also need to start thinking about inclines and bridges. So maybe we'll do that. I think we should do a bridge over to the other side. So we're gonna start that off. Right, let me let me buy a bridge, Tom Nook, please. How expensive are the bridges? It's gonna be like 168,000, isn't it? Where can I have the bridge? Do I want it near the bottom? Nah, I think we'll have it in the middle, near the plaza. I think that would fit better. Let me imagine. I think that works well. Oh my god, I could actually pay off my loan, but no thanks. And maybe we can start thinking about inclines as well. We have more than enough. Let's go as much as possible. Donate. There we are. Thank you. Let's go. Okay, should we time travel? Or is there anything I needed to do? I feel like I did everything today. Hello there, everyone. Hello, Isabel. It is October 13th and Freckles is moving in. Exciting. In between. We got a fossil. We have a couple of houses over this side, but not too many. <gasps> Flick! Hi, Flick. Do you know what I have? Do you guys know what I have? I have stuff for Flick. Wait, I need to... I'm gonna open this. Hi! Okay. I'm gonna sell you some very good bugs. Let me see. I've got bugs. That's a lot of wasps. That is so many. 42,000 bells. We got our money back. No, Sherpa's has fleas, guys. Sherpa's has fleas. Sherpa's has fleas. Sell the fleas? That's so clever. Okay, I'm gonna sell you a flea. You can have the flea. I don't- I don't want it. Take it away. A flea? It's so beautiful. What the hell? 105 bells. It's not as good as I thought it would be, actually. I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of sad. Okay, bye. Oh, I don't really care for these, but I suppose in the trick-or-treat neighborhood, it makes sense. Hi, little cutie. She kicked out Lopez, who was our first campsite villager. I also want to get to work on this plaza area, but I don't know what I should do about not having a custom code for it. Well, I could actually, I could have my normal custom codes that I've got. I've seen some plazas where it's really natural, so we could do that style thing. Let me eat these and move these trees. I have no idea where I want bamboo trees. I don't know where they'd fit in on like an autumnal island. Because do, do they change colour or do they just stay green? Oh, it's just flying past my head. Okay. That is not how you get a balloon down. There we go. Hi, Flick. You're a little cutie. 
Okay. What is wrong with Agnes? You're so upset all the time. I don't get it. Actually, don't get it. <laughs> right. I think I want to... Nope, that's not how I open my phone. I want to terraform a bit. Not terraform. Let me accidentally say in the naughty words for this island. I want to put some paths down. Don't you worry. No terraforming here. Let me grab this like that. Could do something like this. Right. How do I want to do this? And be like... Not like that. Go in this. What could we have in the middle? I don't know. We could do bushes as well. Do I have bushes? I might have bush starts in my house. Let's have a look. I can plant these, maybe. Plant one, plant one. Then how big is the arch? Oh, it's pretty sizable actually. I don't know. What's this, a hand cart? How do you make something good? It's so difficult. I might actually order the fountain. Put the arch here. There we go. Do I need... Right, yeah, I'm gonna go get the fountain. Wait, do I have enough nook miles for that? Stop clicking the wrong thing. Probably not. I don't think I have enough nook miles. Can I make benches? Do I have that? Let's see. No bench? No bench? This is my center for now. This is it. And then I'm gonna put the path like all the way around and it'll connect to this one. And then... Okay, we had all this done. What a great time. This is lovely. Hello there everyone, right now on Applesauce it is October the 15th and we're hosting our very first fishing tourney. Amazing. Right, we're back. We're back to Crunch and Town. For those of you who weren't here yesterday, we finished up extending our pumpkin patch and we have a flower field entrance. I'm kind of obsessed. We also did the paths over here and that's looking cute. Dom's on the beach. We bought a piano, which really upset me, but that's okay. Let's see what is in Nook's cranny. Oh my god, it's a pumpkin table. Of course I'm gonna have to take this. 22,000. Why is it so expensive? I'm gonna buy this as well. 700 bells. Thank you for the chair. I need my candy. What we need to do, save up more Nook Miles to finish off this build with the pergolas. Then I kind of love the flower field. I think it, it goes so well. Pumpkin table. I don't know where I want to put the pumpkin table, but that's okay. What Nook Miles things can we get? 10 flowers? Well, I have plenty of flowers to tend, I suppose. Where's my watering can? Why are you not on my favourites? The yellow hyacinths are very cute. I used to really not like yellow, but I think I'm changing my mind. Just in the Animal Crossing sense though, not in real life. DIYs, pop balloons, chop wood. Okay, we need 8,000 miles to get two more pergolas, which is probably the amount we need for this central bit, but that's okay. Why won't it let me run? What is going on? Is it lagging over here? I have a laggy spot on my island, that's really weird. I forgot about the fish and Tony. Do I want to do that? Maybe not. Why won't it let me run in certain places? That's so weird. We have our new bridge over here, and there's a balloon I see. Thank you. Oh, spooky fence? No way. <laughs> nice. And my message on the beach is here from Faith. I don't even know who Faith is, a shell speaker. Now, I haven't came in with a plan today. I kind of forgot to plan because I was so excited to play Turn Up Boy Commits Tax Evasion. And that was so fun. That was so fun. Um, I always get surprised because like there's so many games. Like, all of them can't be fun, but they are. All of them are fun, the best time. But yes, I haven't really planned out things. So maybe we could do a farm area. We have our plaza over here here but we've got this weird transition area in the middle and we also have down here which is gonna be a dig site so we need to get more fossils let me open up pinterest just to see what i've saved just in case i did plan it and i just forget let's have a little look see cozy hobbies animal crunching no, i haven't really planned it but i could do some villager yards and i need to get the bench diy so we need to go into people's houses and see who's crafting are you crafting Tell me if you're crafting. You're not, Olive. Uh, why would you let me down like that? Olive's house is kind of cute. I like Olive. Castle's making biscuits on the bed. She is a certified biscuit maker, guys. Right, is anyone here crafting? Someone's in here. Is there going to be a craft? Shub. You're meant to be crafting. Bye. Silly Shub. He doesn't understand. He's just so small. A little baby. No one's crafting today? That's actually really upsetting. Well, let's get these fossils, I suppose, and see how that goes. Okay, let's make some money from our fossils. I also need to get some of the, like, black ones because I want to put them in front of the, the tent, the museum tent. Any more fossils around here? Oh, I forgot the um, campsite's here. We should decorate the campsite as well. I'm going to dig up, put this there. I'm confusing myself later, but that's okay. Where's my bridge? Oh, it's over this way, isn't it? Do I have anything to sell? Not really. 
Let me put some things in my inventory. All right, I'm going to put some of my things away. We're going to put away. Carrot starts. We might make a farm today. That could be a farm thing. In storage. I want signs for in front of my orchard and I don't know how to get those. I'm just stuck because I need to get loads of items and I don't know how to get all the items. You know what I mean? Four fossils. Who is us? You don't get any of my fossils, blathers. What do we have? We have a torso. Wow. We have a another one. Jesus Christ. That's a big boy. We have a, a what? <gasps> one of these things. Yes. Oh my god. Look, we have one. It does just look like a rock, I'm not gonna lie, but any of those we can sell. That's a good time. Let's sell them. I don't know where I was going there. I was like, in a world of my own. Do I just sell the bamboo? I feel like we're not gonna be able to use it. I might sell the bamboo trees. They're not autumnal enough. We can go to a Captain Island. That would be a good time. You can always find more litter. This is true. That's the good thing about Animal Crossing. Right, we're gonna go on a Nook Miles. Wait, do I have a net? Yes. What am I missing then? I don't think I'm missing anything. A Nook Miles tour? No. A Captain tour. Mm-hmm. We love Captain here. Carrots. Mine. Teehee. We're on another Mum's Island, which is cute. We'll grab these and then we'll be rich from those. But this feels like a little bit of a waste of an island. There's nothing much here. At least we get carrots. Maybe I'll get a few bushes and stuff as well. Who's your favourite Animal Crossing flower? I would say the Mums. Or the tulips. Oh no. I suppose I won't get some of the bushes then. That was so rude. Well, that was kind of a waste of a thousand miles, but that's fine. Thank you, Captain. You're the best. We didn't get much, but that's fine. That is fine, I suppose. We should do some villager yards. This one is, like, ready to be done. I feel like all of these are, actually. I don't know how to do it, though. Do I want to make, like, some rocks and stuff, maybe? Or... Mm, I don't know. What if we did, like, a little farm area? Like, here. Oh, but uh, what about the archaeological site? I need more items and stuff as well. Let me sell things. Let's grab these. And then the oranges sell well. So I'm gonna grab those. Doink. And then more. There we go. I need to put like more decor on that orchard. Some weeds and stuff, I think. That would be the best idea. I don't think I'm gonna do the fish and tawny because I just. Tawny? I don't know how you're gonna say it. It'll get me bells, but also I just don't want to. And I have carrot starts anyway, so I'm gonna sell those. 16,000 bells. Sounds good to me. That sounds goodly doodly do. I love the flower field so much. Do I continue the flower field throughout the neighborhood? That's a maybe. How big do I want this area? Do I have the rope thing? The rope fence? Because then we can like make a little area for this. We do. We just need iron nuggets. That's perfect. Excuse me? I think I have a billion iron nuggets, so I don't need to get more, which is like the best case scenario. Grab a few of those, make some dig site areas. We can't actually terraform to make anything like that, so we're just going to use custom pathing, I suppose. This bad boy. I don't know how many we're going to need, so I don't know. Let's craft like 20. Let me grab this. Why is it different? That is so annoying. Why would they do it different? My brain hasn't been in my body since I started this challenge. What do you mean? So if you see the fence on Blather's tent, and then this one, they're a different colour and this one's taller. It's really not nice. Alright, let me put this down. I should go and get a shovel. Let's do that. Okay, we want this. This will work. A globe? I don't have a table to put the globe on there, but it would look nice. I need the jumpsuit and this hat. And these boots. I'm gonna put those over there. Yes. Okay, my idea was putting this here. It's like a little uniform, you know? Like, cute. And then the boots. Oh my goodness. Do I want them all in the same place? Oh, don't do that to place. Do you think that looks cute? I reckon. Hmm. That's that build started, at least. We'll just have to continue with that again we have time traveled the shooting stars tonight that's a great time okay hi oh i try to read my mail not go inside let me out i want to see what's in nook's cranny let's have a look it's gonna be something cute oh, we've already got that in green i mean i'll get it anyway but 
I'll not be happy about it, guys. Let me get the candy as well. And then I want this. And then... That one is so good for the museum. Let's get that. I like the colours. It fits. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Let's go put these by the museum. And it'll be a great time. Right. I want to put shovel here. Oh my goodness, look at that. That fits so well. And then maybe a net up this way. Place. There is room, you're just being silly. Place. You can put that there for now. It's okay for now, I suppose. We're just gonna have to keep an eye out for the balloons and start getting areas ready. I can hear a balloon. Where is it? I can't hear it anymore. Am I going insane? Maybe. I don't know where it went. I need a way to like cordon off this bit. I want to put fairy lights in front and then signs in front as well. I can't do that right now. Let me grab... Where's my shovel? Did my other one break? Oh, I needed a new shovel anyway. Let's get one, I suppose. Didn't realise that at all. Hello, I'm back. Yes, I'm very curious. Let me get this bad boy. And goodbye. I also want to keep an eye out if anyone wants to move out. Something I need to do. Wow, we got a fossil, boys. Oh, hello, Freckles. You're such a little cute. I love you. I do want an actual picnic somewhere. But here just doesn't feel right for it, you know? It doesn't feel right. Grab you. We got the acorns. My inventory's full. What? The hell? Okay, let me go put some stuff away. Nice. Right. We should craft something. I want to craft, not the sleigh this log stool okay um do i want any of this no that's fine right let's get island designer on so we can put some custom paths down that would be a good idea thank you that's such a like right angled river let me use this there and i'm gonna put these there that's so rude wow first off the roses need to go how much can i get not this much okay I'm gonna sell all of the flowers in the drop-off box because I don't really they don't really get you that much so I don't really care I just need like a nice clean slid up there I can't really drop much either right this is gonna be a slow process we'll get rid of that rock there as well I don't want that one and get one more let me grab my ladders to go sell my flowers -na 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 -na. I'm gonna sell these as well I don't want them Right, I'm gonna get rid of all these roses. I don't want them all. They're spreading too much and it upsets me. And sell these. There we go. This is what we're working with. And it'll look cute. We're gonna put some custom path down. Of course. Let's see. Oh, right. This down. And this. It might take a while, but it'll look good. Oh, I forgot we can't actually put it underneath these sign bits. So let me do that. And then, I don't know. We'll see how I want to make this look. A little bit over here. And then let's get the middle. Let's get this middle sorted out. This is the beginning of the campsite. What if I did like a little bit over here? Or what if I did like a farm in this bit? I don't know. Right, what do we want at the campsite? That is the question. A little garden lantern. A little bush over here. That is completely the wrong thing. Nope, that's not what I meant. I want to do a bush. There is room! Right, bush. Wow. How do I make this look good? I don't know. I put like a wheat here. What if I had like an incline up this way as well? You sell those. I've been looking for you. No! I thought he was in a cage. That's so sad. That's so sad. With this one, oh, I don't have my net anymore. Can I put a tree here? No. Figures. Can I put, not that, there, this. Can I put a tree there? Why not? Let me do like this. One of these and this bad boy like that. Wow. We've got a balloon. Please be a good item that I really want to use. I don't have a slingshot. Did it break? What? Please be there when we get out. Please, 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 please. No, I need to run. Stop talking. Leave me alone. Did it despawn? I'm mad. I'm so upset about that. How dare it do that to me? Well, now we have a slingshot for when we need to use it. I suppose. Let me put this hand cart here. There we go. There we go. A fossil? Maybe. Do you have a favorite type of bread? This is a toughie. I do love a good, like, sourdough bloomer. I think that might be my favorite type of bread. 
at the minute at least. Let me get these fossils assessed. No! Wow. I did not want sneakers. I wanted an item. Three fossils. Wow. They are rare fossils. Thank you very much. I'm gonna keep them and you're not gonna get your hands on them. Sorry, blathers. Right, what do we have? Can we add anything to our little area? Amber? We can. Wow. What else did we get? What? Oh, that makes sense. So we could definitely put this next to the museum. That makes sense there. And then what did we get here? A torso. We don't need that. I want to sell you a big old fossil. Thank you. 3,500 is not too bad. Okay. Thank you. Bye. We got Nook Miles, baby. Okay, what Nook Miles did we get? Sell bells for... Sell bells? Earn bells by selling items. Yes. What have you got for us? Is it going to be a cool item? What is it? A spooky table? Is that the big pumpkin table? So we already have one of those. I suppose we're going to have to time travel again. Hello, Isabel. It is October 16th. CJ is visiting. Okay. I'm good with that. Oh, it's so pretty. Phone is ringing. Okay. Thank you for the bells. Thank you. That's pretty decent for selling some flowers, you know? Right, I do want to go to Nook's Cranny and see what's popping. I'm gonna grab this. Spooky scarecrow. Thank you. I'm gonna use that at the pumpkin patch. Why is there never any good items in here? You know what we're gonna have to do, actually? Can you buy things from Harv's Island? Can you buy items there? I don't know. Maybe we should go to Harv's Island and start opening that up. I feel like that could be a good idea. I have a bit in savings. I could probably unlock one. One stall. That's so cute! Thank you for the reaction, Freckles, you little cutie. Here it is! Open up. Cosmos Shower. It's fine. Can you do one thing at a time on Harv's Island, or can you donate to multiple? I don't know. I'll take out, like, I don't know how many bells I've got. We'll have a look. Blink. Only one a day. Okay. ABD. You can do multiple, guys. Right, let's go see Harv, I suppose. Hi! Here we are. Okay. Harvey's A wall. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Where is he? Here he is. <gasps> Cutscene. Cutscene. I did get the little note. So excited to share this with you. This right here is going to be the heart of our new collective. I really put my soul into this. I have plenty of help from all kinds of folks along the way, like my old pal Harriet here. We go way back. You can call her Hattie for short if you want. Sorry, sugar. I'm Harriet. It's nice to finally meet you. I've heard all about you from Harv here. Where was I? All right, my dream collective. Well, this is what I envision as the heart of the movement. Central Plaza filled with co-ops. Now, here's the business part where it kind of gets ugly. I hate talking about bells, you know. But a co-op can't build itself without a little cooperation. So I think the best idea is to have a little fundraiser. I've brought some bells. To which one is which? Which one of the shops is worth getting? Do any of them sell items? Let's see. Harv's Island Shops. I don't want shoes and accessories. I think Red, Leaf, and Recent Cyrus are going to be the ones that I want to go to. So, who is this one? We can do this one. Yeah. Donate. We have to come back another day? Well, fine. I'll come back another day then. Amazing. And that's all for today. I'm also going to keep an eye out for Thought Bubbles. Because I want Peanut to leave. Do you ever play Pocket Camp? I don't. Can you give yourself stuff from Pocket Camp? Well, exclusive Animal Crossing items including a campsite sign. That's so cute. Don't think that counts as online. If you can send it to yourself without using online, it should be fine. Both link to your Nintendo account. That would make for an interesting episode, to be fair. I feel like I just never got into it properly. I had it, but I felt like I couldn't get past it. Past, like, um, the beginning. We've got two hammocks already. This is a rubbish selection. We found the DIYer. Hi! What are you making? A spooky tree. I don't think we have a spooky tree recipe. Thank you. Oh, it looks so nice at this time of day. Oh my god. How many fossils we got? Two. I'm just gonna plop them next to Blathers for now and deal with them later. And let's go sell some things as well. It was just in Nooks and I didn't sell. Oh, let me get these. We haven't got too much done today, but it's hard. Might do a lot of offline grinding for like Nook Miles and things to be able to order stuff from the Nook stop. Get loads of balloons and things. Right, let's sell. 9,000. What do we want? 
We want items. When do we want it? Now, please. I forgot to sell my coconuts. That's really annoying. We can go to recent services. I'm gonna bring some things to customize because I have hammocks and I'm pretty sure there's a cute hammock design. Right, hammocks. Do I wanna customize anything else? If they have different colors for these, I feel like those could be used for something. Yeah, I think that's a good amount of stuff to go and customize. Do I need to bring the customizable kits? I don't think so, right? You just pay them to do it? Right, let's go see Harv. Harv! Come on, Harvey. I can pay off someone else. I might get red next, just to get like paintings and things. A big news for you, honey. It's now open. Wow! Hi, Reese and Cyrus, you little cuties. Can I customize some things, please? Wow. I've never utilized Harv's Island before. I will tell you guys that. Sci guy. Hello. Can I please customize stuff? Yes. Hammock. We'll do a dark brown. The white looks nice. I think we could do the white. We'll do a couple of those and that would look nice in um the campsite, I think. Definitely. I do have more things. Why do we have to do them one at a time? Very upsetting if you ask me. Hammock. There we are. So cute. Oh my god. Thank you. Popcorn machine. Did you bring me Pagola? No, I didn't. I did not. I'll do that when I have all three. Oh, none of these are like autumnal, really. And that kind of is. I'll just do one. Now, where's reds? Is it this one? Dealer. Okay. I can do that. Wow. Amazing. Look at us go. Right, let's go home. The hammock to the campsite. I think it could look really cute there. Okay, bye. I'm loving Animal Crossing at the minute. It's a bit of a grind at the minute, today especially, but I am loving it. I just need more like balloons and things. I don't know if we got the message in a bottle today yet. I don't know if I did that. We've time traveled so much that I'm unsure. I want to catch that. Oh, my net broke? Okay. Well, then I can't. I suppose I can't then. Hammock. I want to put like a fence there. Do you reckon I can get him? Hee <laughs> hee. Cricket. Where'd it go? Here? Now that is what I wanted. Oh my god. Indeed a Rooney. That looks so cute. Wow. Look at this girl. We haven't gotten much done today, but that's okay. But I have something exciting. Last night, we got wheat fields in Nook's Cranny. Let's get into it. Okay, so yesterday I did not stream. And if you don't know, the, the episodes are like a day behind. So I do the episode and then I upload it the next day. So day 14 is filmed on the 13th and so on. But I didn't stream yesterday because I was looking after my little mental health, which is always a good time. Um, I was feeling very anxious, but it was nice to curl up in bed and play some Animal Crossing. Now, as you saw, we got wheat fields and nooks cranny last night. So obviously I ordered a bunch of them from the nook stop and we're gonna start decorating the island with it. Um, and here I am, open them all up. I'm so excited. I've been saying how much I want wheat fields on this island, but it's gonna be impossible because I've never seen them in Nook's Cranny before, but here we are and they're here. So I have a lot of things to do. These are some stuff that I got last night and then I noticed, Dom, what are you thinking about? Something's on your mind and he wants to leave. So that means we're gonna have to get set up for a villager hunt, but I'm not gonna do it in today's episode. We'll do it tomorrow. But that's a good time because I'm wanting to get another dreamy on the island. Someone a bit more autumnal. I feel like we've got we've got some really cute villages on the island, but not super autumnal villages, you know? So it'll be nice to get some more fitting villages. I decided I want to like decorate the entrance area with some of the wheat fields that I got because that's all it was missing. It's it's a great time. I'm just, I can't describe how happy I am that we got wheat fields. So now part of the daily routine is going to be ordering my five nook stop items, which are probably always going to be wheat fields, but I am saving up for the silo, which I think you get with nook miles, um, and the windmill as well, which I think you get with nook miles, but I don't think that counts towards this one because this one's bells. I'm not sure, but we're ordering the wheat fields. Now, as we know, villager hunting has a lot of tickets. And so I started doing some of my Nook Miles tasks 
to get some tickets. I got my money tree, catching bugs, getting fossils, all of the good stuff. Um, and started collecting up all of my Nook miles. And I needed to check Nook's granny today because we haven't done that yet. There is a spooky arch here. I already have one of these and they're actually quite expensive, like 18,000 bells. I feel like the Halloween stuff is so expensive. I guess the seasonal things, all of them are so expensive. So I decided to go against that, but I did get this flower display case, which I'll use in like a future build. Of course, with collecting all the fossils, we need to get them assessed and I need to thank whoever told me I could get these assessed. It's ridiculous. It's such a good time. I'm making so much more money, but what we're looking for now with these fossils is those like singular ones that look like rocks or like little bones and things that you can just put on the floor that aren't in a big display thing. Um, so we can do Blather's little dig site area. I have a few skulls and tails and then I think we got, yeah we got one, I'm not even going to try and attempt to say it, but we got another one of these stones, these fossil stones, which will fit in fine, but I wish it was something new, you know, but like it's coming together. And then I found my bottle on the beach, which was always a great time, um, and it was for a pile of cash, which I already know. I was about to say, like, I swear my inventory gets so filled up in this game at the beginning and, like, I just can't do anything about it. But I realised I actually have another inventory upgrade to do, which, like, why haven't I done this earlier? I'm gonna have to do this, like, today. But I sold my things and we got 16,000 bells and that's the best time. Sahara was visiting, so of course I got some rugs and things. It's definitely necessary um, if I want to make my house nice and pretty on the inside. Um, I'm gonna get all of the rugs that she offers and both the mysterious um, wallpaper and flooring. Right, let's put everything away because again my inventory is just filling up. So I need to put everything I got from Sahara. Um, so I have a few things here and there that I want to like replace in this little neighborhood. I want to start getting the yard sorted and I got this trash can and I thought it would be so perfect next to one of the houses and I want to start getting everything um, a bit more fully decorated instead of doing it like half decorated but it's really hard. I have barely any items that are usable to actually do this so I'm gonna have to do it like a little bit at a time but that's okay. I needed to move this tree because I thought it was in the way but it's looking cute. Um, and I want to move some of these vegetables around um, so they're more visible. I do need to move those two trees as well next to the house. I don't know where I'll put them, but I just need everything to look a lot nicer and it's it's looking messy at the minute. A little bit messy, but that's okay. We've got plenty of time. I've decided for the central area, the uh, like plaza area, I do want like a full on central thing, but I don't think I'm going to do a fountain. I think I'm going to do like a little seasonal kind of thing. Um, I don't know what to put in the middle, but I do want to put, um, what are they called? Benches around the centre. Um, but I don't actually have those DIY recipes, so I'm going to have to hold off for that, but it will look cute. I've been waiting so long to get these balloons and like this just really broke my heart. And then on top of it, I got these miles and it was literally only 500. Like, please. Okay, so I've been wanting to do a little actual like farm build somewhere and I haven't done it yet. So I thought we'd make a little start and I'm gonna do little three by three squares in little rows. I couldn't decide whether it was gonna be like two by three or three by three, but I went with three by three. because I think that's like, it makes it look nicer on the eyes, you know? Having a farm core build will just really fit in with the like autumnal aesthetic and I was going to do it as like a, a wet way you visit to get your pumpkins and stuff but I thought I'll include all the other farm things in the game, the um, produce because I've already got a pumpkin patch so I think it would be better just to have an actual like little farm bit and I'm just adding a little bit of extra things around. I don't have much to finish this thing off, but that's fine. I also decided that my path was not good enough. And I've been mentioning it in other episodes where I want to make it fit in a bit better, uh, make it a bit more natural, 
and I decided to do it today. I had the time and so I'm just adding like more flex and dots in and making it, I don't know, it just feels more natural now that I've done them all this way and you'll see what I mean. You'll see what I mean. Okay, so I've done some of them and I want to show you how they look. Um, you can kind of see the difference between the ones that I've like revamped and the ones that I haven't. Um, the ones that I haven't have these like big splodges, whereas the ones I have have the small little dots and it looks a bit more natural and cohesive. Um, so I'm going to finish that off and do that with all of them, make them flow a bit better and then I'll get back to you. Here is the finished look of the updated path and I just think it looks a lot nicer compared to what it did. I don't think it's perfect yet, I think the middle bits need maybe a little bit improving, you can see where the corners are, um, but I wanted to make sure the corners like blended in with the crust I suppose, but you know, this is the way it looks and I think it looks cute. I also decided to revamp the small little one um, design path thing that I have. I can't remember what they're called. Design code. Um, what are they called? Single square. Is that what you would say? I don't know. But I wanted to do a little single one so it could go in between these. I don't know what to do for the other sides. Um, and I'm kind of tempted to do like a double row. You'll see what I mean later. But I did this single row for now and it went everywhere but where I wanted it to, so I need to get rid of those on here. Um, but I think it looks really cute, I think it looks really natural, I think it fits in. Um, I've done like a top and bottom as well, um, and so it'll, it'll just come, it'll make everything come together. Um, here's my top, here's my little top bit that I did, um, and it's super cute. I don't know, I'm just proud of this, I feel like I went into this challenge and I thought custom paths were going to be so difficult and don't get me wrong they are they take so long but I'm like proud of myself for like being able to do it I don't know I'm very very proud of myself I love how they've turned out and I think it's really going to pull the island the autumnalness together having all these different like little custom paths I love to like sprinkle in design codes in every little build so I think it's going to work well I am changing a lot with the island today, which is really fun. I'm doing a lot of builds and making a lot of progress. And I feel like yesterday's episode, I felt like I didn't get much done at all. So it's really nice to actually make some progress and see the island kind of like coming together with everything. And then Dom was thinking again. And I was like, what the hell? But he bought me something. So, you know, that, that's fine. I'll have a lantern. I'll use it in my build. It's a great time. Um... But yeah, I wanted to change up this path at the entrance. I always wanted it to be like a skinny path. And then I realized it's too wide. I could just do two of these paths, the one wide paths, and it'll look like a little vehicle kind of track kind of thing running through the middle. And I thought that would be a lot cuter than the too wide path. I don't know. Let me know what you think. I think it I think it fits better. And I'm really happy with how it turned out. But yeah. Yesterday it was really nice just to curl up and play some Animal Crossing and enjoy some me time I suppose. Um I was in such a weird mood yesterday. Um so it was nice to like not have to stream because I don't ever want to put on a face and be fake and f fake that I'm in a good mood, you know? So um, it was it was definitely best. I've been doing this new thing of like mindfulness mornings where I'll wake up and I'll try and get out of bed straight away without like going on my phone or anything. And it's been working um, the past couple weeks, which is really nice, where I'll just get up, I'll go set up on the sofa. Cause I like to work on my sofa compared to at my desk. It's, the sofa's next to the window, it's next to the sun, you know, and my desk is not next to a window, so I don't get as much light. But it's really nice to like set up and then get on my laptop instead of my phone and just set up working, watching some like little daily vlogs 
Um, I'll have like a fun drink, usually like a cup of tea or some lemon water or something like that. And my breakfast, read maybe a little bit and then get into some work. And it's been really, it's been making my life a lot more productive. And I feel a, a lot more present in the moment. Life is still going by so fast. Like how is it September? How are we almost at the end of the year? That doesn't make any sense to me, but we're here. And I want to definitely practice more being in the moment and things. And it's it's been really nice to do that, I suppose. Um, yeah. I have also been clearing out a lot of things um, with my apartment. I'm doing like an autumn reset and there'll be a vlog on it um, later on where I'm fully deep cleaning, cl decluttering my wardrobe, decluttering my studio apartment basically because I've got so much stuff in such a small space and the other day I donated like three bags of clothes that don't even fit anymore or like things that I just didn't wear um, and that felt really good to just get them out of the space and uh, you know have room <laughs> for all of my clothes that I do wear because I have so many clothes it's it's ridiculous and over half of them are like secondhand but um, I love charity shopping it's always a great time I got so much done on this day and I made a little circle like little path of this like design and I love it so after that I decided to time travel because we got a lot done and I needed to get more done still and I accidentally time traveled to my birthday so we're playing my birthday today which was a big oopsie but I've never played my birthday in Animal Crossing even though it's still in like a month's time but I thought we'd give it a go we'll see what it's like because I've never done this before and I thought it was really exciting and Agnes came and picked us up and took us to our house. Agnes was the one who decided to do my little surprise party and I thought that was so cute. And uh, Norma and Sherb are here and oh my god, how adorable. Like, I can't believe I've never played Animal Crossing on my birthday before. I wasn't meant to play this day. I suppose it was a happy accident and that's okay. So I blew my candles out. It was a great time and then we celebrated and I got to do my piñata. I don't know. I feel like I'll definitely play my birthday on my birthday um, when we go back in time at some point. But it's not going to be part of this challenge anyway because this challenge is for September. So it was nice to go ahead and uh, do that even if it was by accident. Um, but yeah. Let's, let's hit this piñata and get all my cupcakes out of it. It's really funny how like all of the treats that come out of the piñata you're expected to really like share them with everyone else. But I guess that's a uh, part of gift giving. It's all about sharing, isn't it? So I was beating this piñata, beating it so much and we got our cupcakes. They were all dancing and I felt really bad for leaving but I wanted to like just get on with the builds and things and get on with giving people their cupcakes but this is so cute I love that it actually includes like a little birthday celebration for you I don't know adorable and of course we got a little birthday cake from our mum and all my wheat fields arrived so we've got to decorate with those today as well which is the best time um Picasso's just crawled up into my lap and she's just sitting in my lap because it's nice and sunny where I'm sitting she's just basking in the sunlight sitting in my lap it's so cute we ordered some more wheat fields as you can see and got some nook miles which is a great time um and I went round to give everyone their cupcake because what I've watched from other people playing is when you give the cupcakes you get presents from your villagers and I'm not friends enough with a bunch of villagers to be able to give them cupcakes but I'm friends enough with like three, <laughs> three or four and so I was going around giving these cupcakes out and I give one a peanut even though I wanted to leave she's such a she's such a little cutie you know uh, and she said this looks le super nom nom so I mean how can we not be besties she is a little cutie. Uh, it's it's sad that she has to leave, but she's just not autumnal. And of course, we go see Norma and give her a little cupcake. And then off to Sherb as well, getting all these gifts. I really hope that they're going to be something useful. 
Um, but usually when a villager gifts me something, it's not useful at all. So we'll have to see. We'll see where it goes. Shub, that's nasty. Why are you licking the cupcakes? That is so nasty. Please, get it together. There's, I don't want cupcakes that have been licked. And then I went into Dom's place and I completely forgot he was leaving and I felt so bad because I went in with these cupcakes. I couldn't give him one, but it was a situation, you know? He was in his boxes, he was leaving, no cupcakes for Dom. Um, I did decide I wanted to water all my flowers to get them to spread because we just need more flowers for that like flowery area so I did that and I started putting my items outside because they're my storage is just so full. I did want to redo this area and so you can see me picking some things up, doing all the good stuff, changing the, the dirt colour because I decided that's not the, the colour that I wanted and I wanted to make this area a bit more put together. I had more items now to do it and the path was nice and finished. It looks so good now. I'm really proud of how it turned out. And so I'm rejigging everything just to make it look a bit nicer. And yeah, I'll just let you watch some of the speed build and it'll be a good time. I had some of the fossils and I was like, oh my God, I can just like put them down like this. This is so cute. So cute. And I decided we needed some bones. I feel like having bones as a custom design near Blather's tent is just an absolute must and so I'm, I'm doing that and it's gonna look so cute look like it's perfect it fits in so well especially with those fossils down and then we have these two rocks here right next to the tent and that was the way they were when we first started this island and I thought well they're like absolutely perfect for a little like archaeological dig site thing and so I put up the fences and some custom designs and got it all ready. And I'm loving using these bug cages as decoration. They just look so good. But yes, I'm, I'm very happy with how this came out. And I need to add a lot more to it once we get more fossils and more items, but that's okay. And then we move into this build. Now, we have done so much today already, but I was watching a YouTube video from, I think it's QB Crossing, Kyubi Crossing, maybe? Um, and she toured an island that did diagonal flower fields. And I was like, I have to do this. I have to make a diagonal flower field. It's just so perfect and it'll fit in so well with what, or, what we already have. And I did do it with Cosmos at first, but I, I did swap them out because I thought it would be better just to like mix them in. Um, and I realized the top little bit, um, the top little custom design actually fit on there quite nicely. And I hid the bottom ones with like a bush and things. And like, look how cute this looks. I'm so happy with how this has turned out. I just, we've done so much today and I feel like the island is just really coming together. Hello there, everyone. Right now on Applesauce, it's October 21st. Oh yeah, I accidentally time traveled to um, my birthday yesterday, which is a little bit embarrassing. I had to play my birthday. Kick is in the plaza, it is Saturday, and that's it. Gulliver was there yesterday as well, but I just couldn't be bothered with Gulliver. I haven't done him yet. Right, we have wheat fields. I'll have to show you guys. Okay, so today, someone moved out. Dom is gone. So we're going on a little hunt. And like, Dom is really cute. But I wasn't in love with Dom, you know? Okay, let me drop all these. Oh, I got like a few things from like birthday yesterday. It's not actually my birthday. I accidentally traveled to my birthday. We have two tickets and then we have maybe 10,000 in Nook Miles. Let's have a look. Yeah, we've got 10,000 in Nook Miles, which is a brilliant time. So I suppose we'll get hunting. We are looking for anyone autumnal, really. Anyone autumnal will do me. Okay, let's go. Why does everything have to cost money? This is true. Can I not just pay in look miles? Like, that would be better. Time for takeoff. Should get everything for free. We are good people. Everyone here should get everything for free. We're just so good. Okay, who have we got? I want someone cute. Okay. Okay. I was literally watching someone villager hunt earlier. Was it Haley? Did Haley get this? villager earlier peggy peggy's a cutie i don't think i'd ever have her on my island the hair unsettles me but she's a cutie time for takeoff let's go let's see who is on this island 
Oh my god, it's a frog. It's a frog. Camel frog. Hello, camel frog. Hello. I love all of the frogs, but alas, camel frog, you are not coming onto the island. But you are a cutie. I love you. Let's go. Okay. Who is here? Who are you? I don't like any of the ballers. That is something about me. Gonzo. Gonzo. Hmm. Oh, his little stars in his eyes were cute there. Okay, I don't like Gonzo. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, we've got three wasps. That's a great time. Let's keep going, I suppose. Okay, let's see. Who is on this island? I'm gonna have to get my stick out. Hello? It is a rat. Who are you? <gasps> it's Petri! Petri's like the only mouse that I actually like. Petri's like the only mouse I like. A little cutie. Oh my goodness. Do, do, do. Constant comment tea is your favorite. It's very autumnal. I've never heard of that. I've never heard of- <gasps> Guys! Guys, 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 guys! We got maple. <laughs> now we have three bear cubs. Oh my goodness. I eat grab her and run. That's exactly what we're doing right now. Is this gonna be a bear cub island? Oh my goodness, my heart. You're gonna move. Little cutie. Welcome to our island, applesauce. You'll fit in so well. Look at her. Look at her little cheeks. Her little baby. Oh my goodness. Look at her little sweater. She's perfect. No one could be more perfect. We got Mipple. Yeah. I've never been so happy in my life. What the hell? We got three little bear cubs. We have Cherry. We have Olive and we have Maple now. That's gonna be so cute. I guess what we need to do is just carry on decorating. I might time travel to have Maple move in. Not yet, but today. Right, we have five wasps. And we have a spare ticket, like what? There we go. A bath mat, nice. Hi, let me sell some stuff. No, I even have like a billion coconuts. So many coconuts. We got so many items that I already have. How do I get like so many duplicates? I don't understand. Let me sell these. Wow. Do I want any of this stuff? No. I do want a candy though. I do want a little candy. What do I need? I need more Nook Miles because I need two more of these bad boys. I love that Olive loves the stuff that I make. It's a great time. I don't need another spinning wheel. I will take a wheat field though. Water pump. Handle. Let me grab all these. Mine, I tell ya. Do ants sell for money? Maybe. You can give us some money for that later on. I don't like ants. Ugh, look at it. In the glass. Crawling around. That's actually disgusting and upsetting. <laughs> Let me get these. Yummy in my tummy. I'm so rich now. Um, Cherry just um, working out up there. You, you okay? Wheat fields. All right. Let me take this because I want to plant more. I'm going to have to turn that off. It's the most annoying sound ever. Oh, I couldn't hear it last night when I was doing it because I had the volume down while I was watching, watching videos on the YouTubes. I plant that. I'll take these so I can plant them as well. Let me plant this and another one. And what if I put a wheat field here? What would you do then? Nothing, because you can't do anything. It's my island. Right, I actually do have a dilemma. Do you guys think I should keep the single path here? Or should I get rid of this line of dirt and do a double path and put another line of dirt here? I don't know. Single path in your opinion? Okay. Okay, I trust you guys. This is looking chow! Can I put a custom design underneath? That wasn't where I wanted it to go. I think it looks so pretty and it's so perfect for these builds. Excuse me. Thank you. Doink. Right. Do I have anything else for this corner? Hand cart? Well, diddly darn it, that is pretty perfect if you ask me. Wow. Let me get this fossil. Wow. I also, I need to chop trees because I don't want to time travel and not do this because it's the five times one. Chop wood, 10. I wonder what I can make. Did I open my bottles? Maybe? Let me get this. A balloon. Wow. Thank you. I kind of love this dig site area. Oh, 5,000 bells. Don't mind if I diddly do. Okay. Yeah, a lot of these, I just don't know where to even like use them, but that's fine. Let me put more blathers fossils here. Drop. There literally is room, love. There's so much room. I'm going to get my wheat fields of the day as well that I need to buy from the next stop. 
wheat field. I can't believe we got a wheat field. It really blows my mind. It blows my mind, it does. I should get some of them changed color by Reese and Cyrus to like the golden ones to match like the autumnal vibe, but I can't be bothered to do that right now. White cosmos. Wooden chair, what does, the, wait, what does the wooden chair, what? I'll take that. Thank you. I have some water, but yes, there's still more that I need slash want. Like this place is nowhere near done. The orchard, I really want a lot more things like signs and I don't know, there's other things that I wanted to do. I suppose we'll time travel because there's not too much more I could really do today. Hello there everyone. Today's announcements. We have a new friend. Maple has moved in and that's all. Okay, brilliant. Maple is such a cutie and I am so happy that we have been blessed with her presence. It's the best time. We have Happy Home Academy. But then we have all of these wee fields are the best time to Nooks. I wanna see, oh, what did Nook Nooks Krani has? Hi, another one of these. Okay, 10,000. So expensive. This is nice. I'll take this. 35,000 bells. Yep, and these cactuses are cute. I might actually get the little VHS thing. I feel like this little tape thing would be cute if we did like, I don't know, something with it. Some sort of movie thing. All right, we need to get more bells now. Because apparently I just love spending all my bells. Wow, look at us go. I have to put everything down here though because, oh, what does this look like? Oh, that's kind of cute. I could definitely use that. We field cuckoo clock. It's gonna be dropped. SA set. Don't need right now. I don't know why I keep a lot of these things. I'm like, yeah, I might use it. I'll not use it. Like a dresser. I won't use that right now, but I will inside. It's a struggle, you know, because what if I go to use it and then it's not there because I sold it and then I'd be very upset with myself. I need to upgrade my house. That is something that needs to happen. Okay, look how cute this house is. This is so perfect. Our little autumn island. So excited. Oh my god, it's a cutie. Hi. Welcome to the island. I wanted to do some villager yards as well, but like it is so hard to do little builds when there's like nothing. You know what I mean? I don't have any items for it, but maybe we'll give it a go. We have wheat fields and we have flowers. And that's got to count something, you know? And then these haven't grown more, but that's okay. I just need more. I decided I don't want to use these because these are not autumnal, like the, the purpley white. It just doesn't really fit, you know? What I might do is take these. I need some apple trees with apples on. Where are those? I need to know. I need to also stop some of these trees from growing. I already let that one grow too big. It was meant to be the one before. Okay, let me get some apples. Do I have coconuts? I do. Let me grab those and I'm gonna plant these behind them. How do you stop it from growing? You plant a fruit tree behind. Plant a fruit tree behind and then it'll, it'll not grow past this point. Let me do that. I might let this grow one more. Will it, is it, will it be smaller than this still? Maybe. If not, I can always like let it grow again. Right, let me plant some things. This is a villager yard that I'm gonna do. I want a wheat field here. This is Norma's yard. Always a great time. I have a lot of wheat fields. Oh, I have a little wooden chair that could be utilized. I should put a little tree here. No, a little one. A big one. That's kind of cute. Let me plant this here. I feel like that works. Move this. Pull that out a little bit, maybe. You know what? I want some socks. I might have socks in the house. I want some... Wait, do I have anything that I could use in that yard? We have plants, a little clothesline. Books always make me happy in builds. I want like some sort of clothing. I feel like this could be used. Maybe some socks on the floor. Oh, those ones aren't very autumnal, are they? Maybe some of these. Maybe one of these. I only have one fences. Hmm. Why are villager yards so difficult? Right. I feel like I need a tree that's stunted to be nearby, but I don't know where. Is this part of her villager yard over here? Where's all my wood? I'm gonna make some of those spikes in the in the ground. I don't know what they're called, but these things. Actually, I could just steal these ones. They're not officially part of that build. Hmm. Is that there? You wouldn't want a chair next to a bin, so I'm gonna leave that not there. Where is this? Wow. Right, you know what I need? I don't know. I don't know what I need either. Do I want to chop either of these trees down? I don't know, like maybe? I need my fence. I feel like my fence will help as well. And I think I've got some fence somewhere. I just don't know where. It's on one of the beaches. Oh, I'll take that. My inventory's full. 
a deer decoration. Let me put some things here. We're gonna decorate this area. Let me display this on ground. Right, let me eat this coconut and take this tree. Other types of bears that are sort of black and white, like a penguin, joking. Just so kooky and random, you know? Let me put this here. I want another tree to be like here, but like stunted, stunted tree. So I'm gonna go buy some saplings. Do I have a room? Not really. Hmm. Doink. I don't know if that tree will be able to be planted, but I hope it will. Do I have the concave one? I haven't changed this, but I feel like it fits nice anyway. Yeah, like that fits in fine. Oh, that won't work like that, will it? That's fine. That's fine, I suppose. And then here. I'm so happy with the new path. I just feel like it fits so much better. Let me grab all of these middle bits. I'm gonna do one like this, and then do the rest like these. I think the middle bits aren't perfect yet because I can still see the squares, but it's definitely getting there. It's definitely getting there, I think. I put this there and that there, and then I'm gonna put some wheat fields about because, like, that just feels right, I suppose. Let me do the fencing first, actually, and then we'll do the chair, would be nice here, actually. Where's the chair? I do want a tree there, so we'll keep that there. Let me do a book here. Where's the book? Here. And then maybe some shoes off to the side, like that. I don't know, maybe. Wheat field. Can I put a wheat field in that awkward area over there? Will it not let me? I don't think so. Let me try again, hold on. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. It won't let me. That's actually really mean of it, to be honest. Place item. You're in the wrong place. Can I not move it that way? Why not? Wait, why? Hmm. I feel like I need a little log stump. Let me go make a log stump. I don't know what we need for log stump, but I'm gonna use probably wood or hardwood. And we have that. Wood, hardwood. Log stump, please. Log stump. Where is it? Here. Oh, it's a stool. That works. Amazing. Thank you. Right, let's run down. Actually, I might. Let me drop that wood. Let me drop these. And then I want to go get some saplings from Nook's Cranny and make some stunted trees. I could just take that one, but that one's a money tree. I don't really want to do that. Excuse me. Where's the saplings? I'm gonna grab five of each, I suppose. How much was that? Was that like 3,000? Oh my god, we're so broke. I need to make bells. Did I order the wheat fields today? I don't know if I did. I'm unsure. Okay. Yeah, I'm so broke. I need that money tree to grow in and be a money tree. Right. Let's go back down here. Nom 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 nom. I'm gonna put a little circle here. And I'm gonna do my leaves here. Wow. Right, I wanted my stump here that I did. Where is it? Here. And then, that looks so much cuter. Do I have any weeds in my inventory? I do. Plant. And then here, we're gonna do one of these bad boys. That was not where I wanted to. Thank you very much. I wanted you in here. What did I get? Ooh, a big one. We have planted 10 trees. That's a good time. And then, I just need some more flowers. But I think this is looking pretty good. I do want to change this apple tree to a stunted tree, I think. I think so. I might swap round that normal tree over there for this apple tree. Oh, I'm gonna need a fruit to eat, I've just realised. There we go. Can't remember if I ordered those wheat fields. So I might go around and sell some stuff. Wait, do I have enough inventory space? Not really. Let me put my shoes down here. Sink of piano. Very annoying. Let me drop some things and sell some things. What do I need to drop? All these wheat fields? Maybe not. Maybe I'll just drop this candy here. This Nook Miles ticket. And let's grab some things to sell. I'm just gonna go around and get all of the seashells and things. I feel like that's probably a good idea. I also wanted to move that stone thing over to Blather's area. This thing here. So I'm gonna take that. So I'm not using it as decor there. Let me grab all these. And then we'll be rich. Crunchy noises. Let's go all the way over here. I can hear a balloon. I don't know where. I heard a balloon, but it's gone. There it is. I hear it. Oh, I'm way too far away. Hold on. Come on, balloon. Am I in front of it? Quite possibly. Nope. Where did you get me? 10,000 bells? Okay. I will take that. Thank you very much. These will sell for a good time. Let me grab this. Look at all those ants. Oh, sell these. I have not that much really. Ooh, look at us go. Getting some easy nook miles. I'll take one of those um pictures and I'll get S fossils assessed and then that'll boost our nook miles as well. Always got the nook miles on the mind, I suppose. Right, let's go get these fossils assessed as well. I know I have one over here. Excuse me. 
Let me take that, and then I have a bunch over this way. Oh yeah, we've got loads. Okay, we've got five to assess. I love using those like bell crickets as decor, but like very annoying. No, 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 I didn't want to donate. Okay, wait. See ya. 6,000 miles. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I had a feeling there was one of those ones. 500 miles. Amazing. What do we have? A torso. The same torso. Amber. Another one of those. And a tail. It's that rock in it. Yeah. I'm using one of those rocks. Let me put one over here. I feel like it would fit in. Hello. Take all of these fossils off me. How much are you selling me those for? 14,000. Thank you. 200 bonus miles. I'm just so good. So we obviously haven't ordered um, the wheat fields. This area is getting there. I want to do these village yards as well, but we just don't really have much to decorate with. I did have a stone that I wanted to put in Blather's area. So let's go do that. My cat is screaming. Can that go in there? Wow. I can tend flowers. I could definitely do that. Wow. The grown flowers are so pretty. Don't they look so cute? The white and yellow together, I think it just really pulls everything together. I do want some of these to grow. I'm gonna continue watering so they'll spread. I want these ones to spread. One of them did. Wow. I need to do some DIYs. Plant trees or shrubs. Right, I'm gonna plant one of these. There we go. Amazing. What do I want to DIY? What can I DIY? Let's see. I don't know what... Mm, clothesline? I need some tree branches for that. Could definitely use that. And maybe I just want to do like more log stakes. What did I need for log stakes? It was one of these woods. Was it hardwood? I don't have enough hardwood for this. Do I have hardwood in here? Let's have a little look-see. No, I don't. Um, okay. I think we will time travel. Hello there, everyone. Right now on Applesauce, it's October the 23rd. Gulliver is here. Maybe we'll do that for the Nook Miles. What did I do? Active Island Resident? I played 50 days in 14 in real life days. That is wild. Right, what have we got to do today? Sell fruit, get fossils assessed, redeem Nook Miles, plant flower seeds, hit rocks. Do I have flowers in my inventory? This is a question. I do. What do I have? Windflowers. Tulips. I have tulips. <gasps> should we try? Should we try making some? What are those? Wait. What are you? White tulips. Pockets are full. Since when? I'm gonna plant all these flowers. How do you make different flower colors? Is there a specific way that I should be doing it? Let me have a look. Plant one. And then you miss one. And you plant one. And you miss one. And then you plant one. And then, wow, look at us go. Oh my god. Already done one of these. Didn't even mean to. Then next to it, next to these flowers, you do red like this. And then that should make orange. I don't know how that works, but apparently it does. And that's fine. Right, let me put this back in the ground there. Right, we do have more flowers, so I'm gonna plant them around. White mums. Can I plant one here? Is that a no? Why would it go there? Fine. Let me plant some flowers over here. White mum. And let's get some of these over here. Place this down on the ground. And another weed field. This works. Oh, we have one of these clothesline thingies. What if I put that like here? Let me put like a leaf on the floor. This one. Wow, so autumnal clothesline wait a sec my trees fully grew did it have to not be a coconut is that what i messed up that's so sad i can hear a balloon wait a sec wow i might fill up this area with trees i need a plant not there please i need to plant one here oh my god please it was so rude i'm gonna sell is this enough Sold. Bye. Oh, I did not mean to put you there. I needed a wheat field. Oh my god, look how cool this is looking. Spooky tree. Can I put you in the corner? No. That's so mean. Is this going to be too many pumpkins? No, that looks kind of cool, to be honest. I like that one. I like you. Gulliver, we're, we're going to find your little communicator part thingies. Because I need Nook Miles. I did find them. They're right here, Gulliver. Um, I know this isn't efficient. No! <laughs> Why did I have... Why did I have 
and my rock my rock how low is about we're, we're doing day was it day 16 yes hello to everyone right now on apple sauce it's october the 26th pick is here okay and that's it beautiful so i'll show you what i've done i took the pagolas and got them customized i thought these are very autumnal i like these it fits so much better and then i changed some of the wheat fields see we've got like golden ones now mixed in so that works i, I turned around that pumpkin just to not have the face and i thought that worked quite well we did this on stream i think yesterday um and most of this on stream as well just a little bit of decorating you know and then i'll show you where else i changed as well let's see oh i did this yesterday so I just want to like get the plaza kind of like going I suppose. These trees are gonna grow at some point. I don't know how big I want them. Maybe we'll keep them that size. Maybe I'll stunt them there. Cause they look kind of cute like that. I think I have an apple nursery. It's a nursery tree. That's kind of cute. Yeah I think so. And then up here. Up here we got... I put some fence around, changed out some of this and we have a silo now. And then what I also did is turn around this thing so the faces aren't there so it just looks like normal pumpkins and i thought that was really clever i was watching like um island tours um last night of like autumnal islands and they've done that and i was like that's genius like can't believe i never thought of it before right i'm gonna plant this what we're gonna focus on today is just decorating what we can and what i want to do is get lots of different level of levels of trees <gasps> there's a balloon um so we have like lots of variation in that oh that moved so quick and then lots of bushes and things as well where are you going excuse me i'll just wait here for you then don't mind me Ayo. okay present what did we get director's chair oh those look i i want to do a little build with like some of those on the beach actually oh hi it is me okay amazing we have another reaction as well i need to get another apple for this area let me just get one. Never mind. I need to upgrade my storage. This is too much. Drop item. Oh, yes. We've got these. I need to water them so they actually spread. Yes. So I want to do these village yards. Get these done. And we already have the start of this one, really, you know? I just want to put some more flowers around. I think that would look really cute. So this tree isn't growing. Do I have a little thing behind that? No, I need to do that. Do I want... I might get let that grow like one more actually. Might be too close to the building. I think so. Even though it's not that close. Little dingus. Can I do one here? Look at maple. Look at that cutie. Will that grow? I think it might. Maybe. We'll have to see. A thousand miles. Amazing. Amazing if you ask me. White mum. Yellow tulip. See the key to decorating? It's just gonna be flowers and natural things everywhere that's gonna be the key because we're not gonna be able to get loads of items and that's okay because we can manage we can manage i think a bush here would be nice do i have any in my inventory no that's a tree sapling damn okay that's fine let me see we've got these stunted trees here which makes me happy this one needs to grow a little bit more but it's looking very cute i love the way this little area turned out and I think I've stunted these ones all over here, so that's all good. Let me put more flowers. And I swear I have bushes somewhere. I don't know. I have lots of wheat fields, though. That is something else that I can put around. Look at this little mini tree. Little cutie. I want mini trees everywhere. That is one thing that's going to be amazing. It's going to be mini trees everywhere. Very sadly... Are you joking? It spawned here, guys. My rock spawned over here. That's insulting. That's rude. I'm gonna break all of my rocks. Of course it was my money rock. Wow. That's a hate crime. <laughs> Just gotta trust, you know? Right, I think it's time to put some more wheat fields over this way and whatever else I have, I suppose. I don't know how many I got changed. That's okay, in it. I just buried my wheat field. And that goes there. I think that's okay. Look at how cute this is turning out though. I'm obsessed. Yellow mum bags, and then another... I obviously didn't change enough wheat fields to die. Oh, wow! Oh my god, this island's gonna be so cute. I'm so excited. I'm gonna use things like uh, apples and things to uh, decorate as well. Because, like, how cute is that? The cutest, right? Let me... Have I got another wheat field? I do. 
course I do. I've got so many. So the things that I ordered from the Nook Star, I think it's all wheat fields. But because I've catalogued the golden wheat fields, I can order them now, which helps a lot. And what else do I have here? Mini cactus, life ring, always wanted one of those. These ants are upsetting, but that's okay, I suppose. Look how good these wheat fields make it look. It's just, oh, it's so good. I have like this parasol that I kind of want to put here. Oh my god, someone dropped their parasol. What? Like, how cute is that as decor? The cutest. You can't tell me otherwise. And let me put another golden one. I feel like I've finally cracked the code. I now understand how to do it. And then, did I put a hand cart by... Actually, I might put it here in this little um, area. Oh my god, look how cute. Absolutely perfect. And then I need to water these because these need to propagate. Is that the right word? I want all the cool colours. Wait, look at this little bow in her hair. That's so cute. I haven't decided what I want to do with this, but something, I suppose. Let me put another wheat field down. Wow. What is this? Oh, another wheat field? Don't mind if I diddly do. And like something in the center, but I don't know what. Look how cute this looks turned around without the face on. That's so cute. What do we think about spooky arch in the middle? I'm unsure. Okay, I need flowers here. Yellow mum. And this one. Wow, pretty. And then, do I have apples to eat? I have one. I want to make more stunted stuff. Nursery hardwood. But I want to get rid of this one first. Doink. I want to do a stunted tree here. Right, I'm going to move these trees to here. And then stunt them. Medium young hardwood. There we go. And then we put an apple there. Let's see. Plant one. And then... Oh, I've already planted one there, but that's fine. I can just swap them around. And then... Plant. How much do I have in my inventory? Not too much. Let's go to an, um... Nook Miles Island. No, Nook Miles Island. A Captain Island. Let me drop a few things before we go. What is this? I don't know how I got that. Okay. A thousand miles. Let's hope this is worth it. I do want some bushes and stuff. Some new flowers, maybe. Let me grab this. Thank you. Oh, did I get miles for that? Did I get miles for that? I did. Not much, but good enough, I suppose. Right, lots of bushes. Also, I don't want to get any gyroids because gyroids, they were so annoying on my last island. And I know, like, they're really cute, but, like, I had a billion. A billion gyroids. It was ridiculous. They were washing up on my beaches. They were showing up where fossils should have been. I couldn't deal with it. It was too much. It was like those eggs around Easter. It was haunting me, you know? I'm surprised there was no gyroids on trees. Do you get a fossil on this island? Or is it all gyroids? Because there's another X at the back. That one's a gyroid, actually. You can tell because the smoke blooms out of it. So this one must be a fossil. It lied. Not happening. It lied to me. That was very upsetting. I got Nook Miles for it. You've been bamboozled. I have, indeed. Nice. Thank you. Let me grab these. And then these. We're gonna get so many nice things. I'm just gonna grab all the things that like I feel like I can decorate with. All right, and I want those bushes. How much room do I have? I have enough room. I have enough room. Okay, let's go. Right, let me plant bushes. Bushes be good. I have a custom path here, but I really feel like a bush would be like the best there. So look at that. When they're out of season, it'll look even better. Right, I need to do this. So I'm gonna eat one of these and steal this tree. This here, miss one, this here, this here, and then here. Wow. And then, Nook's Cranny, what have we got? Sorry, I'm shaking the desk. No way, we've gotten wheat fields again in Nook's Cranny. What? Blessed run. Wow, we're silly. We should probably do that Hit Rocks one as well. Bye. I actually, I was time traveling the other day and I was editing my video and there was a campsite villager and then... I didn't go see the campsite villager before time traveling and I was very upset. I feel like I do that too often. Okay, I think this is looking pretty neat. It's looking pretty neat. I need some more items to make it look even cuter. Do I want another seat here or do I want to put it... Actually, I want to put it at the farm, I think. I want to put it at the farm, I think. Meow. I also need to decide what builds I want to do. What other builds? Where could I put the seat? Like here? That's really cute. I like it. Let me grab this. That's not what I asked to do. Amazing. Wow. I wonder if I should do this as like a flower field of breeding flowers or not. I'm unsure. 
Maybe I'll leave it to build that area last. Do I want my house here as part of the trick or treat neighborhood? Big question, you know? Then I need to sort out this area. Maybe we do Nook's Cranny build. Maybe that's like the next thing that we do. I need to get rid of a bunch of trees first. One and one more. Let me take you. And I feel like this will be perfect for doing lots of stunted trees. Let me open my island designer. No, I want it like here. What if I blocked off drop off box so I can never sell there again? And then I'll never be upset that I sold there by accident. I feel like that's a big brain move. And then this one. Wow. I feel like I'm getting better at like getting quicker at custom design paths again. When you restart the island and you don't have it like at first you, you're not used to it you know oops i kind of want to go that way as well and then what i could do is literally put like a bunch of these around wow no i messed up <laughs> i messed up okay it's fine wow and then two of these so efficient and then one here and i'll do this funky one there as well wow and then we need a little path that snakes around too Able sisters. And I need to get rid of this rock. You pee off. You better go where I want you to. I want to put a stunted tree here. I only have one more sapling. I can buy more. I can buy more. Oh, can I not put anything there? Okay. I'm going to put this there. And then I'm going to put my big leaves on the floor. Yes. And then another stunted tree can go here. Oh, that's not stunted. These are all big. Right, I need to buy some. Hold on. Hold up, loves. Hold your horses. The lemon umbrella is really cute. I'm gonna have to buy that. I want five of these, and then I want five of these. That's it, bye! I put you there. Yes. And then, flower here. I kind of want to do the dirt path there. That is beautiful. And a yellow mum. Wow. Then, I have no more flowers. Why do I have no more flowers? I also have no more fence. Maybe I do that. What do I need for fence? Is it hardwood? Let me see. Oh, I also got the simple well. Um, that could go in the middle, actually. That's a good idea. Um, okay. Where's my fence? Here it is. Hot potato. Exactly. Hardwood. Do I not have an axe? I have a big boy axe. Let me go get an axe. All I do is make funny noises when I play Animal Crossing. Okay, let me buy this. And we're gonna get some hardwood. I gotta chop all my trees. Okay, yeah, I may as well I may as well grab all of them. This tree is half grown, but I'm guessing that's my money tree. Going, whoa, look at all that hardwood. Oh my goodness. Right, let me go make uh, this fence. Oh, I have some of this here. Let me pick up all these and then I can drop them again. I'll make craft. We can do quite a few of these. This is my fence for the island, so. Wow. Can't put a fence there. It's actually really sad. Right, let me put a little dirt on the floor. Place item. Yes, this is coming together. I don't want this tree here. I want a stunted tree here. And then, what if I did a picnic here? I think that would be the cutest thing in the world. I think so. Display on ground. Like that. And then maybe I move this umbrella over to the picnic area. Place item. Oh, don't do that, please. And then, I just need to do picnic stuff with that, I suppose. Let me put this here, and then this. A balloon! Oh my goodness, that's a sad time. What did you give me? Pendulum clock. That's not helpful for this build, I'm not gonna lie. It's not helpful at all. I'm gonna put one of these here. Wow. There's some items I really do want, like um, the mushroom items. I'd love to get some of those, but I'm not sure when you get the mushrooms. Is that at the beginning of the year, or is that in October, November? I can't remember. Because I feel like I had mushrooms on the last island, but I'm unsure. Let me grab these. Let me get these middle bits. Sink. Oh my god, it's already looking so good. Let me do that one. I'm going to change that big tree there to a stunted one, I think. Let me grab these and put it down. It's going to look cute. And that is uh, the path. The path. Let me grab these. We can move some trees around. The, the tall ones are okay at the back, but I do want to make sure... I'm not gonna have enough room in my inventory to pick up this tree. Let's plant some bushes around then. I could put one here. Doink. Wow. And then maybe one here. There we are. And now I have room. Amazing. But I do want a tree here. It's a nice spot for a tree. Wow. This is looking quite nice, I would say. I do need some flowers. We could time travel 
cool. Let me put some country fencing around. Let's see. I'm gonna put this here. Fencing. Doink. This is, I'm really happy with how this is turning out. Let me put one of these here and then maybe one here. I don't know what I'm gonna do in this side. I have no idea, but I'm sure ideas will come to me at some point. I have my leaves as well. Can't forget about. I also have my autumnal leaves as well. They're super cute. Hello there everyone. Flick is here. Right, we have lots of trees that are growing. Let me put all these here. Wait, there were some trees that I wanted to not grow. I didn't stunt these trees. I've done that like five times now. God's sake. Oh my god. That's actually really upsetting. I will stunt this one. Oh, I stunted them. That's so silly. Plant one. We planted a fruit tree and we get some miles and that makes me happy. I'll do it right this time. Let me grab this one. I want to put this in there and I need to stunt those ones once they get almost grown. I got all three. <gasps> a thousand miles. That makes me so happy. Okay. And then are there any trees that I need to stunt over here? This one needs to stop growing right now. Actually, I need some fruit to do that. Am I going to take this? Yes. It was decor for all of one Animal Crossing day. And then I think I want that one to grow one more. So that's fine. Um, let me check. Did I put any anywhere else that I needed to stop growing? Maybe. Oh, please. Just let me get the fossil. Thank you. Okay. Wow. Wow. Do we have any trees that I wanted to not grow? No. Oh, this one. But I wanted to grow to like, it has the two little bubbles. Oh, my little baby trees. Look at them. They're so cute. We have money. That is what I want to see. Noma, I'm really sorry, but like, there's not much room in there for the both of us. This is looking cute. Let's go continue up at the top. I did actually need to drop some stuff so I could pick up. Maybe I'll sell all these trees. I have so many trees in my inventory. Let me sell those. Just watch this build transform once I put these wheat fields out. Already a billion times better. Wow. Nice one here. I need some of those green ones, methinks. I also need more flowers. Norma. Big pumpkin table. A globe. I'll grab a globe. I am interested in globe. Thank you. And I also would love to buy some flowers. If you have any good ones. Another lacy parasol? That would be the third one. Oh my goodness. Yellow cosmos. Let me grab a few of those. I would also really like some orange cosmos, actually, you know? I don't know if I can be bothered to like, breed them. White mums. Thank you. So many, please. Amazing. And then let me get some white cosmos. And we'll get some yellow mums as well. Cool beanzos. So many flowers in here. Where do I begin? Oh, you can't just put the nice dirt down, can you? You need to go into this. I feel like I should be able to just put the dirt down. You know what would be so cool? If on your island you had, um, you know how you get different, you, you get starter fruit and you get starter flower. Why don't we have starter crops? I want starter crops. I don't know. I feel like that should have been added and it just hasn't been. You can get crops from the Captain Islands. I have tomatoes, pumpkins, wheat. You can get like sugar cane and stuff, can't you? Or something like that. Why don't we have that? This is gonna look so cute. And you can't tell me otherwise. It's just not possible. Here we are. Wow. Oh, I can't plant there. That seems a bit rude. Can I put a custom design on top of this? I'm pretty sure I can, right? See, it's like I actually planted, but I didn't. A pumpkin would look so nice there. Oh, Norma. Thank you. I can't even put an item there. Are you joking right now? That's really upsetting. Balloon. Oh, is that going over the orchard? You got to be kidding me right now. Okay. It's fine. Oh, what did I get in my balloon? Oh, a diner uniform. It's not autumnal, but like, it's kind of cute. Let me do stuff like this. One there. Wow. Okay. Do I want to put any more along this side? Maybe like one there. And then like... One there. Right, I do want to go into Abel's because I'm wanting to get some cute things. Like dresses and things to use as decoration. Because like, why wouldn't I? Hi! Wait, these are kind of cute. These are kind of cute. I might get the, that one. And also this shirt dress could be used. And these socks to just throw on the ground. And then these shoes to just throw on the ground. Actually, the loafers. Yes. Okay. Let's go home and see what I have in the storage. I've had lots of things sent to the storage. 
and I haven't looked at it in a hot sec. So, this can go in front of Nook's cranny. That would be so cute. That would be so cute. Are you kidding me right now? What else? This for the picnic. Maybe a little sewing box for next to Mabel's. Able label Mabel's. And then, we have a bunch of clothes that we could definitely use as decor. These socks. These shoes. <gasps> My pockets are full. Let's not slay. Where is it? There it is. Let me put it there, but I like want it next to the river, I think. No, I want it in the middle. What do we have? Sturdy sewing box? That can be like the picnic basket. Place. Some socks, but I kind of want them like off a little bit. Like this side. Nope. Ugh, cute. And the menu chalkboard can go here. Wow. That's so cute. Oh my god, I'm so excited about this. Wow. You know what? I might actually stunt this tree there like that. I think it's kind of cute. And then I could put like a, a taller one next to it. Give me those apples. Thanks. Wow. But I can't bury because I don't have my shovel. Hold on. Thanks. And then I could put a taller one right here next to it. Yep, I deedly do. I want to get my wheat fields. And then I might time travel again. 300 more miles. Look shopping. These. And let's go all the way down to the bottom. So fast. Where's my wheat field? Here it is. And I might order some of the other colour as well. Just to sprinkle in a little bit. And we've got our five per day. And then what is in... Nope, excuse me. What's in the drop off box? Right, where's my bugs? Right, here's all my bugs. I don't think I have enough room in my inventory. Wow. Rude. What do I need to get rid of? What can I drop? I can drop that. What is this reaction? Disagreement. Okay. I've got books to sell you, Flick. These bad boys. And now we're gonna be rich. That's gonna be the best time. 18,870 bells. Amazing, if you ask me. Now we're rich. Hello there, everyone. Right now on Applesauce, it's October 28th. Wow. You're looking splendipitous, Isabel, with that witch's hat. Right, let me water all these bad boys. Wow. Did that get all of them? Did I only get two? That's annoying. Is there any I need to... Alright, let me put one here as well. I need more apples. Okay, I need to put one next to this tree. Wait, I'll do it on the other side. Wow. Beautiful. Not the low battery. You pee off. We haven't seen that in a while. Look at this baby tree. Put a little apple here. Actually, no, I want that to grow, like, one more. Just one more, though. Maybe one more for you as well. Yeah, all these need... I'll stunt this one. I'll... I like that one there. Let me... Nursery apple. This is gonna be so cute, with all the little stunted trees everywhere. It takes so long to do, but, like, it's so worth it. There we go. I think we've got a lot of space now. A lot of space now for all of these. I have so many. Let's hope it's something good. Something goob. Hello, blathers. If it's not anything we can use, hopefully it's something to sell. Hello, how you doing? I want you to assess my fossils. Thank you very much. Oh my god, there's so many. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have been hoarding my fossils. Go beans. Bye. See you later. Thank you very much, blathers. That was a lot of items to assess, and you did it so quickly. Very impressive, if you ask me. We don't need that. That's a tail. That's a skull. <gasps> Wait. Oh, nice. Hold on. Oh, look how cool that is. Okay. Chest, a tail, a skull. What are you? Another one of these cool plaques. What do you look like? Cool as hell. Where can I put it, though? On this side, here. Is this one the cool one? That's the cool one. I might save that for behind the museum, but I'm unsure. I'll put it there anyway. What's it called? Megalo. So we want to get the other side of the Megalo. Look how cool that would look. We want the other side of the Megalo. So, I don't have it, do I? Megalo. No. That's okay, I suppose. Let me go sell all these, see how much they're worth. Look at their little hat! Oh my god! Wait, that's so cute! I can't! I've never seen them in their little hats before. What cuties, oh my god. Let me sell that as well. 
What have we got? 30,000. Don't mind if I diddly do. I feel like we've done so much today, which makes me happy. Tumnuck is also wearing horns. <gasps> I didn't notice. I didn't notice at all. We're gonna have to have a look at that. Thank you, bye. Bye, 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 bye. <gasps> he is. Look at his horns. Amazing. The true nook at last. He's revealed himself. Hello there, everyone. Right now on Applesauce, it's October 29. And it's the start of a new week. Amazing. Right, we ordered some weed fields. I have some trees that are growing. Do I need to stunt some? I do need to stunt this one. I think so. Let me put apple here. Right. That one's not stunted. Let me take these apples for when I need to stunt other trees. Look at them all, all in a little row. Is there any things that I needed to stunt? Did I stunt this one? Yeah, it looks like there's one behind. Let's have a look over here. I wanna stunt this one. Do, 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 do. I need some more fruit. I'm gonna stunt this one as well. That's not the area where we need it. Beautiful. And I have more wheat fields to plump. Plump? Plop around. <laughs> Plumping some wheat fields. That little mini tree is the cutest little thing in the world. What about one there? Can you go there? You can. It's kind of cute. I can hear a balloon. Oh, not anymore. Is it over this way? Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. I was like, what? What did we get? Is it something useful? Fortune telling set. We've already got two of those. This is looking so good. I'm actually so obsessed right now. Can I put one of these? Place item. Actually, I want it slightly off to the side. We field. This is looking super cute. I'm so happy with how it's looking. Look how small it is. Oh my god, it is so tiny and baby. I think I'd want to swap it though with this one. I think that would make sense. Plant this here. That makes sense in my brainios. Then I need another apple. Where are all my apples? There's one over here. You know what I did start today? I started the fourth wing audiobook. So far, I am loving it. And I have a feeling I'm not going to be able to put it down. Doink. I feel like that's just in the wrong area. I feel like it needs to go here. Display on ground. Do I need to stunt any trees over here? Let us look. Also, this rock needs to go. Where did- has a rock- wait, I won't destroy the rock yet. Has a rock shown up where we want it to be? No, it has not. My money rock. I'm gonna break this one as well. Do I need to- oh yeah, I need to definitely- I let this go on too big. This one's too big now. I used all my apples. Doink. What if I moved this one along a little bit? I'm probably gonna have to eat an apple for that. I think so. And then my shovel, move it to here. There we go. And then apple. This works. Okay. Okay. I also want my bottle on the beach. So let's have a little luxy look. Let's have a little luxy look. I'm currently reading four or five books at once. I don't know how I'm doing that, but I just need to hop around sometimes. First thing we want to do is order my wheat fields. I think that is a good idea. Here we are. I'm gonna buy all of these, and I also want some of the other colour as well. I can't wait to snuggle up in my Udi in the winter. I'm not gonna sleep cold ever with that. <laughs> I'll be so snug as a bug in a rug, you know? Right. We've got things to do. <gasps> we have the recipe for a well. Oh, I didn't actually mean to do that. Don't do that. Right. Tree stump rug, so cute. I still really wish that we could do tree stump, like tree stumps? Do rugs outside in Animal Crossing. There's no reason why we can't. It doesn't make any sense. Stone and flimsy shovel, okay. Let me go get flimsy shovel and then I'll get my stone out and my wood. We'll make a little well and it's gonna be so cute. I forgot they're dressed up. Look how cute they are. Hello, all I need is a shovel. Oh, I can get this, stones. Do I have wood here? 15. Amazing. Didn't even have to go inside because my storage is actually on the outside. Let me craft this. I always forget you can make that so much quicker. Is there anything else we can craft? Is there... Can you sort by craftable or not? Let me see. Alphabet little auto obtain series. Let me... Is that a fossil? What? Let me grab you. Beautiful. Today, I want to focus on decorating more of the island, I suppose. Getting more done. 
Oh, didn't mean to do that. Look at Maple. She's so cute. I want the three star pumpkins, but we haven't gotten that in our shop yet, and it makes me very upset. Simple well. What do we think about this? The well. I think I like it. I think so. Little middle piece. A spooky well dressing. Spooky well. Where's my thing gone? Steaks. Okay. And then I would surround the rest of it with like wheat fields. But I don't have enough. I think that kind of works, right? Or I could do bushes. Do I have bushes in my inventory? I have one. That one there. Oh, I have these ones, actually. Let me grab these. Oh, and this one. We can put two of these down. Oh, don't do that. And then one here. I love the leaves on that one. It's so pretty. Oh, and then can I put wheat field? I feel like this is doing something at least, you know? I think I like it but time will tell. Okay, do I have any... No, I don't have any... I don't have any flowers. I want an incline. Let's talk infrastructure. Bridges and inclines. Make an incline. This will be our first one. Do we want natural or do we want the log staircase? Natural or log? I think maybe natural, you know? I'm gonna go with natural. Do you know what I have in? I have Oreos and I'm very excited about having Oreos in. I really like Oreos. Incline needs to go up to the campsite because I want to try and get started on that today. But where would I put the incline, you say? No other than here. You need an even stretch of cliff? This is a joke, right? Let me imagine. Even stretch of cliff. I don't know what we put in that awkward little corner. We field. You're so right. You are so right. Bells? No. That's fine though. Is it 98,000 or something? Yeah. Why are these so expensive? That's actually really rude. Let me do like 50,000. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Why did it do that? There we go. You can. Right. That's good. And then I could do a little, a little bit of patharino this way. What else is this way? We've got the, like this weird corner area. I don't know what we do around. I think I'm gonna buy some more saplings because I've seen people use the different sizes, trees, to like chop them down and have smaller stumps, which I think that would be adorable. Let me grab these. Sapling. I'll take five. Thank you. Why do I want these trees? Oh, they're stumps. i put one here. Give me a stump. We're gonna have a stump right there. Then, about this. I'm so excited. And one there. I think that makes sense. And, ooh, we've got a fossil. Okay, what I want to do is do something like, like this is the idea. If I can do this is another question, but I am going to attempt it. Let's make some stones, I suppose. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do it, but I'm going to try my best. The idea is just having like stepping stones, you know? And I'm going to turn this off for now. Wow, that's a stone if you ask me. I'm going to change this. Oh, not like that. Like this. So it's like warm. That is too pink though. That works. I think so. Okay, I suppose let's keep drawing our little stones in like a little pattern. And I will want to do like some little grassy bits as well. Yeah, little stony stones. There's some stones if you ask me. Now I just need to, to shade them. I am gonna do a plain stone and then I'm gonna do one with plants and flowers on it because I feel like it's easier to just be able to use the same one, but change it a little bit, you know? I need a light green. Yeah. I put this like that. I could put a few like over this way, possibly. I think that works. Okay, that's kind of cute. Stones. We did stones. Right, let me use this now and see how it looks on the floor. Like, you know where I wanted to use it actually? Underneath all of this stone. I hear a balloon. There it is. I want to use it on like the, the dirt path here. Oh my God, that was so perfect. Go board. What is it? Oh, it's like game in it. I could use that. What I think I need is different versions of said stones. So let, let's do that now. Let me get rid of this one and maybe the big one and make it like small ish like that. Yeah. Anyone who watches any field notes, certified cute. The rocks aren't perfect. What if I don't put them in? What if I don't have all of them there? What if I only have some? I didn't mean to do that. I feel like I need more rocks. Mine don't really work well together. I don't know. This one doesn't look like a good stone. Maybe because it doesn't have a middle bit? I don't know. Now it looks like a stone. 
And then maybe I have to put a couple at the bottom. If I put like a big one here. Wow. That is a rock. I don't know how to make this look nice. Right. How do I do this? How many stones do I want like on the floor? I don't know. This is the question. Display on ground. This works. It's giving slay. That's not what I wanted to do. And now I need the haunted thingy. Whatever it's called. Spooky arch. Oh wow. And then wheat fields either side. I don't know if I like these or not. I don't know. I want to put more stones around here, like a little maybe rocky footpath area. So let's try and mix them together and see how it goes. Please don't wear that. Nope. They like kind of work. And there. I don't know how I feel about them. I'm not gonna lie. And then this one. I want one right where this fossil is. Right here. I think they're a nice accent, I would say. Not my fave, but I'll be able to use them like in little bits. I do like the way they look on their own. It's very cute. Right, I'm gonna open up Island Designer. What theme is your island? We're going with like autumnal metalcore. That's kind of the idea. I need a bit more autumnal in there. But once we actually time travel to like when everything's like orange, I think that'll work. That's not where I wanted that to go. Okay, let me plant a tree here. And I wanna get rid of this one and make it like a stunted one, you know? I wanna put this here. Those ones are gonna be stunted. Do we have any cute dresses and stuff from Abel's? Oh, this is cute. This is really cute, but it's not. Okay, it's not as cute as I thought, actually. I thought it was a little like dungarees dress, it's not. Right, we're gonna time travel. Hello there, everyone. What have we got? Pass out on the beach. Gulliver is here. I don't think we have gotten red yet. Unless she doesn't announce red every time. I don't know. Right, I'm gonna get all these wheat fields. Look at that. And now we have access to a here. Hi. But my trees will have started growing, right? That one has. Look at this little baby. I'm obsessed. No! Oh my god. I want to sell some stuff. Let me drop this. I don't want the essay set. I don't want a pendulum. Actually, maybe I do. I don't want that. Is that everything? I don't want that. Make some- Oh, the pumpkin stacks! Oh my goodness. I've been waiting for this one. I think a pumpkin stack here would look so cute. Once it's not October, can I get these on the nook stop? Can I buy them in the nook stop? Oh my goodness. I assume so. Right, I'm gonna do some pathing. I'm gonna pull this path around the trees and try and involve them. But I- No, I wanna involve this tree. But I do wanna do some other trees, like stunted trees and stuff as well. I'm gonna, gonna go around to this one. Let's grab this one and make a super pretty path, if you ask me. This is looking cute, guys. Oh, what did we get? I didn't even look. I can't cook. Right, let me take all these roses to be binned because I don't want them. I don't want stinky roses on my island. Why? Please. That was so upsetting. How dare it. Hi, Cherry. <laughs> Sleepy. Amazing. Thank you. Do I have any cosmos? Should I put another tree like here? I think so. Do I have more fence? I don't think I do. It's kind of sad. I'm going to make more fence. We need hardwood. Do I have hardwood? Probably not. Let's have a look. This is looking really cute though. Do I have no axe? I have big axe. I can chop twice. I don't need that one. I need hardwood. I don't need that one. It's very upsetting to me. Look where the rock spawned. Literally, all you had to do was go down here. And you had to go here in my flowers. This is a punishable offense. This rock is being destroyed. Rip in pieces. Let me get out. My shovel? Nope, not my shovel. My axe again. Wow. <gasps> no. Actually, that kind of looks cute there. Never mind. I'm not panicking anymore. That kind of looks cute. I like the stump. Stumps are underrated. Stop doing that. Why do I keep doing that i keep not thinking hit it twice one two thank you one two i'm gonna have to count one two is that enough what was i wanting to make i forget what i wanted to make fence i wanted to make fence yes let's craft short term memory go brr where is fence here we got more than enough thank you country fence let us go decorate with said fence i suppose it's gonna be super cute 
can't fish there, Maple. I'm not gonna lie. I heard a balloon, but I don't know where it went. So that's what I was looking for. Oh, it's right here. What a quinky dink. Hello. What do we have here? Open up. Simple chair. I can use that. It's green. Look how cute it is. It's a little green chair. I like that one. That's nice. All right. Let me get this. Cute. I do need more wheat fields, but we'll deal with that when it comes to it, I suppose. I'll need to time travel to get more. Another white Mumbai. I was like, why did I make these holes? Get rid of the roses. We haven't bought the wheat fields today because we just got 300 miles. Wheat field. I kind of want a lot more of the green ones. Yeah, it's five a day. What are the special goods? Nah. Let me see. Is it spooky tower? I want to see if we can order it. It's definitely not up there, is it? Not for sale. We can eventually, I think. I am going to time travel. Hello there, everyone. It is October 31st. It's 5 p.m. to midnight. We'll be treating you to a Halloween event. And no, this is not a trick. Okay. What time is it in my game? Am I that time travel? 3.45 p.m. Why am I... It's literally 9 o'clock at night for me. Some villagers can give you candy if they're home. <gasps> That's exciting. Okay. We should time travel to later on to play Halloween as well. Do you want to put these over here though? And then... Can I buy a candy today? Maybe. Open... I want a wheat field to go here. Pretty. Oh, wheat fields just make everything better. And place one here. Like, it's just brought everything together. Like, how could they not be good? Wheat fields just make everything laggy. Only if you use too many. This is lovely. These mini trees are like bringing me so much joy. They're like the cutest little things ever. Okay, I do need to stop the... Do I want to stop the growth of this one? I'll stop the growth of- yeah, I'll stop the growth of this one. And then keep the other one growing. And then I put one here. Not take the whole tree. Just wanted to put an apple plant next to it. What a silly sausage. Is there any trees I need to stunt around here? No. 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 Look at my two little growing trees here. Are they meant to be- I feel like this one is meant to be there, but the other one might be a money tree. I can check though. Yoink. Let me eat. This is a money tree. I'll leave that there. Okay, this one I am meant to stunt. Nice. And let's put an apple here. I'm gonna water lots of flowers because I want them to spread. My watering can's gonna break, which is gonna be so sad. How did I know? How did I guess? Devastating, actually. Okay, my, my rocks came up here, not here. Okay. Oh, I don't have an apple. I see a balloon. I see a balloon. Where is it? Not on this side. A sprite costume? What is that? Oh, okay. This is what we're wearing for um Halloween. This is my outfit. I'm gonna buy some candy. Those lockers are very cute. I'm gonna grab them. 3,000 bells. I was expecting like a lot more. And I think this is really cute for like maybe like a tea party picnic. Thank you for the candy. Tee hee. So many bells being spent. Wow. Right, let's time travel to like 6 p.m. Oh, I've never played. Hello everyone, the Halloween event is now underway. The Halloween music. This is so cute. Oh, look. Yo, welcome to Halloween. I've been waiting all stinking year for this. I'm super revved up. Oh, hey, if someone in a costume asks you for candy, you might want to give them some snuffle. Jack's on the island. I've never played it. Trick or treat. If you wanna, don't want to get tricked, you better fork over that candy. I have one. Jack is here. <gasps> Sweet Halloween goodness. Thanks a bunch, honey. And now I feel like I gotta make us even. Here, why don't you take my spooky table setting? They give you items in return? Why didn't I know this? This is gonna be so perfect for the island. If you ask me, it isn't just Halloween unless everyone's running around getting scared, so check this out. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> awesome, huh? If you want a reaction, that'll give some someone a jolt scare is the best look at that this is so cute whoever's in their homes are candy givers okay hi this is how you get the spooky diys as well amazing trick or treat could i have some candy please if not i'll play a trick on you sweet pea <laughs> this is so cute oh my god hooray thank you honey you gave me a candy so i'll give you a spooky garland i can't this is amazing have a nice Halloween. Wow. You try and not give him candy? Never. Hi, Jack. Trick or treat. Oh, ho, he, he, he. I'm Jack, the reigning czar of Halloween. This is the night for frights and delights, which comes but once a year. That's right. Halloween is here. 
Ah, what a thrill it, it, it's, it's been to see this day draw near. The anticipation gives me goosebumps, Pumpkin. Now the hour has come, and it's accomplice I seek. Tell me, Pumpkin, do you fit the bill? Hmm. Hmm. It's spooky month, it is indeed. I am the accomplice. What am I doing? <laughs> hee hee, what an agreeable little minion. I reward my servants handsomely for work well done. And what work is that, you ask? Here's the task. You must fetch me that delectable candy. Oh ho, why I detect you have some candy on you right now. Trick or treat. Come, hand me that candy pumpkin. Okay. Wee, time to treat myself. That was scarily scrumptious. And now for that reward I promised. Feast your eyes on the king size prize. I bestow on you Jack's robe. This is so cute. Dazzling pumpkin. Now your true work can begin. Next you shall bring me my most dele delightful delectable lollipops. I have more in store for one who scores me some. These frightfully special items can be yours. Hmm, hmm, I feel it in my bones. Sure as shadows someone out there has a lollipop. Apply them with candy and you may pry it from their grasp. Stop at nothing to get your claws on one. I shall be hunting this area, so come to me again with a lollipop in hand. Don't disappoint me, my minion. Mind you, I also hunger for more candy. Whenever you bring me, don't keep me waiting long, pumpkin. Aha! Ho ho ho, this strikes me as a fine time to teach you a sinister reaction just for Halloween. It goes a bit like this. Uh, if you don't give me some candy, you regret it, pumpkin. Ho ho hee hee, did I make your knees knock? Has your spine turned to jelly? It has indeed. I should hope so, for that is the intended effect of the haunt reaction. This particular reaction is perfect for Halloween, so have some fun with it. It'll be a scream. Oh my god. We look so funny. Reaction ruler. We got 20 reactions. And that's more Nook Miles. We need to find a lollipop, apparently. Is it all spooky items on Halloween out of the balloons? If it's not, I'll be very disappointed. What are you giving me? A lollipop, maybe? <laughs> Open up. That's so rude. You're not spooky at all. <gasps> Look at Shub. Go on, do you want some candy? You want some candy? I know you've been on this island somewhere, honey, but I couldn't find you. I've been stood outside your house for a whole day. Okay. I'm right here. Oh, you don't want any candy? I do need to go into people's houses, and I saw someone's in up here, so let's do that. I need a lollipop. This is so cute. I'm actually obsessed. Oh my gosh, honey, finally I get a chat with you. I've legit missed you a lot. Are you gonna give me a lollipop? Mwahaha! Welcome, welcome to the ultra-fab house of Hauntitude. Having fun, honey? Mwahaha! I've got enough candy to feed the whole island. Here you go. That's not a lollipop, is it? Happy Halloween! Time to get back to scaring and getting scared. Anything can happen. That was a normal candy. Okay. Amazing. Let's find the other ones as well. At least we have plenty of candy. I think we've got even more on the beach. Hi! Trick or treat! Could I have some candy, please? If not, I'll play a trick on you. Okay. Here's your candy, sweet pea. Hooray, thank you, honey. Well, I have some candy here for you too. It's a lollipop. Well, thank you, Olive. That is so perfect. <gasps> that was so cute. Oh my god, Shub. Where's Jack? Mr. Scary Man, where you at? Here he is, hi. I know that smell. You're in possession of some scrumptious candy, aren't you? Oh, there's no hiding it from me, pumpkin. Jack always knows. Trick or treat. Come on, give me, I crave candy. A lollipop. I forgot we had bat wings on. No, no, but y oh yes. Happy Halloween. Tis the grandest candy, my very most favorite, a lollipop pumpkin. Whatever I was doing can wait, time for a treat. Nom nom. So good, it sent chills down my spine. You have performed most admirably. This calls for special reward. What have you got me, Jack? Show a little gratitude to old Jack for this in-candy incandescent reward of a spooky carriage we got a spooky carriage we could put the spooky carriage here we could put it here or is the well too cute i don't know i'm so excited let's see what it looks like it's gorgeous Trick a treat if you don't want to get tricked you better fuck over the candy i just really want to get all of the the items that they're going to give us you know so you halloween goodness thanks a bunch honey what have you got me a spooky rug? I mean, I can't use that outside, but I'll take it. Halloween for knife's life snuffle. <gasps> I have candy here. Right, let's see if anyone else is in the house. Also, I don't think Jack asked for anything else. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure he didn't. Hello, Norma. <gasps> Hello, cutie. Trick or treat. Here you go. We will. I'll maybe the next one. I'll 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 get a trick because I haven't actually seen it. And we've got a lollipop. We can give Jack another lollipop then because it's favorite candy. It's his favorite. How could I keep that away from him? Hello. Oh, you little cutie. I can't. 
Got enough candy to feed the whole island. Thank you. Bye. Peanut's house is so cute. I wish she was autumnal. And then freckles. Freckles. Hello with your fish tank. How you doing? And we got more candy. Look at her little outfit. Ah, it's too cute. Is there anyone around who wants some candy? Hi. <gasps> Maple, you little cutie. I've got no candy. That's disappointing, but we both know what happens now. Hocus pocus. Oh my god. I'm really sorry about that. Don't worry. It's just a little prank. If you don't think it's neat, you can change it right away in a mirror of vanity. In fact, here, you might find this really useful. Please take this wooden table mirror. We're a little zombie. Oh my god. It's face paint to remove it, go into your pockets, and then to where you change clothes. Oh god. Hi. Should we get tricked again? Oh wow, well I guess I have to trick you, abracadabra. What are we now? We worked really hard on that trick. I hope it turned out well. What do you think? Look at us. Oh, we're like Sally. Hello. I have a lollipop. Now we have like a full outfit. It's a great time. Here you go. A lollipop. No, no, but yes, oh yes. This is so cute. Okay. Nom nom. He's so cute. I can't. Look at Shove in the background. I can't. What have we got? A DIY? A spooky carriage recipe. Amazing. Do you want any more candy? Can't believe you haven't done this before. I can't believe I haven't done it before either. Kind of crazy if you ask me. Time to treat yourself. Have the candy jack. So scarily scrumptious. Jack's face? He gave us his face? Oh, I can't. Wait, wait, let me learn this. Look at them scaring each other. Oh my god. I'm gonna keep our Halloween outfit, but that is so cute. Can we place it on the floor? Look, it's just another pumpkin. <laughs> that looks so funny. Oh my god. Do I have enough room in my pockets? I do. Hi. Shake a treat. Here's a candy. I think this will be the last one. And then I'm gonna right out spooky flooring okay i can't really use that on the island either but that's fine thank you agnes okay that was a spooky scary time and that was so much fun <laughs> hello there everyone right now on applesauce it is november the first don't have any big news but there is a seasonal topic mushrooms are starting to pop up all over the island amazing that's what we've been waiting for and we're getting sent a diy i am so hyped mushrooms we can make our little mushroom farm i can't wait we should get a lot of the mushroom diys as well does that include like the fairy core items and today we're going to be building a bug cafe we're gonna to have to like time travel to see if we can find flick to get some commissions and a mushroom farm is the idea oh mum sent us something Something about seeing piles of colourful leaves everywhere puts me in a good mood to bake. Pies, cakes, muffins, biscuits. Can't fight this. I won't. I wouldn't fight it either, mum. You love the mush furniture? The mush furniture is so pretty. Tables? Oh, the mushroom tables? Yes. I can't wait for the lamps, the tables, the mushrooms in general, the, the mushroom, like, big divider things. What did she bake us? Oh, it's a kitchen mat. Okay. She didn't bake us anything, guys. <laughs> also, yesterday, I did play a little bit. Not too much, but a little bit more of Halloween. And I got some more things. So we have... Okay, yeah, we got the mushroom wreath. And here's all of the things, the DIYs that I got yesterday. All of these. I got the tower, the spooky tower. This is so good. This is going to be so good. Let's go see what's in Nooks. Let's go see what we can get. Do I have any money? I have no money. Let's... I'm gonna get these and I'm gonna get the oranges and sell those because then we'll have some money, you know? Also, using a ladder there, I just... It's genius. Hello. Hello. Yes. No? Do I get nothing here? I didn't know it was empty sometimes. Oh. Okay. Right. Let's make some things with the pumpkins. We can make this. How do we make this? Clumps of weeds. Okay. Wait, can we only do it with orange pumpkins? We can't do it with other colors? Why? Doesn't make any sense to me. Okay. So many cute DIYs. It's a great time. Right, I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna put my little tower that I made. Oh my god. Like, is that not the cutest thing ever? A little, a little pumpkin tower? Oh, so cute. I wanna put a little pumpkin here. If I just grab one and then drop. Decorating with things like that I think is really gonna help because we don't have lots of items. So I think coming up with creative ways to decorate is gonna be good. Grab one of these and drop item. Yeah. And I'm so glad that it doesn't block like the fact that you can still walk there. That'd be really happy. Let's have a look for our 
mushrooms, I suppose. Um, I don't know where they'll be, but probably just dotted around. I'm also gonna start clearing out the roses because we don't want any roses anywhere. We are not a roses island. We are going for mums, cosmos, and tulips, and hyacinths. That's the vibe. Oh, I have to add... I need to stunt this tree as well. Do I have apples? I'll have to find some apples at some point. Um, yeah, cleaning up is, is the way we're gonna do things. I swear, I can breed flowers better when I don't even pay attention to them. We've got pink roses up there. Like, what the hell? I haven't even looked at you guys and you're making hybrids. I'll pick up this one and we can get a little bit of money from these as well, which is good. I wish the flowers stacked. That's one thing that really annoys me about the flowers is that they don't stack and they're all like separate entities in your inventory. It makes no sense. They're all the same, just let the same colours stack. Um, where's all my mushrooms? I'm confused. I've only seen one. Love that you're still a zombie. Oh my god, I am. We'll change that soon. It's not Halloween anymore. <laughs> I'm gonna sell you all my flowers, Jimmy and Tommy. I want to sell. I also need to keep an eye out for moving bubbles. So I just, we need to kick Peanut out and we don't actually have that long left. So we might have to time travel quite a bit, but it would be best to get lots of these flowers dug up and sold, like the roses, so they don't spread loads when we time travel. So yeah. How come the island's still not like orange? We're well into autumn now, not adding up in my brain. And this one, is there anything over here? Like a mushroom maybe? No, just more roses. I might sell this stuff in the drop off box because it's so much quicker. And you get like barely anything from it anyway. That fills my inventory. Not super. Let me grab some apples as well so we can... Oh, hi. You know what? Okay, another reaction. Laughter. Okay, too cute. I think little bug cafe could be like here. I'm gonna make this area into an area where you can set up a little bug cafe and it'll be super cute. And then I don't know where I'll put the mushroom farm. I'm not sure but I'll figure it out. I need more saplings so you can make more stunted trees as well. And then I'll take probably this one as well. I'd rather have like stunted trees at the front so we can like see what's going on. Let me plant these. Let me plant this. Beautiful. And then, can I plant one there? I'm guessing no. Figures. But I can probably plant one there. But I kind of want one of these big pine trees. Do I not have any more apples? Oh my god. Right, there we go. Let me get my... Wait, I do want to change what outfit we're wearing. Let's go see what outfits we have. What outfits do I have? That is the question. What do I want to wear? We've got quite a few cute, like, outfits. I feel like the overalls, even the, like, fishing clothes, I feel like that could be quite fun. And then I might wear... Hmm, maybe we'll keep it at that. Wait, this hair? Because we don't want to wear the, like devil horns anymore. I kind of love it. Look at us go. A little, a little cutie. Now, I'm gonna open up the island designer app and we're gonna make a little path here. All right, and then let's do this little top bit. That is the wrong one. And let's put this little bottom one here. This is gonna look so cute. Oh, don't do that, please. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna put our middle paths down. Is this faster than like doing it normally? I feel like it is. Display on ground. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And then we're going to do this side. Amazing. This is our canvas, if you will, for our little, little tea party, I suppose. Our little, our little bug cafe. I don't think I actually have anything to make a cafe, so the space is there. But we can't really do much. I could just drop some items in that I know I will use, like this coffee grinder. I just drop it there. Actually, I might place it so we know what we have. And then like the more items I accumulate, we'll know when we can actually decorate that area. I'm gonna start putting my wheat fields down as well. Because we know that in all our areas, we are filling them with the best decor item ever, which is wheat fields. And then last one. Wow. Now, I need to find that balloon that I heard, but I don't know where it is. Was there a balloon or was I imagining it? That's the question. Let me check on the other side of this island area. I definitely can hear one. It's over here. Okay. Which way is it going? I can't see it. Uh, was it literally going to where I was? Here it is. Oh no. Okay, wait. I need to be quick. Why is this going to go over the sea and then I'm never going to get a chance? This isn't quick. What did we get? Campfire cookware. That can go at the campsite. Cool. Okay. I'll take that. And I will take this as well. This little fossil. Thank you. 
Sometimes I feel like when I wear my glasses, it like blocks me from breathing, <laughs> which isn't the best time, you know? How did Freckles get up here? This is Scoot's house, but how did Freckles get up here? Freckles is down there. Do the villagers have ladders? Is this a thing that I don't know about? Alright, let's go and see what items I have and see if we've got anything for a little cafe. A little clay furnace. Oh, this is so cute. I want that there. And then maybe some plants. We could make a flower shop as well. That's something that we could do. I love it. Okay. I'm full of ideas today and that makes me happy because ideas means progress on the island. I do need to sell some items as well. I want to craft. Pretty please. No, I wanted, I wanted to customize. What am I doing? Customize, please. Right. And yes, we can. Okay, that's amazing. I just want the... Oh, do I go with brown? Do I go with brown or white? And then brown chair. Let's go. What else do I have? None of this stuff was useful, was it? I feel like I could definitely sell a lot of this stuff. I don't even know why I've like held on to it. Who is in here blocking my way? As always. Oh, it's Maple. I'm sorry. Let me put these items out. I don't think I have little... Oh wait, I should have coffee cups actually. That's really cute. I like that colour. Um, I would put this here. Oh my god. That's really cute. I like that. Then... We have little trees that we can like plop around so that can like blend in a little bit. A little tree here. Kinda works ish. Fancy water pitcher. Oh, it's like a kettle. Why do they call it a water pitcher? Then we have the dessert case and campfire cookware. I reckon the dessert case should go like here. Oh, not that. I don't know how we're gonna make it all fit in, but I'm just gonna leave the items here for now. This isn't what it's gonna look like, but I just wanna put the items there. And then I want to put the campfire cookware here. That looks cute. And then with this, I need to stunt this tree actually. So I might do that now. Let's get rid of these flowers and put a little apple there. We've got plenty of apples as well. And I'll put the flower here. I could plant a weed as well. I don't need the weed in my inventory. A weed. Okay. And I want that one to grow like maybe one more. This is looking cute. It's looking functional, you know? I'm going to order my stuff from um, the nook stop. I might time travel to get more mushrooms and more items in general. Where's my wheat fields? Here they are. Let's have a look at who we've got on the island. Because I kind of forget um, with our villager houses being so out of the way. Some of them are just like, I barely even see. Scoot could go. I love Scoot. He's not very autumnal though. But if he ends up staying on the island, I wouldn't be mad, you know? And then I would say Peanut. The rest of the villagers are like kind of perfect. Sherb isn't autumnal, but he's just such a cutie. I don't know. If he had a thought bubble, I feel like we would let him go, but I'd be very sad, you know? But he's not autumnal, so I feel like we should probably let him go at some point. Oh my god, that's so cute. Here it is, our little message in a bottle. Oh, there he goes. Kusto sent us a little tree standy. Okay, that's kind of adorable. Hello, Isabelle. Right now on Applesauce, it's November the 2nd. Kick is here. Okay, thank you very much. That is a good time. Right, let's find our little message in a bottle and things. Get our wheat fields. We did sell some stuff, didn't we? We sold um, our roses in the drop-off box. Thank you. Right, nook shopping. All of the wheat fields. All of the things that make our builds so much better. So much better. Right. Hello, Shub. Let's check Nook's cranny first. The rain makes it so autumnal. We had like a mini thunderstorm earlier. It was one flash of lightning and one crash of thunder. And then it rained really heavy. And then it stopped and then it was sunny all afternoon. It was really weird. Oh, these are bad things. These are all things that I don't want. I'll get the cushion. I need to check Abel's every day. And I need to start checking on the villagers again to see what they're crafting. Because I've stopped doing that as well. Which is really silly of me. A little silly sausage. Hello. All right. Got a little Cinderella dress. Let's go inside. Barista uniform. That could definitely be used on a mannequin. Princess dresses. Acorn hats. I feel like I could definitely use the acorn hat. These socks. Definitely the boots. Okay. Let's see if Freckles is crafting. You're not crafting. Is everyone else out of the house? I guess Scoot is up there and stuff. Sherb is out. Is Scoot in? It looks like he's in. I see some mushrooms as well. Let me grab those. Are you crafting? Maybe. That'll be a good time. He is! Is it something mushroom? Hi. Could you... Yes. Look at his little hammer thingy. An iron frame. I really don't care for an iron frame. Nah. 
That's really upsetting. That is sucky if you ask me. Right, I'm gonna check the um, beach to see if our message and bottle is there. And then we'll get back right into decorating. Are you up here? Nope. I should probably get some of my fossils assessed as well. I've got like a big pile just accumulating. <gasps> here it is. What are you? Classic picture. Do I already know? Yeah. I already know that. That sucks. Oh my god. I am loving how this island's turning out though. Looking great. What I will do actually is start to extend the farm. I see a mushroom. Thank you. I feel like that's a good idea. Let me open up the island designer and get ready. So, I've seen some more ideas of farms on Pinterest and I've got some ideas that I want to do. So we'll get onto that. I want the farm to be big. I want it to like stretch out all the way across here. Let's grab this. And I need to move all of these trees for what I want. Let me put some wheat fields out. And this one. Right, yeah, I want like all of this to be farm. So let's do that. Grab these. How many trees? One, two, three, two for now. Let's eat these apples. Oh, I could go put the fossils next to blathers and then my inventory will be like significantly emptier. Let's go do that first. All the way to Blathers. Oh, and our money tree grew. I didn't even realize we had one there. Yeah, we've got quite a few. Nice. Let's get this money as well. I'm still in love with this middle bit. It's so cute. Right, let's dig up these trees, I suppose. That is not my shovel. Let's grab this one and this one. Right, so let's start here. Doing this works. No, I don't want that there. One two, three. Maybe I'll move this along one, like this, and then get rid of this there. Right, let's get rid of this bit. Huge farm makes easy decor. You know, I see some little mushrooms. I'm gonna get rid of this tree as well. Eat apple. Here we are. Right, I think I'm gonna have to make a sideways path as well. Yeah, right, hold on. Let's see. How will I do that? I don't know. Maybe use this on that one we'll do this one copy and we'll do it like this i think that's what i want let me put this down that works for what i want it to work now i need one for the inside bit display on ground okay does it fit with the top one let's see have i done this perfect i have indeed look at that that makes me happy i do need ends for that one as well though but i can do that later Doink. let me put all these through here keep one little end one for the end bits and the middle one for the middle bit i hate bugs can they just like leave me alone why do they gotta be up in my business floor you know this one this is looking like a farm i would say let's plant some pumpkins and things all right give me some orange ones please thank you and orange and we have exactly two more all right and let's put this one here I think I have carrots in my storage. I'm gonna go get those. Let me plant some carrots. And then that's on this side. Right, I'm gonna plant all these here. Maybe I plant it next to the wheat fields. I feel like that would make sense. Here, and let's see. I'm gonna plant these here. Wait, is like, is there a villager actually called Stinky? What? Oh my god, how did I not know? Stinky is too cute, oh my goodness. 2,000 miles, look at us go. This is going pretty well. I could do a little mushroom farm as well. If we walk down, this area could be like a mushroom farm. This could be the farm area, the big old massive farm. And Ruby can be the farm person. I'm gonna grab you, thank you. And then I need more, I need more fruits. I think I want to do, I do need, more fence that is something that i need to do and then plant some flowers around as well i need to get rid of some of these trees because i don't want them oh a balloon that's what i've been hearing i thought i was going crazy okay excuse me thank you we've got a mush partition that is one of our first mushy recipes and that's a good one i like that one i need hardwood wow okay we got some nook miles how much have i got 14 so i can make 20 what do we need for this? Skinny mushrooms. That mush partition will come in useful, I think. My fence, here it is. Let's go put this fence down, I suppose. I'm loving the way the island's looking. This can look cute here. I put like a fence here. I think this works, yeah. What did we get? More nook miles. Let's get our fencing out. And we're gonna separate. We're gonna separate this area. Actually, I don't want that connected. 
like this. Grab these here. I can put like mushroom items around the outside of this. I think that could be cute. How do I want these to be though? <gasps> Look at that balloon just, just coming in for us. How did I miss that? I need all the mushroom items. Um, okay, we got a little tree. I could do smaller farm with just mushrooms. Maybe? Like this. And we've got like different levels of farms as we go through. Just remember how to get rid of rocket. I love that for you. Do you have tips on getting rid of villagers? I don't want this to like be perfect. I'm gonna do that. What do I have? Flowers. And I have my mushrooms. Like this. Grab one. This is where they're gonna go. Why would you drop there? That's so rude. Drop item. Let's do this one. Middle one. Oh my god, it works so good. The top one and the bottom one. I'll make the side ones at another time. You know, I just can't be bothered to make them right now. This is gonna be so cute. I do need these ones for crafting though, so I'm gonna keep the skinny mushrooms for now. Just for crafting purposes. Alright, I'm gonna go into Nook's Cranny and order some wheat fields. Why am I sitting on a stump? Don't do that. That is silly. Silly goofy wheat field. I do need to get a new watering can because ours broke. So let's go buy a watering can. Thank you for the watering can. Let's go water my flowers. Oh, it was literally raining today, wasn't it? That's why all my flowers are watered. Oh my god. Hello there, everyone. Right now on Applesauce, it's November 3rd and CJ is here today. Right, let's sell some stuff. I've got some trees that I do not want. And then this is useless to me. Thank you. I love how we can like sell full on trees in the drop off box. It's just wild. I love how we can have trees in our pocket. I do need more mushrooms and stuff. Place item. Oh no, I don't want it there. I don't know where that wheat field went. Maybe I do want it there. All right, I'm gonna put a flower here as well. Because we do need to continue the medical. Medical? Meadow core of the island. You know? Butterfly. I actually need to start catching the bugs that I want models of. That would be a good idea. The purple flower. OMG. We've got a purple flower, guys. Right, let me move this tree. Purple. That's one more closer to green. That's a win from me. I need two purple to get green. I have watered our bad boy. Have I? I'm gonna double water because I'm scared that it isn't. I'm happy. Very happy. I'm just checking for mushrooms because we need mushrooms. Here's one. Look at all those flowers that I don't want. Cherry's house. Hello. Cherry's house is super cute. Having a little house in the woods. It's going to be so adorable. Ooh, look at all these fossils here. They've all congregated on this side of the island. And there's a mushroom here. There might be enough of those mushrooms to make one of those mushroom standy thingies. The tall thing. Right, do I have more of this? I do. Imagine if I accidentally ate it, I would be very upset. <laughs> that works. I'm gonna pick up all this as well. Tidy up the island a little bit. Oh, thanks for the do-rag. Appreciate it, I suppose. Will this be enough for you? I am unsure. I am unsure. I think it might be. Okay, let's get all these assessed. Hopefully we'll get the left megalo side. I think that's what we're looking for. And maybe some other cool fossils that we can like put down. Next to Blather's tent. That would be very helpful. Assess fossils. Is that 14 fossils? That is wild. There's way more than one. <laughs> a wing? Oh, it's not as cool as I thought it would be actually. Um, okay. Is this the right one? Wait, no, we've already got this one. We've already got that one. That kind of sucks. Oh, look at that. Look at that bad boy. I'm gonna put the other right side here for now because we could put it together like that until we find the other side. <laughs> it looks so goofy. But you can't really tell from here. And that's what matters. Let me go sell all these. I hope this is gonna be a pretty penny. Is that a McDonald's meal? That's a McDonald's meal, guys. I am selling so many fossils. 46,000. Amazing. I'm gonna buy this for next to the Able Sisters. Let me get the island designer open. Yeah, without custom paths, I'd be very sad. But I'm just doing it without terraforming the cliffs or water escaping as well. Put these middle bits in. Play on ground. Don't eat the apples. Why have I done that? Custom pathing takes so long. 
Like, why do I have to take years to make this path? It hurts. It hurts my feelings. Don't think I put those in the right area, to be honest. Let me put more middle paths. I'm gonna make this super foresty. This little bit. Display on ground. I might actually stop this path here and then make another one. Like, you know, when you like cut it off a little bit and it looks super cute. How far have we gotta go? Over here. Okay, not too far. <gasps> I could put stones. I keep forgetting I have those. Let me put some stuff here. There's so many little rocks. And then can I put like the middle thing here? I can. And how would this top and bottom one look? That looks kind of cute, just sitting alongside. I could do it here as well. Um, okay, amazing. Do I have any more fence? I think I do. Okay, let me... Oh, I don't have any mushrooms that I wanted, actually. I do have enough mushrooms to make one of those mushroom things that I want. There's no space... What? Can I plant you here? I can. <laughs> right, let me go make my mushroom partition thingy gonna have so many stunted little baby trees and they're gonna be the cutest thing ever one of these and a bush here as well i'm gonna put some more of my rocks around my cute little rocks that i made because they deserve to be seen with me so first things first i really want to get these flowers bred and sorted i want to get some more orange flowers we've got two growing look at them little cuties but we have no green mums yet we have a couple purple mums which is definitely gonna help because we need the white ones to get purple ones and the purple ones to get green ones. It's all very confusing. It's my first time breeding flowers and I'm just hoping and praying that we'll actually get a green mum out of this. The main goal of today is to start getting some transition areas kind of finished, putting a bit like extra things in. So I'm gonna gather some flowers and I'm gonna try and put those in areas which are just like lacking that little bit of extra decor, I suppose, because there's a lot of areas on this island that like we have, like we've got the farm and I mean, we've got this forest court area that like is a transition area. So I'm gonna put all of the stuff here, but there are other areas that like round here is very, lacking i would say it's got the farm but it's empty over this side so i definitely need to start putting things together when it comes to that a big thing to help with this is going to be crafting i have quite a few good recipes now that can help especially with the like extras like the mush partitions and things and then obviously balloons because if we get good stuff from balloons we can decorate more and we didn't get something to decorate with. That's um, that's unfortunate. I've definitely been forgetting to put as much um, importance, what's the word? Like emphasis on collecting my uh, recipes in bottles, the balloons, the actual crafting, like even getting like items from my rocks and things, speaking to Sable. Like I feel like I've just been forgetting about these things the last few days, so. We're getting back on top of it, and hopefully we'll get some things we can use. I literally can't get over that we've got maple on this island. Look at the little cutie giving us a little please reaction. Oh my god, I'm obsessed. She's so perfect for this. As well as collecting all of my like recipes in the bottles and things like that, I want to collect more fossils so we can use them to decorate a little bit more around Balada's tent area. And I think that area is looking pretty good, but what is going on? Hello? Are you two good? Are you two fighting? Norma? Olive? Um, hello? I'm loving how this farm area is looking. I really do need to fill it out with these little vegetables and get all these little patches nice and ready and actually finished. And I think it's gonna look so cute once everything is kind of put together. But I definitely need to figure out how to fill out all of the areas around here because it's, it's lacking a little bit. I definitely think it's looking super cute and I'm so glad I decided to extend the farm but we need a lot more done to it, you know? I love the way these pumpkins look so much. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do more pumpkins. What I've decided to do in these little areas is um, plant a little bit of each color. So the top bit has orange and white, then there's green, and then 
we have the yellow ones separate as well, which is super cute. And then I'm going to fill out these areas with a few pumpkins as well because it's autumnal. This island needs to be full of autumnal little little add-ons, little extras, and I think these pumpkins going everywhere will really help accentuate the theme um, of like autumnal medical. I'm so excited for that theme, like I have not seen an island with this theme and I, I might search to see if like there are any tours of that kind of theme because I really would love to see inspiration for it. Um, I'm just, I'm so excited to be doing this. I've always wanted to do a Meadowcore island as well. I'm just, oh, so excited. What has this balloon got for us? Please be something good. Let's see. What are you? Open up and it's a little magazine. Well, we could use that for like a little picnic or something and see how it goes. I thought we could also craft a bunch of things for the foresty area. We need a little bit more extras and obviously we've got this adorable spooky tower that we can have. And then I wanna do a couple of those and I'll probably need to collect some more like craftable items to be able to actually craft more things. But I have ideas. I'm gonna put the spooky tower here, I think. I want to have the pumpkins like not showing the jack-o'-lantern faces because I feel like it adds more to the the autumnal aesthetic and I want to try and just have them dotted around in places. I also want to include more spooky trees and I don't know how they're gonna look with the whole theme because I don't really want like too much spookiness in it. Like we have the trick or treat neighborhood, which I need to add more spooky things to, definitely. Probably more of those spooky trees actually. And some things like trick or treat bags and that. But I don't know how much spooky things I want around the rest of the island. Shub, hello, you're thinking? Do I let Shub go? This is, this is the, oh my God, this is so difficult because I want Peanut to leave. Do I want Sherb to go? I don't think so. I don't know, I don't think so. Oh my god. I feel like I've made a mistake, let him go. Right, wait, 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 wait. I've just restarted because I feel like I made the biggest mistake ever by letting Sherb go instead of waiting for the bubble to transfer to Peanut. And I'm hoping to the Lord, you know, the Animal Crossing gods, that Sherb isn't actually leaving. Okay, we haven't got an announcement. So I want to see, I want to see, oh my god, right. Did it, did it save or did it not? I just, oh my god. Okay, so he's not in the house, so he's not in boxes. And I did time travel to the next day, like, because I went on and like, I couldn't really tell on the same day. Hello, Shub. Okay, I think we're safe. I think we're safe. What I need to do is time travel and see if Peanut will get the thinking bubble. I think we've dodged a bullet there with my little mistake and that's okay so i'm gonna i'm gonna speak to peanut where is she peanut hello okay she wasn't in the house but like here she is little cutie i want to chat i'm gonna chat to you become friends so you'll want to leave i don't know how that works but it works somehow okay let's check nook's cranny this kitchen thing is kind of cute how much is this bad uh, One hundred and thirty thousand bells that is that is too much, sir. That is, please stop. I'll just buy your skeleton bones. I'm just gonna change a few more things around, add a couple trees, put some decor around, and then I think we'll probably time travel to the next day to try and get um, the moving bubble changed. And I don't know how it'll work, because obviously we did speak to Shub, but then we like quit the day, and then it didn't go through. So I don't know if there'll be a moving bubble soon, or if it'll be like, a few days until then but we'll have to see i'm gonna put this spooky tower here because i mean look at it it's so cute okay we have time traveled to see if the moving bubble has time travel the moving thought bubble so let's get into it besties besties peanut got the moving bubble straight away how did this even work? How 
did it work out so well that I messed up with Sherb quick quick enough time traveled two days and Peanut wants to leave we've won the game I'm so happy right now what what even like uh with the news that Peanut is leaving and we get to go on a villager hunt tomorrow I would love to focus on getting more Nook Miles. We need more Nook Miles so we can get more Nook Miles tickets. So I'm watering my crops, I'm doing all the things that the Nook Miles gods want us to do and we're gonna get so many Nook Miles. I think we've already got like quite a lot. Yeah we've got like 13,000 at the minute. Let's try and get that up to 20,000 so we can have a bunch of tickets to work with and we can find a dreamy for this island. Now, I mean, the ultimate dreamies would be like, I love stitches. I think stitches would be so cute on this island. Bo, Eric, Fauna, anyone that fits into like autumnal, like cottage core, meadow core, like all of those kind of aesthetics. So we've got a lot to work with, which is the best time. So. I'm just gonna work on getting some more Nook Miles so we can get more tickets and that means collecting all these shells. I see my message in a bottle up ahead as well and hopefully it's a good DIY in there, we'll have to see. But we've got so much to do. I'm so hyped that we've managed to get Peanut to leave. Another math recipe? I'm so sick of these mats and rugs, please. Okay, hello. I want to sell you my shells so I can get some Nook Miles. Thank you very much. You enjoy those. And I actually found some rare mushrooms. The truffle mushrooms or whatever they're called. Oh yeah, the rare mushrooms. That's all they're called. They look like truffles. And um, yeah, I want to see how much those sell for. 37,000 bells. And we have some Nook Miles from all of that. That is, that is so good. That is so good. Let's get back to the decorating. As I said earlier, this area needs some stuff to fill up the gaps. And I've decided like to extend more of the pumpkin farm. I feel like having pumpkins everywhere is gonna make it feel so autumnal. And I really love the use of tiny little farm areas. This is gonna be a theme throughout the island, I have a feeling, because they're so easy to make and the fill up spaces, which just makes it so much better. I don't know, something about it. So I'm gonna grab these pumpkins and I'm gonna put them around and hopefully it's gonna fill up the space and make it look a lot cuter, I think. And then I also have an idea of maybe doing a little picnic on the end of this bit that like sticks out near the tree. Um, just a tiny little picnic. I have a few items, not loads to use, but I'm pretty sure I have a picnic blanket. Nope picnic basket which will definitely help when it comes to this um, and I think I have a few other things that I could definitely use as well so I'm gonna put down the blanket custom design that we made and get started on making that one of the main things I wanted to add in this area was this cushion because I got it from Nooks the other day and I thought it would be perfect in a little picnic area I also brought over the picnic basket and I found a little candle in my storage as well which I thought could look cute. Little, a little candle lit picnic. I would absolutely love that, please and thank you. Um, I don't think that candle fits there very well so I might put it behind. Oh my god. Why do I always mess up my custom designs and get them off the floor? Like I don't want to rub them out. Please, can it be like a different button to picking up my items? because it just, I mess it up all of the time. Right, candle in the back, looks okay-ish. And then I got mum's tea cozy, which I thought would be really cute. I wonder if I could maybe change the design on this, I'm not sure, like customize it, but I think that looks really cute. And then the magazine that we got out of the balloon earlier. It's looking okay, it's not perfect, but it's definitely something and I need some flowers and things to fill up the extra space that we have so I might go get some of those as well. Let me just pick up this one actually. I don't want both of those tulips there, they're, like, they're too parallel. So I'm going to add this into the back and maybe get a different flower for that area. 
decorate in a different way. But look how cute this looks. Oh my god. One thing I forgot to do the past couple of time travel days is check my nook stop. So I'm back down to 50 bells. Not 50 bells, 50 miles getting instead of 300 per day, which is so annoying. Um, but we'll get that back up and I need to order my wheat fields. I need to keep doing this because I keep forgetting. Because we need wheat fields to cover the island. Wheat fields make every build so much better. And of course, it fits in with the autumn theme. So they're perfect. Still looking for balloons, still hoping out that this might be a mushroom recipe so we can have more autumnal cute things on the island. What is it? Come on. It's a mushroom load stool. Oh my god. Finally, something more that's mushroom themed. With this museum area at the bottom, like Blather's tent area, I need to add a few more things around just to fill it up. I'm gonna add some trees, gonna all add all this good stuff around, and I think. I'm gonna add some flowers and things later on. I, it just feels empty, it's not fully finished, but I'm gonna add the trees for now. So Norma gave me this thing because she fought with Sherb earlier. She gave me a little gift to give to Sherb, so we're gonna do that now. And it just so happens that Sherb is crafting, so let's see what he's got for us. A little signpost. Oh my God, that's so perfect. I feel like the stars are aligning today and we're getting everything we need. We've got peanut moving out. We got some mushroom DIYs in balloons. We got this signpost now, like everything's just working out. Let's let's give him this gift and hopefully their friendship can be, you know. Oh, Norma did not just gift Shub a jester costume after they just argued. What is Norma thinking? Oh my God. I'm sorry Sherb, that's, that's brutal. That is really brutal. After looking at some Pinterest posts of things like builds that I wanna do, I realized that something that we are missing is some really cute little wooden steps as a custom code for the island. So I thought I'd give my, my, I'll give it a go. I'll give the design codes a go and I'm gonna do hopefully curving ones as well. I don't know, I'm not the best at the custom designs, but I'm kind of proud how these ones came out. Like just little cute things. Maybe I'll add some flowers to them or some greenery or some autumn leaves at some point. But for now, I think the plain little wood is fine for me and hopefully it'll work when we get it put down on the floor. I don't know, we'll have to see. So I've done a few different ones. Let's see how it looks. Oh my goodness. Look how cute this looks. I'm gonna have to put it everywhere now because I'm obsessed with how well this works and it's just gonna fit in so well. Like I feel like custom designs can really save a build. When it's looking a bit bland or empty, get those custom designs on the floor. You don't want an empty space there. You need something that's gonna spruce up the area. And this is gonna be the wooden planks little job. Sprucing up these cute little areas and oh my God, even the little curved thing. <gasps> I'm so happy it worked out. Okay, I want to do a little curved bit at this orchard area. And I hope that putting the two curved things together will work, but it doesn't look like it's going to work. So I think I'm going to have to edit these custom designs. Okay, I'll, I'll get back to you on that. Okay, I think this is the best I'm going to be able to do right now. I've tried to do a few different ones to try and make it work, but it's just... It hasn't been working out. I'm, I'm gonna come back to it. We'll get back to the drawing board and try and make it better. And okay, thank you. At the beginning of the video, I said I needed to continue making some transition areas. And I've got this area in between the apple orchard, well, the, the fruit orchard, the tree orchard thingy, and my house, like behind the villager little neighborhood. And so I thought I'd put some custom designs down and try and get that like, I guess started. It's not gonna get finished anytime soon, but just laying down the land and seeing how it might look, uh, it's gonna be a help for the future me, you know? And I thought we could put some custom designs down in the orchard because I have these one tile little paths and I thought doing those next to each other, kind of like the middle bit, would look really cute. So I'm gonna do that and get that sorted and I think it is looking cute. I think it'll work. And it's just like, you know, those extra, it's all in the little details, you know? 
I've come back to the little farm area to add in little extras to try and make it feel less empty. And I think I'm going to add a little path here of all of these, like just a little circle of these corners because I just need something to fill up this small space. And I don't think adding like a bunch of flowers will work. I think it'll look odd. So adding like this little custom path, I think it will work better than what like plants or something would work. So here it is. And I'm gonna do custom designs around Blather's tent area because we need a path that leads to his tent. We've got the stuff around, like in front of his tent and to the side, but to the back, we needed to get that sorted. And I'm just kind of thinking, do I, do I need to leave space to have these flowers breed? Or will they be okay breeding just on the other side where the custom paths aren't? I'm not sure. Maybe I'll have to like get rid of this path. Yeah, maybe maybe I should put a little bit um, a little bit more room around where the flowers are. I feel like even though this path was looking cute and things, I think we need room to get those green mums. So I'm gonna get rid of this area. I want to do some more DIYs, so that means I'm gonna have to chop some wood. So let's let I went and bought an axe and let's go chop all this wood down. I really need an area that's not decorated full of trees just so I can get this stuff because it's so hard to work around getting wood when there's so many objects and things in the way. Oh, well I won't be getting too much wood apparently, thank you. Okay, luckily I do have enough wood for all the stuff that I wanted to make, so I'm gonna make a few signposts I think. Maybe I'll make, yeah, I'll make a birdhouse. Also, this little wash tub, I think that could be really cute if we just like plonk it around, you know? Little extra details every everywhere, that's like the theme of the video. So theme of today, day 19, is the extra little details. And we need a lot of little DIYs to do that. I was thinking about areas that we haven't done yet, and I've been leading this path down here, and there's this awkward little area here which I'm not sure what I want to do with but I think I want to prep it so I can do something with it in the future and that means we're going to move some trees around I think I'm going to plant some trees as well maybe put a little bit of custom pathing down because I want to start it off and help ourselves out you know so maybe I'll put will a tree grow there I'm not sure here's a bush I can put a bush there and do I want to put a little sapling here? I think so. I think it could look cute. Maybe we'll do it stunted. We could put like a little fruit tree next to it to stunt it. And I'm keeping the long weeds because I want the long weeds within these builds. And you can't grow them properly. You have to like just leave them there if they're there, you know? I'm going to add this custom design path down and then I suppose that's all I'm going to have to do with this space because I don't have an idea for it like to finish it but it's good to get it started at least I think now that I have my wooding wooding wooden little plank custom design path code I want to add all of my little custom designs in like the little spaces that I have from making these like paths on the floor because I feel like the extra space needs to be filled and it looks so cute like why are these like they're just perfect chef's kiss i think the last thing i want to do today is prep this area by the campsite as well we've got this massive space that everything needs organized so i'm going to do that and yeah i feel like i'm very much ready for this challenge to get oh thank you shovel to get underway to get towards finishing i'm gonna have to do a lot more in the last like what 10 days 11 days that we have but it's gonna be so worth it but in the next few months I'm very excited to do non Animal Crossing stuff you know I think I'm gonna have to have a little break from Animal Crossing even though I've absolutely loved doing all of this it's really brought some love back into the game but I'm ready to do some like I've got so much vlog footage actually that I need to edit like so much vlog footage and I want to do some reading vlogs and videos on some of my favourite books that I've read recently, like Fourth Wing. Obsessed with that book, finished it yesterday and I can't get those characters out of my head. I don't know, there's just something about it. 
So I've been prepping this area and I'm just adding a few little custom designs. I don't know what I want to do with like the whole area so I don't think I want to put a big path in the middle. I don't know if I want to do like a splodge. So yeah, I think we're going to have to leave it at this for now. Okay, so today we're saying goodbye to Peanut. She is finally leaving after we got her thought bubble yesterday, which is a great time. But I think I'm going to leave the villager hunt to tomorrow. And I'm going to continue collecting Nook Miles and getting some little things done. Because I really want to stream the villager hunt, but I just didn't feel like streaming today. Um, because I wanted to look after myself. I wanted to do some hobbies. I want to do some self-care. You know, it's, it's the best for your mental health, looking after yourself. And I hope you guys have been looking after yourselves too. Again today, I need to continue getting more balloons so we can get more decor for the island, more items, more recipes. I also need to collect all the mushrooms that's gonna be on the island and decorate the little empty areas with whatever I have. And it's looking pretty good so far. I'm very happy with how this area is turning out. I just need to add like the little finishing details I want to add some fence later on and we got a picnic basket in this which is perfect because I'm just going to use that to decorate. I'm just going to use it to put it in this little foresty area on the walk up to the farm core area and I'm kind of obsessed with how this looks so far. I'm loving it, I really am. And the mushroom area is going to be great now that we have a lot of things to finish off the little farm. Um, like these ram mushrooms that we've just picked up and hopefully I should get some more of those tall mushrooms and those like kind of like chunky ones I don't know now I'm gonna look for my bottle on the beach because we need to continue getting more recipes and things and I think later on I will be crafting a lot so we can add little craftable crafted items to our builds. Here it is. Okay, brilliant. What have we got in our message in a bottle? A wooden table mirror, which we already know. Thanks. Leaf is here on the island, which is always the best time. And because we are doing meadow coal, I need more flowers. And of course, leaf is gonna be the best way to get these flowers. So I'm gonna buy a lot. So I can plant them in the little areas where we haven't got much decor around the forest area, in the campsite area, because we want it to feel like a meadow. And of course, I need to check Nook's Cranny today to see what is on sale. We have this vintage looking music player, the little phonograph, and even though it's expensive, I think we'll get it. It's just something extra that will work in our little builds. And we got some Nook Miles for that, which is a brilliant time. So I'm gonna put all these flowers around in the areas that I think need it. I think I'm gonna keep this rock here as well because it looks really cute in this like little natural area near Airball Sisters. I think it's adorable. And I just wanna chat to you about some things. So today I actually had some exciting things arrive and I'm getting into a new hobby. Now, if you've watched my channel's uh, vlogs, before you'll know that I'm into a lot of cozy hobbies and now I'm gonna get into like bead jewelry and I've only been recently seeing this pop up as like a cozy hobby I suppose recently I've seen a lot of Pinterest pictures I've seen people making these gorgeous like chokers and necklaces and bracelets and rings and I want in on it I would love to give it a go so i've been making a little necklace at the minute maybe a bracelet i'm not sure where it's like little daisies and i've got like lilac beads and some white beads and it looks so pretty so far but oh my goodness it's, it's so finicky you really need to have like steady hands i don't have like one of the bead needles for those who do beading um i've only been using like my hands and it is so difficult to string these beads the way you want them to string. It is so frustrating, but I know for a fact it's gonna be so worth it when I actually get something like finished out of it. But, oh my goodness, it's frustrating. Um, I'm excited to make some things though, and I got some 
Like, I used to have beads when I was younger and I used to make a lot of jewellery. I had like a full-on jewellery making kit in like a toolbox and I was gifted so many things for birthdays and Christmases because I was just so interested in jewellery making as a kid and I bought some beads to like kind of go back to my childhood self and you know enjoy that hobby again and I, I got these like pink and iridescent stars hearts and like kind of pearly beads and they're so cute and I really can't wait to make some like 2000s style bracelets or even phone charms like what I used to when I was a kid it's it's gonna be so much fun I've also been reading a lot recently which has been a really fun time I recently finished Before the Coffee Gets Cold and I finished Fourth Wing and I read Fourth Wing as an audiobook which was the best time and I had the book for Before the Coffee Gets Cold and I was expecting more from Before the Coffee Gets Cold but I did really enjoy it I definitely enjoyed it but I was expecting just a little bit more in depth to the stories because I was fa I found like after each story I was like but now what you know you were kind of left hanging on the end of the story and then with Fourth Wing that was the most perfect book I've ever read in my entire life and oh my god how is anything gonna top that I love fantasy romance books and this book had the perfect amount of fantasy and romance and it had dragons in it and I was just having the time of my life listening to this and I could not put it down I needed to listen to more and more and more and it got in the way of work and it got in the way of my life but I would do it all again especially with all audio the audiobooks I'm so happy that I've discovered audiobooks because I get to do things while reading while listening to this book it helps so much and I can do my hobbies while doing my work if it's not like doing voiceovers and you know other stuff like that but it's a great time um but you've been seeing me work on the island a little bit i've been working on the able sisters area i've been ordering my wheat fields doing all that good stuff and then i got the shopping app on my nook phone which i didn't realize i ordered that many things but apparently i have so i can start ordering from the app but i don't know whether it's worth it or not because i still want to get those nook miles from the abd so we'll have to see about that but we did get Nook Miles for this as well. And we, we've got a lot of Nook Miles. We're going to have a pretty good hunt ahead of us, I think. 21,000 miles there is going to do us so well. And I wanted to go around that island and plant some more pumpkins. Put that orange kind of, like, colour, I suppose, around the island. And make it a bit more cuter, a bit more vibrant, you know? Um, because I need it to be more autumnal it's very spring at the minute i feel if i didn't have all the pumpkins everywhere so i really want to like pull it into the autumnal aesthetic that we're looking for i suppose also with this cafe i'm still adding little items around that i think i could use here i don't know how it's gonna look yet because i don't have a lot of things but that's okay that's okay still adding the pumpkins around and I think, especially at this time of day, I think I'm gonna have to put the dream address at golden hour because look at how pretty the island looks in this light. I'm obsessed. I don't know, it's just, it's gorgeous. I'm just decorating these areas with more embellishments like weeds and pumpkins and things because it does look empty and I need to do more in those areas. I'm a silly sausage, you saw me decorating next to Nook's cranny, that little extra area over there. This is next to the Able Sisters. And I have an idea for this build and it's going to look really cute. I'm very excited for it. Um, I want to do like an outdoor area where they kind of display some clothes. And it, like, I want to kind of just make it cute and autumnal with the mannequins with the clothes on it, a clothes line, some socks on the floor and then I don't know if I want the fishing area there, I've put like a little fishing rod there but I might do that elsewhere because um, I don't think it really fits in but I'm gonna leave it there for now 
So I'm just gonna do all the custom pathing. It takes so long, but that's okay. That's okay, you know? Um, so more things I wanna talk about. I am also reading. In my dreams, I hold a knife. I've just started it last night. And the first sentence brought me in so good. Like, I love books that start off so strong with their first sentence, just like Fourth Wing. Like, I think it was like, a dragon without their rider is a tragedy, a rider without their dragon is dead, something like that. And like, if that doesn't make you want to read the rest of the book, I don't know what does. Like, <laughs> it was so good. Um, but this book, In My Dreams I Hold a Knife, I'm very excited for it to be like, um, If We Were Villains. I read that this time last year and I was obsessed with that book. It was so good. It broke me in all the best ways. And I'm just hoping that this is going to be similar, like the, the Dark Academia vibes, the murder mystery that's going on, stuff like that. So I'm, I'm excited to see how that goes, but nothing so far. I haven't gotten very far in, I think I'm like five pages in or something because I'm also reading The Bone Shard Daughter, which I'm halfway through, and then the third book in the Bridge Kingdom series I'm listening to, and then I'm also listening to another one, which I can't remember what it's called, like City of Thorns or something. I'm feeling so scatterbrained at the minute. I need to do everything at once, and I can't do everything at once. It's, it's such a struggle, it really is. And I, I imagine that a lot of you can, can relate to being scatterbrained with trying to do everything you want at once, but that's how I'm feeling at the minute. I've added some little, little things to the area over here, added a little lacy parasol, all the good stuff, and then I was looking for the villager for the DIY, and Freckles, the little cutie, was crafting, so I needed to find out. And we got small cardboard boxes, and I'm not sure how I'll use those, but maybe I could put some cardboard boxes near Nook's Cranny and have it like as overflowing stock just to fill little areas. That could work. So, you know, I'll, I might do that. I need to get a lot of items to finish off this area, but of course I need to put down some wheat fields to make it look super pretty because a uh, build without wheat fields doesn't look as good on my island, so I've got to do it. Um, and I need to probably grab some DIYs. I need to make some things, so let's go do that. I'm gonna craft quite a few items, and I, I got loads of wood, so we can make a clothesline. And I'm not sure if I'll make the other things now, but definitely the clothesline for now. That is one of the main items we're gonna use for this build. Okay, here we are. Let's put the clothesline down. I'm gonna move these socks first and put this down. And I wanna push it in between the bush and the wheat field because I think that'll make it look the best there. And this is really awkward. Okay, hold on. Let me, let me move it. Let me move it. And pull it out. There we go. And hopefully it'll just slot in. Perfect. Look at that. And then I'm gonna put the socks back down because how cute are socks on the floor? They're such an underrated item for decor. Like, I don't know, there's just something about it. Okay, now it's time to craft a bunch of stuff. Now I'm thinking a bunch of log stakes because they work really well, just dotted around in the natural areas and it, it doesn't take too much wood to make. I thought I should pop into the Able Sisters and see what they have available and they've got this really cute like little pinafore skirt and then I think that's all I want but I could definitely use that in one of the builds, put it on the mannequin and it'll look super cute. Okay Blathers, I need to give you a bunch of fossils to assess and hopefully you're gonna get us that left megaloside or at least something that we can use. Let's have a little look. Look at all these fossils. I've got so many. You can assess these for me. Okay, let's go through them all. We've got the right megaloside, unfortunately. And then we have this thing. What is this? Um, 
Is what? <laughs> Tell me that is not poop. That is okay. Let's move on. Um, I think I'm gonna go sell all of these fossils, but first I want to move this tree. This tree's been really bugging me, and it just it doesn't fit in here. It's blocking the orchard. I want to put a little stunted tree here, I think. And I was meant to find something to do with this piano. But I think it kind of looks really cute where it is. I really do. So I think I'm going to leave it there and make it like a part of the decor. Okay, I'm going to sell all of these. Let's see how much I can get for them. How much have you got for me, Timmy? 30,000 miles is pretty good for a piece of poop, if you ask me. Okay, I just quickly went round and did a bunch of Nook Miles things just to get us get going a little bit more. So, watered some flowers and plants, talked to neighbours, planted some stuff. And now, let us finish off this little build here. Look how cute that is. I think that's adorable. I'm not sure if I like the grey, but it works for now. And then I've got this acorn hat, which I thought could be really cute, like placed as an item. And it does look a little bit sus, but I think I'm going to keep it there. I think outside of Able Sisters is where it needs to be. I also have this really cute hat here, which would look really cute next to the picnic. Look at how pretty that is. It's perfect. Thinking about the bug cafe that I want to do, which is inspired by another Twitch streamer called Emmy Moo. Kind of obsessed, but we're going to pick, like, pick, catch some bugs. Oh, we're not gonna catch some bugs. Okay, thank you. Let me go put them on the beach for now then, if I'm not gonna continue, because I can't be bothered to go get another net, so I'm just gonna place them down here. We're gonna have a little bug beach. So I wanna make some fences. We've just made a hay bed, but I wanna make some fences because I love how they look when they're like dotted around. So I'm gonna do that. And then we've got that stacked firewood which I could definitely use just everywhere and anywhere. And then there's also the signpost that I could use and then maybe a couple more watering cans. I feel like that would be really useful. Now, today I didn't get too much done. I was more focused on all the in-betweens and I feel like it was the same yesterday, but I really wanted to save the villager hunt until on stream tomorrow, so I'm still just going around filling in all of the little empty areas and these bits are important, you know, like I could leave them to the last minute and things but I would probably forget and then we'd just have awkward empty areas by the time I got finished to actually, well around to finishing the actual island. I definitely think that getting all this stuff done early is going to save me in the long run, it's going to save me time and things even if like it takes so long to do these like little bits of like putting the fence down, putting little custom codes on the floor, putting wheat fields in areas where they fit and crafting all these like extra items but I think these the little bits make an island you know people notice the little things at least I do and so it's important that the little bits are, are cute and and work well with the theme so I'm glad I'm putting a lot of effort into them you know so I'm just adding in a few more little bits, as I've said, around the firewood. I've got some log stakes, signposts, and I also need to plant some more flowers around, but I don't have any of those at the minute. Um, I need to keep buying, I need to buy way more when leaf arrives on the island because I keep buying like 10 of each flower and that's just not enough for an island that's gonna be absolutely covered in flowers. I need more, you know? Oh, here's a balloon. Let's let's see what this is. Did you just hear my cat scream at me? You probably didn't, but she just screamed at me. She was like, hello? What is this present? Let's see. It is a toy box. I'll probably end up selling that. I actually really want to pick up some items that we have and just sell them. I'm going to chop this tree down, actually. It's in the way. I want a stump. Look at that. Look how much better that looks. Right, I'm going to put the signpost here. I remember, I don't know if it's just me, but I thought you could have signposts on a diagonal. Like, pointing diagonal. But like, apparently not. It won't let me put it diagonally. 
and that really upsets me. <laughs> I really want to have the, the signpost just like a little diagonal pointing instead of like just one way. I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna buy a lot more flowers and things. As I said, I need so many more flowers for this island and I don't know why I didn't go to Leaf because Leaf is on the island but here we are now. There he is, look at Leaf. I've just bought flowers from his competitors. This makes no sense. No sense at all. But I'm just gonna plop everything down. Picasso's here. Say hi, Picasso. No? Okay, she's on my lap. She's been a little cutie and she's on my lap. And I think in these areas, I there's not much room for more trees. So I'm thinking of just making a lot more flower areas to pull in the metal core aesthetic, you know? And we have another balloon. It's so good when you're working in an area where balloons come often because then you get loads of little presents. Especially a window display stand, which is definitely gonna fit in on a natural island. <laughs> okay, I wanna sell just a bunch of items that I know I'm not gonna use. We've got like a million essay sets. We've got life rings, like loads of stuff that just will not fit on the island and just, I won't get around to use them, so. Let's see how much these will sell for. I literally bought that phonograph and I've accidentally sold it, which really upset me, but you know. I, yeah, that really upset me, to be honest. It was 53,000 pounds or something, pounds, bells, and I let it go, like a silly billy, because I thought it was something else. But I suppose it'll show up in the future. And I thought to finish off the day we could go on a Captain Island tour just to get some bushes, some flowers, whatever else is on the island, maybe a message in a bottle, all of that good stuff and just see, see what we can get. Oh, I managed to get some Nook Miles, which is great. I mean, it's only 200, but like 200 back that I've just spent. Hopefully this is worth it though. I'm gonna grab all of these coconuts so we can make some money. And I found my recipe in the bottle over here, which was great. And I decided that I'll take all of these weeds and the pumpkins and things because they'll, they'll come in useful at some point. And I'm also going to grab the yellow and the white flowers on this island. Hello there, everyone. Right now on Applesauce, it is November 9th. And we have a campsite villager. It's open. Look. Oh my goodness. Do I have apples? I have one. I'll stunt this one then. Let's put it here. Wow. Is that a fully grown tree? Are you fully grown, sir? I think that's actually fully grown. I think I'm just being a silly sausage. <gasps> and Flick's here. Hello, Flick. We need to work on getting um, bug models from Flick, so I can't forget to do that today. So there's not much that has changed, but it's just like little areas that have. Like I did this picnic over here with all these pumpkins that I've grown, and then all these trees and stuff, things like this. Mushroom garden, isn't it so cute? I love my little mushroom farm so much. It's not fully finished, but Oh, I made these little wooden planks. It took, oh my god, so long. Oh, we have a campsite villager. Should we see who that is? Right, let's see who this is. Because if it's someone cute, we could always... Oh, you're very, very close to me. Hi, bye. I'm gonna empty my inventory and we're gonna go villager hunting. That is today's agenda. Right, we need to go get some tickets as well. Let me go check if I have any tickets in my um storage already though. Right, do I have Nook Mile ticket? No. I don't. That's fine. I think I have around 20,000 look miles. So, a lot, you know? Do I have any here? Oh, I do. How many is that? One. Okay. Yeah, we've got almost 22,000. Almost. Redeem look miles. We'll start off with two and then see what we get out of that. We'll do two at a time. I feel like that's probably the best. Wait a sec. <laughs> oh, we have another ticket we can get. Perfect. I want someone cute, someone autumnal, someone perfect for the island and you Orville with Wilbur will take me there. We can do this. It's gonna be a great time. Right, who is here? Oh my god. I see a pig. Look at her! Carla would be so perfect for a little farm core island. She's cute. She's definitely a cutie. She's so cute. For a sec I thought it was gonna be curly and I was gonna be like, oh my god. <laughs> Not autumnal in the slightest. But I used to watch, um, what was it called? Buzzfeed? 
It was Ryan and Shane. What did they used to do? And now they have their own channel called like The Watcher or something like that. Or Watcher. What was it? Unsolved. Unsolved, I think. I'm gonna grab these to sell. Ryan and Shane. They're, they are the dynamic duo. Buzzfeed Unsolved. Yeah. I'm just going blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, blah, blah. No idea who you're talking about. <gasps> You've never watched Buzzfeed Unsolved. It is so good. I'm definitely Ryan. For context, Shane and Ryan go ghost hunting. And Shane doesn't believe in ghosts, whereas Ryan does. It's a very good balance, you know? And they go demon hunting at some point as well. Also flicks on the island so we can sell all the wasps that we get. Right. Cool beans, thank you. Manifest a cutie. Hopefully it is a cutie. <gasps> it's bones, it's bones, it's bones, it's bones. Do I take bones? It's literally two tickets in. I saved up so many nook miles for this hunt. Oh my god. Do you have to take bones, do you reckon? Bones is such a cutie and pretty full in your opinion. Where do you go? Bones? Hi. Hello, you little cute- Oh! No! Don't do that! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Bones. Oh, I'm gonna invite Bones because Bones is so cute. Bones should be on every island. I agree. You wanna move? Yeah. That was the shortest villager hunt ever. That is wild. Spell applesauce with just is. It spells ah. I mean, you're not wrong. The lazy villagers are so cute. I think normals and lazies are my faves. They're just some of the best ones. <gasps> my item. Oh, we got our wasp. We got our item. Um, is there no bottle on the beach? Nope. Let's go home. We found the perfect little cutie for our island. It was this, the shortest villager hunt I've ever had in my life. Two tickets and both of them were cuties? What? I don't go after villagers for their personality types. I know you can get like all of the Norma bestie. Hello? Can a moving bubble happen when you have someone already moved out? Might be a non-moving bubble. Yeah, it could be. Hello. Maybe wants to sell something or a gift. That's true. Okay, you got a problem. A wrestler uniform? Norma. You think I want a wrestler uniform? Please. Please, bestie. Like, what? Right, so our map. So I was looking at our map yesterday. I was like, okay, who do we want to stay here? The, the finished island i think we need to get rid of scoot and i haven't really spoken to scoot but he's not autumnal you know he's so cute not scoot he is a little cutie isn't he looks like he's wearing underwear on his head it does yeah he's got his little helmet that looks like underwear but he's just not autumnal for the island you know and then shub maybe like if he asked to go probably a yes and honestly i really like ruby but i hate ruby's house the inside of ruby's house I just, it hurts my head. So if any of them three asked to go, I would say okay. But I also wouldn't be mad. It's very, my island is autumnal meadow core. And Scoot is very spring, I would say. Very spring or summer. Ooh, a balloon. Oh, it's over the water already. Ruby's our farmer. The outside of the house, absolutely gorgeous. This is perfect for this area. But like, look, it's so loud. Can I turn you off? No, okay. What are you crafting, my love? What are you crafting? A cherry lamp. Okay, thank you. I, I don't have cherries. I can't get cherries, but thank you. I love that Ruby wears a shirt of her own face. That's my favorite thing about Ruby. It's just so brilliant. I wish I could wear a shirt of my own face. Right, let's go find Flick. We have bugs. We have bugs. And I need to catch more butterflies, actually. Let's catch this one. Wow. Do I have bugs here? No, it's on the other beach. Okay, um, excuse me. What if I didn't do the beaches? What then? What if I just didn't? I don't have any other wasps. Are all the bugs I have? Okay. Oh, we got three of them. I'm gonna have the autumnal colored one, I think, for the model. And then I'll save the other three. Let me put these here for the next time Flick is here. Flick is down here. Hi! I do remember you. Can I get a commission, please? Yep. Commissions! Monarch butterfly. Thank you. And then I'll sell you my wasps and my other butterfly. Um, okay, I have those to sell. How much are you gonna give me, Flick? That's the question. 7,000, that's okay. Three bugs for 7,000? Thanks, bye. Ooh, what did we do? Is that because we got, oh no, it's this. I suppose, I'm gonna water my flowers. Right, I want a wheat field here. That's not a wheat field. This is. And then, okay, wait, I can put a mushroom here. This is where I wanna, wanna put my skinny mushroom. Wow, we only need these ones now. And then that'll be like fully done. I was gonna do something. I'm gonna order my wheat fields. Right, I'm gonna order all of the wheat fields. Wait, and I wanna order these ones as well. 
Oh, why can't you order just like a billion? Why is it five a day? Um, it's just so silly. I don't understand. I also need my bottle, message in a bottle on the beach. <gasps> and this. Give me this. Oh, wait. I'm going to wait until we're in the middle because I don't want it to get eaten up by all of the items in the way. We've got so many items on this island that I've been shooting down balloons and then they're disappearing because they land on like an item, which has been very upsetting. What is in here? A mush lamp? <gasps> Wait a sec, is it the tall ones? It is! Okay, we need to find all the skinny mushrooms, except the ones that I've used. I'm so excited. Right, let's see. <gasps> oh, it's one of these barrels as well. I want to use that in like a restaurant -y area. The main places that we have space on the island that needs to be decorated is mostly on the cliffs and things. We have spare space here. Mushrooms mine which we need to fill up and then space here that needs to be filled up we need to move this house scoot's house is up there actually i need to speak to scoot is he in the house where would scoot be if you were scoot if i was scoot i suppose i'd be scooting about wouldn't i i don't know where he can go he doesn't have much room to to work with i also i thought i kind of want a bridge i don't know where it would fit like it might fit here i think that's the only place we're gonna be able to fit a bridge so i might do that now so we can start decorating this area where scoot is Ooh, another one of these why are there always the mushrooms that you don't need that there's loads of it's a bit silly if you ask me doesn't make much sense let me go get a bridge um i'm just gonna use the normal bridges i suppose actually no i think i might do the suspension bridge the cheaper bridge that works for the campsite area you know okay hello how do let's talk about infrastructure and we're just such inclines let's build a bridge amazing and i just want this suspension bridge i think that'll work i think it'll look cute amazing thank you is there anything in here that i want maybe accessory stand but yes we've got a lot to do and the island's gonna look super cute right and we've got back here to do as well i always find like around resident services so difficult to decorate i don't know there's just something about it this is difficult let's go up here and put the bridge down also here is like where i want the cafe but we haven't got many items for a cafe yet so i'm just holding out on hope that we're gonna get some right a bridge yes let me imagine it i think that works i think that's gonna look cute there do i have any mm, not a lot 129,000 bells well let me put 20,000 in for now also, I want to do a lot of time traveling today, but that means I want to get rid of all of these flowers that I just don't want on the island. All these roses, so I'm going to start. That was a great start, wasn't it? Right, I need to sell some things. Let's do that, I suppose. We need to put more inclines in places as well. Hi, what are we selling in here? I don't think anything in here uh, is something that I want, to be honest. I want to sell all of these and the coconuts and the desk mirror because we've got so many. The wrestler uniform and the wasp nest. Before we time travel, I need, need to pay off the bridge. That's one one thing I don't want to time travel without doing. Let me get this. The time travel and we'll get rid of all the holes, which is a good time. And I'm going to get rid of this rock because I still want a rock to show up at our museum area. We've got a lot of island that it could show up in. That's the problem. But, oh, I don't have anything to eat. Never mind. I've got nothing to eat. I wonder if I've got any trees that I need to stunt as well. That could be a possibility. Cause I'm just planting trees willy nilly all the time now. Like that one, that one needs stunting. Let me get some oranges. They're good money, but also I need them right now. And more. There we are. I'm gonna stunt this tree this small. I think it works well. It's gonna be a tiny little baby tree. That one I want to grow more. This one, I need to stunt. Right, I think that's everything stunted and stuff. Let's get some money out of our savings so we can build the bridge. That is a good idea. Hello. Right. I don't know how much we've got in our savings, but I'm pretty sure yesterday I kept putting stuff in. Not a lot. Let's see. I'm going to have to withdraw all of it. I don't think we have enough still. Let's have a look. Okay. I'm running. Let's go have a look if this will work. Hi. How much did we put in? Like 20,000? We're just under actually, so maybe I could sell the peaches and then have enough. I'm not sure. Will it sell for like 8,000? I don't know. Let's have a look. Actually, you know what I could do? I'm gonna go pick all of my veg, I think, from the farm area because that gives you so much money. 
so we may as well do that because we have so many look at these bad boys we're gonna be rich and it's gonna be the best time all of these we're gonna grab every last one oh we'll be done what do i do oh my goodness we have that was two thousand oh my goodness we've picked so many uh veggies i suppose i'm gonna sell all these how much is this gonna give us okay let me sell these Thirty-five thousand. great and scoot i need to say hello is, is that it i can't speak to him anymore right let's um give all of this we are paying this bridge off thank you hello there everyone it's november 10th and bones is moving in oh we got the butterfly model amazing we can start on our book cafe which is great looks cranny do i have any oranges i do we can stunt this tree now let me do this put an orange here a present for me painter's coverall look how cute that is so cute oh my god i'm gonna make work i think start working on scoot's house i feel like that's the place i want to work on at the minute i don't have many ideas and it's a very small area but that's fine first things first get rid of the roses we don't want roses there's that oh yeah there's all these oh the one place where a flower wasn't of course i did that I'm going to keep the long weeds because I need to use the long weeds in these builds because they look so cute. Right, I need three more. I don't know what I want to decorate this area with yet, but it'll come to me. I can do the basics, you know, like getting rid of the roses. And I need to buy some ones, some saplings so we can stunt trees. Oh, what am I doing? Thank you. And these ones. That should be enough. And then some saplings as well. I'm just gonna get like the um not pine trees or whatever they're called, cedar tree. I don't know. The hardwood trees. I'm gonna get those. The ones that are round, <laughs> not pointy. This island is definitely coming together, which is very exciting. Hi, Scoot. Let me grab the weeds that I don't want around. I do wanna keep the big ones. I'm gonna have to be careful and let me move this tree i'm gonna move it to can i plant it here i can indeed okay that works there i'm gonna move this one and i think i'm gonna move this one as well we need some space to do something for his yard that's something i have not discovered yet but i will i'm gonna put a tree here i'm gonna put a sapling here and then i don't know i could do another one here I suppose. Yeah. Because we, we want up here to be quite overgrown, I would say. Sapling there. Let me put another one here. This works. And let's open up our island designer. Let's do it. Amazing. I'm just going to custom path. I might put some of the normal dirt around as well. I need some fences. What are we doing after the 30 days? Are you taking a break from Animal Crossing? I am indeed. A nice break from Animal Crossing is what I need. <laughs> I've really enjoyed the challenge though. It's been so fun to see what we can do in 30 days as well. I feel like we've done so much and it's only been 21, but we've got a lot a lot to do as well. But yes, I have some new games scheduled that I got gifted. I got gifted um, Potion Permit and I got gifted Sprout Valley. So we need to play those in October. And I'm very, very excited, especially for Potion Permit. Okay, let's keep going. Oh my god, please. I swear this game doesn't make sense most of the time. It really doesn't. And let's do these for, hopefully, it'll go on better than it did in the other ones. There we are. Right, this works. Then, you know what I have that makes these builds, we feel. Oh my god, it's already so much better. I don't know how it does it. It just do be better. Let's put one here. I've also got that butterfly model for like... What am I trying to say? The bug cafe. Yes. I know what I'm trying to say. It's fine. One here. Let me do the little circly bits. Let's play on ground. You know what I might do here? My little wooden bit. Wait. Look how cute this will be. No. Oh my goodness. Look at this. This is so cute. Right. Oh my god. This works so well. Wow. Let me do this. And then we can have... What am I doing? This one? Then uh, this one? Amazing. Let's decorate Cherry's yard. <laughs> Get the base of Cherry's yard done. Just like we did with Scoot's. 
We're just gonna move some things around and make it so we are ready to do a build here when we need to be. Right, I'm gonna put... Nope. Actually, I think I want a stunted tree here. Let me plant a sapling. That is not where I asked you to be, is it? What a silly sausage. I want it to go there. Here it is. I'm gonna have to remember to stunt these. And then, I don't know if I can plant a tree here, but I really love one here. I really love a tree. <gasps> it's perfect. And then those ones, I kind of like being there. I think... Can I plant one behind or not? No. That's fine, I suppose. We have a little lake here, so I'm thinking of doing a little fishing area. If we did, like, some wood here. I'm just gonna put the path around. I'm just gonna, like, wiggly wobbly it around. I think a big thing that's gonna help pull these builds together, the little templates, I suppose, is definitely gonna be making some fences. Because fences just make everything look pretty. I don't know. I do need to get more wood if I want to do that, though. And let's put this path down. Not there. What a silly sausage. Yeah, so what I need now is fences and flowers. We use all the flowers up at Scoot's area, so we're definitely going to have to get some more. Let me just put these around as well. I definitely think I want to do a little fishing area here. I think it would be super cute. Maybe an incline? I don't think an incline will fit there, though. I don't think so. Then we've got round here, all the way to the campsite. Yeah. Ooh, I need to stunt these trees. You know what? I'll get all of the mums that I like in the colours that I like. And then I'm going to get all of the cosmos that I like. So white. White and yellow. White and yellow works. Let me just put stuff around, I suppose. All the flowers. All the good stuff. The amount of flowers I'm using on this island is crazy beans. But you know, I suppose that's what you need to do when you do meadow call. I'm only going to plant that one. I also just need more decorative stuff that's like natural. I don't even know how we're going to do that, but it's fine. Um, I think the very top I'm not going to make accessible. I'm just going to have it filled with trees and flowers. Just to make it a little easier. We've got other builds that we're doing. We've got things that's going on. We don't need to make it harder on ourselves by trying to decorate the, the top bits of the island. That would be torture. Right, I want to check over here if there's any trees that I need to stunt. Do you need stunted? You do. I need apples. Oh my god, look at Shub. That one's stunted. Okay. Maybe I'll move this one. Right, I don't know what I'd want to do here. What if I did just another, like... Is it silly if I do another, like, pumpkin patch? Like, farm area? I feel like that would go well, though. Oh my god, Norma is so happy. Norma and Shub dating? Confirmed? Maybe. What will I do? I mean, there's so, so many options. Right, let me do this. How long did it take you to get your island to look like this? We're on day 21. 21 days, but I have been time traveling. But we're not using online or terraforming. Yeah. I've been playing every day for hours, which has been really fun to be fair. Oh, no, I don't want that there. Let me do... There we go. That's our pumpkin patch. I don't currently have lots of pumpkins to plant, but I have one. What would I do without pumpkins? This is the question. Will that be enough? Maybe. Okay, all of these. Where's my other pumpkins? I'm right next to it. It's just blending in. Let me put these two there. And then another one here. I forgot I could, like, actually just use and drop one as well. Use my little leaves that I did. Um, okay. I was about to water my flowers. It's literally raining. Make it make sense. I'm gonna craft some fences. Did I have something? Fences! That's what I wanted to do. It's the difference between a crazy chicken and, say, a crazy goat. One's a chicken and one's a goat. That is the difference, I suppose. Doink! And then let me put some fence over this side. Why does it just make it so much better? Same with the wheat field. If I had a couple wheat fields around here, this would be done. This wouldn't need any, any more. Couple fences here. That's not where I wanted you to go. This is working. We're doing good. There's lots of things that we're getting done today, which is the best time. Right, I'm going to display all this on the ground and it's going to look weird. Right, I have my little circle. Display. Okay, let's see. I think this looks weird. I might move this because I don't want it there. Okay. 
Let me do this. The rain is so nice though. Let's get this done. I'm just gonna do most of the custom pathing areas so we can like prepare. No, please don't do that. So that we can prepare for the future builds. I feel like that is a good idea. I'm gonna put this rain it makes me feel so happy. I don't know why it, like it's because it's like sunny. It's like a little bit sunny while it's raining in the in the game and like it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Eat apple. I actually think I want to move this tree. I did just put it there but I want to move it. Let me eat both of these. There we go. Thank you. And I'm gonna put one. Nope. Stand here and do a shovel. There we go. What? I should be able to plant there. That's a little bit rude. I can plant next to it, I suppose. There we are. And then I'm gonna plant a sapling here. It's day 22 and we are getting there with the island. I sold some things in the drop-off box yesterday, obviously, as we've got some bells from Timmy and Tommy. And I also ordered my wheat fields, so I'm gonna collect all these bad boys. Okay, well, I need to actually empty my pockets. Let's put some wheat fields around first and empty the pockets that way and decorate a little bit as we go. And we made some little transition areas and preliminary areas for decorating yesterday. So I, I prepared areas for future builds, which I do need to have a little think about what the yards are gonna look like, what those areas are gonna look like, because we don't have a lot of items. So it's gonna be difficult. Like Scoot's yard, look how cute it looks. But what items do I have to elevate these builds and make them into actual builds? So let's see what Nux has and nothing of use, I don't think. I don't think anything here is going to be very useful for any of our builds. Oh my god. So I'm going to go around and collect all of my fossils and I want to speak to Scoot because I want to make it so we have enough friendship levels with him so he will actually ask, ask to leave at some point. Hopefully, we'll see though. We don't have long left to kick him out and then I think I'll also go around and stunt the trees that need to be stunted. We have a few and I'm gonna plant some pumpkins here and there and you know add some more decor to the places that are just kind of missing it in these little builds. And like I said yesterday, I think the pumpkins will really bring everything together with the orange tones and just make it a lot more autumnal and hopefully it'll bring everything together. Same with like the green ones and things, just adding in the, the little naturey bits. And I don't know, I think it'll add a little more. I'm so glad we have some of these tall weeds in some of our builds because you can't actually like decide where they grow. They kind of grow on their own and there's like a maximum amount you can have on the island at any one time or something like that. I was looking into it. There's lots of little things I'll be doing today, collecting the apples I need, stunting the trees I need to stunt, adding in custom designs where I need to add custom designs, all that good stuff. And yeah, I also wanted to talk about, I'm starting a new hobby and did I, I don't know if I mentioned it yesterday, but I ordered some bead jewelry making things, just lots of beads basically. And so far I've made a necklace and half another necklace, a ring that kind of failed a little bit. It looks pretty, but I couldn't like join the ends together very well. And I've also made half another necklace as well. No, a bracelet. I made a bracelet and that looks nice. That looks nice. And I'm kind of obsessed. There's this thing like, I've been filming um, an autumn reset video where I like, I've been getting rid of old clothes that don't fit or that I don't wear anymore and I got rid of like three bags of that. I've been, you know, cleaning as if it's like spring cleaning but for like autumn and I'm filming a little vlog for that and I kind of forgot about it and then ended up buying more stuff for the house. <laughs> so I have this like little tub of beads now and I mean it's not that many things. Definitely fits in there. There's room for it especially with the stuff that I've gotten rid of. But it's just really funny that I go from like getting rid of things to getting more things. But I think that's kind of the way of life, isn't it? I suppose. But I'm really enjoying um, making these little bead jewelry things. And it's exciting to have like a new hobby, a new cozy hobby to get into. I've also been loving my reading, as you guys have heard throughout these episodes. And I am I think I'm like a minute off finishing one of my audiobooks today. 
which is the Bridge Kingdom book three audiobook I've been listening to. So I was just trying to order some um, wheat fields and I was broke and then I got these bells in a balloon and it it all worked out very swimmingly I suppose. And today I will need a lot of bells to keep trying to get like more wheat fields every time we time travel but also flowers are so expensive in this game like even if you buy it in bulk, it's 1,200 for five little measly flowers. That's a lot of money. It eats up your bells so quickly. So we're gonna have to focus on selling some things so we can get more flowers to decorate with. And I've just spent all of my bells on getting some here so we can decorate like just the little bits of the areas because we need the metal core to come into these builds. A lot of flowers need to be just everywhere so we can feel like we're in a literal meadow, like a flower field, and it's it's gonna look so good, I hope. Um, I don't have a lot of variety of flowers because we haven't had leaves that many times, and I should probably get them on Harvey's Island, but oh my god, look at us, planting so many flowers. 3,000 nook miles? Oh my goodness. But yes, I should probably get Harvey's Island, I should get um, Leaf on there because I've just been- I'm in need of bushes and I'm in need of flowers. I don't know why I didn't think of getting leaves before I got reds. I haven't even spoken to red on there yet. And I've opened it. What I might do tomorrow is go to reds and get some paintings actually. I've just thought that we can also upgrade our pockets, finally. I've been saving up my Nook Miles for the hunts, but I want to upgrade my pockets so we can have an extra line of inventory space and stop complaining about our inventory being full. And it's, it's just gonna be so good. I'm very happy that we finally have gotten around to this because I've been forgetting every single episode to actually do this. I spent some time getting some mushrooms. I went around and collected some mushrooms and made some mush lamps and some mush low stools I think they're called and I thought I should start dotting them round I want to include them in our whole island it's not fairy core cool, but I think the mushrooms fit in with the autumn kind of aesthetic and so I think they're gonna be like a really good accent and yeah I'm gonna sell some uh, items and clothing items that we're not using. I've decided that I may as well get rid of the stuff out of my storage and on the floor that I know I'm never going to use and actually get some bells out of it, you know? Even if it's not too many bells. I'm gonna get rid of these orange flowers. Well, not get rid of them, but move them because we want the orange flowers. That's what we're trying to breed the flowers for, the orange tulips. But I'm gonna put them on their own so they can kind of spread on their own and then there's more room for these red and yellow ones to like what's the word? Propagate? Is that breed? I don't know. One of those words. But these tulips are here on their own and I'm gonna water them and hopefully they spread. I was told by someone in the YouTube comments that I probably won't get a green mum from my purple flowers um, because like they have to have special genes and I have no idea what that means. But I'm gonna keep trying, we'll see if that happens, and if it doesn't, it's not the end of the world because green mums aren't autumnal anyway, you know, they're not one of those colours that are vital to the builds, I just really wanted to give it a go, and yeah. Okay, I'm gonna plant some more of these flowers about just so we can add a bit more into these builds, I suppose. Once they actually grow, it's gonna look so good. Like, all of this is just like little green planty bits at the minute, but once the flowers actually grow and bloom, this island's gonna be so full of all the autumnal colors and flowers and it's gonna look so pretty. Okay, so I had a little break from Animal Crossing during the day to stream. I streamed some Moonstone Island on YouTube, which was on YouTube, on Twitch, which was a great time, but I've time traveled, we're getting back into some Animal Crossing and I did sell some stuff. Yeah, I sold those flowers in the drop-off box and order my wheat fields, so let's let's collect those from my mailbox. I absolutely loved playing Moonstone Island. It was so exciting to have like my first um, game sponsorship on my Twitch channel, like a paid sponsorship, which is 
I'm just so grateful to Moonstone Island for allowing me to have that opportunity. I don't know, so exciting. And what's even better than enjoying the game as well? So earlier today, I found out that if you shake your trees, you have items on your island. You get items, like look at this. So I'm going around, I'm gonna shake all of my trees. I'm gonna pop this balloon in between and get that fossil. But I'm gonna shake all my trees, try and get the two items of the day, which would have been so helpful to know because we need all the items we can get. And I just haven't been doing it. I did it on the Nook Miles Islands, but apparently I just didn't know that you could do it on your actual island. And I also know there's, what, five wasps, is it, or something like that on the trees? So maybe we'll try and find those so we can keep them and sell them to Flick as well. So that's going to be part of our daily routine, I suppose. Shaking the trees to get the two items of the day and the five wasps. And here's one. Look at us go. Absolute slay. These wasps... Wops? <laughs> These wops can't get me. And you also get bells out of some of the trees as well, which... It's super helpful. It's not a lot of bells. It's like a hundred per time. And I found a rare mushroom, which is like the best thing ever. It's, it's a lot of money. But yeah, getting all my wasps, getting all the little bells, having a great time. And there's my second item of the day. And we have enough room in the inventory. And I'm gonna sell the items that I'm not gonna use. I feel like there's no point in hanging on to items that I have no idea if I'm going to use them. Well, basically, I mean, not even no idea. I know that I'm not going to use some of these things. So I'm going to sell the wasp nests, the rare mushroom, and some... I, I, I don't know whether to sell the other ones. So I'm going to keep the, the ones we got from the trees and see what it looks like. We've got a pull-up bar and something else. Okay, let me put my wheat fields around. We've got to decorate this island. It's going to be cute. This area around cherries is actually looking adorable. I'm kind of loving it. I might give her her own garden. Maybe we'll do like a little diagonal flower field or something for her. That's an idea. And I'm gonna put all my fossils here. We got so many. I'm gonna whack my rocks because I need some more clay so we can get more mush lamps. We need so much clay for those. I think it's five clay per mush lamp. So I'm gonna have to start whacking my rocks again even though we don't need any of the other things. We've got like a billion pieces of iron and stone. And I found my message in a bottle. And what have we got? What did you give us, Mira? Something we already know. And of course, I need to get more flowers. It's just such a necessary thing at the minute. Like, it's just, I need so many flowers to fill the island and it costs so much money, but Adding them around, it is really making the island look super cute. I love these orange windflowers as well. I really want to get some more of those when Leaf comes, if he's selling them. So I think that's going to be like one that's going to tie everything together, especially like any of the orange flowers, actually. We don't have many orange flowers. I haven't bred many. I should probably try and breed the hyacinths to get orange ones because they're gorgeous as well. But I just haven't done that I, sh I don't know do I have enough time and maybe if I time traveled loads I would but I don't know I don't know right I'm gonna plant all these flowers and it's gonna look very cute as you can see a lot of the stuff today that we're doing is just to improve the build that we've already kind of started because we've took it slowly we haven't done oh my god please can this path go in the right place thank you um, but we've just decided to like start the builds everywhere and then finish them as we go because I feel like if I try to do one at a time we just wouldn't have enough things to be able to finish each build and it would just take so much longer. So I'm glad that I've like spread out all of the builds, that, uh, got everything ready for where I want to put the items um, and built them up slowly because they're looking so cute. Um, I mean, in my opinion, I hope you guys think they look cute as well, but they definitely need just items to pull it together. Maybe I need to find some more. I've got books. I could probably order books from the Nook Stop um, and I might have some in my inventory, my, my storage. I'd love to get things like a book stack and stuff like that, but you know. For now, let's go to Captain's Island. I've got enough Nook Miles to spare because I want 
more bushes and more flowers. And I've been spending too much money on those flowers. And hopefully we don't get holly bushes because that's one that I don't want to use. I'm going to collect all of the coconuts and it's holly bushes. It is holly bushes, which is very upsetting. Not good news, besties. I'm going to take them anyway, though. They're all mine. We'll use them for now. We'll use them as placeholders, I suppose. And I did get a little message in a bottle. So let's get going back home so we can put some of these things around the island. Okay, let me plant some of the flowers because this area especially is looking very bare. We've got this pumpkin patch, but it just... Something about it makes it feel really empty. Probably the lack of trees around it because there's like not that much room to plant trees around. Um, I'm going to put some bushes and some flowers around here to try and spruce up the area, I suppose. And I'm going to talk to Scoot again, you know, getting that friendship point up. Hello, goodbye. And plant some more holly bushes. I will end up probably um, replacing those as soon as we get leaf on the island and I can buy some like actual bushes that I like. But that's okay. I'm going to sell some stuff and then I'm going to time travel. Okay, we have time traveled and leaves here today, so that is great. Um, I'm going to shake all my trees and look for my items and my wasps. Oh my god, okay, come on. I can do this. I wasn't in the right position there. And I couldn't do this, guys. I didn't do it. This is very upsetting to me. I don't even know how long ago it was when I was stung by the last wasps. Like... I was got to be climbing up there. I could have got like the, the nook miles for like a hundred wasps and not getting stung. No, I don't think I could actually, to be honest. And we're going to go to leaf. We're going to ignore that, ignore what just happened and we're going to buy some bushes and we're going to buy some flowers and let's just pretend I didn't pass out from the wasps stinging me. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we have like 20,000 bells. I'm gonna spend probably most, if not all, of my bells on these flowers and making the island look cute. That is the idea. And let me plant them around, I suppose. I'm gonna replace all these holly bushes because those are very much Christmas bushes that we don't want on the island. They were just placeholders. But luckily we got a leaf literally the next day, so it's kind of a waste of time. And we got a balloon. What is in here? I hate when the the slingshot breaks because I always like put off getting another one and then there's loads of balloons and then I waste so many balloons because I don't have a slingshot because it broke. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. I'm just going to plant my flowers and bushes and life is happy. I need to replace this one as well. Let me get that up and put my hydrangea in here. And yeah, this today has definitely been a day of planting our our little flowers and things like that and I think the island is definitely coming together you know this 30 day challenge has been so difficult it's been so difficult but I've enjoyed playing Animal Crossing every single day and I mean obviously we're time traveling I don't think I could do this challenge without time traveling but I think we've done so much for the time that it's took we've got the island basically fully got the base down you know the idea there the canvas has been started <laughs> um especially with us putting all of these custom designs on the floor and things i'm just i'm proud of how far we're getting and it's been really nice to see your comments and everything and reply to you guys being inspired by this challenge and seeing everything that's going on the island it's so exciting and I've heard a few people have started a little 30 day challenge that's um, the same as mine and that's even more exciting to know that people want to give it a go and I was definitely very very inspired by Froggy Crossing's 30 day challenges they're my favourite videos I absolutely love them I've watched both of them multiple times all the way through they're just comfort series so it's it's nice to know that people are enjoying this one I suppose okay we've done a lot here we're planting a lot of things and the island is coming together and we're getting there it's day 22 that is crazy beans we literally have eight days left eight days of this challenge 
and then we'll have a little tour on the 30th day and that'll be the end of applesauce I don't know will I be ready no I think I will be ready to let it go it's been intense it's it's been a lot of Animal Crossing and I'm very much ready to get into some spooky games I have a lot of exciting games to get into and I have most notably witchy life story that I want to play I've got little nightmares that I want to play potion permit um, there's quite a few that I've bought or been gifted that I'm I'm excited to get into. Okay, I'm gonna fossil fossil all these I'm gonna fossil all these fossils. <laughs> Assess all these fossils. And I'm sorry, Blathers, not for you, but we wow, okay. Two thousand miles, don't mind if I do. Let us see. We have two of these bad boys, but they're different on each side, so we could definitely use them. Definitely use them in our builds. And I'm going to sell all the rest and hopefully we get a pretty penny. I love saving up the fossils and then selling them together. Because then it's like, you get 43,000 bells, that's so many bells. And then we can spend it all on getting flowers. And then it's like a win-win situation because we save all the fossils, get them assessed, we make loads of money, we get the flowers, and each time I'm happy afterwards, you know? I finally ended up making the end little custom designs for this um this like custom design thing the left and the right ends because it was bothering me that we didn't have it for all of our little builds and I don't think I added it to the farm area which I should do tomorrow um but yeah I'm just adding the last little finishing pieces that I can manage to do today and I suppose it's, it's, I'm gonna pick it up again tomorrow, as always. <laughs> Hello everybody, right now on Applesauce, it's November 14th. Today's announcement, today we have a visitor staying at the campsite. Okay, is that gonna be someone good? Or maybe. My phone is ringing, thousand bells. I just realized I didn't order my wheat fields yesterday, which is really upsetting. So before I forget, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna order my wheat fields. There we go. Yeah. And we have a, a villager in, in the campsite. So let us see who is molesters. Let's see who it is. I'm ready. It's gotta be someone cute, I hope. I'm ready for someone cute to kick out someone that's not so autumnal. Goodbye. That wasn't the cutest, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I don't even know who he is, but he's not coming on the island. <laughs> Okay, let's check Nook's Cranny as well, because we need to see what items we can get. So we can decorate some more. That would be a great time. Okay, let's see. Ooh, we have some lockers. I might buy the lockers. Yeah. And I wonder how much the loom is, because what if we did like a hobby area at the campsite if we don't get any kids' tents? Yeah, that's not too expensive, so I'm gonna get that. And maybe we could do some hobby area sort of thing. I don't know. I don't know. I think today is going to be a lot of time traveling. I want to get rid of, um, you know, all of the roses at the top. And I also upgraded my pockets yesterday as well. Right, we're going to get rid of these roses. I think this area is the last area where roses are, if I remember correctly. Um, that's really upsetting. Wow. It don't want us to get rid of the roses. I need to go get a shovel. That is something that I need. I'm also going to drop off a bunch of items over here because I don't want them in my inventory right now. The loom, the wooden locker, stacked fish containers. Okay, I can use that. One thing I haven't even thought about is my house area and also my beaches. I haven't thought about what I want to do for those areas, so, you know, maybe I'll think about it soon. I don't know, I've got so much to think about today with everything we're doing. Right, let me get a shovel. Let me get a little shovel. I am curious, what have we got? Okay, I'll get this. Do we have any different flowers? Pansy, rose, and cosmos. No, thank you. Let's go get these roses so we can time travel a bunch. I've started shaking my trees because you guys told me that you get two items a day from shaking the trees. I can't believe I didn't know that. It feels so silly, but I've started doing that now and I need to do that before we time travel. We need all the items we can get. At, I mean, if we can use the items that the trees decide to give us in the builds. Nothing here. Nothing here. Nope. I always hope it's going to be nice and easy and they'll be up on this like top cliff, but usually they're not and it's a sad time. Nope. 
Ooh, there is a mushroom though, I'll take that. Nope. Here's a wasp. I'm saving all these for Flick, so we'll be rich, even though I don't even know what we need to be rich for anymore. There's not many good items in Nooks at the minute, but I suppose rich to get flowers. We need to get more flowers, and those bad boys cost a lot of money. Okay, those are gone. Let us shake the rest of our trees elsewhere. We shall do that. Do I have trees over this way? Maybe? Might draw this. I love using these as like a little extra bit of decor, you know? Oh, natural. Nope. I got stung by wasps like three times yesterday as well. Thought you guys would like to know. Oh, I'm prepared this time though. I'm so prepared. Chicken the trees. There's a money. A hundred bells. What a sleigh. There's so many trees to shake. So many. Yes. I think that's all the trees that I can shake. Let's go down. Oh my god. Okay. No, 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 we got a fossil. We also got another orange tulip. Another two, actually. That wasn't my fossil, was it? That was so rude. So rude. Wow. A fossil. There we go. Look at us go. Let me collect my 100 bells. Here we are. Um, okay, there's a couple more trees up here and then we need to go to the forest. There's an, a more money. There's also trees behind here that I forget about every time. We got one of these! They're worth a lot of money! That's happy times. Okay, let's go over this way to shake all these trees! Ugh, okay. I feel like if the items fall from these ones, I won't even be able to pick them up. Are you kidding me? Hold on. <gasps> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm not good at doing those, so I'm proud of myself for doing that. I thought we got all of the wasps, I'm not gonna lie. I wasn't expecting that at all. What was that? Oh, it was a stick. Right, I'm gonna put all my wasps here. Five wasps per day, yes. And we ran away from one of them and got stung by one of them. Let's go get this item. We also have one more, unless we did have one drop earlier. And I guess we'll find out because these are like the last trees to shake. Let me shake this one. I need that mushroom. Thank you. Where's that mushroom gone? Oh my god, we have two! That means this area is completed. Wait, why won't you let me put... What? Is it because of this? Probably. Let me put that mushroom there. There we are. Pick mushrooms. I'm gonna put the wooden stakes here. There we go. I have too many trees on this island. Mush umbrella? Yes, I want a mush umbrella. A layered tank dress. Adorable. Oh my goodness. We are winning. Let's see what it looks like. I don't actually know what they look like. <gasps> Look, and it's with the flat mushrooms. I have some of those. I have so many flat mushrooms. Like that one right there. I'm gonna sell these and polybush. Oh, I should probably, actually no, I'm gonna sell in person because I don't want 80% because we have something that will give us a lot of monies. So you know, what are we getting? 17,000, that's great. See, if I sold at the drop off box, I would only get 13,000. So that was a good choice. We got a lot more. I made the mush umbrella. I don't know where I'll put it, but it's there. Right. I'm gonna leave this area like this for now, but I do need to think about actually decorating it properly um, because we're coming up to that point where we need to get it all sorted. This here, I think we're gonna time travel a bunch to get items and then we can start decorating with said items. So let's time travel. We don't really need the green mums because it's not very autumnal. It's just like fun, you know? I want to have them. Because yeah, I have these white mums, but I don't think they're from seeds. I think they're from a Nook Miles Ticket Island. And they've made a bunch of purple ones, but the purple ones just keep making more purple ones, you know? Okay, let's go check Nooks. I also have some, actually, I'm gonna order. I need to remember, my brain is very scatterbrain right now, um, but that happens all the time. Oh, please. I'm gonna change the color of this and order some more. But yeah, I need to do things as I remember or I'll forget. Look at this science set, that's so cute. Oh my, right, there's nothing in here that I want. You guys have failed me. If Leaf comes here, I'll buy, what is it, two yellow seeds? Or is it one yellow seed and one red or something to get a hybrid yellow? Something like that. Okay, we've got our fossils and stuff. Let's go get our fossils, like, assessed for now. Torso, what is this? 
Oh, we've already got like two of those. And then, okay, cool. What I need to do is move everything around, really, because it isn't very efficient right now. That's not what I meant to do. I wish we could see where we were aiming because I do that all of the time. And I'm gonna put that one there. Actually, no, I'll put it there. I'm gonna move everything around. And I don't have a lot of room to work with, but I'm gonna try and make it work. So I'll keep the whites going like this. There we go. And then the purples, I can plant one where I'm standing. And move this one. Let's move this one. So there's like room in between them to make our, our green. Or more purples, I suppose. I have so many purples that I'm not gonna want, but that's fine. And give them a water. With our elephant watering can. Like this. What are these? If we get a green mum, if it's like one green mum, I'm gonna make a shrine to it. This is gonna be the shrine of the green mum. Let's go sell some stuff. I've gotta shake all my trees, find my bottle on the beach. And I see a balloon. Hello, balloon. That's mine. And let me sell these fossils. Hello, Nook's Cranny. Sell this. Um. Oh, I forgot to sell the peaches. Oh, that was easy. What did we get? Also, what's in here? Mush log. Oh, the mush log was so cute to decorate with. Ah, okay, cool. And then what's in here? Skateboard wall rack. I'll learn it, but I'm not necessarily gonna use it. And I suppose we can shake some trees. But I don't know if shaking my trees will be worth it because it might just take way too long. Oh, none of these. Nope. Feels like I've literally just done this, and that's because, like, I have, but we did time travel. Nothing there. Keep going with our stuff. Oh, I don't know what that is. There's a bug, though. There's a bug. Shake this one. Nope. I'm gonna have to start picking up these twigs. There's too many. My little flower breeding area. I hope I get, like, one. Oh, look at these mushrooms. Thank you. I will be using you guys. I also need to break some rocks. You know what? I'm definitely gonna have to make one of those for when someone, like, comes to the dream address. The little gifts. That's too cute. Where's my net? Here it is. Also, this mushroom does not belong there. Oh, what did we get? Did we pick some mushrooms? What a sleigh. I need to stunt some of these trees, but I want them to grow a little bit bigger than this, I think. I should just let mums roam wild up here. No, don't, 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 stop it, stop it, stop, 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 stop. No! Okay, thanks. That sucks. That's not the bench I thought it was. That's actually really upsetting. That's an ugly bench. Look at all these wasps. We're gonna be rich when Flick comes here. Any more? Nope, because we got stung by the other one. I'm just gonna time travel. Hello everyone, right now an apple sauce, bibbly bobbly boo. Maple leaf? Paul's coming to the end. No, don't you dare. Oh, red leaf pile. Okay, that's fine. We could use that, definitely. I should catch some maple leaves, apparently. We have so many wheat fields, so I'm gonna plop them around in like areas that I feel need them as well. I don't know which maple leaf I can catch. There's so many just falling. Was that one? No. Let me put wheat fields here. Place. Wow. Look at that. And maybe one here. Wheat fields. Place item. I'm gonna place one here as well. I'm gonna place one here. It feels like it's missing something. Wheat field here. Seems like a good idea to me. Yes. Now we need to bottle on the beach. And to keep an eye out for any balloons. None of our things grew. Kind of sad. Right, I can make a few more things with my mushrooms. But I want to collect a few more, I think. Drop item. I might shake a few trees. But to be honest, shaking the trees really gets on my nerves. All I'm getting is sticks all the time. That's not what I'm looking for. You know? Nope. Oh, a pine cone. I'll shake the ones behind here. But then I might just time travel. I don't think we're gonna get an item, but that's fine. I would rather not deal with the wasps anyway. Let us, wait, did I check nooks? I wanna check nooks one more time, just in case. Just in cases. Actually, I wanted to stunt some trees as well. Let's check nooks first, Charlie, please. And then we're gonna go stunt some trees. We didn't check nooks and I don't want anything here. No thanks. Right, let's go see the top of these. Okay, I can actually just use my ladder to get up. I just go up here. Oh, <laughs> please. Up here, and then up here. Where's all the stunted trees that I was growing? Have they all grew? Maybe. Maybe. Ooh, it's the expensive mushroom. Mushroom. I might time travel back in time. Mushroom. Because 
Okay, you know, I might just let them all grow. I might just let them all grow up here. It makes more sense to me. I'm gonna break this rock. I'm gonna break this rock. I don't want it up here. Oh, it's my money rock. I'm gonna put a sapling here to grow. There we go. Wait, have I ordered my wheat fields? Let's do that first, just in case. I'm very glad I did this. Okay, that's all five. And we did get our um, message in a bottle. I remember that at least. Hello there everyone, it's no November the 17th. CJ's here, we have a few things to sell to CJ actually. I'm gonna get all these, the nook shopping, all the wheat fields. And then we're gonna look for our message in a bottle. Did any of these grow? We got another white one. We also got another purple one over here. My beaches are such a mess as well. Really need to work on that. Oh, I should probably grab all these to sell. Let's search for CJ. Can I carry everything? That's a bug. I need to put the bug back down. Place. Where's CJ? Hello. Also look for our message in a bottle while we look. Oh, we've got a balloon. No CJ. Where could he be? I hate how they're always just like wandering around and you never know where they could be. Please, give me a clue. Something. Don't know why I thought he would be at the airport. What can I drop? What is this? Where is CJ? What the hell is CJ? Guys. Hi. Hi. I just want to sell you. I was like, do I have to do the three fish thing? I really don't want to. Can I? Not now. I just want to sell. Oops. Do I have to catch him the three fish before? You always have to with CJ. Okay. We'll do it this time. L let me drop. Actually, I'll open all the wheat fields and put them down because we don't have wheat fields around here. So I need to do that anyway, I suppose. We have wheat fields here. CJ, you're going to have to move. Thank you. Do I have wheat fields here? Oh, I have a few. Not a lot, but a few. Imagine if you hadn't gotten the wheat fields in Nook's Cranny. I know, right? I don't know what I'd be doing with my island. I honestly scrumped. <laughs> the scream I scrumped when I found them in, in my Nook's Cranny. Let's do your little sea sports thing. What do we got to do? Okay, we need three small fries. Let's do it. Come on, please, just let me get to it. You speak so much, CJ. Wow. Okay, number one. Where's all these fishies at? Also, I swear, as soon as you're doing this, this challenge, the fish just disappear. The ones that you want anyway. You're not what I want. There's one here. You turn around. You notice this right now. It's not gonna, is it? Oh, I have a money tree. Nice. Am I gonna have to go to the other side just to get this pale chub? This is such a rude fish. Get my mushrooms. Hold on, you stay right there. Being a diva, this is true. There we are. <laughs> okay, we're starting again. Okay, Zilky. There's a big fish. I don't want you there. You go away. Thank you. Number one on my small fry list, thingy my bobby. You go away. Thank you. I want homemade pizza now. Let's. Should I get my this? Not even that much. It was literally a thousand bells tree. It was like 3,000 we got back, but like... Excuse me, thank you. I need to keep an eye out for the thought bubble for um Scoot as well. That's something that we need to have a look at. I've got this. No, I don't. That was very upsetting, by the way. If you couldn't tell. Okay, I got that wrong. Hold on. There we are. Same with the Stardew one. If I listen to it, it just... I don't know why. It doesn't work. Maybe we could give it a go, though. All right. I have to keep my thumb off the button. How was that not quick enough? I don't know how I'm being too slow, but I also think that the slight delay that the capture card gives, it's like like a millisecond. It makes it so much harder. That's not a small fry, is it? It's too big for a small fry, right? Well, we'll never know. Why am I like this, guys? Why is there so many fish that I don't want? <gasps> a balloon? Don't mind if I diddly do. Oh, that was so close. That was so close. What did we get? Ooh, we've got a hundred balloons. Look at us go. I'm getting so good with the Nook Miles at the minute. What are you? A floor lamp. Fish and roared. Well, I'm glad that wasn't a small fry because I'd be so mad at myself for scaring that off. As a big boy. Will that not scare him? No, okay. Fine then. Hi, Scoot. Bye, Scoot. Another balloon? What? What me? What? Oh, we're getting winter stuff now? Okay. Slay, I guess. I might give up on this silly fishy thing. Let's see. Fishing rod. Number one. I used to be so good at the fishing. I'm not gonna lie. But now I'm just so bad. I'm bad at all fishing. Every fishing. 
Number two. Okay. Okay, that's good. Oh, of course you did. That's, um... What else would I get? We finally got number three. Where the hell is CJ? You're still here? Oh! Look at our top-down view. Yeah, this took a while. Thank you. I think CJ would say slay. If Animal Crossing was made today, New Horizons, CJ would say slay. I can finally sell all of these. I hope it was worth it. 26,000 bells I'll take. I was hoping for more with having like an eel and everything, but you know, good enough for me. I literally woke up. I put my Animal Crossing video together. I watched Haley stream while making bead jewelry. And then, and now it's like 7 p.m. But where is Balloon? Not this way. Oh, no way did I get a wheat field from a fucking balloon. Is that the other colour as well? No, it's 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 a golden one. But what the hell? What are the chances of getting wheat fields twice in Nook's Cranny? Then another one in a balloon. How does that add up? Oh my god. <laughs> Agnes is taking selfies. <laughs> Did you just see you? Agnes. Announcement. We're getting into the fall season. Turkey Day is 23rd. <gasps> Turkey Day items are so good. Okay. Message in a bottle on the beach. Did we get a green mum? No, we didn't. I will water these again, actually. Give me the green goodness. Sounds quite sus, that, to be honest. But come on, my village has got to be watering these flowers at some point. There's my bottle down here on this little beachy beach. Nope. Nope. Where's my bottle? This is rude. Oh, here it is. All the way at the end. I'm going to put some wheat fields around here. Wheat field. More wheat fields. And maybe one over here. I'll order my wheat fields and then we'll go on a little breaky break. What do I need for this? Log stool. I'm gonna get some wood for a log stool. But I need to see how much wood or what wood it takes, I suppose. Where is log stool? Here it is. Hardwood. Okay. One of these bad... Oh, please. I need more hardwood. I'll do that at another point. What can I craft? This one? Stop pressing back. I love that you can make it go quicker, it's so good. I don't know why there isn't just like a skip animation bu button or anything, but I'll take this. Okay, and then, let me do this one. Wow. Do I have enough for another? I do. Amazing. Okay. Let us get started with this one over here. So we have this here, which like, yeah, that works. But I'm also gonna put much low stool, gorgeous. Can I put a bug model on there? Oh my god, look at that. It's so cute. Oh my god. Let's do this. And then... Wait, can I put things on mush log? Maybe. Oh, that, that's like... That could be like a high table. You know? A low stool and another low stool. Put it like there. We could like this. Coffee cup. Can I put it on the log? No, but it can go on the low stool and I'm not mad about that. I'm not mad about that. So we've got this like kind of started. You push it around a bit so we can like make it look a bit more full of stuff. Let me put another, do I have another mush low stool? Maybe, I feel like this works. I want some bookshelves. That would make me happy. This is gonna be like the playground area-ish. Just like stuff that you would find near your campsite, I suppose. But there is room, that's where you're wrong. Is there actually? Yeah. Does that look good there though? No, that's in the way. That's definitely in the way. I reckon. Yeah. That looks good there. I like that. Okay, that's nice. Then... This is looking good. I just need items. So... I think we're gonna time travel again. Okay, thank you, Isabel. Bye! A bucket! I have been waiting to get a little bucket for ages! Okay. I'm gonna get these books as well. This camera, super cute. Sorry, Ruby. Hi! Okay, 30,000 is fine. I suppose a camera in real life would be expensive. Maybe not that expensive, but... Can I not have it any closer? There we go. Let's put this here. That doesn't really work. This trees aren't gonna grow. You're not gonna grow. I'm gonna put a wheat field there. I wonder if a little mini tree... Actually, it probably won't. Let's just do the wheat fields. That makes the most sense to me. There we are. Yeah, that works. And if I do one like there... I think a wheat field here. That could be good. This island is looking pretty darn close to finished, you know? Okay, so today I had a market where I sell my artwork at a lovely little market in Brighton and 
that meant that I didn't get to stream today and so we did some what is that hello we have a black tulip when did that happen but anyway as I was saying I was at a market and so I didn't stream meaning I got to do some gameplay afterwards while trying to decorate and obviously putting the wrong things where they're not meant to be you know um and I got all my wee fields. I've been putting some custom designs down. I want to finish up some of the areas that we have like half built. So especially this museum area needs a bit more love to it. I'm going to water my flowers because we still need more orange ones that I just want to dot around everywhere. And I'm still holding out for the green ones, the green mums. I'm still holding out, but I, I, I don't know how much I believe in it anymore. Look at how cute Agnes is and Freckles watching Agnes having a little sing song. This is the most adorable thing. And I realized Flick was here, which is amazing because we have so many wasps to sell to Flick and we'll get a bit more money from that, which is great. Oh, we got a little gothic headdress. That's kind of cute. Okay. Here's all my little bugs that I'm going to grab and that we're going to sell to Flick and it's gonna be a great time, we're gonna be rich after selling all of these bugs. Um, but yes, yeah, so I went to the market, I sold my stuff, and it was a lovely time, I had a great day. I met some of um, people who are like following me on Instagram already, which was really fun um, to meet some of you guys, and um, I don't know, sell my artwork. It's always the best time at markets. It does really, really tire me out, but it's very re rewarding, I suppose. Um, and next year I won't be doing as many. I'm wanting to... Oh my god, 34,000 bells. Okay. Um, but yeah, next year I'm wanting to tone down a little bit on how many markets I'm doing. I haven't formally announced this anywhere, but um, I will do at some point. It's just my health is getting a bit too much for me to handle to be able to be going to markets like every other weekend. It's, it's a lot. Isabel said we had a campsite villager today, so let's see who... Uh, hmm. I don't even know your name, but I don't want you here, okay? You can leave us be. Why can't we ever get any cute campsite villagers? Honestly. But yes, I'll be toning down the markets I'm doing, and... Um, but I do have loads in between now and Christmas, which is a great time. Um, but I'm ready to focus my efforts elsewhere. I want to focus more on YouTube. I mean, I'm doing a lot on YouTube at the minute, obviously with the 30 day challenge. Um, but I'm finding I don't have enough time for everything else. So being able to tone a few things back and focus solely on YouTube and Twitch and Patreon and a few other things will be a, a, a lot of help, you know? Okay, I need to sell some things to Timmy and Tommy because we have so many leftover little bits and bobs that, like, I'm not going to use. Like, these these clothing bits, this tree, you know. We've got one of those expensive mushrooms, which makes me happy because um, that always helps us bolster up our funds, which is the best time. Okay, let us sell this. And what do we get? 19,000? Okay, so I have time traveled again, and Keck is here. Okay, thank you, Isabel. Yes, I have time traveled because I felt like we did everything I could. I'm just spending today trying to decorate the leftover areas, like from what we already have built and designed. So just like the empty bits around the places that we've already got templates, like the, the base of it down. And a lot of that is wheat fields and we're going to have to get a lot more items through balloons, maybe shaking our trees, um, getting recipes from our bottle on the beach and from our villagers. So I'm putting down a load of wheat fields and placing a bunch of fence just to like make everything a little bit more pretty and then I realized I have a little table that would look perfect here I think I mean I wish it didn't have the glass on the top but I want to do like a little apple stand maybe that could be cute I do actually have simple panels and if I have time I might make a little custom design to go behind that but I don't know how well it will work here's my message in a bottle what did we get come on it's gonna be something good we got a decoy duck that is amazing. I'm gonna make loads. I'm gonna make so many ducks 
because they look so cute. Whenever you've got a little bit of water anywhere, you need to have a little duck put down. It's perfect for our natural island. Finally, something that we can actually use and that is useful. Oh my goodness. I've been waiting for this one. So I'm going to make a few for just dotting around in the water areas. I think I want one near the Able Sisters. Oh, here's a balloon. Did we get anything good in this one? I don't know. You know, we've had a lot of luck today, so I'm not sure if... Um, okay, it's, it's a little plant. It'll do. It'll do. But yeah, so decoy duck here, and I want one up by the campsite area, and then one by Cherry's house. Yeah. I think they look so cute. And then I'm making a few more little de DIY things to, like, just put around the island. Planting some flowers, getting all the good stuff out, and collecting some nook miles. Okay, so Agnes, what is that thought bubble doing above your head? We have a thought bubble and that means we can chase it as we time travel. I will keep an eye out. I will keep an eye out. I will be keeping an eye out for a thought bubble to see if anyone else wants to move because that's going to hopefully hop around. But I'm placing all of my little mushroom DIYs that we've just done around the island and then ordering my wheat fields so we can time travel again. And then I might shake some trees um, to find our item. But I'm not going to do them all. I'm just going to do the ones on the top. It's where I can easily reach. The ones everywhere else are just too much. Okay, so I have time traveled. It is turkey day. Okay, so it's going to be a busy one, I suppose. I've played turkey day before on Animal Crossing. And I've done the whole thing, um, so I kind of know what to do, and yeah, things like that. I need to put away, well not put away, place on my wheat fields. That DIY was useless, I'm not going to use it. But let's place all these, and then I guess we'll start out on Turkey Day. Um, I've always been able to play Turkey Day because in the UK we don't really, we don't celebrate it. We don't celebrate Thanksgiving, and so around about this time, we're not having family plans and stuff because it's just normal days. It's just a normal day, but of course we are heavily time travelled at the minute. Um, let me get these clams and give them back. So yeah, we are in the future. I know some people have been pointing it out, and we are time travelling in this challenge. It would be very hard to do without time travelling. Okay, here are your manila clams. We're going to make some... Clam chowder. I've never had clam chowder before, you know. I've never even thought about eating it or wanting it or craving it. But it exists, I suppose. Look how cute everyone is. Oh my god. Okay, what else have you got for me? What else have you got for me, Franklin? I need to know. We got a turkey day rug, which is great because we do need to start thinking about the inside of the house. We only have six days left. This this month's gone so quick. This Saturday challenge has just absolutely flown by. That's it's wild. Okay, pumpkin pie is next. We have a billion pumpkins on this island, so let's go get the ones that he wants. And yeah, I'm gonna drop one there because I don't want to fill up my inventory with everything. And I picked one with two pumpkins. Okay, hello. I have your pumpkins. One thing I did forget is that um, you can give him extra ingredients, which we'll see later. But I did forget I could bring all four different pumpkins over um, to make a better pumpkin pie with the extra ingredients. But I'll, I'll remember to do that later on, you know? Let's get cooking. Big up Franklin. That, that looks like absolutely delicious. I, I would eat that pumpkin pie. To be fair, I would, I would try the clam chowder, even though I've never wanted it ever, but I would try it. This game makes food look absolutely delicious sometimes, you know? Okay, let me put some stuff in my inventory, not inventory, some stuff away in storage because my inventory is full. So we can go diving. Okay, I've got a few things. I got a scallop, and so obviously Pascal is here. Hello, Pascal. You can. You can have it. And I suppose I'm just gonna do a little collage of like all of the sea creatures that I find because like it takes so long to do the deep sea diving. 
and catch exactly what we need. We need a mussel and an oyster. Okay, so I did not find an oyster, but I have a mussel, so I'm just going to sell this whole inventory full of things and we have got 26,000 bells. That is a good time. another inventory full of things and we did not get the oyster again 12,000 bells is not as good um, and then I can't believe I didn't realize this Franklin told us that we can say hello to the villagers and get the stuff from the villagers without so being out there deep sea diving with probably zero chance of even being able to get it or like a very low chance you know right we need to go get some sea bass for Agnes. Let me fish a little bit. This game annoys me so much sometimes. Like, I've literally been searching for sea bass for ages. So I'm gonna see what normal wants. Because I literally find every other fish other than a sea bass. And it's really annoying me. Are you gonna give me some sea bass? Yes, I have a horse mackerel. You can have it. At least we've already got what she wants. Give me an ingredient pretty please is it one that we can use flower does franklin have flower freckles you gotta give me something better what do you want what do you want freckles freckles is so cute with a little chef hat on i can't okay could use a a christian carp okay well what does sherb want then hello hello you give me what you want I want laid on me, show A horse mackerel. We've literally just given that to Norma. I found one for straight away, so it's fine. It's fine, Shub. Here you are. I've got it for you. We're all good. No, not the tuna. Here's your horse mackerel. Are you going to give me something that I can give to Franklin? An oyster! Finally! We finally get what I've been looking for this whole time. Okay, hello. Scallop is a very interesting ingredient. Um, okay. Yes. I can give you that. You can improve the dish with it. Wait, have we been looking for mussels and oysters or did we give that in earlier? I can't even remember what's happened anymore, guys. Turkey day just like it melted my brain I was just fishing and deep sea diving and talking to villagers for hours and hours <laughs> and so we'll have to see what he wants next we'll see what he wants next clam chowder slays but yeah I, I think we did need the mussel and oyster because the clam chowder was made with manila clams obviously come on Charlie catch up catch up this is this is not going well Okay, oyster and a mussel. We have those right here for you, Franklin. Please take them. I've been I've been waiting for this moment. I've been deep sea diving for hours after not realizing that I could go to the villagers and find the items. Let's get cooking. Let's go. Look at that. That kind of looks delicious as well. Franklin is a chef. He knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing and I can't complain. We have one more dish to finish. What do we have? Turkey day flooring we got as a as a present, as a, a reward. And then we need to make something with a sea bass and a red snapper. I feel like I can do that one. That one's like achievable. Right. Let me do some fishing. And yay, we got a tire. I have been fishing for so long and I am so bad at fishing up the things that I need to get. I mean I've been I've been fishing quite well, collecting everything that I need. I mean collecting fish, not that I need, but actually catching the fish. Other like on stream, because like on stream I 
I can't catch anything. But when I'm in bed, it's all Gucci, it's all fine. Look at me go. And is that a sea bass? A sea sleigh? Hello, Shab. What have we got? I need a red snapper, and I've been fishing for so long. And... Oh, I do have a dab. Yes. Are you going to give me something useful, maybe? I swear to God, if I'm given something that I don't need. Oh. Thank you, Shub. Thank you for the yellow pumpkin that I don't already have. Definitely not. Definitely not. The villagers never know what we need. Okay, let's let's keep trying to fish for this red snapper. And nope. Okay, I've given up. I'm gonna try and see Norma, see if Norma will give us a red snapper. Um, right, hello. How are we doing? What are you wanting on this fine evening? A turban shell. I have to go deep sea diving again? Again? Okay, let, let's go deep sea diving for a little bit then. Okay, we finally have the sea bass and the red snapper. So let us give this to Franklin and have it finally finished and it's gonna be the best time. Okay, yes. I got the red snapper and the sea bass. I actually got two red snappers, which like, look at me pop off there, I suppose. Getting extra ingredients that he didn't even take. You know, maybe I'm not, maybe I'm not clever. Let's get cooking, let us get into it. That one, I would definitely eat that one. That one looks delicious. I mean, all of them look pretty good to me, you know? And it, why is it so like special with special stuff? That's so fun. Look at the confetti stars. That's so exciting. Okay. You're welcome, Franklin. And we got a cornucopia. Okay, let me sell our spoils that we don't need anymore. We got quite a few big things. And so hopefully we get a few more bells. Today was a good bell making day. We made a lot of bells from just doing all this fishing and all this deep sea diving let's see if we can get some of the stuff where um that franklin wants to like level up the dishes um i think i heard that we could use a crab and then did i give in the extra pumpkins maybe i did norma's not home okay great she was just there okay I got a few more things. Let's see if Agnes will give us any little ingredients. Any little ingredients to improve what we've already got so we can get some more things from Franklin. Um, here's the dab. Here you go. Okay, and she gave us a muscle, which we really do not need. That's upsetting. Hello, Scoot. I haven't seen you today. What have you been up to? I think I have a turban shell. That's what I was going to go give to Norma when she wasn't in. So I have one spare for you, Scoot. Don't you worry. And the white pumpkin. Okay. Well, thank you anyway, Scoot. But this is why I'm kicking you off the island as soon as you want to go. Because you do things like this to me. Okay. Okay, I have not been successful in trying to find a crab or anything. Um, but I do have the pumpkins that we can give in. And I already had them in my little farm, even though Scoot gave me one. But, you know, I suppose that's fine. We're going to make the little pumpkin pie even better. How does it work? Like, he's already cooked the ingredients together. How does he add in the extra ingredients? Like, that was already there. Oh, do your dishes have, like, stars on them? When they've been improved, look how sparkly they look. That's really cute. I didn't notice that. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love that. Okay. Well, I think that's all I can manage for Turkey Day, you know. So let's let's sell our spoils. Hello there, everyone. Right now on Applesauce, it's November the 24th. Okay, someone's passed out on the beach. Gulliver. That is fine. Let's get back into it. So yesterday... It was turkey day and I just I just added some more like wheat fields and things around so this area is feeling a bit more put together 
you know, with the custom designs and the wheat fields and things. We got this turkey day thing over here as well. Olive's got the freaking thought bubble. Agnes had it the other day. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. This is good. Right, this area is like pretty much finished. I added a bunch of flowers on this area on the sides. So, yep. And I want to do a restaurant here. Actual build. But we don't have stuff, you know? Hi! And we got a little sale. Okay. I mean, there's nothing in here that I want, but thank you for letting me know. I feel like we just need to work on getting items and stuff. So, I'm gonna order my wheat fields. Seems like I didn't do it yesterday, which is sad. And then search for our tree items, I think. Oh, we've got, we've got Nick Miles. Okay. I wanna shake some trees. I also need to find my message in a bottle. Yesterday I was, no way. That was so quick. I don't necessarily want that, but that was so quick. Think of all how, how long we've been searching for trees, items in my trees, and then it just happens in the first one. None of these got my item. No. Nope. Right, I don't think I can be bothered with the rest of the trees, but that's fine. I've ordered my stuff. We have a thought bubble that we need to follow. I don't have a watering can anymore, but that's fine. I might clean up this space, officially give up on the green mums. I know I didn't give it that much chance. I need to make this into a flower field. I'm gonna, I decided I want this flower field to be a proper build and we're gonna have a diagonal flower field all the way over this whole area. That's my idea. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get um, my, a watering can and we'll, I'll leave them growing while we do our other builds. Um, okay, let me get watering can. Hot chocolate with vegan marshmallows. Hot chocolate. I actually don't have marshmallows in my hot chocolate. I just have hot chocolate. I don't like marshmallows that much, but I see the appeal. Now I want hot chocolate. Trees bounty, big tree. I'll take that. Right, we're gonna time travel. Hi. Uh, I need to order my wheat fields. That's what I'm doing. I have so many bells. Right, actually, did I show you my bug cafe, guys? I literally bought a watering can and I didn't water the flowers. It's a little bit embarrassing. This is my bug cafe. It doesn't have many bugs yet because we need Flick to come on the island. And he came on the island yesterday, but I forgot that I needed to get a commission from him. So we're gonna have to wait again. I need my message in a bottle. It's also something else I'm looking for. Also something else I didn't get yesterday. Open up. We already know that one. It's a little bit upsetting, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Items in my trees. That could be a question that is a yes, or maybe it's a no. Can't be bothered to shake all of these trees, it's ridiculous. Oh, we got like a little silkworm or whatever that's called. You know what? I think it's time to bust out spending. Can I hear a balloon? I can. Hello? What? I need to spend some Nook Miles, that's what I'm trying to say. Because I'm gonna order some items that cost Nook Miles. There it is! Oh my god, that took so long. Yoink. Would you let me throw, please? Thanks. I'm very upset. Oh my goodness. Let us have a little look. Redeem Nook Miles. We have 30,000, which is great. What do we want, though? I'd love to have some sort of bench. We still don't have a bench. And, like, that really upgrades what the island looks like. A windmill. I'd love a windmill as well. You know what? I'm gonna get a windmill. Where is it? Let me get one of these. And this. I want a bunch of these to go into the orchard so it'll look more like a build and less like a place filler. You know what I mean? I need it to be like its separate own build. Maybe three will be enough? One, two, no. Do I want anything else from here? I don't think so. Oh, I, I would love a stall. I'm gonna get the outdoor bath as well because then we can have like a little place filler. Right, let me put like 100,000 in here. I wanna customize this as well. Oh, a little stall-y stall. Hello. I need my custom kits, which I put in the house. Right, let me grab this. We can make a flower shop as well. Let me put that in my pockets. I think that is a good idea because I really need to have some actual builds that aren't just like placeholders. So I'm gonna do that. That should be okay for now. These have some cute options. I'm gonna go with the dark brown. I would love to have this, but more autumnal. I don't really have an autumnal design. We have that, but like, maybe I just go with the green thing. I think so. I think this, cause how come they get like cool 
funky different shapes. I want a funky different shape. Where is that skull? Here it is. Oh, now that looks so much better. Look at that. That's so much better. Right, I'm going to put an apple down here. This looks so cute. Oh my goodness. Let me put that on there. Yes. And then hopefully I can get something else to plop on. But like, I love it. Let me put an apple on the floor here as well. Perfect. Okay, and then where do I want my little flower shop? I hear a balloon. There it is. Over here. Slay. I think the flower shop could go here. We don't have much room to work with, but that's fine. We don't have many items to work with. 10,000 bells. Don't mind if I diddly do. Where's my big item? My flower case there. Wait a sec. What if I removed this wheat field and shoved it in here? Does it look weird with that tree, like going into it that works a bit better the tree glitch is a little odd i feel like it looks better that way instead of having it like that looked way too weird but this just looks like it's in front what else do i have a little plastic canister for you know all of the big watering duties you've got to do in a flower shop question mark can you move the tree back at all unfortunately not that is an unfortunate no this works then I have a plant over here, which I think I might bring over. Girl, that is a gas can. Shh. It's got water in it, okay? Don't be silly. I, I can use it for my fun builds, okay? Okay. Let me put this moss ball here. I don't like it there. What about here? No, it kind of fits though, look. I kind of love this. This is going well. This is going well. This is our flower shop. We have a build. We have a build. I'm gonna drop that here. Wasp core. I'm gonna put a wee field here. I don't know what to do with that cornucopia, yep, but you know. How many leaves for a leaf pile? Maybe we get rid of the gas pump because it doesn't really. Maybe we call it. We call it a petrol pump. It doesn't really go with the aesthetic, does it? <laughs> I can hear a balloon. I'm gonna put a wee field here. Where's this balloon? You are very loud. Oh, it's all the way over there. Wait, let's go up this ramp and get it. Let me go up here and get it. Where's it gone? Why is it so quiet now? Oh, is it not up here? Oh, it is. Just barely. Put that there. Oh, this is looking cute as hell. We've got our orchard getting set up. And we've got this little flower area now. Let us time travel. Actually, wait. I want to see if I've ordered these, just in case. Okay, we have ordered these. Hello there, everyone. It's Winnie C. Enjoy your pizza, Wister. I'm very jealous. What? Oh, I ordered all these. I was like, what? <laughs> Why am I getting sent things? Let me grab these. Oh, can I please not press back too many times? This is annoying me. Now I gotta open everything. I wish they didn't wrap everything up. Could we please just have them all open? I have windmills. I have party light or or orchards. Arches. And I have wheat fields. And then I have other things that I can build. Oh, stop. Why? Is there something here? No, then why are you not- I'm actually so mad right now. Oh my god, finally. Okay, cool. And let me get this and put the party lights arch here. If I can find it. This is cute. I like that. I feel like there's so many like little things that Animal Crossing just needs, but they just don't have. And more light. No! There's an apple. That's the culprit. That is the culprit. Do you have any memories like that from Dicker or anything? That's gonna look really good there once we have like all of these. Okay, let me start this off then. I'm gonna put this here. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Maybe I'll have to put a different one then. This one. Let me put this here. I might need to pick this up for a sec. And then put this here. Hello sweetie, you're doing great. <laughs> Windmill. Look at her. Oh, she's reading a book in the flowers adorable right i'm gonna move flowers around i'm gonna move these ones around right let me grab this and this Doink. right i need to do the next like diagonal area how do i do this nope you're in the wrong area nope it really wants to go everywhere but where i want it there we are and i do this that is literally the wrong place let's get all of these making the island pretty right let me put this here 
That is literally not where I wanted you to go. And let me do this. I don't want any red tulips, so I'm gonna have to sell all those. What are these? A lot of them are wheat fields. And I don't know how many wheat fields I really want here. I'm not sure. Wheat field. There's my green wheat field. That's what I wanted. I like that black tulip, but I don't know what to do with it. You know what I mean? I'm gonna sell the snare drum because I don't want it. I don't want it. And I'm gonna sell this. Playing Halloween was so much fun. I really enjoyed Halloween. Turkey Day on the other hand, that was just stressful as hell. Turkey Day was mean. It was just like, yeah, you have to get this ingredient and this ingredient. And I was like searching for all these ingredients. That was difficult stuff. No greenies yet. We've got all these purple ones, but no green ones. I should probably make it a bit easier for them to spawn. Move some of these. So I don't even think this will work. Plant. Let me take this. We have a lot of yellow hyacinth and put that there instead. Only one orange flower over here. That's okay, I suppose. I should have been focusing on the like autumnal colors. I definitely need some more orange flowers, but alas, we don't have too much time. You know what? I might actually just grab some seeds so we can make some orange cosmos. Hi, I know. Yeah, I don't think there's anything here that I want though. Red cosmos. I'll take five. Thank you. And I'm gonna make my breeding area elsewhere because I have stuff to do in that area. Lots of time traveling in store today. Let me plant one. And was it like this that I did it? I think so. Oh, look at us go. Okay, this is my area where I'm gonna have these hopefully breed, but we'll see. We will see. Grab these. We still have a lot of Nook Miles for buying loads of stuff. Great time. Okay, let me continue getting this area sorted. Just lots of custom designing on the floor. Okay, this works. And then, oh, that doesn't work there though. Let's keep going. Doing these can be so time consuming. And this, this flower field's gonna look really cute though, I think. Can I put this here and it'll be good? Nope. There we go. Top one. And what if I do that? Oh my god, it worked. That one didn't though. That's not too bad. I love diagonal flower farms. They're just so pretty. That's not where I wanted you to go. I don't know how far I'm going out with this, so I'm just gonna leave it like that for now. Grill. And that goes down here like that. We have a little walkway to this area, which I'm still not sure what I want to do with this area, but that's fine. This is looking pretty good if you ask me. And I might remove this rock, maybe. Now, I'm gonna water these, uh, like so. And then, I guess, hope for a green mum. Which I don't know will ever happen, but that's fine. And then, did I get my message on a bottle? In a bottle today? We'll have to have a look. Message in a bottle, hello. There you are. That was nice and easy. Always clicking the wrong buttons. Box-shaped seat? What does that look like? Because, like... I've been waiting for a little stool like that. Wait, how do we make it? Wait, was it normal wood? Yes. Do I have normal wood? I have 10. I have been waiting. We'll see for the little wooden stool. Wait, I'm not customizing. Make craft. We can make one. One little stool. One little box shaped seat. Where do I want it? That is the question. What if I did instead of that there? Because I don't think that mushroom goes very well there. If I did. Oh my god, that's so cute. Okay, yeah, that's fine. I think the mushroom belongs somewhere else. Where that else is? Maybe over here? Maybe like here? Mush lamb. I feel like that fits in quite well over here. I think that looks pretty good. Wheat fields. Wheat fields can go down here. And I'm gonna place that there. This is looking pretty good. I just really hope that a rock turns up in the area that I want there. Do I have any more wheat fields? Yep. Okay, I think we might time travel again. Hello, Isabel. Leaf is here. That's a slayer to me. Did I not order my wheat fields? What? I'm such a silly sausage. All right, what have you got, Leaf, for me? Sugar cane? We don't have sugar cane. Yeah, let me grab like quite a few of these because I'll just plant them around everywhere. Okay, we have orange windflowers. Agnes, you literally had the thought bubble the other day. What did I tell you? Scoot needs to just scoot. Okay, I need to go talk to Scoot, I think, so we can get him going. Right, let's get some oranges in and around. We got 20 orange windflowers. Put one here. Right, let me 
plant some more, plant one here, and we have all these now to plant around. Right, this is our flower field. I'm pretty happy with how it's turned out. Okay. Yeah, this is really cute. This is for our flower breeding. I don't even think we'll get a green one, but I'll hold out hope for now. What do I do with, like, this? I don't know what to do with it. I could put it in the middle of the flower field, like here, maybe, so it like really stands out. I don't know. Can I put a flower here or is that impossible? Haha! That's good. This is looking pretty cute. We got another build out of the way. That's good by me. Whose house is this? Bones' house! Oh my goodness, I've never seen Bones' house before. Hi! I haven't spoken to Bones since he moved in. I'm such an awful island owner. Oh my goodness. A bone door plate. Oh my god. That's a bit morbid. I'm not gonna lie. I don't really want it. Thank you. Olive is here. Hi. I've been time traveling without speaking to them, which is pretty bad. Hello there, everyone. Bingle bungle. And we have a campsite villager. Well, that makes today exciting, doesn't it? There's some loud people outside. Who have we got in the campsite? How dare Boris set his campsite? up on my island. Boris, of all people, I'm very upset. Bad villager then. Boris was our arch nemesis on our last island. Boris was our arch nemesis, yes. Right, let's see what is in Cranny. Let's see what's in here. If there's something good, we could use it in a build. Oh, there's a turkey day table, but I don't see myself using that anywhere. <gasps> bones, hi! I always feel like crying bones. But alas, my happy pills don't allow me. And I need to do a restaurant here. This is the idea. But I'm wanting to breed these flowers first. I have a lost item. That's going to be used as decor. It's going to be used as decor. I'm going to put this here. You know what I really want to do? I want to play Minecraft. I really want to play a Stardew Valley, but I also really want to play Minecraft. Doink. Is Minecraft still, like, huge? I've been out of the Minecraft community for a very long time. I don't actually know. Olivia, are you okay? I need to search for Scoot because Freckles is just falling asleep over there. That's so cute. Because I want him to leave and he's evading us. Let me chat to him. Is anyone crafting? No, over here. Over here, maybe? What are you guys doing? Hi, Isabel. And Gulliver is here again. Do I have room? I literally have like no room. This is very upsetting to me. Mabel has a flea. Oh my god, I need a free Mabel from the flea. Mabel, honey, I'm sorry. Oh, a flea. I'm so sorry, Mabel. That's really gross. Oh no, it's big yikes. Right, let me open all these. Where do I want my sugarcane start? I might plant one here. I don't actually have a sugarcane area up top, but maybe I only make it here, next to where the market is. I don't know. I'm gonna plant a few. Can I plant here? I can. Plant and nope, one here. This is cute. I think that's a good idea. No superpowers, something real. Okay, okay. I want superpower. Something real. World peace, that's a good one. World peace is a good one. Waking up and having an able body instead of being disabled would be a pretty good one. There we go. Play an instrument perhaps. See, if I put my mind to anything, I know I'd be able to do it when it comes to like playing instruments or hobbies and things like that. Need field. Right, this is gonna be my marker area for like all the farm stuff. So I need to make a stall, which requires wood and that requires an ax. You see where I'm going? I'm gonna have to go get an ax. Where did that go? Behind? Whoa, I really need to do it up where like there's no stuff around. Wait, let me go over there. What have I got? Okay, stall, yes. Was that what I wanted that for? Maybe. I might move this tree. I don't like this tree here. My stall can go here. There we go. That fits in so well. That's so cute. Wait, let me move this. What does investigate mean? Oh, <laughs> someone lost this, guys. I'm gonna put some fences. Wow, look at that. This is looking pretty good. I, once we actually get some flowers from this, I'm gonna put a little pumpkin patch down here, I think. Where is my stall? Where is it? I built one, right? Yeah. I didn't even customize it, guys. Red leaf pile. 
Cute. Then I want to put like a mush stool somewhere. Grab. No! I didn't mean to eat that. <laughs> that is so sad. Let us do a little custom path to get down to our market. Let's go. Yeah. Amazing. I also put the... Actually, wait. I'm going to do the, the custom path first. I'm getting ahead of myself. Okay. Here. Yep. I love how the path is like blending in better now. That makes me happy. Put that there. I put that there. I'm going to pick up that. Paths take a while, but it's going to be worth it. Right. Let me do this. And then this. Nope, that doesn't work there. I'm just being a silly sausage. Let me do this there. Nope, this is necessary. Let me... No! Stop it. There we go. I need to do this here. It works! Okay. Okay, I need the top bit now. And then we can fill it in. I'm leaving these flowers here for now. Is there a balloon? Oh, there is! No! My slingshot broke, guys. I'm gonna have to let the balloon go. That's really upsetting. This works. This is what happens when it breaks. I forget to get another one. And then these bo these balloons like come flying past. And I miss all the balloons. And it's the worst time. Zero out of ten. Wouldn't recommend. Let me grab one of these. Don't eat it. This is looking good. This is looking good. I wanted to put one of these on the floor. Cute. Oh, also, I have some barrels. That I would love to know how to make these. 30 turnips. Oh my god. I'm literally never at the right time to get turnips. That's very upsetting. I'm gonna go get a slingshot. I'm also gonna drop a bunch of stuff. Did I make that stool in the end? We feel red leaf pile. I did. I made the stool. Let me drop these then. That's not what I wanted to do. I've got no room. Stop it. Uh, I think we've done a lot today, which is nice. That makes me happy. Hi, give me a slingshot, please. <gasps> cute umbrellas. That's really cute. I'm good, thank you. Thank you. This is looking pretty cute. I do think we need a few more stalls and stuff, but it's getting there. Let me drop some things over here. I'm gonna pick all my pumpkins and sell them because, I mean like all of my vegetables, not just the pumpkins, because then we'll get rich. I need to sell that as well. There's no room. Oh my god. Hold on. I'm wanting to upgrade my house because we need more storage. If I get more storage, I can clean up the island and then I'll be able to rest easy. So let's do that. There's a pumpkin here. The more I get, the more money I make. Nice and easy. Lemon. Easy. Breezy. Or however it goes. Let me grab all these. There we are. And this bad boy. And let's run over to our farm. Oh, not me running through all the flowers. All of the pumpkins with the two. Oh, it's so cute. It's so cute. This is looking good. We have a lot of these. So hopefully we get a lot of money from it. I wonder if I have random things just laid about everywhere that I don't even know that I have. Like items. I want to sell. Let me sell. Oh my god, it's so much. Nope, not that. Do I need to sell any of these? Bunk bed. Don't need you. And... Yeah, that's everything. What have you got for us? 37,000. And we've still got a ton more. Hello, Isabel. Oh my goodness. Today, it is November 30th. We've had the first... No? Please? No. Okay. Right. First things first. We're gonna have to time travel back in time soon. But I'm gonna get all of my vegetables and sell them because... Today, we are aiming. The big aim, the big goal, per se, is to upgrade our house, to pay off our debt and get that house upgraded so we have more storage. Because, besties, I am struggling with the lack of storage that we have on this island. So, we're gonna upgrade our house, but first we need to make a lot of bells to do that. It's like 300 and whatever thousand to upgrade the next, um, you know, part of the house, well, to pay off the next loan, I suppose, and then be able to upgrade after. So, this is a big thing. And, I'm gonna do some time traveling. I wanna time travel, try and get Scoot to move off the island, but also I wanna time travel back to the beginning of November so we can finish off this challenge around about the mid of November, because we'll be time traveling still, and then set my DA around about the middle when it starts like getting all the different colored trees and things 
and I'm going to water all these cosmos. I'm not going to give it too long to have these duplicate, any, well not duplicate, m mutate, no, propagate, breed um, into the orange flowers because I need the space to be finished. So we don't have long left to, to get some of those orange flowers. And I'm going to sell all of these. This is quite a lot of produce that we have here and I'm excited to see how much we're going to get. It's not quite a full inventory because I have like a crap ton of other things in my inventory, but let's see how much we're getting. 45,000 bells. Like, honestly, it's such a good way to make money. Okay, so I would like to decorate this area. Um, besties? What? Scoot? Hello? Scoot is thinking? Um, he's been thinking about moving out? <laughs> this episode is going pretty good so far, I will say. Oh my god, safe travels. See you later, Scoot. You know, happy to have you go. Bye. Right, I'm gonna pick up all these fossils and we're gonna see what we have. Um, because I still need to make more bells. So I'm gonna get them assessed. And then I'm gonna, oh yeah, I picked up these bits and I wanted to put them back down because I finished like the build around the museum area. There is still the the little right side that I want to finish up, but I'll do, I'll do that today at some point. I want to finish up that and, you know, just work on it looking nice, I suppose. I'm gonna move a few things around. This bush needs to go so we have some more room and then I might move some trees around as well I guess I'll just see where it takes us um, I just like to see how the flow works oh my god my cat's here hello Minnie I bought my cats a new cat tree today and like I might post the video to um, Patreon or something because Picasso went absolutely feral I was building the cat tree and it was like half built. I was holding it together with my hands. Like if I didn't, it would fall. And she like jumped on top of it while I was like building it. And she went absolutely feral and I couldn't get her off. She was like attacking this cat tree. They, they must spray catnip before sending it out. Like it was that crazy. Um, and I was laughing the whole time and I got it all on video and it was, it was wild and I cried from laughing, so, so you know, it, it was a great time. But their little cat tree is so cute, it's all fish themed. It's got like a pink octopus on it and um, a little blue fish. And it has some little dangly, um, has like a dangly moon and star, which is super cute. And I'm so happy with it. And I got it on sale uh, from Happy and Polly um, for their anniversary sale, which was a great time, getting a cat tree for £10. I don't think the sale's still on, unfortunately. And this is not sponsored, although I wish wish they were sponsoring me. That would be pretty cool, getting some cat trees for my cats. <laughs> but I also ordered another one, which is due to come soon for the same price, which I'm very excited about because they have one from there from years ago, which like they've absolutely destroyed. It's been years since I got it and it, the, it needed an update, you know, it's just falling apart and I'm, I'm happy with the, the new one so far. And the other one's vegetable themed, which I thought was super cute. So I'm excited to get that. So I've been decorating the little museum area and I think it looks pretty cute. Okay, so I've deposited the bells that I have into my savings balance just to keep on top of like, not spending it all I suppose, even though I don't know what I would spend it on, but having it all in the savings makes me feel like it's it's getting there, you know, and then I'm gonna order all of my wheat fields because I still need more wheat fields for this island, which is surprising because we have like a million, but there's still a few still a few builds to do. I don't know if you can hear my cat purring, but she's like purring super loud, super loud. She's like a little a little purring machine. Okay, we got our little message in a bottle. We got a tall garden rock. I could use that, definitely. Okay, hello Timmy and Tommy. What have we got? Let me sell some stuff. Because I just got some um, fossils assessed that we can sell. All of them are not what I've been wanting or looking for, so 
they can go goodbye. And 20,000 bells for a few fossils is pretty good on my end. Oh, let's get this balloon. Let's get this balloon. Okay. It looks like it's in a very awkward position. I, I can't get it? Okay. Well, fine. Let me get it this side then. Thank you. Thank you. Right, what have we got in here? What have we got? A tree's bounty mobile. I mean... Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just time travel. Here we are, a new day. I went back in time and Leaf is here. It is, I think, the 1st of November. And for those of you who have never traveled back in time, the first time you travel back in time, if you've already played that day. I think if you already played that day. Or maybe just in general. Um, you you don't get an announcement from Isabel because you've like you're traveling back to a day that's already happened. But after that, it goes back to normal. So I'm buying some flowers from Leaf to decorate the island. And let's look for our bottle on the beach. Here it is. Look at us go. And did we get anything interesting that we can use? Maybe an iron frame. Okay, thanks. I felt I did everything I could yesterday, so I decided to time travel to a new day, and Kick is here. Okay, thank you, Isabel. And we got our wheat fields that I ordered the other day on, like, the first day we played today, um, because your orders don't actually go through when you go back in time, until you go forward again, if that makes sense. So we have our wheat fields, which is a great time. Hello, Shub. How are you doing? You don't have as many crumbs. Okay. Oh, nice. Thank you. Bashfulness. And I'm going to put all of these wheat fields around. And we did just do this little museum build together. And I think the one thing that has been missing is some wheat fields. And so I'm going to get that ready. And it's going to look really cute. I think it is looking pretty good so far. I think it's just missing like a few things. I'm not sure what, but something it'll it'll come to me i think the wheat fields definitely make it look a bit more filled up we don't have many wheat fields around the museum area because a lot of it's just um the fossils wait a sec oh my god i've time traveled and i didn't i i forgot that we kicked scoot out and I, like what what about the autofill oh my god have we autofilled or oh, does it does it stay open if you time travel back in time and because we didn't have them in boxes it was the day of so I, if we have autofilled oh my god thank the animal crossing gods and goddesses <laughs> that this plot is open now i need to i need to remember what day it is it's the second of november for stream tomorrow because we're gonna do the um villager hunt live okay I, i'm this wow that my heart was in my throat I was about to say it was in my chest, and I would hope it was in my chest, to be honest. You know, that's kind of where hearts belong. And we already know this. Okay. And our veggies, well, some of them grew back, and so that means I get to sell another round of veggies to Nooks and hopefully get some bells from it, because that would be a very nice time. Because we need to get more bells to pay for our loan, so it's going to be a big old day of doing chores to get bells, I think. Okay, I have a few things to sell. Not as many veggies as last time, so it's definitely going to be nowhere near as much. But I have a few trees, a little DIY that I've already got and stuff like that. How much are you going to give us? 13,000, I'll take it. Okay, I thought we would also sell the fruit from our orchard because that can also get you lots of money be a sister fruit and the fruit that your mum sends you it sells a lot more than your native fruit which mine is apples and so i'm gonna sell those as well let's get these peaches and go to next cranny oh i'm gonna buy some um saplings and things as well i want to do some decorating um, I also, I need to sort out the upper areas because even though I'm not going to fully decorate the upper areas of the island, I still want them to look cute. I still want to decorate them a little bit. Decorate them with like a natural aesthetic, I suppose. 
Right, let me move some things around here. My cat's kicking off. I'm gonna put her on a cat tree. I've got a new cat tree for them, as I said, and I've put it next to my desk so you can see them like lounging on my cat tree in, in the behind of my camera on the stream. It's gonna be a great time. Um, okay, yeah, I'm just putting some things down. It's a good time. I hope everyone's been having a great September so far. I can't believe we're nearing the end of the challenge already. How is it the 26th already? It doesn't make any sense to me. Like, I feel like I've blinked and we're here and the island is basically done. Like, it's, it's, I don't know how I've done it in this little time. I guess playing Animal Crossing every day for hours would help. Um, but it just feels like absolutely wild to me. I don't know. And I'm making a little market stall area over there, which is super cute. And then I thought we should decorate this picnic area next to the bug cafe because I haven't actually done anything with it. And I have this turkey day item, the cornucopia, I think it's called. And I mean, it's a bunch of, bunch of vegetables. Is it picnicky? I don't know. I don't celebrate turkey day, so I don't know what's appropriate. I'm gonna plant a little flower and put some custom designs down, I think, um, to make this area just fit a little better. It's a, it's a little secret, a little secret picnic. I have a few other items as well that's kind of brought it all together, and I think that works. I think that works. Yeah, and I'm, I'm happy with this area. I, yeah. Hello. Okay, we are working on the cliffs at the minute um, because. These cliffs are very empty compared to my other ones. I've I've decorated the other ones a little bit um, on stream and things with like flowers and fences and bushes and things. And so I thought I'd put some trees down, like make it more of a thick forest, put some flowers down to have like the meadow aesthetic there and just like get things together and find these rare mushrooms because they sell for so much money which makes me so happy. So I'm gonna just plop things down everywhere and yeah, it's gonna look pretty cute, I think. We're gonna continue getting our fossils as well because we're still wanting more money. You know, we still need to sell stuff for bells and it, it just, it's necessary, you know? What has this gotten us? A mush parasol? I thought we had... Did we get the Mush Umbrella last time? I'll have to have a look. We got some Nook Miles for that, which is honestly great. The 2,000, that's the whole Nook Miles ticket. Oh! Oh my god, that's so cute. Right, I'm immediately making some of these Mush Parasols because I forgot they existed. I forgot this was a DIY in the game. Okay, I've put a few Mush mar Marisols, Parasols around. Just so excited I can't speak. And they, they look so cute. They're so autumnal with the warm colours. I mean, I could customise them to the other designs, but I don't think it's necessary, you know? And then I'm going to continue up here. I'm going to collect all these mushrooms, get the fossils, all the good stuff, and put more flowers down. We just... We're, we're finishing off little areas, and I think that's kind of been the theme of the past few episodes is adding to all of the areas that we already have going on you know all right i'm gonna make some more little mushroom items and put them around and i decided at the back of resident services we can have like a little natural area i'm gonna sell these mushrooms these rare mushrooms sell for so much like thirty-two thousand for two mushrooms count me in let me plant all of these little flowers and I'm also going to grab a lot of wood so we can make some DIYs and also get some Nook Miles. We still need more. Okay, let us see. I'm going to pick up these and I want to see what we can DIY. We have quite a few recipes for things now, so I'm going to grab some rocks as well. Got some fence, got some rock. And Olive is thinking, hello? How are you doing, Olive? A comedian's outfit? I mean, I'd rather not have it. But if you do give me it, it's just gonna get sold. I can sell it for you, and I can keep the money for you as well. Yeah, that's definitely getting sold. Thank you. 
Okay. Now we can finish off some areas up here. I think it's gonna look super cute. Hopefully the flowers will just kind of like spread on it on their own with like the rain and things when we time travel. And I'm gonna get these fossils as well. But yes, I just hope they go kind of wild and unruly because I mean, there's not much else that I can do with this top area. I wanted to add a little bit of flair, a little bit extra things to this build over here. So I'm adding some fences, adding some little like accent pieces like firewood, putting away my bells apparently. And then a few things up here as well. I just want to like swap things around, try and make it feel a bit more cohesive and make it work a little bit better because I do want to feel like make things feel like unintentional but it is intentional because I'm doing it on purpose you know so I want it to feel natural there but I also don't want it to feel like I haven't put any effort in because these builds I want them to feel like builds I want them to feel like we've actually put chosen items there and not just done it randomly you know look how cute everything is turning out up at scoots area as well i'm so happy and then i'm gonna put a little parasol here because it just looks so cute okay here comes the annoying part where i am diving for sea creatures so i'm just gonna show you a highlight reel because i wanted to fill up my inventory so i can sell full inventory of sea creatures to nook's cranny you know and it just it, it gets you lots of battles and look at pascal hello pascal i have got a little scallop for you i do indeed you can definitely have it pascal you are the best yeah thanks you can take it go ahead what have you got for me left me something thank you and feel this you gotta be careful with what you wish for in life that's ominous okay i'll let you enjoy what are you doing pascal I mean, I've never actually thought about what Pascal actually does with the scallop act at, like after we leave him, after he goes. But that wasn't it. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I got so many sea creatures. Let's get out of... Why can't I get out of the ocean? Animal Crossing, please. Let me out. Hello? What? Okay, we're good. We're good. Right, we have a full inventory. This is actually ridiculous. We got given a little DIY from Pascal. I'm going to keep that and learn it. But other than that, there's so many sea creatures that we're selling. And I hope it's for a lot of bells. Let us see. 38,000 bells. I'm happy with that. Hello, blathers. Can you assess these fossils that I got earlier? I would be appreciative. And we got some nook miles, which is the best time. Okay, I want to sell these fossils as well. What have we got? What are you going to give us for these fossils? Okay, a left megalocyte? Okay, I didn't even think to look for that anymore. I felt like we'd never ever get it. But besties, we have... I'm running over there right now. We've completed the megalo. Little... What's it called? Skeleton? fossil we've got both sides so let me put this down and see how it looks it did work with the right side to be honest but this is even better this look at that perfect fit she is beauty she is grace she is a megalo with two sides and i got this one here which i thought i'd just plop down and i decided to do another round of deep sea diving and i didn't quite get full inventory this time but I got a few rare things, so hopefully we get some bells. 42,000. That was more than the full inventory. Right, I'm going to put all of this away in my EB ABD. I yeah, we have enough to pay off the loan, which is a great time. That music to my ears. Okay. This is a mess over here. And we should be on the 2nd of November. And Scoot's house should be available. Imagine if it's not open. It is open. Look at me go. Doing this correct. I added a few more things to this area, a little mush stool, one of these things, a little stone thing, so a load of good stuff. I also have around about 
20,000 Nook Miles? Yeah, almost. 19,000. So we've got a lot of tickets to get. We can get quite a few, which is really nice. Is that 10? That's 10, I think. Do I have Nook Miles tickets in my storage is the question. Let's have a look. Also, I paid off my loan yesterday, so we can upgrade the house today as well, which is great because I really need the storage. And no Nook Miles tickets in here. We're not that lucky today. Okay, let us go get some Nook Miles tickets and go on a little hunt. I'm so excited to go on a hunt. Ruby's a little cutie, look at her. Oh, well, hello there. And we paid off our home loan. Yeah, you know I want to expand it. I can do that right now, sir. About my home. Uh, I want to expand. Half a mil. A different color roof. Red, pink, yellow, black. What's the one that we've got? I feel like red is the autumnal decision, you know? So I'm going to go with red. Thank you. Thank you, Tom Nook. Let us get two Nook Miles tickets. Two Nook Miles tickets. And um, we'll do it two tickets at a time so we don't waste any Nook Miles because I'll use the rest to order like items. Two Nook Miles tickets. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye. Hello, Orville. Let us go to a Nook Miles Island. I do. Use Nook Miles ticket. Let us go. Bye. Hi. Thank you, Wilbur. Well, this. Gloria? Hmm. Gloria slays. I love Gloria, but Gloria is not autumnal. She's a villager. I think she's really cute personally, but I also know she's not autumnal. Not autumnal in the slightest. So let us get our stuff and go. And I'm still searching the trees for all the items and things we may as well while we're here. Messages in bottles. We're gonna need a lot of bells to pay off that next loan. So I'm gonna continue collecting things for that. Oh no, why am I like this? I thought I was set up for it and I just messed myself up. Oh my God, that was very upsetting. <laughs> Hi, I'm ready for takeoff. Take us back home. Money Rock Island and who is this? Hello? Who are you? Mary! Oh my god. Oh my god. What do I do with Mary? I don't know if we should take her. She's kind of autumnal. But I feel like I want to search for someone that like I actually want. I think she could fit in. She's really cute but not the vibe. Right, let me get some apples. We're gonna go and get this money from all these money rocks. Give her an autumn jumper, she could be. This is true. <laughs> if she wasn't wearing pink. But also... Oh, I didn't mean to eat that. Okay, that's fine, I suppose. Wow. Let me grab these and get all these money rocks. Let's go. I don't think I'll take Mary. I'm not convinced, you know? I think she could work. I don't think she's like... Not autumn, but I don't think she is autumn. You know? Let me do this. We've got a lot of Nook Miles. We have enough for how many more tickets? Quite a few. We can get eight more tickets. I feel like we have a chance on eight tickets. And if not, we can grind out some Nook Miles, I suppose. Although it's going to be a lot harder to grind out Nook Miles. We can get how many more? How many more is that? Seven? We can get seven more. Yeah. And then if we get like another thousand miles, we can get eight more. So I feel like that's like enough. We found all the other villagers in like less than 10 tickets. Okay, that's all of the money, which is great. I'm also not a big fan of a fringe. She is cute. Are we gonna need this? I think we might. Who is over here? I'm actually nervous. I'm actually really nervous right now. Hello? Oh, hi, Piper. Piper is a cutie. I would say Piper's, mm, do I think she's a cutie or do I think she's blessed? <laughs> she looks like a snowman. Look at her little beak, she is kind of cute. Where are my items, please? I need them. Oh, okay, am I in the right spot? Okay, we're good. I was nervous there, but yeah, I'm a professional now. Well, at least we got the wasps. And our item, oh, lab experiment. Why am I wearing this? This is not, this is why we're not getting dreamies. There we go. Take us somewhere good. Take us somewhere good. Nook Miles ticket. Bessie, please. Bessie, please. Such a yucky individual. Violet, curse. You can leave me alone. Um, I'm not happy with you at all. I'm very upset. And I forgot, I forgot my net. So I'm gonna have to go buy a net as well. 
Oh no. Oh no. What do I do about this? Can I water them? Could I escape them by going up a hill? No. I'm very upset. Very upset right now. I'm scared we're gonna get lots of cursed villagers now. Ooh, it's Lucky Bamboo Island. Lucky Bamboo Island. Who have we got? Who is this? Pippi! Pippi is so cute! Look, Pippi is adorable. I feel like Pippi kind of fits, you know? How many tickets can we get? Let's see. One, two, three, four more tickets. Do we take Pippi? Do we think Pippi is good for the island? Def cute, don't know if she's autumn though. We do already have a bunny. Like Pippi's really cute, but we do already have a bunny. That is one thing that I will say. Because we've got Ruby. Pippi is okay for the island, but if we can keep searching, then I think we should. In your opinion. That's, I agree. Because we have a bunny already. I think Pippi is so cute, but I don't think Pippi is right for the island, you know? So, I think we can do literally four more tickets and that's it. But I could work on Nook Miles. Will I regret that in like four more islands? We will see soon. Okay, someone autumnal, someone cute. We are down and docked. I'm nervous now. Because after this we got three tickets. Oh, is this Hornsby? Is that his name? Hornsby's really cute. Oh, he's Tank. Sorry, Tank is a cutie. But I don't want Tank on the island. But he is a cutie. What did we get in the bottle? So many coconuts. Oh my god. A wooden stool. Is this the one that I'm thinking of? Because I've been waiting for this. Oh my god. What is this is the stool that I've been wanting this whole time. Okay, amazing. That That's great. That is a great time. <laughs> I've been getting some really good DIYs recently. Let's see who this is. Let's go. Who is this? Oh, is this Tia? Tia's a little cutie. Nope, it's not Tia. It's Margie. Similar, but not quite. Margie is a cutie though. If I ever did that villager bingo where you had to like know the name of the villager on the island that you go to, I would be screwed. So Margie is kind of autumnal, but also, I don't know, she's very cute. I like her, but I don't want to take her. I'm going to try and get my item. I think it's a soft G, like Marge. Margie. Oh. I learn something new every day. Next island, let's go. I wanna travel and I wanna go to a Nook Miles Island. Let us see. Oh, who is this? Tony the Tiger? Rowan. Rowan's orange. Rowan's orange. Kinda of full and Rowan is a type of tree, so that's cool. That's really cool. I think Rowan's a cutie. He's very tired, but I would say cutie. Do I want Rowan on the island? Hmm. I don't think so. He reminds me of Tigger. And that's probably literally just because he's a tiger. I love Tigger so much. Tigger was my favorite character in Winnie the Pooh. He needs a better shirt. This is the thing with a lot of villagers, you know? You love Tigger as well? Tigger was my favorite. I had... Did you ever see the Tigger movie? He had his own movie where he was like going to try and discover his family tree. I had that on VHS, I think, and I used to watch it all of the time. Yeah, okay. You were cute, but not quite for the island, I don't think. Oh, do I do I want Tigger on the island? I know he's not Tigger, but like, now that we're chatting about Tigger, how many tickets do I have? One more ticket? Oh my goodness, what do you guys think? One more ticket. Oh no! How hard would it be to grind miles for more tickets? Let's see. I've already done most of the times two ones. So chop down trees, grow fruit trees, catch a long locust, sell fruit, catch fish. And then... Wait, what? I don't talk to my neighbours a lot, do I? Oh my god. Um, okay. I think maybe with a different shirt. You think he's cute? I think he's a cutie. If he had a little autumnal jumper on, I'll put it down to a vote. I'm gonna do a little poll. New poll. Take Rowan? Yes. No. Alright, I'm gonna put it on for two minutes. It wouldn't be too hard to get more miles, you know? But now that we've made the Tigger story in my brain. 60 40 split. Oh, you'll like Rowan. It's better than Scoot. I think Rowan's better than Scoot. He's kind of a cutie. I would just wish he didn't have that top on. Imagine a like nice little sweater. Then he would really fit. Rowan is better than Scoot for this island, agreed. Yes. In general, I prefer Scoot, but for this island, Rowan is better. Okay, we're gonna take Rowan. Hello, you can come onto our island. Oh, goodbye! Okay, we have a lot of stuff. Let me sell these. I don't want the rice cooker. 
I don't want the kitchen scale. I think I know what the outdoor bench is, which is disappointing, but we'll have a look. Right. Let's see. What? Uh, did I just get... Did I just get some nook miles? I swear, if this is like 2,000 nook miles. Okay, no, it's not. It's fine. Selling fruit. Selling fruity duty. That is all good. Oh. Another 2,000 nook miles coming in. Straight after I said it would be really hard to grind for them. And we took Rowan. Okay, well, that's fine. I suppose that's fine. Right, what we're gonna do is we're gonna time travel because we'll get Rowan moved in and till I order my wheat fields and we'll do some other good stuff. Hello there, everyone. Right now on Applesauce, it's November 3rd and Rowan moved in and that's it. Olive sent me a gift. Wow. Okay, we have and more storage so first matter of business is tidying up the island because then i think my brain will be able to breathe can i put you can put bugs in your storage i did not know this why did i not know this oh well i might keep the wheat fields out because it just feels like why wouldn't i you know let me put this and this and these this is good. My inventory is looking happier. Weed field and another one. Cute. How would one there look? I don't think it'll look good, but... Oh, you know what? It doesn't look, doesn't look that bad. And then maybe I put one here. Um, yeah, that's fine. Let me put that there. There we are. And let's start clearing up this island from all of these. The curse of the dropped items. My goodness. I literally have birthday cake here so many things coconuts i'll leave the bugs for now i don't even know what all this clothing is i'm not gonna lie oh there's more stuff here didn't want to keep it all together did i okay anything else let me check over this side i'm pretty sure there's probably stuff on this beach one item i'm so good at just putting items everywhere i'm just leaving them just dropping them there for later just no thoughts just drop items why is there just randomly things everywhere is that it on this side i think so that is a good time i don't know if there's any more elsewhere on the island I don't know but there is outside my house i know that for certain so we'll tidy that stuff up as well so many oh my god we should probably decorate my house as well i still have a bunch of stuff out here hopefully it's just like an inventory worth so we can get it done in this last go but it looks like a lot more to be honest oh my god this is so much stuff what even is all of this i literally don't even know mushrooms oh that is really nice of me to do that for future me wow i'm just so thoughtful and kind what oh i picked mushrooms even though they were there because i put them there let me grab these is there anything else here oh my god weeds and a stick is there anything around this side no is that everything then i may as well put this bug away as well then okay let's put everything away oops and then i need to figure out what i want to do today other than the villager hunt that we've done we have my house to decorate we have the outside of my house to decorate we need to put the custom path back near Rowan's house. And we have the flower field to fix because we've got those purple flowers waiting for the green mums, which I'm just going to get rid of now. We haven't got a green mum and that's okay. That is a-okay. Then I need to make the market a bit bigger. And then onto beaches. Wow, that's a lot of stuff that we've just done. So many miles. 5,000 what i want to do the house i think that it makes the sense to me bye bye my storage is full well this is the main room i don't really have much to decorate with but that's fine right actually i want to go into the bedroom did i decorate the bedroom already let's decorate this room we need wallpaper which i actually haven't been keeping on top of so i don't know what i even have let me like angle it so we can see i have that one that's spooky it's a spooky wallpaper okay and the spooky flooring i'm dead what do i want what is more bedroom i'll do that because i have this rug and that like fills up all of the space anyway right let us get this bedroom decorated we have this and luna's bed a wardrobe that we made little shelves a lamp a folding floor lamp okay what if i have a cool guitar because i'm just such a cool person you know little waist bin kitty litter box sewing machine oh my god we've got so many things 
Right, how do I want this to look? This is the question. I put you there and you there. Actually, do I want that there? Let me do this like that. Where's my bed? Here, right? Please just let me move things around. If I put like my bed here and then like my wardrobe, that's kind of cute. I like that. If we put that there. Ooh, this can go on top. Yes. Then, hmm. Hmm. Sewing machine in this corner. Oh, excuse me. Oh, I don't really have a lot of places to put things, do I? Instead of that, I'm going to put that there. My little guitar can go here. I'm going to put a little bin, actually. Here's my hobby corner. Let me put that away. This isn't perfect, but it works for what I need it to do. You can sleep in here. It's a bedroom. It'll do. It'll do. Okay. Now for the living room, which I'm nervous about, but that's fine. I would say let's do the floor. Maybe that. And then what have we got for the walls again? We literally don't have anything good, really. The city wall works, you know? Spooky rogue. Oh, that's so cute. I love the spooky rogue. Oh my god. What is this one? That's kind of cute. I don't mind that. I forgot to put a chair in the other room for the desk. Let's do some colour in this room because it's looking a bit dark if you ask me. Why does this look so dark? I don't understand. I don't understand. This is so ugly. What do I do? Guys, do you like my new living room? It's just really modern. You wouldn't get it. Oh, I have a cat tree. That always makes everything better. A vacuum cleaner. We don't have much storage in this house either, so... Right, that's fine. At least we emptied the storage a little bit as well, so I can, like, add to it. Which makes it a lot better. So, main things to do are finish off over here. Actually, you know what? Guys, is that a green mum? Or do all of them look like that before they sprout? Did we get a green mum? <laughs> that's a hyacinth? <laughs> Guys, we bred a hyacinth from purple mums? What? <laughs> oh, not me picking the flowers by accident. Yeah, that was a bit upsetting, wasn't it? I was so excited for a second there. It's like, no way. The second I was about to get rid of everything. Wow. How did I not notice? The petals are completely different. The little leaves are so different. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. You can stay there. You can stay there. Let me get rid of all this. So we need to finish the flower field. Nice, thank you. One flower left, couldn't have waited. No, no, it had to break there. Cool beans. I got a few more stalls so we can make a few more stalls at the markety area. Let me sell all these flowers. I haven't had a look in nooks today either, I don't think. Okay, we have a few things that I could use in the house. I've got to think about that now, you know? Oh my god, so many. Let me open up the island designer. Let's start. I'm gonna cut it off there. I think that works. And then put the, a little circle thing. I'm gonna put the top on here. And I suppose that's where I'll finish it, at that length. Should I go all the way out? Maybe all the way out. What harm does it do if I extend it? I'm gonna do some rocks here. That works, I think. Okay, then let's go get our stalls. I need to customize the stalls. Here is our little market. I'm thinking of doing a stall like here, like this. And then we have a stall here. It's like a front to back one. I want to put this little pumpkin. Where is it? There. It's a trick lamp, but like if you put it backwards, it looks like a pumpkin and it's very cute. And then I suppose I'll wait and get something for that. But this is looking pretty good. This is looking pretty good. What if I did like this and then did like the little ends and you get rid of that flower. But I do want to put different flowers here, I think, because I want to I want it to feel like a meadow still in like every area of the island, I suppose. Coffee grinder. And then let's put coffee cup. Then I'll put the kettle behind. And then I think a candle. I feel like that works for me, at least. Some stacked bottle crates. I think that's cute. I really wish we could go into our video games. Just, just enjoy life in the video game for a little bit. A tire? Oh boy, that tire toy sure is my favorite. I think that works. Definitely depends on the game though. I agree with that, yeah. There we go. That looks nice. I think that looks okay. And then I think a garden faucet around here would be cool. What if I did a garden faucet here? And it's a little red brick one. Ooh, yeah, that hides in quite nicely. That's good. I like that. Paper lantern. Actually, I might bring this over here. I think that works there. This is looking good. I'm very excited. 
We need more flowers for here. I think I have some in my inventory. In my, not inventory, my storage. Let me do that. And then this here. And I guess hope it spreads. I don't have any more flowers. Drink. Right, let's see whose house is on the beach. I can't remember who it is. Whose house is this? Maple. Maple is on the beach. We haven't even done the peninsula. Oh my god. I'm so forgetful. Okay. We've got quite a few things to do then. And we have three days left. Because the last day I'll be doing the tour. Golden wristwatch. That's exactly what I wanted. How did they know? Where could we put maple? Unless we did a little path this way onto the beach. And she had a cute little beach house with a forest behind. I think that's a good idea. Yeah. I think we're going to do a beach house for maple. And it can be like an extension of the neighborhood. Will one grow here? We'll see, I suppose. One grow right here, quite possibly. And then like maybe one there. I don't think anything else will grow here. But that's fine, I suppose. I don't actually have any custom designs for the beach. I guess I have like some leaves. Ooh, they show up nice on the beach actually. And let me do the hammock here. Oh, that is not what I meant to do. Oh, can I not push it in? And then what if I did like a beach chair on this side? That's the wrong way round. Why well, won't it turn? And I can plant saplings here, can't I? I can. And I might put like a chopped bamboo there. So let me put the bamboo tree. And then... Did I not get an axe? Let me see. What if I put like a bush? That could be cute. I might go to Captain Island to get some bushes and things. I just hope it's not one of the holly bush islands. That would be very upsetting. Let me do this. And then this. I can't even see what I'm doing. Let me put this on the ground. This is looking good so far. I didn't customize the beach towel, but that's okay, I suppose. I never know how to use these, but I'm just gonna, like, put it there, I suppose. Maybe I'll put this chair there. Actually, what if I put the kimono stand here? Where'd it go? Here. It's a bit strange, but, like, it's there. <laughs> oh, wheat fields. That's what'll help this build. Let me do some of these. Oh, the custom designs look so good on the beach. Oh my god. Right, I'm gonna go get some weeds because I think weeds look really cute on the beach. Weeds, and I have a beach towel as well, don't I? What if I do like a beach towel like here? No, I wanna do like a proper build around it, I think. Let's do the beach towel thing like here. And do like a chair here, maybe. It's so hard to design the beach. Oh, that's kind of cute. Okay, let's see. I could definitely do like a little picnic area because it's the same design as this. I have a little hat. That's kind of cute. I do like that. And then I could do a little tree here and then a little beverage. Nice. Then I've got 99 weeds. Plant, plant, plant. I think weeds on the beach just take it to another level okay thank you isabel right let's go decorate this beach what if i did like the little planks through here i bet that would be super cute one two oh well, i want to go where i want okay thanks and then if it curved like right at the end with one of the curved ones like this obsessed yeah and i'm gonna put a little sapling here it'll not grow but it looks cute and maybe one here drop what do we think oh my god they're really going for this chat aren't they whoa okay this is looking cute we've got a little walkway hello there everyone it is november 5th on applesauce there's no news okay that is real to me that is real to me okay so today the main things are finish up every single area on the island <laughs> i'd like to get most places done but maybe we'll set some actual goals because that's probably not possible what is this so yesterday i'll show you guys what we did we finished up the flower field here this is really cute i extended it we need a few more flowers to like really finish it up in these areas because we've got a few like missing bits then we also finished up over here this little market kind of stall area i think it could use a few more items i'm gonna look for my bottle on the beach as well 
I think I definitely could use a few more items because it doesn't feel fully finished, but at least it's a build, you know, it's there, it exists. It's better than it was before. Let me get this as well. And I need to do the inside of my house as well as the outside. I haven't done anything with the outside yet, which is a little bit stressful. I don't even know what I want to do for the outside. I'll have to have a little thinky think. I really will. Because at the minute, we'll go back. We'll go back. I've literally got nothing. But I guess I could just do like a typical yard. Like, could I move my house back? If I moved my house back a bit, maybe to like there, then we'd have a lot of room to work with. Rowan moved in. Did I see him over here? Hello, Rowan. We're gonna have to get some jumpers for him to wear because uh, it's, it's not the style of the island, Rowan. But in my head, he's like Tigger and I just couldn't pass him up, you know? Then, yesterday, we also decorated this area, so we've got a little walkway here, and we've got Maple's house, a little cutie, and I did the beach here. I'm not gonna do loads on the beaches, but having like little items there, I think will make it look super cute. And then we've got this little foresty area in the back, which will have more, the, the trees will grow you know, so that'll look good. But yeah, I think that's pretty good. I should actually look for the message in a bottle, so let's go up this way. Is it up here? We shall see. Nope. I also want to check the museum because we have some area where we want a stone to grow and it still hasn't happened, so I'm gonna try my best with that. Okay, nothing there. It's me. It's gonna be on the little uh, beach area then. Be on the little one here. Maybe. I'd really like my bottle on the beach. That would be really nice. There it is. Okay, and what do we have for this? A deer decoration. And we already know that. Okay. That was upsetting. Right, let me put that down. And... Nope. No rock. It's very sad. Okay, let's go see what's in Nook's cranny as well. Let's go see what's in there. But we're so close to finishing. I, I can feel it, you know? It's tangible now. Okay, let's see. I don't think I want anything here. That's kind of pretty though. That's really pretty. That is also very expensive. No, thank you. I do not have 220,000 bells to spare. That is crazy beans. Right, I want a big axe. There we are. And then do you have any mums in? No. Why do you never have any mums in now? You never do. Okay, bye. Let's go chop the bamboo tree down that I need to chop. Hi, Agnes. Bye, Agnes. Oh, she's got the zoomies. She's such a little cutie. This island, it feels well decorated as well. Okay, well, it's not quite brown like I thought it was going to be, but also it doesn't look bad. It doesn't look bad. Okay, I might drop some things on the beach for now and maybe go to a Catman Island. I feel like that would be a good idea. So, actually, why not I just go sell some stuff? I feel like it's silly if I just don't go sell these instead of just dropping them on the floor. That'll that'll help my inventory a bit better. So, actually, I'm gonna keep the tree. I don't care about these, and... Okay, everything else I'll keep. Right, we're gonna go. I want some nice bushes. Last cap on the island we got was, unfortunately, holly bushes. It wasn't ones that we wanted, so hopefully it's gonna be a better. Okay, Captain Island, let's go. Okay, let's have Captain's little song. Okay, Captain, take us somewhere good. It's gonna be a good time. We got some vines. It's a glowing moss island. Oh my god. Okay, this is so good. This is, this is so good. And we got the good bushes. Okay, perfect. I wish you could dig up rocks and just place them around. Why didn't Animal Crossing allow that? It sounds silly to me that they haven't. Get the bushes. Like, if I can put a bush in my pocket, I can put a rock in my pocket, you know? Okay, I'm gonna grab these. I don't know if we'll use the glowing moss. I don't know if that's very autumnal, but I'm gonna grab it anyway. Like, I think we could use it. I just don't know in what build. Maybe on the beach, actually. I like the stuff on the beach. The little planty bits. And is there a message in a bottle? Nope. All of the bushes are mine now. They're gonna go on the beach. They're gonna go in Maple's area. They're gonna go everywhere. And it's gonna be the best time. Beautiful. And uh, let me grab these. I should go get that vine as well over there. 
I think the vines on the cliffs everywhere will just make the island look that much more natural, which is the best. It's exactly what we want. I grab these two. Let's go. I've took like everything I can. All right, I want to put this bush here. Oh my god, we got so many. Wait, what? Can I not put one here? Oh, it was just being a diva. Okay, that was a bit annoying. Plant the bushes. We've got so many and it's the best time. There, there is room. Come on, there is. Oh no, that's too symmetrical. I don't like it there. What if I put it like at the back? Maybe like here? Yeah, I like that. That's good. I like it. Okay. Now, where else can we fit bushes in? This is the question. We've got quite a few bushes around here, which is good. Right, I'm gonna grab everything here. Right, I'm gonna move my house. Literally right next to where the house is, but that's fine. Half a mil. Thank you. Right, I wanna move my house. I've got my house. I want to relocate. Right, I want my house to be moved literally right next to these apple trees, but I'm gonna- I wanna keep the apple trees. So I'm gonna eat some of these. Doink. And then let me get this one as well. And I'm gonna do it like quite close to the river, I think. Not quite there. Do I feel- I feel like that doesn't have enough space next to it. I don't feel like it has enough space. What about here? Let me imagine. Okay, yeah, I think that works. I'm just gonna put a little tree here. That looks so cute there, oh my god. Then if I did like a bush back here, perfect. So we get a little garden. We can have like a little garden here. That's the idea. I love that I've got a tree stump right there. Plant this. That's looking pretty good. I think we might time travel just to get my house moved. Hello, Isabel. It is November 6th. Leaf is here. We have so much room. Right, I'm gonna go to Nook's Cranny and see what's in there first. No, nothing. Let's just get on with uh, the house then. I'm gonna see what I have in my uh, storage. But other than that, we're just gonna wing it. We're just gonna wing it. I'm gonna make it quite foresty, quite natural. All of that kind of good stuff. My house is so dreary. <laughs> Pine cone, these, and these. Let me put a bush here. Wow. And then I would love to have some flowers. I need to get some more flowers. And then let me open up the island designer. Right. I can definitely do under this bit here. Oh, never mind. Let me put this this way. Let me work this one round. We'll figure it out as we go. And then that there. That is not actually meant to go there. I'm a bit of a silly sausage. Just lay on ground. And then I can put all of the middle ones down as well. Let me put one of these and do this one. Nice. And then a few more here. And then I can put... What do I want here? Maybe like a little custom design. Maybe like this. And maybe one here as well. And then the rest of this area I might do like as like a full on foresty meadow. I feel like that works. I probably need to go get some more saplings, but that's okay. Let me drop this, a mushroom, and pine cone, cute, and what else do I have? I have the glowing moss, but I might use that on beach. Nice, this is okay. Right, over here, I'm gonna need some bushes, maybe, like one here, here. Yeah, and then I want some stunted trees around as well. We can go check. I can hear a balloon. We can go check Nooks again. Here's a balloon. How's wait. I'm gonna sell this. I'm gonna get these. I'm gonna buy a load of flowers. I want lots of stunted trees. So I might grow one here, like that. And it can be stunted. I'll let this one grow a little bit more. Can I swap some flowers out for Cosmos? Like this orange tulip because you can't really see it. I might swap it out for a Cosmos. I put like one of them here. Doink. And then I can have some cosmos around it. And a white cosmos. I'm gonna move this. Oh, I'm not actually gonna move it. Okay then. I'm gonna put some custom designs down. I think this is looking cute. Did you know if you open the Critopedia and press X, something neat happens? I did not know this. Should I do it? And press X. Ooh, it does. That's so pretty. Oh, look at the moth. I did not know you could do this. I don't have many, I've realised. That's really fun, oh my goodness. That's such a good fact. We can steal this one. Right, I have flowers. And plop around. I have no cosmos here as well. What happened? How did I get all these flowers? Where from? 
I'm confused. Oh, leaf, probably. I'm gonna put this here. We do need a lot more, but like, I think we're doing pretty good. I don't have any more cosmos left, though. Oh no. Right, I'm gonna put an apple here. I'm gonna put these little vines around as well. I think that'll make everything look cuter. Let me put some vines. Wow. And one here. And then we're gonna go over here and vines. I mean, I actually don't really want people to go up the top area because like there's nothing up there but that's fine a vine i need more so i'm gonna water these and we're gonna time travel because we need either leaf or flick but i'm gonna check the whole island because sometimes isabel doesn't tell you that they're here and i really want to double check that no one is here this is looking cute oh we got some nook miles okay is <gasps> leaf is here why didn't you say it earlier, bestie? Oh my god. Hello? I'm here to shop, obviously. I need to buy everything. I'm gonna buy so many hyacinths. Because I need to actually decorate the top cliffs as well. I'm gonna get as many as I can. I actually don't know how many stars we are. Do we see how many stars we are? I wanna know. It probably isn't five because I like to put dropped items on the floor. Hello, Isabel. Are you gonna tell us how good the island is? And what have you got for us, Isabel? There you have it. Too many items laying around, cluttering up the island. Wow. Too many items laying around. I like the mushrooms on the floor. That's where they belong. Let me plant some of these flowers. I don't have as many yellow ones, but that's okay. Let me put some white ones around. I don't want too many hyacinths either. Also, this doesn't belong there. It just didn't look right. That should be enough for like up here, I think. When you're walking past, it'll just be like a, a few flowers here and there, and trees and stuff. I think that looks good. I think that's good enough. Now, I think we might time travel so we can have these grow and then stunt some trees after. And then, where's this balloon? We're looking for Flick. It's a big goal for today. Hello there, everyone. November 7th. Sahara's visiting. Okay. I'll get some stuff from Sahara, I think. It's definitely necessary. How is this place looking? Pretty darn cute, if you ask me. Right. I'm gonna stunt this tree with an apple. Nope, not with a changing room. <laughs> with an apple. I'll stunt this one with an apple. This one, I want to grow a bit more. Same with that one. This is looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good, if you ask me. The fish for the market. Although we're not selling any fish at the market, so I'm not sure if that would work. We could put it on the dock. I'll buy, like, a couple of them. Because that could go, like, on the docks, maybe. And another rug. A rug, please. A thousand. Doink. What'd I get? A breaker? Oh, I didn't mean to drop it. Let us. Also, I want to check the beach. Sahara's here, so Flick isn't here. So we can time travel again, I suppose. Hi, Bones. Here it is. Okay, what have we got in here? Acoustic guitar. Nice one. And actually, I might... Um, I was going to make something. I was going to DIY something. I'm going to put my DIY bench here, because I think it could be cute decor. Where is it? Let's craft acoustic guitar what can i craft the wooden stool i would like to customize the wooden stool i don't actually have any well a lot of custom kits so i don't know what i can do with that but i'm gonna try my best seven that should be enough for like a stool i want to customize dark wood one probably yeah let's do that oh my god you can put like a little gingham pattern on it that's so cute and then i need oh what i do i might put a little a little apple on here maybe yeah yeah i think that's cute but i need some items to like drop around do i have anything else that i can craft got these and the pile of wood which will look good as well keep crafting this one and i might do the hay bed as well let me do this amazing okay I'm gonna move this and I'm gonna put the the little wood thingy. Where is it? Firewood here. There we go. Maybe like one here. I think so. And what else did I get? Log stakes. I can do some of those here. I don't know if I like it there. I mean, what else? Got a decayed tree. I want to fit the decayed tree in somewhere because this is like a little trick-or-treat area. It needs to go somewhere where it like blends in. Maybe like here, I think. Maybe. 
I'm gonna have to move a few things though. I don't know if I can keep that bush there. Right, let's put the decayed tree here. Where is it? Yeah, that tree works well there. It kind of like blends in. Yeah, this build is literally just missing wheat fields. Let me put like a pumpkin here. Cute. Okay, I might order my wheat fields and time travel. I feel like that works. Let's grab these. Gulliver's on the beach. Does that mean we don't have flick? Maybe. This is annoying. Hello. Oh yeah, I forgot we ordered the wheat fields have definitely made this nicer. Ooh, I might get this for the house. I need to go to resin services and get one of those boxes. Maybe a couple actually. I'm gonna put some like I've got the fishing crates. Oh my god, everyone's got zoomies. Look at them go. Box in here. Right, let's see. Right, I wanna put have a box here and then i have where is it this oh that's kind of cute if you ask me and another fish container okay i think that works that works there for what we need love it there's little areas that we're getting set up and it's doing a good i still didn't get the book stack which is sad i've been i've been wanting the book stack for norma's yard whose house is this olive's house I don't know what to do with Olive's yard. She's got a lot of room. What do we think Olive would have? Clothesline slash somewhere she does laundry. That is such a good idea. Oh my goodness. I love the laundry idea. Yeah. What I'm going to do then, I'm going to make a laundry thingy. Got to get those little washing things that are wooden. Oh, wait. I know what you mean. Wait. Is it um clothesline tree branch? Okay. Is it one of these old fashioned wash tub? I think that's a good idea. Right, let's see. Where do we want to put everything? What if I... No! Did not mean to do that. Let's put that back. Both line can go here. Where is it though? We do have a wooden stool, which is brilliant. That works there. Then, there literally is room. Ooh, okay. Yeah, you just help. Put like the firewood here. Can I put the washy thing up here? I'm gonna put another wheat field here. Where'd it go? There. Looks adorable so far. Thank you. I'm gonna put socks on the floor. That's some of my favorite things to do is put like things on the floor like that. It's just too cute. And then if I put like some shoes. Did I get shoes? I did. Play aside them. Let's see. There we are. Water pump. See that works. That looks cute. I feel like I need to pick these up and put this down. Okay. Wooden stool. Can I have that? Oh, don't do that. One more over, then this here. Cute. What else did I want? Firewood here. This is looking so cute. Maybe that's it. What if I did like a mushroom here? I'm gonna put leaf here. Where do I want the watering can? Maybe like here? This is our bug cafe and we have one bug. So it doesn't really work as a bug cafe at the minute. That's why we want inflict. It is the ninth and CJ is here. I don't want CJ. Plant this bad boy. Doink. And I need to water all these. I need them all to spread, but that's looking pretty good. This area is looking pretty good to me. Did I get my wheat fields? Let me place the wheat fields where I want them. And then I'll order more wheat fields. I'll do that now. And then we'll time travel again. Do I have enough money for all of these wheat fields? Maybe. I'm gonna have to get some more money though. I drained my money. Oh no. I can actually sell all of the produce. I'll make sure these have grown back before we do the dream address. Hi CJ. I don't want to do or sell anything with you. I don't want to have to catch those small fries again because that was not a good time. That took so long. It was very upsetting. I think it might be full. Right, let me... No. Put these out. That works. You know, we feel to make everything better. Right, we're gonna, we're gonna time travel. Is Flick here or is Flick not here? Label's here. The wheat fields will take over. I want another one here. Is there anywhere else that I want them? Maybe one here. So Label's here. What I might do is just check nooks, check for my bottle and then time travel. Oh, this looks good now. Now that everything's grown. This isn't very decorated. Yikes. I don't know how I'm gonna decorate all of the beaches. I just, it's too much. Honestly, it's just gonna be wheat fields. I'm just gonna time travel and buy a billion wheat fields and then we'll be fine. Nothing here, although I will get rid of these because I will forget otherwise and I would rather not forget. People use these as like um, 
So if you have a look closely, when they're without the flower on them, they look like strawberry plants. And people use them to like mimic strawberry plants. And I think that's pretty cool. Maybe we'll do that with these. Maybe I could plant them on the beaches, just like a bunch of strawberry plants dotted around. Because I think they're, they're kind of cute. I don't know where I saw that, but like, I did. I'm gonna plant one here. Oh, am I meant to run through them? KK is here. Oh my god, it's Saturday. Wheat fields. All of the wheat fields everywhere. Look at all these bad boys. Now, wouldn't you say that this beach is basically decorated? I would. But I am gonna order more wheat fields. And I need to get my message in a bottle and then we're time traveling again. Here I need a few more flowers. Some of them are spreading actually, which is really good. I've just got one more space over here and a few more spaces over this side. Okay, time to time travel again. We have a campsite villager. Oh my god, what if it's a dreamy? It's my Juminimal plush. Jackie Pop got me it off my throne. Very sweet. We love Jackie Pop. He's gonna stay here now. <laughs> right, let me get my wheat fields. Who is in the campsite? Show yourself. It's gotta be someone cute, please. That's so upsetting! Oh my god. Hi! No. And anything in here that I want? No. Did I get the wheat fields? Let me double check. No. I'm gonna place the wheat fields on the beaches. Brain empty, no thing. That's always the vibe of these streams. Did I craft something? I want fence. Thank you. I only have ten. Thank you. Let me put the fence all the way over here. That is not how I get fence out. Excuse me. And then if I put like a little wooden walkway maybe. Let me do this here. This top one here. Why would it go there when I'm closer to the other side? That makes no sense at all. Oh, why? Let me put the bottom path. There we go. I think we need some wheat fields back there. But this bit's like a little bit decorated. Sherb's loving it. Absolutely loving it. Okay. Now I need to look around just in case Flick is here and we haven't seen him. I'm gonna have a little look. Not down here, nope. Up here. Sometimes they're proper hiding and it really annoys me. What if we get him? And I don't realize because he's just hiding in a weird nook of the island. I can't see him anywhere, so I'm gonna assume he's not here. So we're gonna time travel. Hi, Isabel. Hello, everyone. It's November 13th. Kick is here. I'm not trying to find Kick, Isabel. Alright, hello. Is there anything in here? Maybe I'll get a watering can because... Oh, it's the elephant one. Because um, I have to water my flowers. Right, I'm gonna put the wheat fields that we've got today behind here. I feel like they'd fit well here. Wow. Who could have known that they'd look nice? Such a surprise that wheat fields look nice and make the builds better. Like what? Yeah. One here and one here. Whoa. So much time traveling today. We're gonna have to probably make some more bells soon as well. Hello there everyone. It is November 14th. Leaf is here again. This time of day is really pretty. Oh my god, like just after golden hour. It's so pretty. It's like a little darker. Whoa. Kinda love it. Wheat field. Wheat field. There we go. This beach is done. Let me go check Nux. Hello Nux. Leaf is here. Might buy some flowers just to fill in like extra areas on my island. I feel like that might be a good idea. Don't think I want a grand piano, but thank you. Hi. I love Leaf. Leaf is so cute. Let me grab quite a few of these. And another one. I'll take five. Right now on Applesauce, it is November 16. Just heard CJ's visiting. Flick was literally here yesterday. That's two NPCs in a row. Wowza. We should have Flick's little gift. Here we are. Nook shopping. I got all the wheat fields and then Flick's little bug commission. And I think I went with um a white butterfly. So that's pretty good. Right, let's go put this over here. I'm gonna put the butterfly here, I think. That looks cute. CJ thinks it looks cute as well. This is more of a bug cafe, guys. Maybe I should go around the whole island and see what we need to do. Let me check nooks. Hi. We have like a kitchen island thingy. Yes. Yeah, I will take that. Sorry for the scrapey noises as well. My partner's just eating some foodies. Oh, we have like no money. Well, that's not good. Right, so I actually want to count how many builds we've got as well. I'm not counting like the villager yards or anything because they're not exactly builds, they're the yards. 
This area is looking really cute outside my house. I'm very happy with how this has turned out. I'm very happy with that. We have the orchard. That is number one. The orchard can count as its own build. It's a pretty good one, I would say. We have flower field, the diagonal flower field. We have the entrance, which just so happens to be another flower field, but that's okay. <laughs> That's okay. These are all villager yards over here, so these don't count as builds. They count as yards, but very cute. I'm also not counting anything on the beach because I, it's just loose decorating. This is looking pretty good over here. I love- oh, am I destroying everything? I love the little foresty bit. I'm just looking for my message in a bottle while we go around as well. We've got three builds so far. Just need to remember which ones I've already counted. I do love this area. I really do. Norma's yard is there. Then, this area we have decorated, which is good. We have... I'm gonna count the museum as a build. We do need to figure out what I'm gonna do in that, like, area where there was a stone and now there is not, but that's okay. This beach is, like, fully done. Just with, like, long grass and things, you know, all the good stuff. That's four builds so far. That's four builds. I might count that the plaza as a build. I think it's more of a build than a transition area, you know? So it's definitely a build. So it's five, six with the market, seven with the forest, which works as a transition area, but it was a full build. Seven with the forest, eight with the farm, Oi, bonk. So that's eight builds so far, which is pretty good. I'm happy that we've got like quite a few builds going on. We need to do all of the beaches that I haven't decorated. That's something that today is gonna entail. And my house. That's mainly the things that we need to do today. Agnes is thinking? Bessie, no. I don't have enough time for that. Just don't. Do I count Abel's as a build? I don't think I will. But I will count the Bug Cafe, which is nine. The Bug Cafe means nine. Then we have the campsite, which is ten. That's ten successful builds which like is all I can ask for. 10 is a good amount, I'm happy with that. We've got all the village yards decorated. I think that's pretty good, right? If I made the dream address on the day where I gifted Tigger the tiger, would he wear it? Maybe. I guess we'll get started on these beaches. We don't have many left to do. I'm just very excited right now. <laughs> I can't believe we've managed to do this in 30 days. I mean, like, what? <laughs> did I do this beach? No, I did in front- I did one in front of the museum, yeah. So I think we only have this side and in front of Norma's house, maybe? I need to go get my weeds. Agnes! She's always thinking. I swear, she's always the first one to get the thought bubble. It's not very good. Let me get the weeds and whatever else I think would be useful for the beaches. A little chair, maybe? This? Right, where's my weeds? Here. Is that it? Maybe. I have flowers actually. We could plant these because they'll never grow. So they just look like different kinds of greenery on the beach. And then we'll use like the wheat fields as well. Let us go. Oh, she stopped thinking. I don't think that was a moving bubble then. I think it was, um, she's probably bought something and wanted to give us it. Oh my God, yes. These as weeds work so well. I love them. Okay, so many weeds everywhere. It's nice to have like the, the beaches decorated but not like fully decorated. I haven't had to like think about it too much. Do I want a wheat field here maybe? That works. And I could do maybe some custom pathing here. Doink. And then maybe one more here. There we are. I like that. That's nice. That is nice arena. And then more wheat field. I'm using them sparingly on the beach because obviously I don't have that many but I'll order some more maybe we'll time travel. I want to find like the perfect day for um the dream address. Tomorrow's the tour which is exciting but it also means I want to put the dream address either tomorrow or today. We won't be resetting which is nice. I don't have to worry about that but yeah. Greedy. The wee fields bring me so much joy. We need some more, but I like that it's been... Wait, what if I swap these? I want... Which? This one is the one that I want? Okay. There was literally a wheat field right there. No, nope, that's not the one I wanted. Nope, yes, it, it is the one I wanted, actually. I want it right next to the edge. That's all I want, please. Animal Crossing. Planting all the weeds. And then if we time travel and get what they're called, wheat fields, we'll probably be done the beaches at least. I will check if there's anywhere else we need to um, do anything to make it perfect but pretty sure we did most of it yesterday and obviously my house. My house is definitely a concern so we're gonna do that today which is gonna be a great time. Right let me plant this. I think all we need now is the wheat fields for this area. Other than that I think we're pretty good. 
I think that's good. Let me check all the other beaches just in case. I'm gonna do a little, wait, it's here. I'm gonna do a little plank here. Cute. Oh, you can't even get through that way. Oopsie. But by, let me go check. I wanna check every little area. This area is fine. This area looks good. This is a farm. This is definitely a farm. And the little picnic, super cute, okay. We've got Ruby there. The little, the little farm overseer, the little farmer. Let's check the museum. There's no rock there, so maybe we need to put something there. I think we do. What do I have? I use this, because it is a rock. It is a rock. Wait, let me place. I think that works. And then what if I put this like in this corner and then turned it around a bit? I think that works. Yeah, the museum's fully finished. Okay. This area is fully finished as well. We're gonna keep the spooky arch. I like it there. I think it looks cute. Behind resident services. Now, it's literally just natural area. So I might just put a bunch of weeds around. Maybe put a bush here. What is this? Is this a fully grown? No, it's not. Plant a little nursery hardwood in there. Just make it nice and thick, full of stuff. So many weeds. And these, I think behind there is done. This area is fine. I think so. I'm happy with how the orchard looks. All of the apples and stuff, everything on the fruit trees, they are grown, which is great. Let's check here. I think everything looks fine here. Some of the flowers aren't grown, but we will time travel and this should sprout. This should sprout. Yeah, I think it looks pretty good there. Then let's check the flower field. I like the rock in the middle of it, so I'm gonna keep that there. The yards, these were built quite a while ago. I say that, it's literally been 29 days. So quite a while ago isn't even that long. This beach is fully done, isn't it? Yeah, with our fake strawberries that are actually red pansies. Right time. Okay, this looks really cute. I'm really happy with everything so far. I think it's looking pretty good. And this bit of the island, do I need some more weeds? I think I do. I think this part needs weeds. I like the way the chopped down coconut trees look. I haven't used too many coconut trees because they're, they're very summery, they're not very autumn. This all looks perfect to me. Look at bones zooming around, those zoomies. We haven't actually decorated this beach over here, so I'm gonna put on some weeds everywhere. Doink. Just gotta, gotta keep going with it I suppose. I have fences as well actually. Fences could definitely help make this look pretty. Is this my country fencing? It is. So like, we've just got spare space here. What better than fence to make it look nice? And a weed. Is that a weed? There we go. And a couple here. I'm so excited for this island to be done. I feel so accomplished that we've done it in such little time. I don't know, it just feels really cuckoo crazy bananas. Let me put a couple here as well. And some weeds. There we are. Maybe one in here. Oh, excuse me. That's my last one. Okay, that's decorated now. That's good. Okay, so the whole bottom of the island is approved. Have I done this area back here? Maybe I need some stuff here. I don't know. If in doubt, weed it out. <laughs> and I'm gonna put a book down as well. It's been so quick, yet it's felt so long as well. I don't know, It's it's really strange. Right, let's check over here, our little flower shop. And over here, I'm pretty sure is fully fine. Yeah, just loads of flowers. Amazing. It also shows that you can like really decorate your island with limited things. This is basically trees and flowers. Trees and flowers, so good. Over here is fully decorated as well. Maybe I put like a little weed here. Wow. Right, let's do this side. I think over here is fine. Yeah, like a little wash area next to the river. I thought it was a really cute idea. Just a little little place filler. A little place filler. Up on the top cliffs, I'm not really bothering too much, but I've put some flowers and things. Over here, fully decorated. Yep. Yep, a doodle do. And then we go this way. It's just a little walkway around. We do have a lot of areas that just like lead to nowhere, but it's a natural island. That's what real life is like. <laughs> Here is the campsite. I'm gonna put a, uh, a weed here. Yeah, and maybe one here. I like how it just fills the area, you know? We've got a little fountain there, super cute. And the top area is like decorated enough that it feels fine, you know? And this area is decorated. Okay, so if my memory serves correct, we literally only have the inside of my house to finish. So I suppose that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna do my house. I don't really have a lot of things to decorate with. 
which is kind of sad, but that's okay. We're gonna work with what I've got. I might work on the separate room first. The living room looks very sad at the minute. It's not the best. Yeah, this is, um, yeah. What I might do actually is put everything away. Right, let us go this side. I don't remember if I did my bedroom, but I have got more items <clears throat> since then. Maybe we'll do the bedroom first, which I've done at the back. Oh, the bedroom's actually quite cute, you know. What? A, mm, maybe I'll change the wallpaper. I wasn't super sold on it, but I think the bedroom's kind of cute. Wallpaper. What do we have? We have flowery walls. We have this. We have this. We have big windows. What if I did that, like with actually i don't think it will work very well let me see oh i can't do accent walls i can't do accent walls which is sucky i don't know why i kind of like that one but also it looks very strange you know it's like a strange choice there's this one the screens which i think works i think that can definitely work let me put some pictures on the wall oh why are they not on the wall excuse me yeah okay let me see i'm gonna put these on the wall do like a little a little picture wall sort of thing right and then let me move these around like this would be cute thank you thank you if i put like these like here maybe i don't know and then we change the light we can't actually do much with the light because we don't have the pro decorating license stuff which kind of sucks you know, it looks like a bedroom. It's got a bed in it. That works. <laughs> right, let me do this room. Now, I have no idea what to do for this room. Ooh, turkey day flooring. Ooh, we also have this kind of flooring. I see. This could be the kitchen, but we're kind of like bound by what items I have. I think this one's going to be the kitchen. I'm pretty sure I have stuff for a kitchen. Could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I do. We have this, we've got a freezer, we've got a gas range oven. Obviously I don't need like everything here, but we'll we'll choose between everything. We have these things, which are kitchen items. I think I've got something in my inventory that will help as well. I wish I would show you stuff that you have in your inventory. It's so annoying. Right, let me put these in storage and then we can use those. And then this away. Where's those things that I just put away? <laughs> I might get this changed colour. I feel like that might be a good idea. You can place directly from your inventory also. Yeah, but then I have to move around and make sure there's room there. Oh, can I do it from here? Oh, I didn't know that. No. Wow. What if I got the lockers changed as well? Could use lockers. Plant. What if we made this little thing the, like, centerpiece? This is like a nice area. We'll have a normal oven as well. Let me grab these. I'm gonna have to make some money. Here are my bugs. Yeah, got some wasps. This will work. I don't know how much we'll get. There'll be less than flick, but I've got a lot to sell. Amber, a tail, some other things. 38,000 bells. That is good enough for me. I love that. Okay, right, let's see. We have red. Ooh, we have some paintings. What if I put some paintings next to like the picnics? I feel like that could work, maybe. Hello, recent Cyrus. I wanna put, right, should we go from this side to the other side? You change the color of the toaster. The style and the, the toast on the bread changes. How come I can't get a flower on the white one? Why does it gotta be yellow? And the bear is on the green one. It's a thousand to change the toaster. At least we get a groovy tube. What? Do that is silver. The green one's really nice. But I'm gonna go with white. Okay, bingle bongle. There's so much dialogue, please. What have we got? 4,000 bells? That's good by me. I literally just want it for a little picnic. Is that our first art piece? That makes sense, because you can't get red on your island when Blathers is in the tent. I guess that makes all the sense. I'm gonna pick up these and let us decorate, I suppose. Wait, I can go with my inventory. That's so good. Oh, I forgot that that's not a counter. That's very upsetting if you ask me. Right, let's put that on the floor. This counter can go there. That just looks weird. I should have got the turkey day dining room table and then like we would have had so much space taken up by the dining room table. We might be able to make a bathroom, you know. Oh, I don't actually have like a sink or anything though, do I? This is not good, besties. Wait, let me put everything away. What if? This might be a little cheaty, but we didn't have a goal to decorate the house. So what if I literally make the main room a studio apartment? 
and get rid of the other rooms, like block them off. I've seen people do that before. Right. What flooring would we want? There's lots of options. Probably not chocolate bar. I would say probably turkey day. Or the one that I've put in the other room. Do I like that more or that more? I like that one. And then we can separate it up with rogues. So we've got this rogue. Or we have... Where's the turkey day rogue? The turkey day one. Let me put this in the middle. I really like that rogue. That rogue is so pretty. Then we need a bedroom area. We have... Ooh that's cute obviously gonna have a desk area this for the kitchen maybe this maybe maybe a study desk a double bed just takes up lots of room which makes me happy maybe we have like a little pop of color with those lockers shelves a vanity we literally don't have much for the kitchen so i'm just gonna bring out what i can see we have like enough stuff for a studio apartment oh stop moving things please plank goes here i didn't even get a sofa out <laughs> Oh my god, okay. The light goes next to the bed because what I have learnt is that when you have the light next to the bed, it's easier to turn off. I might put on the uh, stargy music while um, there's no music on. Just quietly. A nice little stargy time. Gonna be a warm apartment with that stove, this is true. But bestie, I have nothing else for a kitchen. Although actually I do. I lie. What if we just use the little, um, this thing? That could work. I think so. Then I'm thinking desk can go in this corner. Actually no, desk on this side. I've changed my mind. The cat tree goes here. Where does the litter tray go? That's the question. It shouldn't really go next to the kitchen. Maybe the toaster and this. Because you know, toasters and coffee makers are the essentials. That's all we need in life. And then I think maybe a small rug over there to like... What if we did like that for the kitchen? How they like, um separate kitchens in studio apartments They're like luxury separate but open plan kitchen and it's literally because it's got like a separate floor in how is this that might be a bit too much i don't think it's perfect oh wall stuff let me get a cuckoo clock a radiator this all of the stuff on the walls all of them just every single last piece so i do not have many things for the walls so i need to do everything i actually don't have much room do i because of, um, damn, where do I put things? The windows are all in the way. This looks pretty there if we keep that just like minimal. That can go there. That is huge. Why is that huge? I don't understand. I have two clocks. Yes. Let me walk through it. Okay. This is my, this is my thing. This is my apartment. Oh my God. I forgot you can actually cook things. Oh, I'm making a, I'm making a coffee. Oh, I turned on the toast. Oh my God. Animal Crossing is so fun and wild. <laughs> okay, yeah, I think this studio apartment works. Like, it's eclectic. It's cluttered, but it works. I do kind of want a little rug for the living room area. Do I want like a little... That's a cute rug, but like, no. That's too small. Is there too many rugs going on? Maybe like there? It's a bit of a mess. But somehow it kind of works. You know, it doesn't need to be perfect. That took a while to do our house. Guys, is that our island finished? It might be. I think that island's done. What else do I have to do? Did I say anything else? I'm trying to think if there was literally anything else, but I literally think we're finished. I'm gonna order the wheat fields because we might need a few of those for one of the beaches. And we'll time travel. We'll time travel to the time that I want it at as well. I'm nervous to be finished. I feel like it's gone so quickly. Hi, Isabel. How are you doing? Sahara's visiting. Ooh, look how gorgeous this time of the day is. Oh, we got the painting, didn't we? I wanted to put that. I wanted to put that at the bag. The the bag. The bug cafe. I like mixed the words together there, but like also not. <laughs> right. Wheat fields go over here. Let me put that weed back. And then oh, we've got quite a few here. Let me put one up here. Place item. I really love these flowers that look like strawberry plants i know they wouldn't grow on a beach but like i just love the way they look natural beaches make everything better you know i feel so weird now my little island should we set the dream address i think everything's fine like some of these flowers aren't grown but i don't mind that not all flowers bloom at once you know let's get some sleep wow setting the dream address welcome oh this might be the first time i've actually went to sleep in this 
I'm not mistaken, you're from Applesauce, yes? You must be the famous honey. She dreams as pleasantly as Lowe's from Applesauce. Forgive me, I have yet to introduce myself. My name is Luna. My dream address. Thank you. This is so good. And then we've got the tour tomorrow. Hello, my lovelies, and welcome back to day 30 of designing an island in 30 days without Nintendo Online and without terraforming. Wow, it has been a ride. And today is the last day and I thought we'd do a tour because I finished the island yesterday. And I have uploaded it as a dream address and my codes are uploaded as well for those who want to use them slash tour the island because I thought the challenge is over now. We can use a little bit of Nintendo Online to share the love, but the whole island was designed without Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Oh my god. Should we just get into it? It is... I can't believe it's been 30 days already. How has that happened? Tell me how. I just... I don't understand. It's gone by so quickly, yet we got a whole island finished. And the whole place is like, decorated. I just... I'm so hyped about it. I suppose we shall get into the tour. So I suppose we shall look at the map first. Let's have a little look. So, this island has been done with zero terraforming. Zero terraforming. And without Nintendo Online. So, I had to work with what the island gave us. And to be honest, it was a really good map. I'm really happy with the map that we got given. I only used one incline. And I used four bridges. So, pretty simple. But I, I've fallen in love with it. We have Ruby, Freckles, Agnes, Sherb, Maple, Rowan, Norma, Olive, Bones, and Cherry for the island villagers. And I love every single one of them. I think they all fit in really well. I think they're all cuties. And I'm really happy with it, you know? We walk in to this flower field at the entrance. And honestly, I love the flower field. I'm obsessed. For this to be a little entrance into the island, you already know it's going to be very natural. It's going to be full of flowers for the medical theme. I'm just... I love it. I love it so much. And we have a little picnic as like the little extra like space filler here. So we're going to move on into the neighborhood this way. We'll go left first. And this is Norma's house, Norma's yard. She's lost some socks on the floor. And she's our resident reader, so she has a little chair to sit outside in nature and read her little books. And it's so adorable. The beaches are loosely decorated. Um, on some of the other beaches I have like a picnic and things like that, but it's mostly very natural. I've filled a lot of spaces with cute little items and lots of custom codes that I designed myself. And then we go over here into the rest of the neighborhood and we have Freckles, Bones and Sherb here. So we have a shared like laundry yard and I thought this was so cute. Using the parasols, using the hats and the clothes as decor on the floor, the little shoes. When you don't have a lot of items, it is so good to use the fashion items, the clothing items as decor. I've used a lot of different levels on this island through using the stunted trees, which I'm obsessed with. Why doesn't everyone use stunted trees? They look so good. So good. And Sherb has a little pumpkin patch here, and it leads down to this beach with a little picnic blanket, and it's a lovely relaxing area, and this is my dock. And we have a few little decorative things. Very loose, very cute. And then if we go up here, we have a little path to Maple's house. And I did struggle with Maple's house. It's on the beach, but I said, I was like, you know, I've put this house here and I put it out of the way and I was meant to move it. But then I thought, why not make a beach house? Because isn't this like actually adorable? Look at like, she's in nature. She's right on the beach. This is so cute so cute and we've got some trees here we've got lots of nature lots of flowers and custom designs and i'm just so happy with how it turned out right so then we'll go this way we only have one incline so that like forces you to take a certain way around the island 
which I kind of like, you know, I think it was nice that it's not too confusing on where to go. So we go further into the neighborhood and here is Olive's house and through chat's suggestion, I actually made Olive's house a little washing area for clothes and I thought it was such a cute idea because we had all the DIYs that would work for it and I think it worked out really well. And again, we have the beach decorated a little bit. I'm going to continue up into the neighborhood. We have a pumpkin patch here. I'm utilizing a lot of the spooky DIYs because we played Halloween on this island and it was so much fun. Making an autumnal island has been an absolute blast and I'm so happy that we did it. I'm really happy. And this is Agnes's house. Agnes has a gorgeous diagonal flower field right next to our house. And I don't know, I just, there's something about flower fields that I just really love. I just really love flower fields. It's, I don't know. Like, look how gorgeous that is. I'm so happy with how everything turned out on this island. And this has got to be one of my favorite builds. I just, I love a good flower field. We have this black tulip, which I wasn't sure I wanted to include, but I think it works so well for this island. I don't know, there's something about it. And I feel like from every angle on this island, you're gonna get something pretty. You're gonna get a really pretty landscape and I don't know, I'm just really happy with how everything turned out. I hope you guys are too. I need to stop gushing over the island, you know? Okay, so let's follow the path. And the path leads us this way. Now we can either go this way to buy some services or we can go to my house. And I think I want to do my house first. We've got another flower field. Can you tell there's a little theme? <laughs> because this island is meadow core, it was very useful to fill everything with flowers to make it fit the theme, which was also quite handy because we didn't have a lot of items. We have a little workstation area, lots of cute things, and I do have my house decorated. I'm not super obsessed with how that looks, but that's okay. I'll, I'll give you a little look of what it looks like inside. So I wanted to do a studio apartment style thing. I blocked off the other rooms. It has the bedroom, the work area, and we have a little kitchen. And now it's definitely not my favorite indoor build that I've ever done, but I definitely think it works. I think it works for what it is, but I'm going to move on from that swiftly because there's not much to talk about in there. So if we move down this way, we will go past the orchard, which I'm super happy with this build. I kind of forgot about it loads while actually playing the game. I don't know. I just, I really love how it turned out. I love that there's a, a little market stall. It's just the whole island feels so natural and full of good stuff and i'm so happy with how this turned out you can go and pick your apples you can go through with the string fairy lights obsessed and then if we continue this way past the piano and if you guys have been watching this whole series you'll know but if you haven't i accidentally bought this piano for like 53,000 bells and i had no idea what i was going to do with it but I think it fits in quite well here. I kind of, I'm really happy with uh, actually including it in just like a little, a little area. We come up to resident services and Sherba's wearing a jester costume. Bestie, please. You need to get your best clothes on for the island tour and you've chosen this? Okay, fair enough. And my resident services isn't super built up or decorated, but I have included lots of natural things behind here. It's not really anything special, just kind of place fillers, just to make everything look very pretty. And then we have a little plaza area with a decorated well. I'm really happy with how this turned out. I was very, very stuck with what to do for the middle bit. And I don't know, I feel like it works really well, well with the well. <laughs> and then we move down here past the flower field into the museum area and I knew I wanted to keep Blather's tent because it looks just so cute like look at it look at it it's so adorable and then we have some dig sites for Blather's and it just looks super cute 
I'm really happy with how this turned out. I think you dropping the fossils like that with like the skull and bones here looks so cute. There's something about it that just works so well and I'm so happy that we did that. I'm very happy with this build. The beach is just very natural and normal. Not much to say about it and that's okay. I love a good natural beach. I think all the rest of the beaches are like that. But that's okay. We did find the whole Megalo fossil, which I used behind Blather's tent, which I think looks so cute. And then we're gonna go over this side of the island, down here first, to my little market. It's like a little market for all the pumpkins, the mushrooms, paintings, coffee, all of the good stuff, and I think it looks super cute and then more natural beach and then we can make our way up here through the forest core build through the little forest up to the mushroom farm and then the actual farm and ruby is our little farmer she has her little house here and I'm just so happy with how this farm turned out. I was looking at Pinterest for pictures of everything when designing this island. And none of them had like the perfect layout. So I kind of mashed all of them together. So we've got the 3x3 three three plots up here with these um, vegetables. And then we have the 4x2 plots. We have a little picnic over here for Ruby and more pumpkins. And then we have the mushroom plots, which are three by two. So lots of different plot sizes, but I think they all work in their own way for their intended purpose. I love a good farm core build and I couldn't find many mushroom farms to take inspo from. So this is all from my head. I'm so happy with how this little mushroom farm came out. I don't see them often, but I think they're definitely worth doing a little build of. So we're gonna go back down this way. The beaches are all the same, so I may as well not show you those. And we're gonna make our way to the back of the island, which is just up and round. We get to go through the orchard, through the pergolas. Um, Agnes? Okay, thank you, Agnes. That is so kind of you. Thank you, thank you. Let us go this way. And first, I will take you this way. This is Nux, and I did it very natural. Nux has a little flower shop attached. We have a little cute walkway this way, and a lot of places on my island end up going nowhere, but that is kind of the nature of like a natural island, I suppose. We then have a little pond over here, which is almost a heart shape. Not quite but almost <laughs> and this is one of the reasons why i chose this island it had its own gorgeous natural terraforming and i am so happy with how this looks i really am and everything here is just really cute looking everything's so natural i just i'm obsessed with how everything looks around the pond i wanted to fill it with flowers lots of trees lots of stunted trees and we have a little picnic over here that we passed. We have a little mum's cake and things on there. I'm just utilizing everything I can for decor. And then we have a little clothing area right next to Abel's, of course. Um, I feel like having the little clothing pieces just really helps when you want to build next to Abel's. You put the mannequins down and it kind of speaks for itself. We have more of a little flower field, like a tiny one, into the bug cafe. I wasn't able to get many bugs for this and I would have filled it with bugs if I could have, but we got two gorgeous butterflies and I think it works really well for the bug cafe. And then we have a little picnic down here. I just, I love the bug cafe. I really do. And then we shall go this way first. We'll go this way first. And we have lots of transition areas full of nature, leading to cute little, cute little builds. Um, and then we've got this side. And if we go up here first, this is just another transition kind of filler area 
full of flowers, full of nature, and full of my custom designs plopped everywhere, and of course, full of wheat fields, because what would this island be without the wheat fields? It really saved the island, you know? Then, we have Rowan's house, which I'm really happy with how this turned out. I don't think I'm the strongest at villager yards, but I thought this was really cute. I've got the camera on the floor, we've got the mushrooms around, we've got the little hose, we've got lots of little accent pieces that I'm just really happy with. And yeah, I'm just, I just really like this build. I'm really happy with most of the yards, to be honest. And then we have just small place fillers um, for the island. It's definitely very autumnal, definitely full of flowers for the metalcore aspect. If we go this way, we move towards our campsite and we have a natural waterfall here um, because again, I did no terraforming. I wanted to do a little playground for the campsite and I think it works out really well. We have a little um, garden faucet here, which really blends in with the tree, which I'm kind of obsessed with because I feel like if it wasn't on, you wouldn't really notice it, which I love those like subtle details. We've got more parasols, I absolutely love using them to decorate with and a lot of natural areas with mushrooms and things and then we've got a little transition into Cherry's yard. Cherry's yard has a little fishing area, a little pond, it is super cute and super autumnal. I just, I'm so happy with how everything turned out on this island and I think that is the island. It feels huge but small, you know what I mean? It's because I didn't decorate the top cliffs as something that's like accessible. I just did it with flowers and trees, something to just um, complement the lower section. But I'm kind of happy that I did that. I think it looks so much better that way for my island. And yeah, it's just, I'm so happy with how everything turned out. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all of the support throughout this challenge. I've really appreciated all of your comments, all of your kind words, and there's so many new people here, which I just, I'm so happy that you guys have been enjoying the series just as much as I have. Feel free to like and subscribe if you did enjoy the video and the series. If you haven't watched the series, um, I have a 30 full days that you can watch from day one of me designing this whole island without Nintendo Online and without terraforming. We didn't use any treasure islands, we didn't do any trading, no online things, the only things that I've used at the end of the challenge is uploading my dream address so you guys can visit. I'm so glad to have you here and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. I will see you next time. Bye!